As soon as Qin Chen entered the palace, he was immediately taken aback, because he felt the breath of the heavenly sages of nearly ten deities, each of which was intertwined with the terrifying laws of the heavenly sages, evolving various phantoms, compared to clouds. The Dong Guang is still a little bit worse, but they are all at the same level as the heavenly sage ancestors of Yunzo's top forces such as Tian Long Zhenren. Mr. Qiashui, why are you so slow? Going to the deserted ruins this time is of great importance. We have to grab the treasure before the old enemies of our Shengu League. You are so leisurely. Hey? You brought in an outsider. This is the secret area of our ancient alliance. Outsiders are forbidden to enter, and it's a half-step Tian Sheng Jr. Why did you bring him in? Suddenly, the several heavenly saints sitting in the hall opened their eyes at the same time, rumbling, as if the rays of the scorching sun swept across, the heavy pressure caused the Saint Yuan beside Qin Chen to burst. Everyone, this Qin Chen is from the Wang Gu Tower. The previous request from the Wang Gu Tower to investigate the identity of the mysterious woman from the Gods and Ancients League was made by this Qin Chen. He is the guest of the Wang Gu Tower. He came here with us. Entering the deserted ancient ruins together. True person Chu Shui immediately spoke for Qin Chen. What? Is it that he used the Wang Gu Tower to find out the news of the charming woman? At a young age, you are already a guest of the Wang Yulu? Real person Qiashui, are you right? Even if he is the guest of the Wang Gu Tower, you can't bring him in casually. This is the secret place of our God League. My God League and Wang Gu Tower are only a cooperative relationship, not an affiliation. Consciousness passed from one to another with dissatisfaction, doubt, curiosity and shock. True person Chu Shui immediately said, Everyone, I brought him here through the teleportation formation. Therefore, first of all, Qin Chen cannot know the true location of the secret area of my ancient alliance, and secondly, this child is still a master. Can make our wild ancient alliance add a strong combat power. Ha ha ha, real person Kia Shui. Are you convulsed in your brain? Although you are the sub leader of Yuda City, you have an extraordinary status, but you have to speak through your head. What is the role of a half step Tian Sheng Jr.? Go to die. Master? Haha, <laughs> when has half a step heavenly saints are masters, a joke? He came here, didn't he want us to rescue the enchanted woman? Our gods and ancient alliances are going to seize the treasure on this trip not to save his little girlfriend for him. A venerable heavenly sage showed dissatisfaction. It was enough for the real person Chu Shui to bring people to the secret land of their gods and ancient alliances, and he was even preparing to take them to the deserted ancient ruins. Isn't this messing up? If it hadn't been for the cultivation of true person Chu Shui who belonged to the top group in the ancient League of Gods, the others would have been making trouble. One of the middle-aged men stood up with the Sage of Heaven surging on his body, and said coldly, Mr. Kiyashui, what do you want to do? This time the barren ruins are dangerous. Just a dead end, so many of us will join hands. It may not be deadly, you still carry such a burden, what if he has a conflict with other masters for his little girlfriend? Furthermore, that charming girl has a beautiful face and is said to have a world-renowned posture. Hehe. <laughs> Even the masters like Zhu Xing Tian are tempted, maybe they have been ruthless. The wind is boundless, shut up. Real Chu Shui shouted angrily, and hurriedly looked at Qin Chen, little friend Qin Chen, don't take it to heart. Qin Chen's eyes were cold, and he sneered, Mr. Chu Shui, you don't need to say, since boundless wind said that I am a waste, let him see if I am cumbersome. I know after passing it. Boom. When the voice fell, Qin Chen moved suddenly. He stepped out one step, and suddenly, a terrifying murderous aura rose to the sky, with strange steps, each step down, Qin Chen's aura sank even more, bang bang bang, the whole hall's aura was aroused now, as Qin Chen's steps were shaking, and the origin's magical power contained in his body, Qin Chen blasted out with a fist. With this punch, the holy Yuan surged, 
vast as a vast ocean. Roar. Everyone heard it as if a real dragon roared and roared. From Qin Chen's fist, a huge dragon soaring to the sky was swept out, with teeth and claws, roaring and roaring, evolving into a frightening dragon-shaped fist and tent. Bang bang bang! The real dragon roared, mighty and majestic, and the Saint Yuan burst into the room, shrouded the middle-aged man of the heavenly saint, fiercely messed up. The middle-aged man's complexion changed, his feet stepped on mysterious steps, his body was like misty clouds, true dragon fist intent? Hey, even if you have true dragon fist intent, what about half-step heavenly sage is half-step heavenly sage? Can defeat you. Boom. Behind him, the endless Sheng Yuan breath rose, and a Sheng Yuan wind tunnel evolved. This wind tunnel, pitch black and vast, like a black hole in the universe, swallowed all things, and the terrifying wind god's profound meaning shocked the sky and swept everything. Bang bang bang! The wind swept through the clouds, and the true dragon fist intent that Qin Chen displayed was under the wind tunnel. It was constantly being swallowed, making a violent blast, and countless fist intent was instantly crushed and blasted in front of Qin Chen. Mr. Qiashui, this is what you call a master? But so. Feng Wuliang sneered. Is it? Qin Chen didn't startle at all. Instead, there was a sneer at the corner of his mouth. At the moment when the black wind tunnel was about to swallow him, Qin Chen shook sharply using his palm as a sword to cut it out. Hey! The sword was out of its sheath, ghosts and gods were shocked, there was almost no time barrier, the astonishing sword aura, soaring out, turned into heavenly sword light, directly slashed on the holy Yuan wind tunnel that the boundless wind displayed. Strong, strong, strong! That sword power is like the first ray of light in the birth of the world, chasing the sun and the moon, opening the world, and containing the mystery of the operation of the world. Boom! The strong wind tunnel was instantly divided in half and shattered. Immediately afterwards, the sword gas surged, and once again slashed towards the boundless wind. What? Feng Wuliang was taken aback and backed back again and again. Suddenly a mouthful of Saint Yuan sprayed out, and a shield flew out of his body, which was a heavenly shield. However, the sword that Qin Chen cleaved was invincible and invincible. It slashed on the shield. As soon as it went forward, with a bang, it smashed the shield of the day's rank. Then, the terrifying sword aura directly hit above the body of boundless wind. Boom! The Saint Yuan shield on Feng Wuliang's body was torn apart, trembling all over, the whole person flew up in embarrassment, puff, his robe was torn apart his face appeared pale, and there was a blood-red sword mark in his chest. Puff! A mouthful of blood spurted out, boundless wind was already injured. Qin Chen drew back and did not take advantage of the victory to pursue him. With his hands behind his back, he was graceful and sneered, I wonder if you still think I am a burden. Silence, silence in the audience. The atmosphere in the main hall was very strange. Everyone looked at Qin Chen in amazement, and suddenly stood up, with a deep shock on his face. Boundless wind was defeated, and it was in the blink of an eye, shocking the world and shining through the past. What? Boundless Feng was hit by his sword and vomited blood, what is that trick? That's amazing. If I didn't look away, the sword displayed by this child contains terrible spatial power, and there is a terrible power to wipe out the rules of the heavenly sage and this can instantly kill the boundless wind tunnel of the holy origin. It's nothing more than slaying the Sheng Yuan wind tunnel. The key is that the boundless wind's Feng Tian shield was instantly smashed into flight, too strong. Who is he? Is it the celestial arrogant cultivated by Wang Yulu? No, even celestial arrogant does not work. With half-step Tian Chen's cultivation base, he can actually repel boundless Feng although Boundless Feng was caught off guard and despised him but this is also a miracle, Saint Sun, only the Saint Sun of a mansion has this ability, no, even the ordinary Saint Child can't do it, it must be the top figure in the Saint Child, the kind who inherits the mantle of the first mansion. 
Could it be the saint son of Guanggan Mansion? Why have we never heard of it? The rest of the Gashishan sages all exclaimed again and again, and suddenly all stood up, their eyes full of shock. This Qin Chen surprised me a lot. The real Chu Shui was shocked again. He knew that Qin Chen was very strong, but he didn't expect that he could defeat Boundless Feng in one move. This demonstrated strength, at least it is a heavenly sage, not even an ordinary heavenly sage. Damn it, not this time, brat, I was too careless, come again. Boundless Feng became angry from embarrassment, his face was dull and rumbling, he was about to make another move to find his place. Stop! The other heavenly saints shouted angrily, and someone immediately stopped Boundless Wind. The wind is boundless, since it's a discussion, you can stop at it, why bother so much? One of the elders coldly said, it can be seen that this person is extraordinary, his aura is almost the same as that of the real Chu Shui, and even vaguely better, he is the leader of the many sages present. He spoke, Boundless Feng could only grit his teeth, but didn't make any more moves. If you continue to make trouble, you can only lose more. Everyone, this Qin Chen is a guest of the Wang Gu Tower. At such a young age, he can become a guest and mobilize the resources of the Wang Gu Tower. It can be seen that the origin of this sun must be extraordinary. Of course, regardless of the origin, the strength of little friend Qin Chen everyone has seen it with their own eyes, and if he joins, it will definitely bring some help to our Shengu League. Real Chu Shui said. Interestingly, Wang Gu Lu and our Shengu League are in a cooperative relationship. Since they belong to the Wang Gu Lu, they are also members of our Shengu League. That's right, our Shengu League and Wang Gu Tower have been on good terms, little friend Qin Chen, before we just tested your strength, it really is no small thing. The heavenly saints of the God and Ancient Alliance all said one after another. It is considered to have recognized Qin Chen's strength. In the heavens, the strong are respected. What kind of status and status are all imaginary? Even if it is the host of the Wangulu, the cultivation level is not good, it will be mocked by the people of the Ancient Alliance, because this is a dead spirit realm. Are all lawless ruthless people, only looking at strength, not other? Now, Qin Chen's strength has been recognized by them. Young man, since you want to cooperate with us this time, the old man agrees to your joining, but the ugly words are in the front. The ruins are very dangerous. Then you can't act recklessly. Moreover, when you encounter a strong enemy, you must obey our gods. The arrangement of the ancient league, of course, if you encounter the woman you want to find, if possible, we will rescue you, how? The old man who had prevented boundless wind said that the heavenly sage rules were very thick on his body, as if it had become a substance. No problem. Qin Chen didn't say much, and said neatly. Okay, let's go. A female celestial sage stood up and slowly exhaled, her breath tight. Qin Chen counted, there were seven heavenly sages present, plus the real person Chu Shui, plus himself, that would be eight. The eight heavenly saints are enough to command a state, and this alliance of gods and ancients is indeed no trivial matter. The eight masters of the heavenly sage level are vast and mighty, and Qin Chen is mixed in them, and he has a strange feeling. If so many heavenly sages go to the Tianyu continent, what kind of picture will it look like, it is simply a of heaven. Down to earth, unmatched. Even destroying a continent like Alien Demon Continent was easy and irresistible. It's a pity that the rules of the heavens are very powerful. It's okay to fly in the lower realm. It is very difficult to enter the lower realm from the heavens. The eight powerful masters stepped on the teleportation formation again, but before starting, everyone had reduced their aura, pretending to be just an ordinary Earth Sage realm, otherwise, the eight heavenly sage masters would go out at the same time, which can cause enough there was a huge storm. After entering the teleportation formation, Qin Chen gradually became familiar with these eight people. There are three strongest among the eight people. They are the white-haired old man named Su Feng Zhenren, 
who is the master of the early peak of Tian Sheng, followed by the woman, called Fairy Rugu, and then Chu Shui. The peak masters of the early holy stage are not inferior to the master of Yundong Guangzhou. For the remaining four people, the middle-aged man was named Feng Wu Yang, there were three others and a very delicate-looking woman named Siem Iron, and a real Gu in XIU. These four people are all in the early days of the Heavenly Sage, and they are probably similar to the cultivation bases of several major sects in Yunso, such as the Tianxu ancestor and the Tianlong real person. However, the Heavenly Sages in the Necrotic Realm had obviously experienced more killings than the Heavenly Sages in places like Yunso, so he was more murderous and had more combat experience. Once these seven people join forces, the power that erupts is absolutely terrifying. But before, Qin Chen heard them say that when the seven people joined forces, they might not have killed half of their feet and stepped into the Mid-Tian Sage Zhu Xing Tian, making Qin Chen more curious about the Mid-Tian Sage powerhouse. The eight people, together with Qin Chen, left in no time. The purpose of these seven people should be to fight for the treasures in the desolate ancient ruins, but my purpose is different from them. I can follow them first, but once we enter the desolate ancient ruins, especially into the depths, my purpose and theirs there will be conflicts, and when that happens, you have to find a way to go deeper by yourself. Qin Chen followed the crowd, but was thinking about it in secret. In the deserted ancient ruins, there are many dangers, but I have a jade disc of good fortune from the universe, there should be no problem, but the strong inside is like a cloud. If I can have the opportunity to break through to the realm of heaven, it will be even more worry-free. For Qin Chen now, the most important thing is to break through the realm of the heavenly sage. Once he enters the heavenly sage, Qin Chen believes that his cultivation level will be fully improved, and he will be fearless when the time comes. Furthermore, this ancient alliance can only cooperate for the time being, and can't put all hope in their hearts. People's hearts are unpredictable. No one can believe in them except themselves. Although Qin Chen acted with the Shengu League, he did not completely trust each other. Boom. I don't know how long it took, the formation stopped, and everyone appeared in a barren void. Arrived. Fairy Rugu licked her delicate tongue. Qin Chen raised his head and saw that a dark world appeared in front of him, and everything that came into his eyes were barren ruins, desolate and abandoned, like ancient lands and wilderness, just looking at it, there is a feeling of soul being shocked. All sorts of mysterious auras linger here, with the aura of the ancients, the ancients and the ancients, with the shocking power. The environment here is so bad that it is even worse than Yama's secret realm. If the desolate ancient ruins are really the remains of a certain tribe in ancient times, then this place was at least the dojo of a master master. Qin Chen's heart was dark, the aura here was only stronger than Yama's secret realm, but it was definitely a relic of some top power. No wonder it is so dangerous that it is regarded as a forbidden place by the people of the Necrosphere. Everyone, be careful. Entering here is equivalent to entering the desolate ancient ruins. However, this is only the periphery of the desolate ancient ruins. There is not much threat to us and the Gashishan Sage for the time being. If you want to enter the depths, you have to fly a few times. Genius. Arrivals. Real Su Feng reminded. Little friend Qin Chen, you have to be more careful. This is the first time you have come to this barren ancient ruin. There are special barren ancient powers in it. The periphery is good. Inside the barren ancient power becomes more and more intense. If ordinary earth saints rush in, fly in, not out. Within a few days, it will be torn apart by the power in the ancient ruins. Chu Shui's voice reminded. Whoosh whoosh. In the words, a group of people have rushed into the deserted ancient ruins. Sure enough, a terrifying ancient power swept over and this power was very similar to the power Qin Chen felt from the clay pot, and it was extremely domineering. So comfortable. In the deserted ancient ruins, the ancient power swept across, invaded the body of the warrior, and clashed with the celestial sage, 
but Qin Chen was shocked to find that after this wild ancient aura entered his body, he was unexpectedly comfortable. This barren ancient power is actually similar to the aura of the immortal body I cultivated in the Tianyu continent. Is there any connection between my immortal body and this barren ancient ruin? Qin Chen was taken aback. It didn't feel much just to perceive the clay pot, but after entering the barren ancient ruins, Qin Chen thoroughly discovered that this barren ancient power, capable of tempering the physical body, is in the same line as the immortal Eucharist. Although there is a slight difference, the nature of the power, but it is very similar. Hohu. <laughs> a large amount of ancient power entered the body, and was refined and absorbed by Qin Chen's body, and then began to change, merged into Qin Chen's body, and gradually changed Qin Chen's body. It should be known that Qin Chen's cultivation has reached the peak of the heavenly sage for half a step. If he wants to go further, he can only step into the realm of the heavenly sage, but now, this ridiculous ancient power is actually enhancing Qin Chen's physical strength. Originally, Qin Chen's physical body had reached an extreme after being stimulated by powers such as the thunder body of the cultivation space, the immortal body, the endemon body of the Yama demon clan, and there was no way to enter, but under this ridiculous ancient power, it was actually again started to improve. The strength of my physical body is only strong or not weak compared to the strong people at the peak of the heavenly sages early days, and it can actually be improved. Is this going against the sky? Qin Chen was shocked, and a glimmer of anticipation emerged. As a result, while flying by, he continued to absorb the wild ancient auras around him, but these wild ancient auras were absorbed very slowly, and there were many impurities in it, so the speed of improving Qin Chen's physical strength was also very slow, but Qin Chen was still surprised. At his level, any slight improvement can bring him immense help. Everyone, be careful. This time the desolate ruins have changed, and many masters from the dead spirit realm have come here. Now, in this desolate ruins, strong people gather. Even if you are on the periphery, you must be careful. An ambush by others. Real Su Feng continued to remind. Mr. Su Feng, don't be too nervous, this time we are seven walking together, who dares to ambush us? Feng Wu Yang sneered, full of arrogance. You still have to be careful. Mortal Su Feng shook his head and looked at Fairy Rugu, Fairy Rugu, are you sure that Zhu Xing Tian has entered the depths of the deserted ancient ruins? This Fairy Rugu, with a very delicate appearance, seemed to be shy. But after this conversation, Qin Chen has come to understand that this Fairy Rugu is in the ancient League of Gods, but he is extraordinary and the intelligence is very accurate, even the real Chu Shui is right. They are all a little afraid, the strong who once died in her hands are unknown, and they have a tracking technique that is very powerful. Mr. Su Feng, you still can't believe me? I have already inquired. Chu Xing Tian was indeed one of the first strong men to enter the deserted ancient ruins. He was the deserted ancient ruin that followed the young friend Qin Chen's beauty into the deserted ancient ruins. Later, the deserted ancient ruins there was a riot. Nowadays, there are endless changes in the deserted ancient ruins. We want to find the treasure in the shortest time. It is best to find Zhu Xing Tian. The place where there is him must be the core area of this riot. Fairy Rugu made a promise. Hey, just right. After we found that Zhu Xing Tian, the eight of us joined forces. If we can take this opportunity to eradicate that Zhu Xing Tian, the power of our god and ancient alliance in the necrosphere will definitely increase. Feng Wu Yang smiled coldly. Ambush Zhu Xing Tian, this matter will be discussed again, the top priority is to find the other party first. Su Feng said in a deep voice. Yes, only by finding Zhu Xing Tian. Can we find the place where the treasures in the deserted ancient ruins may really be unearthed? Moreover, little friend Qin Chen is here to find his beauty. Zhu Xing Tian broke into the deserted ancient ruins to capture little friend Qin Chen. Han Jian, so. Besides, I might be able to rescue the other party for little friend Qin Chen. True person Chu Shui also agreed. 
the deserted ancient ruins are so big, I don't know where that Ju Sing Tian is hidden. In the wild ancient ruins, the environment is harsh, and the terrain is complex and vast, and it is inaccessible. It is extremely easy to hide by the means of Ju Sing Tian. It is not easy for us to find him. The real Xiu shook his head. This real person of Ziu, Sheng Yuan is also unfathomable, his voice is like a metal knock, and his body is full of vigorous aura, like a strong cultivating external force, with an invincible momentum. Then you have to ask Qin Chen. Feng Wuliang smiled coldly, obviously still very dissatisfied with Qin Chen, and sneered, he came to find his beauty, should there be some way out? Is it possible that it depends on us? Although Arshengu League and Wangulu are cooperative. Yes, there is no obligation to find an inexplicable woman for them, right? Real Chu Shui looked at Qin Chen again, little friend Qin Chen, I wonder if you have a way to contact your confidant? Or can you give us a little help? No audio at the moment. Qin Chen shook his head. As soon as he came in, he felt it with all his strength. According to the truth, Sisi has the inheritance of the Abyssal Demon Clan. He may be able to sense that little bit, but the strange thing is that no matter how he perceives it, he can't perceive the breath of Sisi. Not saved. In general. He can only attribute this to the special atmosphere of the deserted ancient ruins, which may have shielded the Sisi atmosphere. Humph, nothing is good. Feng Wuliang snorted coldly. Okay, don't say anything. Fairy Rugu smiled charmingly, will this fairy be unprepared? She lifted her right hand and suddenly took out a compass, this is a penal table specially made by this fairy, last time Ju Sing Tian fought against the Lord of the Leader, although the Lord of the Leader suffered more injuries than Ju Sing Tian, he was in retreat and was unable to go out of the mountain. However, he also left a blood of Ju Sing Tian, and this Sing Tian pan was made by using a drop of the blood of Ju Sing Tian. As long as there is a breath of Ju Sing Tian, you can find his approximate position, even if he is in the depths of the endless void, you can also find the square. Bit. As soon as the Sing Tin pan was taken out, a pointer on it spun around, finally pointing to a certain direction in the southwest, shaking constantly. In this direction, there can be nothing wrong. Go. Everyone flew up and flew towards the depths of the deserted ancient ruins. Qin Chen felt the wild and ancient aura passing by, constantly absorbing it, and his soul power diffused, searching for changes in the surroundings. Vaguely, Qin Chen felt that there were horrible auras hidden in this barren ancient ruin, which made people feel gloomy. Suddenly, Qin Chen noticed that a violent force flashed by in the ruins below his body. Boom! The next moment, a terrifying monster soared into the sky, resembling humans and non-humans, beasts and non-beasts, surging with the aura of ancient times, rushing toward Qin Chen's eight people. Naughty animal, die! The real person Zio made a strong shot, rumbling, and there seemed to be a mountain between the heavens and the earth and it hit the monster with a bang. The monster was hit, his whole body split, and he screamed, but he didn't die. Hey, real person Ziu, let me take action. At this moment, the strange and extremely weird real person Gu suddenly grinned, and suddenly a black wind flew out of his body. No, no, this is not a yin wind, but composed of tiny insects like sand. These bugs wrapped the monster all at once. Russell. As if the sound of nibbling mulberry leaves sounded, the monster let out a scream, and then was instantly swallowed into ashes and turned into nothingness. Call. Countless black sand like goo worms entered the body of real goo, and he exhaled, as if he were very relaxed, and there seemed to be black lines wandering under his skin, which was extremely terrifying. Little friend Qin Chen, this is Master Goo's natal stone worm. It can swallow blood and is very scary. Are you not scared? Master Chu Shui said with a smile. Master Gu seemed to sense the voice of Master Chu Shui, turned his head and glanced at Qin Chen, his eyes were pale, gloomy, extremely cold, without any emotion. 
After the monster was swallowed, it turned into nothingness, and only a dark brown stone remained in the void, which looked like a rock, not a stone, like a crystal, and was ugly and ugly. Snapped. This stone was ingested by the real person Su Feng, he glanced at it, and then put it aside, an ancient waste stone is useless. Go. Everyone continued on. Seeing this, Qin Chen hurriedly picked up the stone, and then followed. This stone is very ugly, with sharp edges and corners, and a rough surface. It contains a wave of violent aura power, which is more powerful and violent than the aura in the ancient ruins, but this power is completely different from the Saint Yuan in the Saint's body. Do not. Same, and incompatible. Little friend Qin Chen, the monsters before were only unique in this deserted ancient ruin. In the realm of dead spirits, everyone called these monsters the deserted ancient tribe, because these monsters are neither like humans nor monsters, let alone the demons are very weird. Chu Shui explained, moreover, they all have this kind of ancient in their bodies, large or small, strong or weak, but even the weakest cannot be swallowed by the warrior. There was once a heavenly saint who forcibly wanted to refine one of them. The abandoned ancient waste stones, as a result, went directly to the devil, exploded and died. From now on, no one cares about these stones. The weird thing is that after these desolate and ancient waste rocks were abandoned, they gradually turned into ashes and merged into this desolate ancient ruin. Perhaps the countless desolate ancient atmosphere in this desolate ancient ruin has not dissipated for countless years because of these desolate ancient waste rocks. Add it. No wonder the people of the Shengu League don't care about this ancient waste rock at all. Qin Chen looked at the abandoned ancient waste stone in his hand and absorbed it slightly. Suddenly, a violent aura poured into Qin Chen's body. He snapped, the ancient waste stone burst open, and an ancient force in it strengthened Qin Chen's body. There is also an overriding. The violent air above almost destroyed Qin Chen's soul will. In Qin Chen's mind, there was nowhere to scream and roar. Not good. Qin Chen was shocked, the heavenly soul forbidden technique was used, and finally he refined this violent gas, and the suppression was dissipated, and he was scared into a cold sweat. Fortunately, no one cares about his actions here. The terrifying and violent atmosphere in this ancient waste rock. Qin Chen inhaled air conditioning. No wonder there was a heavenly sage expert who went directly to the devil, exploded and died. At that moment, if he hadn't practiced the heavenly soul forbidden technique, he would have fallen into a violent rage and couldn't restrain himself. Why is there such a violent aura in the bodies of these ancient people? Qin Chen was puzzled, but couldn't understand the reason. Flying all the way, in addition to these concealed ancient monsters, Qin Chen could still feel that there are many ancient holy veins flowing deep beneath the deserted ancient ruins, but these are the holy veins of mortal rank, and some even even rank. None at all. Impure, all contaminated by the aura of waste and ancient times. After these ancient mortal veins are taken out, they can be cultivated for the mortal and even the earthly sages, but the aura inside is too mottled, not to mention the aura of the ancients, and the martial artist wants to refine, not only cannot improve his cultivation level, but to xin xin. To waste power to purify, the gain is not worth the loss. That's why no one pays attention. Oh 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 oh. At this moment, suddenly in the distance of the ruins, the sky suddenly darkened, a black storm swept over the vast world, countless gravels were rolled up in the valley, like a wind demon, roaring. Countless voids were cut into fragmented. In the shattered layered space, Qin Chen felt a sense of destruction of heaven and earth in an instant. Be careful, this is an annihilation storm, half step Tian Sheng encounters, you will be strangled in it instantly, Tian Sheng strong will also be injured, everyone landed, temporarily avoiding the edge. Su Feng real person moved, displayed mana, and landed reach the ruins and try to be steady. Fixed body. Qin Chen also landed, only feeling difficult to move, surrounded by storms and gravel, every wind wave is more ferocious than the sword aura of the saint, 
especially the ancient aura contained in it, which can even break the law of heaven. It is the violent natural force of heaven and earth. It is true that he cannot be allowed to grow. This time we have a chance. We will kill him and not give him a chance to break through. The real Su Feng said solemnly. It's getting stronger and stronger, you see, isn't the ancient city in front of it? Is Ju Sing Tian hidden in the ancient city? It's really a barren ancient city, but isn't the barren ancient city completely scrapped a long time ago, has no vitality? Why is it like it has recovered now? Could it be that the resurrection of this desolate ancient capital caused the abnormal changes of the desolate ancient ruins? The root is in the city. The real Chu Shui and others were shocked. Sure enough, following Zhu Sing Tian can find the place where the desolate ancient ruins have changed. Inexplicably, Qin Chen's heart also had some horror. Is Sisi here? Otherwise, what's the feeling in my heart? Looking down, this is a huge and deserted ancient city, with ruins everywhere. I don't know how many billions of miles there are. The ancient city has been eroded by wind and sand everywhere, but I can still feel the glory of the ancients in the past. Shocking the ages, the idea that cannot be obliterated is hidden in it. This city was built in very different styles, obviously not built by humans, and left over from ancient times. The real person Su Feng stabilized his figure, stayed in the air, and waved his hand, each hides aura, and the ancient city contains many mysteries. It is the only ancient city in the ancient ruins that has been preserved. For countless years, I don't know how many strong people have been there. Some were buried in it, some got some treasures and left, and they were truly barren countless years ago. It is unexpected that they will recover again. Is it true that there are rumors that there are no treasures found here? This, isn't the aura here very similar to the altar aura shown in the clay pot before? Qin Chen felt everything about this ancient city, and he felt familiar with the altar atmosphere he had felt from the clay pot before. So, the phantom of the altar seen in the clay pot is in this city? Moreover, the altar was nothing. Qin Chen had a faint throbbing. This throbbing was very similar to the throbbing that he had searched for Sisi in the land of the abyssal demon. It was a kind of breath resonance. Sisi must be here. Qin Chen's body trembled, but he just felt the throbbing, but he couldn't perceive where the breath came from. Don't get excited. Since the Ju Sing Tian is tracking Sisi here, then Sisi must be in this ancient city. As long as you find the Ju Sing Tian, you can find Sisi. Qin Chen calmed down his excitement. No matter whether the Shengu League dared to find Zhu Xing Tian, Qin Chen would definitely find it. Attention, everyone, that Zhu Xing Tian, so in this desolate ancient city, we now hide in to see if there is a good opportunity. Once there is a chance, we will set up an array of destroying the sky, attack the opponent, and give him a fatal blow. Let him lose the opportunity to break through, even beheaded here. The body of the real Su Feng tightened, like a beast catching prey, and the breath on his body was perfectly hidden. Whoosh whoosh! Eight people flew into the deserted ancient capital one after another. Qin Chen's speed is the most silent, like the son of space, even if it is the real person Su Feng and others, it is not a combination of breath, and he can't tell his whereabouts. Everyone was shocked, secretly shocked. Qin Chen cautiously felt the aura in the desolate ancient city with the clay pot. Suddenly, his body shook and vaguely felt that there was a feminine charm in the depths of the desolate ancient city. This breath seemed to be transformed into a person's appearance, lifelike, but her face was not clear, she was a woman with fluttering clothes, gentle and charming, while walking, all beings were sinking into her eyes. What kind of woman is this? Qin Chen was taken aback. How could he see the shadow of such a woman in this barren ancient city, and this woman is definitely not Chen Sisi, that kind of enchanting aura almost made him sink into her eyes, unable to extricate himself. This ancient city is weird. Everyone shuttled in the desolate ancient city and entered the city, as if entering a maze, with broken walls and broken columns everywhere, 
piles of rubble, broken halls and even some incomplete ancient idols. However, they have lost their power. There is no rule, that is, the material is relatively strong, but it is gradually weathered. Occasionally, among the broken walls and columns, there are weathered bones. Among them, the bones of the earth saints have long been turned into ashes. The ones that can stay are at least half-step heavenly saints, and some heavenly saints. Yes, but on many bones, even a trace of the heavenly sacred law cannot be found, and the ancient aura in the ancient capital is extremely strong, enough to obliterate all the power of the law. Strange? Why did the breath of Ju Sing Tian suddenly become weak? It seems to be leaving this ancient city. The Sing Tin Pan in Fairy Rugu's hand suddenly oscillated a little. Chase. The speed of the crowd accelerated again. Just ahead. The speed of Sing Tin Pan changed again, shaking violently. When everyone descended and reached a quaint hall with a radius of thousands of miles, suddenly the Sing Tin Pan exploded, as if it had reached the limit that it could bear. At this time, Everyone saw that in the depths of the main hall stood a man with long eyebrows wearing white clothes. This man was handsome and aged between young and middle-aged. He was very elegant and gentle. He stood in the hall with his hands behind his back, like a literati who was constructing a poem. He couldn't tell that he was a violent warrior, with such a fierce reputation in the dead soul realm. Jun Sing Tian The real person Su Feng roared in shock his eyes solemn. Everyone from the Shengu League, you have been following me all the way for so long. It's been a lot of hard work. Come, why don't you take a good rest here? The man in white, facing Qin Chen and others on his side, had long been waiting for the crowd for a long time, and everything was clear. Qin Chen's heart suddenly felt like something bad happened. The seven deputy leaders of the Shengu League also stopped their expressions uncertain, and they seemed to feel that the atmosphere was not right. Ju Sing Tian, why are you here? Why are you tracking you? We don't understand. Our gods and ancient alliances are here to investigate the abnormal changes in this desolate ancient city. There is nothing to say between you and me, since you here, we won't bother. Real Su Feng's eyes condensed, and he felt a little retreating. Ha ha ha. Real Su Feng, do you think I am a three-year-old kid? Ju Sing Tian turned around, his demeanor was quite handsome, and he couldn't see that he was a lawless fierce. His eyes swept across Qin Chen's eight people one by one, and those eyes were like sharp swords, slashing fiercely at everyone, as if to penetrate everyone's body, invisible. The League of Gods and Ancients Ju Sing Tian shook his head, I really can see me. The seven heavenly saints were dispatched at once. The method is indeed tyrannical, but what the is another half-step heavenly saint among you? In order to hunt down me, the gods and ancient alliances even this kind of ants. The general goods are dispatched. How much hatred is this against me? He said indifferently, there was a faint gold in his eyes, and finally fell on Qin Chen, piercing through it up and down, making Qin Chen's cultivation level clear. Thinking that the ancient alliance of gods actually sent a half-step heavenly saint in order to chase him down, he really wanted to laugh out loud. This kind of character can kill a dozen with a finger, which is simply funny. Ju Sing Tian, you really misunderstood. We didn't come here specifically to find you, but just passed by accidentally. But this kid, indeed came to you specially, do you still remember the charming woman you wanted to capture? Qin Chen's beauty. Boundless wind said suddenly. The wind is boundless. The real Chu Shui looked at him angrily. Oh. Zhu Zingdian's eyes suddenly burst out with a sharp light, falling on Qin Chen, squinting his eyes. Qin Chen looked indifferent, took a step forward, and said coldly, Yes, Zhu Xingtian, Ben Shao Qin Chen is not a warrior in the dead spirit realm. However, the woman you chased and killed was Ben Shao's woman. She is now where? Your girl. Zhu Sing Tian smiled, with indifference and killing intent in her smile, a half-step Tian sage's trash, dare to be mad in front of me? 
How can your kid, Hode, be worthy of that class? A beautiful person? However, your courage is a little bit, a small half step Tian Sheng. How dare to speak to me like this, compared to the hypocritical trash of the gods and ancient alliance, I don't know how much better. Ju Xing Tian, you are too much, do you really think that my god and ancient alliance is afraid of you? Su Feng real person said angrily, taking a step forward, and there was a terrible holy Yuan on his body. Boom! Behind the real Su Feng, other people also surged with terrible murderous intent, faintly forming a terrible battle formation. However, everyone seemed to be fighting, but in fact, the Saint Yuan inside the body was circulating, as long as there was something wrong, they would immediately flee. Relying on their intuition, they all felt that today's situation seemed to be something wrong, and Zhu Xing Tian actually knew that they were coming and seemed to be waiting in this hall. Qin Chen, the situation is not good, this Zhu Xing Tian seems to have been prepared for a long time, and I may not take care of you in the future. I have the opportunity to run away. Even if you want to save people, you must save yourself first. The person Xing Tian is targeting, your girl. People. I'm afraid it has become more ill-fortuned. True person Kia Shui secretly transmitted Qin Chen with tension and sigh in his tone. Ha ha ha, just rely on a few of you. Today, the seven of you are here, then you will be left. This seat is just about to break through the middle stage of the heavenly sage, and there is still a little strength. Your gods and ancient alliances sent seven at once, just become our ration. Boom. This Ju Xing Tian shot. Facing the seven great heavenly sages of the gods and ancients alliance and Qin Chen, this elegant man in white, Ju Xing Tian, even dared to attack first. How domineering and mighty is this to force eight people with one person? But Qin Chen didn't feel that the other party was arrogant, because the other party's power was displayed, and it was so shocking that there was no way to describe it in words. Hum. Ju Xing Tian punched out, and countless qi bursts behind him, as if punishment from the heavens had come, so he called Xing Tian. The void in front of Qin Chen's eyes changed, as if the light of an axe in charge of punishment appeared, swept out and enveloped up the whole main hall. This elegant man scheming against the sky was like moving a celestial execution ground to this hall. Not only Qin Chen, but even the seven great heavenly sages of the gods and ancients league, everyone has the illusion that they will be executed on the spot when they are taken away from the desolate ancient ruins and suddenly come to the blood-stained execution ground. This feeling is so real and beyond words. Be careful, everyone, this is the celestial punishment of Zhu Xing Tian. Reversing the void can create an independent space, become the penalty holder in this space, and take control of our life and death. Hurry up and set up the great destruction array. The real person Su Feng roared frantically, hum, a terrible breath surged out of his body, which were runes, and the runes wandered around, turning into sky pillars. At the same time, true person Chu Shui, Fairy Rugu, Beauty Xiat, True Wind, true person Ziu, true person Gu, and the other six heavenly sages, all of them showed strange runes. These rune cultures are Tianzu, and on the real Su Feng. The combination of the runes finally shrouded in an endless array, and the celestial execution ground created by Zhu Xing Tian suddenly shook, rumbling, and at the same time trapped the opponent in the center of the great extinguishing array. Okay, starting from the great extinguishing array, looking at how arrogant Zhu Xing Tian is, this is a large formation that our god and ancient alliance has specially researched to deal with this Zhu Xing Tian. It is designed to break his Xing Tian power. What we are waiting for is this moment. The real person Su Feng roared and urged Saint Yuan, the countless Tianzu large array, constantly turning, suddenly broke out with terrible strangulation power, breaking the heaven execution ground of Zhu Xing Tian violently. This is the killing array that the gods and ancients have worked hard to study specifically to deal with Zhu Xing Tian. Now, the seven great heavenly lords have joined forces to restrain Zhu Xing Tian's breath. I don't know if Zhu Xing Tian can't take it down. Qin Chen didn't take a rush, 
but backed quietly, watching the changes. Kill. The seven deputy leaders of the Shengu League, the Heavenly Sage, the Holy Yuan urged to the extreme, and suddenly turned into a mighty force like the sky, swept down, and with thousands of swords and swords, it is necessary to trap this extinction heaven to death in the sky destruction formation. In. However, at this time, Qin Chen saw that a faint smile appeared on the corner of the white-clothed elegant man Zhu Zingtian's mouth. No, you guys, be careful and get back. Qin Chen roared, and directly hit the Zhu Zingtian with a killing fist. The horrible fist turned into a legendary torrent and directly killed the opponent's head. Break it for me. Zhu Zingtian yelled coldly, between his eyebrows, a flash of murderous intent and a huge picture appeared from the ground. In this picture, it seemed to contain a world, evolving countless battle formations, and turned into a dense array the rainbow light, soaring into the sky, will extinct the sky. Wrapped suddenly. Bang bang bang. On the spot, the countless auras and patterns of the great sky extinguishing array were shattered one after another, and they were torn apart at once. Keng Yuan too. Real Su Feng was taken aback and hurriedly backed away. That horror picture scroll is another top powerhouse in the dead soul realm, the top treasure of Jing He real person. And this real Jing He person is also the enemy of their Shengu League. The Jing He Daowen under his control has been hostile to the Shengu League, but when did this Keng Yuan to reach Zhu Xing Tian's hands? Amidst the real anger of Su Feng, a loud laugh suddenly sounded. Yes. It's Keng Yuan Tuesday. Next to Zhu Xingtian, there was another man of the same kind, dressed in grey, who was another real enemy of Shengu League, Jing Hu. Zhu Xingtian, you said that this time the God and Ancient Alliance will seize the opportunity to come here to count on you. We didn't believe it before, but we didn't expect this God and Ancient Alliance to be so bold. Also, you were hurt by fighting against the God and Ancient Alliance. Coupled with the desolate and ancient ruins, how could the gods and ancient alliances miss such a good opportunity, but the gods and ancient alliances don't know, we anticipated the enemy's first opportunity and set up an ambush first, ha ha ha. It takes all the time. The grey-clothed man in Jinghu laughed loudly, as long as we kill these heavenly saints of the ancient alliance, then the ancient alliance will be greatly injured, and we will plunder their treasures and origins to communicate with the gods. Breaking through the middle stage of the celestial rank is enough to completely destroy the ancient alliance. The voice of the real Jinghu is very young, but the aura on his body is strong and terrifying, like Wang Yang, he is a top powerhouse who is not weaker than Zhu Xing Tian. Yes, the seven heavenly sages also caught the three big fishes, the real person Su Feng, the real person Chu Shui, and the fairy Rugu, and killed them. The ancient gods have lost their left and right arms. Wouldn't they be handled by us? There was another loud laughter. This was an old man in black, appeared beside Keng Yuantu, staring at Qin Chen, but, this little guy, what's the matter with half-step heavenly sage? The Shengu League looks down on brother Xing Tian so much? Let a waste come to die. The black-clothed old man was full of ridicule in his tone obviously full of confidence and confidence. This time the three of us joined forces, enough to cross this place and kill everyone in the ancient alliance. But Zhu Xing Tian, I heard that you are the ridiculous capital that tracked the enchanting woman into the ancient city. This woman is rumored to be extremely charming, it is possible it's a natural charming body, Tusk, my empty old man has played with thousands of women in this life but I haven't played a natural charming body yet. Then I found the charming girl in this wild city, don't forget. Let the old man play around too, quack. The black-clothed old man laughed excitedly, his tongue licking a mouthful of yellow teeth, extremely wretched. But the breath on his body is vast into the ocean, and he is a powerful man who is no weaker than the real person in Jinghu. No one dares to regard him as a wretched old man. The elegant white man Zhu Xing Tian, the grey man Jing He real person, and the black old man empty old man, the top powers of the three dead souls, appeared at the same time, all of them were earth-shaking and shocking, 
which can be described as terrifying. How is this going? Real person Su Feng saw this scene, his shocked soul was almost gone, a chill from the top of his head reached the sole of his feet, and there were dense goosebumps all over his body, and he couldn't believe his eyes. Ju Xing Tian, Jing Hu Zhenren, and the empty old man, these three are all enemies of the Shengu League, when did they all unite? Three top powers, plus a heavenly treasure, King Yuan Tu. Quick back and go. The real person Su Feng immediately let out a sharp roar of anger, and he didn't even have the courage to make a move. Want to leave now? How naive. The real Jing Hu sneered, and took a picture of King Yuan Tu, buzzing, the vast picture scroll, as if containing a world, suddenly soaring, sweeping the entire hall. Suddenly, everyone present was wrapped in the vast picture scroll, and everyone urged Sheng Yuan, violently roaring and shaking, but they could not tear the slightest space and were completely trapped here. Kang Yuan too is a heavenly treasure, and, under the urging of the three of us, it contains the might of one world. It is weird if you can escape, quack, we tried our best to catch you a few big fish, let you run away, what shall we eat? The empty old man in black smiled grinningly, today, the three of us joined forces to destroy your gods and ancient alliances, eradicate a major enemy, obediently become our nourishment, and help us achieve the middle stage of the sage. Damn it, we got it. Many powerhouses in the Shengu League have blue faces, their eyelids beating wildly, and their hearts sink completely, knowing how bad things are. Humph, there are only three of them. I'm all a heavenly sage. I can't beat them. Can't I still run away? The only trouble is this Kang Xian Tu, but this Kang Yuan Tu is a heavenly treasure. The three of them it can't be completely urged, otherwise, would it be necessary to design ambush here? I have already swept our god and ancient league. Don't be scared by their bravado. The eight of us join forces and are afraid of him. Real Su Feng roared, pinched a treasure in secret, and shouted loudly. Is it? Ju Xing Tian suddenly moved his body and grinned and killed him. He burst out and reached out with his big hands. Suddenly, a terrifying claw covered the sky and covered the sun, just like a drew out his claws from the sky. It takes almost no time, blinking. In time, he came to the real person Su Feng. Mr. Su Feng, you are the leader of the many deputy leaders of the ancient god alliance. Kill you first and see how others resist. In a sneer, the big hand came directly to the head of real person Su Feng. Not good. Real Su Feng was taken aback, and the treasure he was holding in his hand appeared in front of him. It was a treasure like a mountain, somewhat similar to the Fantian seal that Qin Chen displayed on the Tianyu continent. This mountain suddenly swelled with golden light. Sweep out, resists Yang Ju Xing Tian. Ha ha ha, Mr. Su Feng, don't make senseless resistance. You Jinchen seal can stop others, but you can't stop me. It's almost the same as you are the master of the ancient gods. King Dang. Destroying the mountain and cracking the stone, Ju Xing Tian's big hand pressed down, the golden mountain trembled crazily, and the golden runes circulating on it continued to explode, rumbled, and then blew out with a violent tremor. Boom! The next moment, the terrifying palm power fell on the body of the real person Su Feng, and the real person Su Feng snorted, his face turned pale, thanks to the resistance of Jin Chen Yin, otherwise he would be crushed by this blow. Amidst anger, he hurriedly backed away, but Ju Xing Tian gave him a chance to back down, a roar, murderous intent, and the power of terrifying punishment soaring into the sky, like a battle axe. What? The real person Su Feng suddenly let out a scream, his chest seemed to be smashed by an invisible giant axe, a mist burst out, the bones shattered, and the whole person flew out, opening his mouth and blood spurting wildly. The strength of the real person Su Feng is the peak of the early days of the heavenly sage, not weaker than the light of the cloud, but the white-clothed elegant man Ju Xing Tian is a strong half-footed into the middle of the heavenly sage, and is still in the home court of Kang Yuan, under the shot, where is the real Su Feng opponent? One strike. 
mortal Su Feng was seriously injured and embarrassed. The real Su Feng. All the heavenly sages, the remaining six strong men, all uttered in horror, shocked. When everyone saw that Su Feng was in danger, they immediately took action. At the moment of the crisis, they all spurred the strongest attack and killed them like crazy. The autumn water stretches. The gods are soft and soft. Natural stone goo worm. Endless wind tunnel. Scorpion blow. Da Yu Jen Ri. Oh oh oh. In the main hall, the gusty wind roars, the sky is full of goo worms, and there are endless black wind tunnels, boundless autumn water mood, and various violent attacks. They are endlessly attacking and killing the three top powers of Ju Sing Tian. The gathering of the sacred elements became a lore, overwhelming the sky, and a lot of vitality was exploded into chaos in the sky, a vast expanse. Kill. The other real people in Jinghu and the empty old man also shot, booming, the two powerhouses are mighty, and the terrible heavenly law is surging on their bodies. The breath of that law is like a sea like a sea, powerful, and violent shocks occur everywhere. Facing the seven great heavenly sages and Qin Chen, the killer was pained. Suddenly, the holy Yuan permeated, beset on all sides. Bang bang bang! Master Gu released a sky full of goo worms, countless black wind tunnels, banging and banging, and being constantly destroyed under the attack of the three great powerhouses of Ju Sing Tian. Boom! One of the power rushed directly to Qin Chen, it was the real Jing Hu. This holy Yuan, mighty and mighty, as strong as a Tianzu, instantly descended in front of Qin Chen. Broke in. Qin Chen drank coldly, the Saint Yuan surging in his body, a strong punch, booming, two forces colliding, Qin Chen only felt an incomparable terrifying force impacted, Kaka, his body, bones vibrated, the tiger, leopard and dragon chanted, and the muscle texture constantly fluctuated. Boom! Amid the roar, Qin Chen was shocked and flew out hundreds of feet. What a powerful power, is this a strong one who has half-footed into the midst of heavenly sage? Qin Chen's eyes were dignified. The strength of this real Jinghu is indeed much stronger than that of Yun Dong Guang. Perhaps above the concentration of Saint Yuan, the two are not much different, but in terms of strength, there is a surprising difference. In the Yuan dynasty, there is a mighty destructive power, this kind of power surpasses the warriors at the peak of the ordinary heavenly sages initial stage, and contains the more powerful rules of the heavens. Although this power was only a trace, it was mighty and unparalleled, making the attack performed by the real Jinghu man more powerful than the heavenly sage powerhouse at the initial peak. If it weren't for Qin Chen's physical body to be transcendent into the sacred, and he was promoted in the ancient ruins, he would be seriously injured if he was replaced by a powerful person like Yun Dong Guang, who was the first peak of Heavenly Sage. This is, the mid-term power of the Heavenly Sage, it is more pure, and it has been comprehensively improved in terms of the sacred origin and the law. Qin Chen carefully sensed the power in it and analyzed it. Hey! This kid actually blocked my move, nothing happened. Master Jinghu stared at Qin Chen, revealing incredible light. Then, he grinned and leaped forward. Kill. Boom. The real person Jinghu stared at Qin Chen with all his strength and urged the power of Kang Yuan to. Suddenly, the boundless and terrifying space binding power swept over. Together with the real person Jinghu's attack, it was obvious that Qin Chen was killed in the first place. Here. No. Everyone is trapped in the Kang Yuan map now. If it's just a real person in Jinghu, or a person from Ju Sing Tian, there may be a possibility of fighting, and I am not afraid. But now, the three powerful men are joining forces. True person Chu Shui can't resist them at all. I'm afraid they will be beheaded one by one if they don't produce a half Zhu incense. At that time, I will face the three powers alone and if I am bound by this Kang Yuan too, I am afraid it will be dangerous. The most urgent task is to break the shackles of the Kang Yuan too. When the time comes, the seven great heavenly saints will be enough to deal with any of the three. 
with oneself on the side, it may not be possible to resist the other. Thinking of this, Qin Chen's eyes suddenly condensed. Everyone, we are not the opponents of these three powerhouses, so let's break this King Yuan map first. At this critical moment of survival, Qin Chen didn't care about keeping it, and suddenly roared, urging the universe to make the jade disc, hum, suddenly, in the void, the universe of making jade disc camouflaged by the ten thousand pirates cave appeared, exuding mighty power space power. At the same time, the nameless sword appeared in Qin Chen's hand, and his whole body revolved, cleaving the strongest sword. Boom! Qin Chen's body suddenly rose up, like a king, using the jade disc of Qin Chen's good fortune to shake off the attack of the real person in Jinghu. Under the urge of Qin Chen, the jade disc of Qin Chen's good fortune roared, and suddenly moved the picture in Kang Yuan. Space forces exploded. After that, Qin Chen brazenly cleaved the sharp sword in his hand, and under the power of origin, like a violent slash of the gods, with one sword, the space barrier of Kang Yuan too was torn apart. The outside air suddenly poured back. You guys, leave quickly. Only by leaving the shackles of Kang Yuan too will it be possible to defeat them. As Qin Chen roared, he rushed out first. What? The seven great heavenly sages such as the real person Su Feng, the real person Qia Shui, and the fairy Rugu saw Qin Chen suppressing the world and breaking the Kang Yuan map, and suddenly felt the body loosened, and their faces showed incredible expressions. They were all dumbfounded with surprise. They thought they were bound to die, but they didn't expect that Qin Chen would break the Kang Yuan too at the last moment. Good chance. The real person Su Feng and others are also world-famous heavenly sages, top powerhouses and extremely rich combat experience. In an instant, each burns lifespan, explodes blood and booms. The seven people join forces to form a battle formation. At the moment that he didn't react, he rushed out of the King Yuan Tu and returned to the hall again. Suddenly, the breath of the desolate ancient ruins poured down, and everyone felt extremely comfortable. Everyone, a good opportunity, real person Su Feng, you should have the ancient void-breaking talisman on your body, let's quickly cast the space jump technique, form a big formation, use the void-breaking talisman, and leave here. As soon as he appeared in the hall, Boundless Feng hurriedly spread the voice. Yes, cast the air-breaking talisman. No need to remind the wind, the real person Su Feng also thought of this and suddenly a simple rune appeared in his hand. The rune burst into an astonishing atmosphere of space. Suddenly, an invisible spatial force enveloped the seven people, in the light, several members of the Shengu League performed the space jumping technique together. Suddenly, the seven people combined and connected into a hole, wrapped in the power of space, they were about to jump out of here. This void-breaking talisman was obtained from the ancient relics of a certain dead soul realm by their gods and ancient alliances. It can instantly break through the void of the heavens and transport people away. It is a heavenly treasure, a heaven-defying treasure used to escape. This is also where the seven of them dared to break into the ancient ruins. Once activated, the Midtian Sage powerhouse could not stop it. However, because they were in the heavenly grade supreme treasure Kang Yuan map before, the space was restricted and they could not be displayed. Now they can escape. The Kang Yuan 2 is undoubtedly the best opportunity. Several people turned into phantoms, and when the power of space came, they had to teleport away. Mr. Su Feng, wait a minute, Qin Chen hasn't come in yet. True person Chu Shui said suddenly anxiously. Qin Chen, Come in quickly. He spoke to Qin Chen anxiously. Hey? The technique of space teleportation. Qin Chen heard the sound transmission and looked in a hurry. He saw the scene of real person Su Feng displaying the void breaking talisman. He was shocked that several people from the ancient alliance of the gods were about to leave here. But also, facing the three powerhouses of Zhu Xing Tian, the seven sub-leaders of the Shengu League are completely powerless. No, I can't go. Qin Chen shook his head, the people of the ancient alliance of gods could leave, 
but what should Sissi do when he leaves? He hasn't found Sissi yet. Who knows where he will be teleported to with this void-breaking talisman? When he comes back, what if Sissi is found and captured by the Ju Sing Tian trio? Just before he hesitated. Boom. The hall was trembling, and the endless roar enveloped. Ju Sing Tian and the three people were frightened and furiously killed out of the Keng Yuan map. Qin Chen. Real Chu Shui said anxiously. Mr. Su Feng, hurry up and move the Po Kong talisman, otherwise it will be too late. Feng Wu Yang said anxiously, Qin Chen's life and death, he was too lazy to care about Qin Chen's death here. Mr. Su Feng, Qin Chen is the guest of eternal building. If he dies in the realm of the dead, how can our god and ancient alliance explain to eternal building? Mr. Chu Shui still wants to fight for it. Mr. Su Feng, what about the Wang Gu Tower? They are only cooperating with our god and ancient alliance. Are we all going to die here for their people? Feng Wu Yang said angrily. There was a hint of intolerance in the eyes of the real Su Feng, but he gritted his teeth in the end. Go. He did not hesitate to urge the Po Kong talisman, and at the same time screamed, Qin Chen, a good man, loyal enough, as long as you do not die, my and ancient alliance will inherit your love, you are our great benefactor, and the future can become a great figure in the heavens. While roaring wildly, the real person Su Feng suddenly burned his life, rushed violently, and the air-breaking talisman suddenly glowed, enveloping the other heavenly saints, and all shuttled out. Fairy Rugu also had a trace of unbearable on their faces. Qin Chen broke the Keng Yuan too forcefully and let them escape, but they directly urged the Po Kong talisman to leave here, naturally with a trace of guilt in their hearts. But in the heavens, that's the case. If they don't leave, they will die here. Compared to their own lives, the guilt, reputation, and accusations of the eternal building are not important. Only if you are alive, there is hope. As for Qin Chen, everyone sighed and shook their heads. Everyone knew that Qin Chen, as a half-step heavenly sage, had absolutely no possibility of surviving under the attack of the three great powerhouses of Zhu Xing Tian and Kang Suantu. As real person Su Feng said, if Qin Chen really wants to survive and not die, it is undoubtedly a gift to the seven of them to recreate, and he is also a great benefactor of the gods and ancient alliance. Moreover, Qin Chen can survive from the hands of the three great powers and become a big man in the heavens, that's a matter of time. If it weren't for Qin Chen to break the Kang Yuan map and give them a chance to escape, all seven of them would die here. It would be an incalculable loss to the Shengu League and the entire Shengu League might fall apart. Hum. Shuttle through the void, the seven heavenly sages suddenly entered the void, escaped from the deserted ancient ruins, and traveled through desperately. The seven people united together and used the technique of space jumping. Each of them burned their life madly. Countless spaces. Just for a moment, the seven powerhouses didn't know where they had escaped. Mr. Su Feng. What shall we do next? Bang! For a long time, the power of the void breaking talisman was exhausted, and the seven were all shaken out of the void. All of their faces were pale, covered in blood, and looked at each other, bitter. No one would have thought that this trip to the deserted ancient ruins would be a good one. This way ended. Looking around, they have come to the edge of the deserted ancient ruins, traversing thousands of miles. The price is the burning lifespan of countless people, and an ancient sky-breaking talisman with the top celestial rank. Don't do anything, anyhow, we have survived, and we also know that the three powerhouses of Zhu Xing Tian have united unexpectedly, and they want to take advantage of the abnormal movement of the barren ruins to break through the middle of the heavens. Such strength is not what we can if you are killed, you must return to the Alliance as soon as possible and inform the Lord, otherwise. Our god and ancient alliance will face the disaster of destruction next. Su Feng is truly human. What about Qin Chen? Chu Shui's face was bitter. Qin Chen is dead, there is absolutely no chance of surviving, hey, he has saved our life, if it weren't for him, we would all have died here. 
how can we compensate? What else to make up? Feng Wuliang sneered. It is he himself who is going to come to the deserted ruins to save his girlfriend. Now he is dead here. There is no way. It is not something we can decide. I think we can pass the news. For Wang Gulu, isn't Qin Chen from Wang Gulu? Tell Wang Gulu that Zhu Xing Tian III killed him. He wants to have a real position in Wang Gulu. Maybe if Wang Gulu is furious, he will send a master to kill him. It's not necessarily the case that Xing Tian is killed. Hey, this is a good idea. Now Zhu Xing Tian and the three of us have joined forces. Our god and ancient league cannot be resisted by all means, but Wang Gu building can definitely be carried down. You can use the masters of Wang Gu building to eliminate Xing Tian and them. His eyes brightened. Never, if Wang Gu Lu is really willing to send a master to come, it means that Qin Chen's position in Wang Gu Lu is extraordinary. Now that people are dying in our dead soul realm, Wang Gu Lu will definitely not let it go. We. What can we do then? This is an unchangeable fact, let's go, now it's useless to say anything. First go back to the ancient alliance, tell the news to the leader, and then make a decision. Yes, get out of here quickly, otherwise the Zhu Xing Tian trio will kill Qin Chen and follow us, and we will be in danger. Go. The seven great heavenly sages left one after another, disappearing into the deserted ancient ruins again. In the hall. Boom. After the seven powerhouses of the ancient alliance of gods left, Qin Chen's body shook, and immediately rushed out of the hall with the jade disc wrapped in the universe. He didn't want to escape from the desolate ancient city, but went directly to the bottom of the desolate ancient city to hide. Qin Chen had already figured it out. After the seven masters of the ancient god league left, it was extremely difficult for him to kill the three of Zhu Xing Tian alone, so he hid it first, practiced secretly, and left here after he found Chen Sisi. Qin Chen had a faint feeling that Chen Sisi disappeared in the desolate ancient city. He should have entered a mysterious place, and perhaps even got a shocking encounter, otherwise he could not explain the mysterious and charming woman he had previously sensed. Hey! Zhu Xing Tian's eyes flashed, and he sneered, You have a great background? Kill you, the necrosphere will be attacked by many holy masters. Who do you think you are? The son of Palace Lord Guan Gan? It's the son of Palace Lord Guan Gan, and he doesn't have this ability. The necrosphere has stood in the heavens for so many years, and it is not that easy to break. Do you think you must be able to catch me? You will eat me. Qin Chen saw that there was only one person in Zhu Xing Tian, not timid, and sneered again and again, although you are half footed into the midst of Heavenly Saint, but if you want to capture Ben Shao, it's still a matter of fire, not to mention, Ben Shao still has space for the secret treasure. It's a joke, yes, your space treasure is indeed powerful, but you are not even a heavenly sage, how can you completely mobilize the power of these treasures? If you are a heavenly sage, this seat may have some scruples, but now, you it's just the food in my mouth. Stop talking nonsense, hand over the treasures, if you are happy you may be able to leave a way for you. The elegant white man Zhu Xing Tian stepped forward step by step, putting pressure on Qin Chen. Every step was sealed with space, as if he was going to crush Qin Chen and torture his mind. Boom! 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 Zhu Xing Tian stepped out step by step, a total of seven steps, each step carried a terrifying energy, like a reminder note, when he stepped on the seventh step, the previous countless pressures gathered together, as if formed tsunami. This is a secret technique of Zhu Xing Tian, beheading seven steps. In Xingtai, the heavenly realm, to behead a prisoner, the executioner usually takes seven steps from the stage to the stage. This is the famous seven-step beheading. It is an excellent secret technique, often within seven steps, the prisoner his mind was completely out of control, his mind was torn apart, his seven orifices bleed, and he didn't even kill himself. Boom! When Zhu Xing Tian reached the seventh step, 
infinite power gathered together and burst into Qin Chen's body. Qin Chen's body slammed and made a cracking sound, as if it was about to explode. It is good. Zhu Xing Tian grabbed it with one hand and displayed the supreme martial arts, shrouded in Xingtai, an invisible statue of Xingtai appeared between the heavens and the earth, and must uphold the will of the heavens and kill all criminals who violate the rules of heaven. However, Qin Chen did not explode. Instead, an incomparable violent aura burst out of his body. The power of origin surged in all directions. All of a sudden, fierce power burst out of his body. Origin Supernatural Power, Qin Chen's Killer At the same time, the power of the Rift Sky Divine Mark was also integrated into that Origin Supernatural Power. These were Qin Chen's two top-level killer moves, fused together at this moment, and displayed violently. Not good. Zhu Xing Tian felt the great danger in his mind, and quickly backed away, but his Xingtai envelope was suddenly torn apart and bombarded. Qin Chen's origin supernatural powers and Rift Sky Divine Mark Force to come over. What kind of secret technique is this? Such a powerful power, this kind of extinguishing void, the birth of Promise Qi, there is such a secret technique in the heavens? Is it the Holy Master's secret technique? Zhu Xing Tian felt that his Saint Yuan collapsed every inch, and his face showed shock and anger, but he couldn't recognize Qin Chen's moves. The origin supernatural power is a secret technique created by Qin Chen, and the rifting divine mark is originally the divine power of the divine master. Even the divine master's fearful attack can leave a mark in the void and kill the soul, although Qin Chen cannot evolve this divine power. To the extreme, but once displayed, it is not something ordinary strong people can resist. Especially during this period of time, Qin Chen kept scrutinizing and effectively combined the two supernatural powers together, and the two combined together formed a more terrifying attack. Boom! The elegant man in white clothes retreats again and again, but he is not scattered. Instead, he steps on the mysterious step, step by step, and the endless source law is emitted in his body, his life is burning, his essence and blood are swollen, and he plays the ultimate move of the coming of heaven. Heaven and Earth promise, I am in charge of punishment for Xingtai, and the sage is easy to crack. In the roar of Zhu Xing Tian, a phantom of a battle axe appeared in his hand, as if he was the execution ground executioner in charge of the rules of the sky, walking for the sky and beheading the heaven criminals. During this move, there was an ancient holy vein in his body burning violently. Good boy, you can actually persecute me to use this secret technique, powerful, Powerful, half a step Tian Sheng actually forced this seat to this level, it is simply unheard of, unseen. What a pity, you are not a heavenly sage, even if no matter how strong the supernatural power is, it is limited. If you are the cultivation base of the heavenly sage, this blow can definitely severely wound me, or even kill me with one blow, but now, I can't help it. The force of terror erupted, a violent explosion. Qin Chen's origin supernatural powers, the cracking sky divine mark was actually blocked. Then, the two collided violently, with endless roars, terrifying power impact, roaring, that amazing power could easily kill a heavenly saint, causing Qin Chen's attacks to collapse. Like a building, crashing down. Boom! Qin Chen flew out all of a sudden, blood surging in his body, and his robes tore if it weren't for his incomparable physical body, like a OR devil, he would be seriously injured or even fall from this blow. Even so, Qin Chen still had blood surging in his body, and there was an urge to vomit blood. On the other hand, Zhu Xing Tian was also blasted out, but the robes on his body were still intact, and his face was slightly pale, but he soon recovered his calm and became ruddy again. Oops! The gap between the half-step Heavenly Sage and the mid-term Heavenly Sage powerhouse is too big. Although this Zhu Xing Tian is not a true mid-term Heavenly Sage powerhouse, in fact, half of his feet has already stepped into this realm, and he already has the sky in his body. The power of the rules in the mid-sage stage is that the sacred Yuan has not been completely transformed. 
it is not much different from the strong midday sage except for the strength of the sacred Yuan. Can't bring him real scars. Qin Chen knew the result in an instant, and also knew how terrifying this Ju Xin Tian was. No wonder that such a big power of the gods and ancient leagues could be changed. In addition to the cultivation base, the supernatural powers possessed by Ju Xin Tian are also extremely terrifying. They can actually provoke the rules of the sky and incarnate the executioners on the execution grounds of the heavens. Who can resist? Simply invincible. If he really becomes a master of the Mid-Tian Sage, I am afraid that the average powerhouse at the Mid-Tian Sage peak may not be able to win him. For a martial artist, cultivation is the most important thing, but the rules and supernatural powers are also extremely important, which can determine the outcome. Dead. After defeating Qin Chen's conquering attacks, Zhu Xing Tian walked over in stride, exuding waves of extinction throughout his body, hum, his double pupil divine rainbow exploded, and a stone with grey-brown spots suddenly appeared in his hand. The urging, suddenly the world roared, turned into a huge phantom. This Xingtai Misty, stained with the blood of heavenly powerhouses, is like purgatory. Boy, this is the treasure of my Ju Xing Tian, the stone of Tian Xing. It is your honour to die under this trick of this seat. Maybe you don't know that this stone of mine is a real Xingtai from the ancient heaven. Left over from above, left over above. With the blood of countless powerful men who were executed and killed in the past, you can die with my trick. You have no regrets in this life, and you are fortunate for three lives. Zhu Xing Tian stepped forward, Hong Sheng said. This is his ultimate supernatural power. Xingtai is here, and I am for law enforcement. All his exercises came from an ancient relic. The ancient relic, which was once left by a celestial execution ground executioner in the ancient celestial realm, was obtained by him, and at the same time he obtained this stone of Xingtai in the celestial realm. This is his most precious treasure. People know. Xiao, it contains the thoughts left by many great figures in the ancient heavens when they were executed. Once they were displayed, the real mid-term heavenly sage power could not resist, let alone Qin Chen such a small half-step heavenly sage. At this moment, the stone of Xingtai exudes a killing light, transforming this world into the execution ground of the heavens, and Zhu Xing Tian is the executioner in the execution ground, unmatched. When he first played against Qin Chen, he didn't want to display this secret treasure. In his opinion, Neither the seven major division leaders of the ancient God League nor Qin Chen were qualified to let him display this secret treasure. Especially for a junior like Qin Chen, who is a half-step heavenly sage, using his secret treasure, the ultimate ultimate move, is too much, and his self-esteem does not allow him to do so. But now, he knew that if he didn't use the power of the Xingtai stone, it was very likely that he could not really hunt Qin Chen. Although the opponent is not his opponent, he can escape at any time and cannot catch up. Especially the opponent still possesses the treasure of space. In the underground of the desolate ancient city, the atmosphere of the desolate ancient is stronger. Difficult. But when Qin Chen wandered the ground before, it seemed like a fish in the water, not blocked at all, making Zhu Xing Tian very jealous. Therefore, he did not give Qin Chen a chance to escape at all. The power of Xing Tian covers all realms. Since then, all powers have sealed off time and space and turned into execution grounds, able to bind top big figures, making Qin Chen inevitable and inevitable. Oh oh oh! Countless murderous air enveloped him, treating Qin Chen as a criminal who violated the rules of the sky, and bound him to Xing Tai. Qin Chen's body couldn't even move. What? Qin Chen was shocked. He didn't expect Zhu Xing Tian to have such a treasure, the stone of the ancient execution ground in the heavens. How terrible is this? In the ancient heavens, those who violated the rules of the sky and were taken to the execution ground to be beheaded were all top big figures. These big figures are all bloodstained on this stone of execution ground, and the aura that erupts, even if countless years have passed, is still extremely terrifying. Boy, don't resist, 
even the midterm heavenly sage powerhouse under the Zingtai stone of this seat can hardly resist, let alone you, rest assured, kill you, your treasures will become the treasures of this seat, this seat will carry them forward. Zhu Xing Tian waved the blood-stained battle axe of nothingness, his eyes widened, and rumble slashed. O.M. Seeing that the power of Zhu Xing Tian's execution ground slammed Qin Chen, and when he was about to behead him, suddenly, the power of thunder in Qin Chen's body seemed to have been provoked, suddenly bursting out. Boom! In the void, a world-destroying thunder of destruction appeared, with a sense of anger, as if a dragon was provoked by an ant and crashed down. Click! The execution ground world evolved by the Zingtai stone was shattered in an instant. Then, the Zingtai stone in the hands of Zhu Xing Tian shivered. Under the awe of this thunder power, it suddenly turned into an ordinary stone, not dare to release the slightest. Penalty. Breath. Feeling this, the power of thunder disappeared instantly, as if it had never appeared before. What kind of power is that? The power of adjudication, is it the power of ruling the punishment in the heavens, the supreme power of adjudication? Zhu Xing Tian looked at the ordinary Zingtai stone in his hand in horror. This is the heaven execution ground he obtained from the ancient ruins stone, is so silent? What made him even more shocked was the terrifying thunder aura that flickered before. It is very similar to the power he received the ruling mentioned in the inheritance. The power of adjudication, rumors are the most supreme power in the heavens, in charge of the life and death of all the great figures in the heavens. What he got was only the inheritance of an executioner in the ancient celestial realm. In the ancient celestial realm, the executioner was in the penalty department. That was the most humble occupation. He was stained with blood every day and was regarded as unknown. He was the lowest figure in the execution ground. And the most terrifying thing in the ancient heavens that is in charge of punishment is the power of ruling. Only the Divine Lord who is in charge of punishment in the heavens has the thunder ruling. The lightning that appeared out of thin air before is actually very similar to the rumored power of the ruling of the ancient heavens. Like. How is this possible? A small half-step heavenly sage actually has the power to judge? This is a power that even the Holy Lord can't control. No, it is not necessarily the power of adjudication. After all, among the major laws of the heavens, the thunder itself represents punishment, and the sky thunder represents the punishment of the heavens. Perhaps the previous thunder is just a special kind with the mood of the sky thunder. Strength will give me. That kind of illusion. Zhu Xing Tian's eyes suddenly burst into excitement. If this is the case, then he really sent it. No matter what the power of this thunder power is, it is not an ordinary celestial thunder system rule. It contains the punishment atmosphere that even Zingtai Stone is in danger. If it can be obtained by me, then. Zhu Xing Tian's excited body was trembling, and what he mastered was the magical power of Tian Xing. If he controls this special thunder power, the future will be unlimited. Lei Tian Sheng. No, he could even reach the realm of the Holy Lord. You must kill this kid. Zhu Xing Tian waved a terrifying void battle axe, rushing towards Qin Chen, excited. Universe Fortune, think of the universe. Qin Chen felt the disappearance of Xingtai from the heavens. Although he didn't know why the thunder power in his body suddenly rioted, he seized the opportunity for the first time and urged the universe for good fortune. Leaping, rushing towards the depths of the cave. Go with. Boom. Qin Chen vigorously urged the universe to make the jade disc, and the strong spatial power permeated, his figure kept flashing in the void, and his speed was fast. Fast speed. Zhu Xing Tian was shocked again. This time Qin Chen's speed was even faster than before. It seems that the power of the space treasure has erupted even stronger, how much is this kid? Treasure? No, this time, desperately, I have to capture or kill this kid. Zhu Xing Tian would never tolerate Qin Chen running away from his hands. Boy, you can't escape. The spirit of the soul, using punishment as the guide, 
the rules of the heavens, the surrender of all spirits. Even if you escape to the ends of the world, I will track you down. Zhu Xing Tian performed the supreme tracking mystery of Xing Tian's art. It was the heavenly executioner who locked the criminals. Under a stab, no matter how many avatars of the heavenly criminals, they would follow their fate and kill them in one fell swoop. The supreme tracking secret technique firmly locked Qin Chen. Damn, this Zhu Xing Tian is simply a tarsal maggot, and it is so mighty, it is difficult to escape his tracking unless I erupt with the strongest power of the universe jade disc, or I use the origin of time to affect the flow of time. But in this way, it is even more dangerous. If it spreads out, the Holy Lord will be alarmed and will come to chase me. As Qin Chen flees towards the depths of the cave, he calculates in his heart, and at the same time, he senses something in the depths of the cave, which has a connection with the earthen pot in the jade plate of his universe, that kind of feeling in the dark. More and more intense. Perhaps, there, there is a chance to get rid of the death penalty days. Haha. <laughs> Countless caves were traversed, and Zhu Xing Tian's pursuit became increasingly urgent. With a bang, Qin Chen once again landed in a deep cave underground. This cave is hidden in a tiny space dust, which is basically not easy to find but the mysterious clay pot has a connection with this space dust. Qin Chen felt the jade dish of good fortune again, and then shuttled in. The cave is not wide, only 3,000 feet square, surrounded by countless forbidden runes. As soon as Qin Chen entered, he was shocked by the breath of the forbidden rune and almost unable to move. What a terrible atmosphere! Qin Chen vaguely felt that he had come to the true core of the entire deserted ancient ruins. He looked up and saw the depth of the cave as a portal. That's it, things that are sensitive to the clay pot are just behind this portal. Qin Chen's figure flickered and came to the door. But suddenly, his body shook, because there was a handprint on the portal. The handprint was multicolored, and the breath it exudes actually resonated with the great Dao of the Abyssal Demon Clan that Qin Chen had understood. It is Sisi, is the blood of Sisi, Sisi has been here. Qin Chen was excited, looking at the handprints on the portal, tears flowed down all of a sudden, a boundless thought filled his mind, above the portal, there was a strong atmosphere of ancient times, besides, the whole cave it was empty, without any figure. Sisi has been here, so how about her? Is it after entering the portal? Qin Chen forced himself to calm down. This cave, hidden in the dust of hundreds of millions of space, is not easy to be discovered at all. If it weren't for the guidance of the clay pot and the terrifying space power of the jade disc made by the universe, it would not be possible to enter, but what about Sisi? Come in. He raised his head and looked deeply at the mysterious portal in front of him. Above the portal, there are many weird runes forbidden. These forbidden runes are not humans or demons, but a brand new system. Perhaps it is the ancient tribe rumored in this deserted ancient ruin. These prohibitions, every time they watched, there was an ancient force rushing out, and it was connected with Qin Chen's body and even the earthen pot in the jade plate of Qunkin's good fortune. The universe of good fortune jade disc emits a thousand rays of glow, and in the dark, after Qin Chen has seen this portal, a beautiful and charming woman floats in the air, showing a powerful and unparalleled aura. It was the woman who Qin Chen felt the charm before. This woman's face was extremely vague, but Qin Chen was certain that this person was definitely not Sisi. Hum. As soon as Qin Chen's eyes saw through the portal, the sky-filling hammer in Qin Chen's body also trembled, as if there was some kind of heaven-defying treasure behind the portal. What shocked Qin Chen even more was that O.M., the green demon sword was trembling slightly, and even the mysterious rust sword had a glimmer of light. What is behind this portal? Qin Chen sucked in the air, and the sky repair hammer trembled. It was very simple. It was very likely that he had sensed a treasure against the sky, but the mysterious rust sword and the green demon sword also reacted. This was the first time Qin Chen encountered this situation. No matter what is behind this portal, Sisi is very likely to be inside, no matter whether it is life or death, 
I must go in. Qin Chen's gaze condensed, and his right hand suddenly pressed on the portal. Hum. In an instant, the prohibition rune on the portal surging wildly, bursting with a dazzling light, the next moment, a suction force came, Qin Chen's body was directly sucked in by the portal, and disappeared in an instant. Not see. The moment Qin Chen passed through the portal. There was a boom. A terrifying figure broke through the endless mysterious void, found this cave hidden deep in the dust of hundreds of millions of space, and suddenly appeared. It was Zhu Xingtian who crazily tracked Qin Chen. Here is. As soon as Zhu Xingtian came in, the rich atmosphere of the ancient cave in the cave almost stunned him and couldn't move his eyes. Where is this place on earth, it is so rich and ancient, is it the core of the ancient ruins? Zhu Xingtian's eyes lit up, and deep doubts were revealed immediately. Weird, in the depths of this desolate ancient city, I have searched countless times and never found this mysterious cave. How can the kid find this place when he comes? If I hadn't used the soul tracking technique, I, I almost lost it, and my divine power is much stronger than that of the kid. The kid can find this cave, but I couldn't find it before. Zhu Xingtian's eyes flickered, looking at the surroundings, it seemed that he wanted to find something, but in the cave, there was nothing but a portal at the end. This place is so mysterious, there must be some treasure. It seems that the kid has already entered the portal. I entered directly. People have both treasures. This sun is really my lucky star. Zhu Xingtian's face showed a sorrowful smile and his hands slammed hard to push the door deep in the cave open. Boom! As soon as his Saint Yuan touched the stone gate, a strong glow burst out above the stone gate. In that glow, a word appeared. This word is an ancient hieroglyph, a wasteland. Word. The desolation of ancient ruins. The barren word thundered, suppressed, and immediately Ju Sing Tian's white clothes all over the body were torn and flew out suddenly obviously not giving him a chance to enter. What is this? What a terrifying ancient power, is it the powerful secret of the ancient tribe of the ancient ruins, it seems that this is really the core of the ancient ruins, but why can the kid go in, but I can't? Zhu Xing Tian was frightened and angry. It was the woman that Qin Chen had repeatedly sensed, exuding endless charm. Who is this? What about Sisi? Qin Chen's eyes became extremely clear. Although this woman's charm was very powerful, she was not aggressive. Qin Chen used the heavenly soul forbidden technique to see through this charm woman, because Qin Chen had a feeling that Sisi was missing. Here, there may be a certain connection with this charming woman. At this moment, the dark green demon sword in the universe fortune jade plate suddenly burst into light, as if attracted by some kind of attraction. The power of the demon sword and the charming woman actually had a resonance. This is. In the next moment, Qin Chen saw that behind this charming woman, there were nine long tails that reached the sky. The nine-tailed fairy fox, the woman turned out to be a member of the monster race, the nine-tailed fairy fox. Demon Lord. At this moment, Qin Chen seemed to see the charm fairy cast a glance at him, and then he saw it and then Qin Chen saw that the endless vein was broken, and there was a person lying in front of the statue. Sisi. Qin Chen was suddenly frightened and angry. Yes, it was Sisi. At this moment, Sisi was floating in front of this charming statue of a woman, and formed a kind of resonance with this statue. Sleeping here, his face was pale, without a trace. Bloody, two tears solidified at the corner of his eyes. Sisi. Qin Chen roared and rushed forward. Boom. An invisible force surged and flew Qin Chen out in a violent earthquake. It was the breath radiating from the statue that prevented Qin Chen from approaching. The vastness of that power gave Qin Chen no hope of breaking. What is this statue doing? Anger burst into Qin Chen's eyes, and a mysterious rust sword suddenly appeared in his hand, rushing in anger. He wants to rescue Sisi. But at the moment Qin Chen rushed to the altar, not far away, the overbearing figure with the clay pot above his head suddenly filled with a terrifying force. 
Om, this terrible force immediately imprisoned Qin Chen in the void. In the middle, and slowly drifting towards the overbearing figure. What? Qin Chen felt that a trace of ancient power was pouring into his body frantically. This influx was too violent and could not tolerate Qin Chen's absorption at all, as if he was about to swallow Qin Chen's body, and, a terrible soul pressure came down, as if to seize Qin Chen's body. Hundreds of millions of years, it's finally time, my lord of the wild god, is finally going to be resurrected. A rumbling roar resounded in Qin Chen's mind, with the endless majesty of nine heavens, suppressing the ages, Qin Chen looked at the figure of the overbearing statue in horror, is this statue still alive? He tried his best to struggle, but it was useless. This ridiculous aura was too strong, as strong as the power of the Holy Master, so Qin Chen had no room for movement. Damn, where did I go? Could it be that these three statues are all three powerful men from the previous life, and they need to use my body and Sisi's body to resurrect? This charming monster fox fairy woman is here? Deprive she Sisi, and this overbearing man is trying to deprive me. Qin Chen felt chills when he thought of a possibility. If so, what kind of tiger den and wolf den did he break into? No, never let the other party succeed. Qin Chenexin roared silently. It didn't matter if he died, but Sisi must not be allowed to die here. With his current cultivation level, he could not resist the power of this statue at all, unless he drew the magic tree in the universe of creation jade disc. There may be a silver lining. Just at the moment when Qin Chen was constantly being pulled towards the overbearing statue, he was about to arouse the demon tree of ten thousand realms. Hum. Not far away, above the kendo statue holding the stone sword, a surge of sword aura suddenly burst into the sky, booming, a vast sword aura with eternal power soared into the sky, suddenly slashed out, and slashed towards N.A. domineering. Statue. Boom. That mighty sword aura collided with the power of desolate god, and suddenly a shocking power erupted, and the world roared, as if this world would be destroyed by this blow. Eternal, after so many years, do you still want to stop me? An angry roar from the domineering statue. The kendo statue seemed to have awakened, and a cold voice came, Arabic god, you set up a trick to frame me and Kyanzian, this time, I won't let you succeed, young man, come to me. A horrible sword aura pulled Qin Chen and flew towards the kendo statue. Qin Chen's heart condensed. He didn't know what happened between the three statues. It seemed that the overbearing statue framed the kendo statue and the fox fairy statue back then. However, this is not necessarily true. It may be them. Disguised. Little dust, is that you? But at this moment, an excited voice resounded in Qin Chen's mind. Sissi. Qin Chen turned his head enthusiastically, with surprises, Sissi was calling him. Sissi, I am looking for you, how are you? Little dust, it's really you, is it really you? Sissi's voice was full of excitement, and in her closed eyes, two drops of tears rolled down, dripping onto the altar. It's Xiao Chen, Xiao Chen came to her. A colorful light on Sisi's body lit up, Little Chen, you go to Senior Eternal Sword Master, you must not be taken away by the desolate god. Sisi's anxious voice sounded. Eternal Sword Master? Is it the Kendo statue? Originally, Qin Chen didn't believe in these three statues, but when Sisi said so, he immediately made up his mind. Qin Chen violently urged the universe good fortune jade plate, and suddenly, a terrifying spatial force burst out, and along with the terrifying force of the sword, Qin Chen's body suddenly floated towards the location of the sword statue. Only then did Qin Chen fully see the appearance of this statue. This is a cold middle-aged man with a golden crown on his head, a close-fitting battle robe on the outside, a bracer on his wrist, and a stone sword in his hand. If there is any murderous air, he lingers on it. Young man, come into my kendo world. An invisible force pulled Qin Chen, hum, the next moment, 
Qin Chen's consciousness was suddenly swallowed by a black hole in the dark space. Boom! When Qin Chen's artistic conception entered the world of kendo statues, the desolate statue suddenly surged with a terrifying and ancient atmosphere, and said angrily, Eternal, you never want to ruin my good deeds. Boom boom boom! The clay pot above his head trembled violently, and a horrible atmosphere of chaos filled the whole altar. At this time, Qin Chen had already appeared in an empty space. At the same time, a terrifying figure walked out of the endless darkness and appeared in front of Qin Chen. You are, the Eternal Sword Master. Qin Chen looked at each other, this middle-aged man, exactly like the statue, was the Eternal Sword Master. Yes, the young man, it's me, and the three of us who brought you here before. The figure rumbling. Bring us over. Qin Chen frowned. Indeed, when he entered the desolate ancient city, he had always sensed the power of attraction and the breath of the enchanting woman, so he came all the way. Of course, there was the resonance of a clay pot, but unexpectedly, but these three powerhouses deliberately did it. However, according to the previous statement, the three powerhouses are not enemies of each other? Why would the three of them summon themselves together? Qin Chen looked at the opponent with a vigilant look. Qin Chen has had the experience of being seized too many times, but he is not afraid. Although he does not seem to have any ability to resist in the opponent's world, as long as the opponent as soon as he had the idea of robbing him, Qin Chen would fully urge the heavenly soul forbidden technique and provoke the ten thousand realm demon tree. The demon tree of the ten thousand worlds is the most precious treasure of the demon race, and even the top treasure that the demon lord of Yama will rob. With this treasure, Qin Chen can guarantee that he will not fall in the first place. And as long as he regained his consciousness, Qin Chen could induce the mysterious rust sword, the thunder power and the origin of time, and he could escape from here. Yes, young people, we want to bring you in, but this is a long story, don't be nervous, Kyanxian and I's purpose in attracting you is not to take you but to make you thoroughly destroy the conspiracy of the Lord of the Wild Gods. The conspiracy of the Lord of Desolate God. Yes. The Eternal Sword Master sighed, the Lord of the Desolate God is the patriarch of the Desolate Ancient Clan, and the Desolate Ancient Clan is one of the ten thousand tribes in the heavens. It is also an accident to know the Lord of the Desolate God. The Eternal Sword Master whispered, I was very young back then. I was the top arrogant of the Heavenly Sword Pavilion, the sacred ground of Heavenly Swordsmen, and also a well-known genius of Kendo in the Heavenly Realm. I was the youngest apex powerhouse of the Heavenly Sword Pavilion. However, the first half of my life went so smoothly. I thought I would break through the Holy Master Realm as quickly as possible and become the youngest Sword Master in the Heaven Realm. But I never thought I was stuck at the peak of the Heavenly Sage. I couldn't make progress. I was very anxious at the time, so I decided to go to the heavens to experience and break into the heavens. In the process of trespassing in the heavens, I met the Lord of the Desolate God, that is, my eldest brother. He was not the patriarch of the Desolate Ancient Clan at the time, but the heir of the Desolate Ancient Clan. We experienced and rushed together. In an accident, I and brother met Kyangzian again. The voice of the Eternal Sword Master suddenly became gentle, and a hint of happiness emerged, in my eyes, she is the most beautiful woman in this world. From the first sight of her, I fell in love with her. The heart sinks for her. The relationship between the three of us is very good. We became brothers and sisters, we went to heaven together, punished the evil and promoted the good together, we broke through the realm of the Holy Lord and experienced life and death together. Gradually, Kyangzian and I came together, and the eldest brother was also very happy. We, what I didn't expect was that Kyangzian told me that she turned out to be a girl from the monster race. The corner of the Eternal Sword's mouth outlines a trace of pain, at that time, the heavens, the human race ruled the world, and the ten thousand races coexisted and the monster race was one of the top forces among the ten thousand races, and the human race's greatest enemy. Demon race? Isn't it a demon's? 
Qin Chen was taken aback. The Eternal Sword Master said, at the time, the demon race could only be ranked in the top five. Because they were hostile by the human race and the demon race, their power was not huge, and the demon race and the human race were the two top forces contending for the heaven. The demon race is the enemy of our human race. As a genius disciple of the Heavenly Sword Pavilion, the holy land of human swordsmanship, I can make any mistakes, but it is absolutely impossible to marry the demon race. The same is true for Kyangzian. We are all imprisoned by our respective forces, and we are in distress. I devote myself to cultivation. Amidst the pain, my cultivation base has progressed by leaps and bounds. I broke through to the peak of the Holy Lord and became one of the strongest people in the Tongtian Sword Pavilion who are most likely to touch the realm of the nobleman. Venerable. Could it be that the realm behind the Holy Lord is the Venerable? Qin Chen meditated. He heard a lot about the realm behind the Holy Lord from the outside, the Tianzun who had a working day, and the Xiaoao Supreme who repaired the heavens in the legend, etc., but it was only now that Qin Chen understood that after the Holy Lord, it is called the State of the Venerable. Whether it is Tianzuo Tianzun, or Xiaoao Supreme, it may be in this state. The Eternal Sword Master outlined bitterness, I thought that if I kept practicing, I could control my own destiny. But I never thought that the stronger my cultivation base, the less likely it is for the Tongtian Sword Pavilion to combine me with the monster race. The future is bound to us. In the end, I chose to elope, and Kyangzian left their respective races. We are going to abandon everything and family rules and choose a place to live in seclusion. Our two actions aroused the anger of our respective forces and issued a wanted order against us. At that time, there was no place for us in the entire celestial realm. The older brother who has become the patriarch of the ancient clan accepted us and let us live in the dense land of the ancient clan, which is the ancient capital. We live in seclusion and live deep. In simple terms, that time was the happiest time in my life. We are immersed in our own small world, but we don't know that there have been earth-shaking changes in the heavens. The conflict between the human race and the monster race has become more and more intense. The whole heaven has been raging for war. We have been staying in the deserted ancient capital, brother. They didn't give us access to outside information. We didn't know anything about it. Later, we learned that the war between the human race and the monster race was caused by the demons. The demons secretly framed the human race and the monster race, causing the conflict to escalate. The clan has greatly increased its strength by this. When we learned about the news from the heavens, the demons had already risen. Kyanzian and I were furious and decided to leave here to fight for all the races. After the eldest brother heard the news, he told us that with the strength of our two pinnacle holy masters, even if we go to the battlefield of the heavens, it will not bring much change to the battle. Unless we can break through the realm of the noblemen, maybe there will be a trace of help. We will lay down a joint cultivation technique, let the three of us attack the realm of the Venerable together, resonate with each other in strength, and become the Venerable. I agreed with Kyanzian, but who knows? The Eternal Sword Master's voice was bitter, the joint cultivation technique deployed by the eldest brother is basically a devouring technique. In order to break through the Venerable, he sacrificed the power of the entire barren ancient race and used the power of me and Kyanzian as a guide. Help him become the supreme being. Sacrifice the entire ethnic group. Qin Chen's eyes showed a hint of horror, you mean, this altar? Yes. The eternal sword master smiled bitterly, this is the place where sacrifices were made in those years. For his breakthrough, the eldest brother sacrificed this endless void creature, and even his entire ethnic group also sacrificed. His purpose is not only it's just to be the lord, but to become the Supreme Master of the Heavens. Become the Supreme Master of the Heavens. Qin Chen was shocked. The Lord of the Desolate God had such a big ambition to sacrifice the entire ethnic group. What kind of iron-hearted heart was he to do such a thing? Obviously it is a hero. That's right. The Eternal Sword Master sighed, 
once he has the power of Kyungzian's monster race and my human kendo power bloodline, combined with his special secret method of the wild ancient race, he will not only become the venerable, but also integrate the ten thousand. The power of the clan has become the highest supreme supreme among the nobles. After the altar was launched, Kyungzian and I discovered something was wrong. We learned about his conspiracy. We joined forces to fight against him in order to stop his ambition. However, we still failed to stop him. The entire territory, countless lives fell, but at the last moment, Kyungzian and I gave up our lives and motivated the secret method of the Kyungzian nine-tailed fairy fox family. This prevented the Lord of the Desolate God from seizing the house, and because of our counterattack, his life passed, and he was defeated by the rules of the heavens. Backlash, turned into fossils. However, we are still too late to stop. All the spirits in this area have been swallowed up by it and turned into nothingness. This area has turned into a dead place, and the entire group of desolate ancient tribes has also been dead silent, becoming no owner of the dead. There was incredible in Qin Chen's eyes. Is this the origin of the necrosphere? The realm of dead spirits stood in the heavens in ancient times, and no one knows its origin. Now it seems that because of this, it turned into a land of dead souls. Then what is your purpose for calling us? Qin Chen said again, the other party summoned them to come, definitely purposeful. Because there is no time. Eternal Sword Master said bitterly. No time. For countless years, the lives of Kyungzian and I have come to an end, and only the last will remains. Although we prevented the conspiracy of the Lord of the Desolate God, we were not able to kill him. When the will dissipates, then no one can restrain the Lord of the Desolate God. At that time, he will be resurrected from the ruins. With his character, he will surely devour all spirits to improve himself and regain his strength. At that time, heaven will be plunged into disaster. Furthermore, Kyungzian and I are fascinated, and we have no descendants, so I don't want to disappear silently. Although Kyungzian and I cannot live in love, we hope that someone can inherit our mantle and redeem our sins. Uphold our will and live bravely. The voice of the Eternal Sword Master is full of pain, this Sword Master has been a heroic hero in his life, but at the most important juncture of the human race, he failed to dedicate his own strength. I hate. I die, but the Sword Master decides. The Lord of the Desolate God cannot be given a new life, and it will be a disaster for the heavens. Time is running out, and there is not much time to explain to you. The reason why this Sword Master leads you is because you are also a swordsman. Only by inheriting the Sword Master's kendo power can you and the woman join forces to resist. The devouring of the Lord who lives in the desolate desolate. Next, we will practice kendo for you, you must not let me down. The Eternal Sword Master sighed, as both swordsmen, Qin Chen had a feeling that everything the other party said was most likely true. So. Is Sissy accepting the inheritance of the nine-tailed fairy fox? Do you have kendo experience? Qin Chen's eyes condensed, then come on, he wants to see how terrifying the inheritance of this eternal sword master is. Bring it on. Qin Chen said solemnly. Kill. The next moment, an invisible figure surged out of the body of the eternal sword master. As soon as this figure appeared, Qin Chen knew that it was the image of the will of the Eternal Sword Master. The terrifying coercion filled the world, and the void couldn't bear his dominance and collapsed. Suddenly, Qin Chen's pupils shrank a little, but he saw the image of the Eternal Sword Master's will pull out the sword on his waist, and slashed it at an incredible speed. The space split with two big cracks, and Qin Chen moved a finger. Can't do it. This is... Killing Sword Intent What the Eternal Sword Master used turned out to be Qin Chen's extremely familiar killing rules. Hey! The terrifying slaughter sword energy swept over, and Qin Chen couldn't even move the bullets between the flashes of thought. His body was shattered into thousands of pieces, and the blood collided with each other in the air, scattered and spattered, like a huge flower of blood. However, 
this was only Qin Chen's illusion, his body was still intact, because it was just a soul, the heavenly soul forbidden technique, guarding the true soul, making Qin Chen sober all at once. So strong soul strength, you, there are soul secrets in your cultivation? Very good. It seems that God heard our prayers and sent you. This is the killing kendo that I understood when I was young, do you feel it? The eternal sword master's eyes are shining, as bright as stars. Does slaughter kendo? You have slaughter, and I also have slaughter. My killing is immortal, my soul, eternal existence, how about your sword will surpass me thousands of times, my killing, killing gods and destroying demons, is unmatched. Qin Chen shouted angrily, a terrifying light shot from his eyes, and his kendo will suddenly spread. Killing mood. Boom. In an instant, two terrifying killing auras collided, and a terrifying roar broke out. What a strong killing mood, have you ever received the inheritance of a certain strong man? No, the killing mood cannot be passed on. Everyone has his own mood. This should be the mood that you have realized from the killing. It is hard to imagine, you a sage who is not even a young man, has such an accomplishment in the mood of killing, powerful, powerful. The voice of the eternal sword master was full of excitement. Very well, after the killing, there is destruction. In your killing, there is a desire for life, the destruction of the world, and then the destruction after my killing. The second level of kendo, in order to destroy the kendo will, with one sword, everything will be destroyed. Kang. Pulling out the phantom of the sword beside him, the eternal sword master's figure cut out with one sword. After experiencing the will to kill the swordsmanship, Qin Chen's heart is long gone. Exit. With a random wave of sword energy, the world no longer exists, and everything turns into chaos. Qin Chen had secretly imagined the power of destroying the sword, but at the moment the eternal sword master swung a sword, Qin Chen immediately understood that the power of this destroying the sword was far more powerful than the killing of the sword. This sword directly wiped out the soul. The body and soul are all under this sword. Annihilated instantly. Qin Chen couldn't feel himself, he was utterly unconscious, all five senses were lost, and he drifted with the flow, as if disappeared from this world. A little brilliance lit up, that was the essence of Qin Chen's will. Origin. Origin. Reorganization. In the dark, Qin Chen's five senses gradually recovered, and his soul consciousness recovered again. What, your soul can withstand my destruction and regroup in such a short period of time? It is unbelievable. What kind of artistic conception is this? The eternal sword master shouted out in shock, the strong man who was destroyed by his kendo, eternal life will sink into destruction forever, the true spirit will be wiped out, and the holy lord and the strong will not be able to escape. Just like the divine mark of the rift, leaving marks in the void, one move blasted out, and the terrifying magical powers remained in the void, obliterating all the will, which was the most terrifying killer move. And the destroyed artistic conception, like the desperate hollow scar, is displayed, immortal, capable of obliterating the will of all things, and unable to recover. But Qin Chen used his own power to reconsolidate his will, so how could he not be shocked? Is this really just a boy who has not reached the sage? Impossible. Although Qin Chen is only the soul consciousness at this moment, not the soul itself, but just a will in the world of swordsmanship, and in the real world, Qin Chen just lie there motionless, but in his own way of destruction, even if he is strong those who are also confused, unable to reconcentrate consciousness in a short time, and need to act on their own. But Qin Chen, in an instant, actually condensed the body of consciousness himself, beyond the imagination of the eternal sword master. Feeling his recondensed will, Qin Chen's five senses are very subtle, he can see things that he couldn't see before, and sense the mysteries that he couldn't feel before. He is very clear that he can condense his will because he is the eternal sword master. The world of Kendo, the world of Kendo of the opponent, there is no malice. Of course, 
what is more important is the magical power of origin that Qin Chen comprehend, originated from destruction, originated from creation, and as long as there is a little true spirit, he is indestructible. It turns out that you have already walked your own way. It is unthinkable that you are so young that you can realize your own way. It seems that you don't need to inherit my kendo, because every swordsman has his own way. The road can only be used as a reference. Only by walking out of your own path can you truly become a supreme swordsman. Then, let you feel the kendo that I finally realized. After destroying the sword, it is for eternity. I am the eternal sword master. Eternity is my true peak artistic conception. Eternal sword master Rumble said. Heaven and earth are eternal, everything is immortal, I am eternal, kendo is immortal. In the void, there seemed to be a sword light of nothingness shining up. This sword light, like the opening of the universe, was born at the beginning of the formation of the heavens, eternal existence, no matter how much destruction or changes the heavens and earth experience, it will not change. Like the light of hope. Eternal mood? Qin Chen was shocked. Although he understood the origin of all things and mastered his own artistic conception, he realized the artistic conception of this eternal sword master before deeply knowing that the vastness of the heavens, this eternal artistic conception, is absolutely true. A peak artistic conception. Kill. Destroy. Eternal. Origin. In Qin Chen's heart, there was an unprecedented new understanding. Boom. In Qin Chen's mind, there was a rumble roar, and the aura flashed continuously. As a swordsman, the realm of the eternal sword master gave him an unprecedented improvement. Okay, okay, the sword master did not read you wrong. There is an unknown sword book here. It is the sword master's kendo treasure. It can evolve the sword of the ten thousand realms. It is also the top treasure handed down by my Tongtian sword pavilion. Unfortunately. I didn't to fulfill the master's wish, to break through, to become the next master of the Tongtian sword pavilion, I am ashamed of the Tongtian sword pavilion. Now, this nameless sword cannon, this sword master will pass it on to you, if you have the opportunity. I hope you can return to the Tongtian Sword Pavilion for this Sword Master to pay homage to the ancestors. Sorry, Master. The Eternal Sword Master burst into tears, and an invisible secret book burst out all of a sudden. Boom. Above the altar, the sword light was horizontal and horizontal, Qin Chen was floating there, and the invisible sword book suddenly poured into Qin Chen's body. The Secret of the Liver this invisible sword book quickly entered Qin Chen's liver, unlocking the liver secret in the five secrets. Hum. A terrible sword intent surged on Qin Chen, and the aura on his body became fierce. Sword lights swallowed and rushed through his body. Qin Chen's consciousness returned to his body, and his strength was rapidly increasing. At this moment, the mysterious rust sword Qin Chen was holding in his right hand seemed to sense the aura of the nameless sword cannon. The mysterious rust sword flickered, and a cold aura suddenly surged from the inside of the mysterious rust sword. Under Qin Chen's unconscious shaking, he shook violently. Hum. In the next moment, an invisible, cold soul's power came out from the mysterious rust sword and entered the mysterious void. Eternal Sword Master long time no see. In the world of Kendo, there is an extra image of consciousness, this image of will is extremely tall, the sky is like a sharp sword, the whole body is dark, as if it is enveloped by a hazy cloud of smoke, and its appearance is not visible. However, his eyes burst with indifferent rays of light, looking directly at the eternal sword master, holding a sword in his right hand, which looked a bit similar to the mysterious rust sword. This was actually the cold soul powerhouse in the mysterious rust sword. What, you, you are, that adult. Feeling this violent soul power, the eyes of the eternal sword master revealed a shocked look, as if he had seen something unbelievable. Why, is this young man a descendant of you? Also, besides you, who else can cultivate such a world-famous swordsman goddess, it seems that I am too conceited, 
unexpectedly. The Eternal Sword Master shocked. This violent and cold soul power glanced at Qin Chen's body suspended there, and said uncomfortably, Heir? Humph, he is not my heir. I was hurt by this kid. The two were located in the Nihil world of swordsmanship, and Qin Chen, who was absorbing the nameless sword cannon, had no idea what was happening here. He is not your descendant, but my lord, what do you? The Eternal Sword Master said in disbelief. Do you think I'm willing? I'm just trapped, what can I do? The violent soul said impatiently, unexpectedly, the most talented kendo genius of the Tongtian Sword Pavilion would fall here. With your talent, if it's not this accident, there is great hope to become a venerable one. It is destined. The Eternal Sword Master shook his head bitterly. Is it destined? The face of the violent soul suddenly hard to look like, who said it was destined, I just made a small mistake and was trapped in this magic soldier. Is this also destiny? Even if it is destiny, Lao Tzu not convinced. The coldness in the violent soul was even stronger, and it seemed extremely angry. With your cultivation base, my lord, would you be trapped? Eternal Sword Master shocked. What do you know, it's not this kid. Damn, don't talk about this kid, I don't have much time, so I came to see you, and seeing you have a worse life than me, then I can rest assured, ha ha ha, unexpectedly there are people worse than me. Although I am trapped, I am not dead, but you only have a remnant soul will, oh. The violent soul sighed as he spoke. What is there to be happy about? Being able to live and die with Kyungzian is already a gift from heaven to me. The Eternal Sword Master didn't have any complaints, and the corners of his mouth just outlined a touch of happiness. Stubborn. The violent soul said something dissatisfied, but saw the mysterious rust sword tremble suddenly, a terrible swallowing force swept across the violent soul, and suddenly, he screamed, was suddenly pulled out from the world of Kendo, and regained the mystery. Rusty Sword. God, you are too cruel to Lao Tzu, why don't you come and accept this kid, and I am free for Lao Tzu? The violent soul said angrily, his voice getting softer and lighter, and finally disappeared, as if nothing had happened. The Eternal Sword Master watched the violent soul disappear, shook his head, and murmured, There are people in this world who are worse than the Sword Master, dignified, forget it. Hum. At the moment before the statue, the unknown sword tome had completely entered Qin Chen's liver, an eternal breath escaped from Qin Chen, and Qin Chen's will reappeared in the world of Kendo the next moment. Unexpectedly, you have practiced the nameless sword cannon so quickly, and felt a sense of eternal mood, but your eternity is different from mine, do you understand? Qin Chen didn't expect that the first sentence of the eternal sword master would be this sentence. He pondered for a while and said slowly, understand. Everyone's will is different, because people are inherently different and copy the ways of others. In the end it will only put a shackle on myself. If you can comprehend your own eternal sword intent from my eternal sword intent, it's no wonder you can get to where you are today. After a pause, the eternal sword master said again, your origins may be more amazing than I thought. I have nothing left for you. Just put all my kendo experience into your mind and help you go further. The of the right hand were raised together, and the eternal sword master pointed one on Qin Chen's eyebrows. Hum. Countless chaotic information poured into Qin Chen's soul C, almost breaking his soul. Qin Chen was shocked, the eternal sword master's method was simply unpredictable, and he could actually put his kendo experience into other people's minds. Don't be surprised. My sword intent is eternal sword intent, and kendo experience also has an eternal nature. If you are replaced by another person, no matter how strong you are, there is no way. After you understand my kendo experience, your little girlfriend should also end the experience. Then, it will be the time to stop the lord of the desolate god. After speaking the last sentence, the image of the will of the eternal sword master collapsed. 
I don't know how long it has passed before Qin Chen opened his eyes in front of the statue. Senior Eternal Sword Master, thank you very much. Qin Chen has gained a lot from the Eternal Sword Master's Kendo will, but it cannot be transformed into real combat power at once, and the Eternal Sword Master's three levels of Kendo artistic conception give Qin Chen a direct epiphany. Only when the cultivation base breaks through and the Kendo is completed, you can speak with leaps and bounds and reach a higher level. Look at the Kendo experience of the Eternal Sword Master first. His mind sank into his soul, Qin Chen wandered in that strange stream of information. Watch the sword spectrum at the age of seven, practice the sword at the age of nine, become the sword emperor at the age of twelve, join the Tongtian Sword Pavilion, become an outer disciple, break through the mortal sage at the age of thirty, comprehend the mood of killing, break through the earthly saint in a hundred years, and become a peerless saint in three hundred years, a thousand years into the realm of heavenly sage, became the top arrogant in the history of Tongtian Sword Pavilion. After becoming a sage, he experienced the world, played against countless swordsmen in the heavens, visited the heavenly sage swordsmen, and fought with countless swordsmen, the sword skills became more and more exquisite, the sword intent became more and more intense, the sense of destruction sword intent, the same level of swordsmen, no one is. He rivals. For three thousand years, he achieved the peak of heavenly sage, then traveled to the heavens, and finally experienced life and death, felt the eternal mood, became the supreme sword master, and became the eternal sword master. Time passes by, and the life of the eternal sword master is replayed in Qin Chen's mind. There is no doubt that the eternal sword master's experience is unmatched by Qin Chen, and what Qin Chen lacks is experience. Without sufficient experience, Kendo cannot consummation cannot go further. It has nothing to do with talents and comprehension. It is purely a kind of spiritual fulfillment. This is also the reason why Qin Chen rarely used swords in his later battles, because his fist and supernatural powers were easy to master, but the real realm of Kendo only had time to polish. Now, the Eternal Sword Master's Kendo experience has filled the gap in Qin Chen's experience, and there seemed to be a broken voice deep in his heart, and the Supreme Kendo cheered, as if he had a free body. The Eternal Sword Master's life has been dedicated to the Kendo, and now, Qin Chen's Kendo has been completed. This is Kendo, that's how it is. Qin Chen could feel that a broad road appeared in the world of Kendo in front of him. From today, my strongest is the sword. Qin Chen said silently. It's a pity that although the anonymous sword tome has been integrated into the liver, Qin Chen's five secrets, but the spleen has not been opened, and he cannot enter the realm of heavenly sage. Normally, the sage opens the five secrets and breaks through the heavenly sage. It doesn't need to be so troublesome at all. Any power is enough to activate the five secrets. You only need to feel it and reach the realm. But Qin Chen and the other four secrets have incorporated the treasures above the Saint Master level, so his spleen must also be incorporated into the same level of treasures in order to break through to become a strong heavenly sage. Indispensable. Hum. But at this time, not far away, Sisi opened his eyes suddenly where the nine-tailed fairy fox was. Rumble. A terrible breath swept out of Sisi. The vast heavenly sage rules like countless exercises, revolved around Sisi and Sisi, with the nine-tailed fairy fox circulating, full of sacred aura. God! Sisi is actually breaking through heavenly sage. Compared with Qin Chen, Sisi's breakthrough is much easier. Nine-tailed fairy fox is the pinnacle saint. Her experience, her inheritance and the natural mesmerizing Sisi are perfectly integrated and immediately let Sisi's the cultivation base has undergone unprecedented changes. Boom! But at this moment, a terrifying atmosphere of chaos struck, and it was the statue of the overbearing man, urging the clay pot, and actually shot at Sisi. Eternal, Kyanzian, your two goals will not be achieved. That vast power while Sisi was breaking through the realm of Heavenly Sage, unexpectedly performed a sneak attack. As long as Sisi is killed, 
the plans of the Eternal Sword Master and the Nine-Tailed Fairy Fox will be destroyed and fall short. Lord of the Desolate God, don't think about it. Boom! The phantoms of the Eternal Sword Master and the Nine-Tailed Fairy Fox rose into the sky at the same time and fought against the will of the Lord of Desolation. Then I have to send you on the road. The Lord of the Desolate God said, his voice overbearing, full of terrifying power, making people feel that their guts are about to break. Big Brother, stop it, you are cruel to life, as long as you give up all this and let these two people leave, everything is easy to discuss. Eternal Sword Master said. Eternal, do you really think you are still the Holy Lord? No, you are just a remnant soul. The Lord of Desolate God sneered, took the initiative and pressed it out with one hand, turning into a grinding disc that covered the sky and sun, and went to suppress the Lord of the Eternal Sword. An ancient rune appeared on this millstone, surpassing the height of the rules, as if revealing the true meaning of heaven and earth. Oh. My brother, why have to come this far? The Eternal Sword Master sighed and swung the invisible sword light to greet him. Boom! 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 The battle between the two great saints was terrible. Although it was only two remnant souls, the void was torn apart by life, as if the end of the famine was coming. Swallow the sky jar! The Lord of Desolate God drank coldly and the earthen jar above his head suddenly burst into chaos, blocking the Eternal Sword Master, staring at Qin Chen and Sisi with both eyes, and Qin Chen felt that his skin was about to burst. The Universe Jade Plate Qin Chen urged the universe to make a jade disc, and immediately, the power of the terrifying space permeated, covering this space. The Universe Jade Plate is the supreme treasure of the top space, without fear of the Lord's eyes. Hey? What kind of space treasure is this? At least it is the treasure of the Holy Master, which can actually block my coercion. Hey! The Lord of the Desolate God snorted coldly, and he reached out with one hand, and instantly came to Qin Chen, who was as huge as a star, and wanted to capture Qin Chen together with the Universe Jade Plate. Big Brother, why do you have to betray us? Kyanxian, the nine-tailed fairy fox, slammed back, swinging his tail over the sky, forming a guardian of the world. Boom! She stopped the attack of the Lord of Desolation. Do you really think it can't help you? Huang Shenzi took the initiative and was really angry, hum, suddenly, the whole altar began to glow, a horrible swallowing aura lingered out, covering the sky. Suddenly, Qin Chen felt that the essence and blood in his body were about to come out of his body, becoming the nourishment of the altar and the source of strength for the Lord of Desolation. Moreover, Chen Sisi, who was breaking through, also showed pain. Stop! The Eternal Sword Master roared, he swung his sword, a dazzling light, leaving only a thick sword aura between the heavens and the earth, as if an emperor is traveling, everyone has nothing but to kneel and worship. The Endless Sword Aura is eternal, wearing through the years, eternal existence. Eternal Sword Intent But the Lord of the Desolate God was not afraid, he greeted him with fists, bang bang bang, sword light and fist energy collided, shocking a billion Li. He is the body of the Desolate God, with amazing defense power, invincible at the same level, and even the most terrifying Eternal Sword Intent cannot tear his defense. The two sides fought against each other and saw the aura on the body of the Eternal Sword Master weaker and weaker. His brows were frowning, and now he was only left with a remnant soul, and his cultivation base fell too severely. Under the torment of this altar and the sky-swallowing pot, he could not hold on for long. Eternal Nine-tailed Fairy Fox also said anxiously, with worry in his beautiful eyes. After all, they only have one remnant soul and if this continues, once the remnant soul dissipates, they will not be able to stop the Lord of the Desolate God. Eternal, Kyungzian, why bother? The Lord of the Desolate God said indifferently, Back then, you stopped me, how to complete my great cause obediently, I am afraid that this seed has already achieved the highest and saved the heavens. What nonsense, come to fight! 
the Eternal Sword Master is willing to fight. He and Kyungxian stay here for hundreds of millions of years to stop the Lord of Desolate God. At this moment, he only has the pride of a vigorous battle, even if he burns himself. And no regrets. The Lord of the Desolate God did not speak, but only urged the swallowing jar above his head, and the artistic conception flowed through the years. Originally I wanted to keep the will of both of you together, but now, I can only completely destroy you. Only by destroying and refining you can this seat be stronger. The Lord of Desolate God said Sen Ran. The Eternal Sword Master and the Nine-Tailed Fairy Fox were so angry that they couldn't think of the Lord of the Desolate God, and still clinging to it. However, the two of them could not stop the Lord of the Desolate God. Over hundreds of millions of years, the Lord of the Desolate God recovered more than them. They have gone all out. However, the Lord of the Desolate God controls the altar and possesses the sky-swallowing jar. How can you match it? Send them both out first. The Eternal Sword Master said, to send Qin Chen and Chen Sisi out of here first. Naive, did you give it away? However, the Lord of Desolate God sneered, and a misty atmosphere of chaos exuded from the altar, sealing the world and not giving the Eternal Sword Lord a chance to leave Qin Chen and Chen Sisi. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyung Xian looked desperate. They had never encountered dangerous situations or desperate situations in their lives. The Lord of the Wild Gods designed to swallow them, the crisis was also resolved by them, and the other party's conspiracy was destroyed. However, now, they really have no retreat. Hundreds of millions of years of hard work, in the end, it is still nothing. It's over. The Lord of Desolate God came out domineeringly, and the breath of the Venerable was filled as if touching the invincible realm. Boom! At this moment, Qin Chen came up, holding the mysterious rust sword, and slashed out brazenly. He mobilized the power of the soul and attracted the power of the mysterious rust sword. Suddenly, the cold aura of the mysterious rust sword surged and slashed violently. Okay. The eternal sword master and Kyungzian looked at Qin Chen at the same time, feeling that his state at this time was a little abnormal. At this moment, Qin Chen was full of violent aura, his eyes were blood red, and he was crazy. In that mysterious rust sword, something seemed to be resurrected. That's the breath of that lord. The eternal sword master was shocked. The terrifying rust sword pierced, and the lord of the desolate god snorted coldly. Although Qin Chen's aura had become very strange, it was still indistinguishable from scum in his eyes, so he raised his hand and grabbed it at Qin Chen. Puff! But immediately, the Lord of Desolate God was frightened and angry, and Qin Chen's sword actually wounded him, and his palm was split into a crack, faintly, as if about to collapse. What power is this? The Lord of Desolate God was unbelievable, although he only had a remnant soul left, and he did not have the supreme real body of the year fighting with the power of consciousness, but he shouldn't be injured by a scum like Qin Chen. It's the power escaping from this mysterious sword. The Lord of Desolate God stared at the mysterious rust sword in Qin Chen's hand and saw Qin Chen split it again, immediately urging the clay pot above his head. Boom! In the earthen jar, the atmosphere of chaos lingered, actually blocking the breath of the mysterious rust sword. What a kid, it can hurt me. It's the flesh I like. The Lord of the Desolate God shook Qin Chen with the sky-swallowing jar, and then grabbed Qin Chen with his big hand. Stop! The Eternal Sword Master and Kyungzian stepped forward to stop them in anger, but the Lord of the Desolate God urged the altar and immediately suppressed the two of them. At the same time, his big hand already grabbed Qin Chen. This flesh body, I want it. The Lord of Desolate God sneered, and a terrifying consciousness surged directly out, and the pressure of the pinnacle holy master level rushed into Qin Chen's mind for an instant, and he would annihilate Qin Chen's soul and occupy his body. Hum. At this critical moment, a mysterious ancient book appeared in Qin Chen's mind. The ancient book bloomed with radiance and the eternal power of ten thousand realms bloomed. Ah, what is this? 
Under the power of the ancient book, the consciousness of the Lord of the desolate God was instantly shattered and screamed. This is the time. Qin Chen, whose eyes were hazy, suddenly exploded from his eyes. The Universe Jade Plate Qin Chen violently urged the universe of good fortune jade disks to evolve an endless black hole. In the black hole, a terrifying dark aura surged out, as if there were some terrifying monsters going out of the endless void. That is. The Eternal Sword Master and Qiangxian both looked over in shock, only feeling that the breath of the endless void made them tremble. Next moment. Boom. Countless tentacles rushed out from the jade disk of good fortune in the universe, and the black tentacles danced wildly, swept across the remnant soul of the Lord of Desolation. It is the Devil Tree of Ten Thousand Realms. The Devil Tree of the Ten Thousand Realms, which specializes in restraining the soul, can swallow all things. It was able to swallow the remnant soul of the Lord Yama, and naturally it can swallow the remnant soul of the Lord of the Desolate God. Numerous tentacles swept over, and the Lord of the Desolate God suddenly felt a strong heart. Fear and Danger Machine The character of the saint has a keen perception, and he instantly understands that the endless dark tentacles in front of him can definitely hurt him. In fright, he dodged wildly, and at the same time, he was about to activate the sky-swallowing jar to block the endless package of tentacles. The Origin of Time how could Qin Chen give him this opportunity? He had anticipated all of this a long time ago, and in a flash, he moved the origin of time in his mind. Hum. In the trance, it may be a moment, or it may be a ten thousandth, the time of the heavens suddenly paused. And this moment is enough. Call. The endless tentacles of the devil tree of the ten thousand worlds instantly wrapped the remnant soul of the lord of the desolate god in the middle. Ah! The Lord of the Desolate God was trapped in the Devil Tree of the Ten Thousand Realms, and he roared in agony. His remnant soul was bound by the Demon Tree of the Thousand Realms, struggling with anger, trying to break through the shackles of the Devil Tree of the Ten Thousand Realms, but it was useless. In the double beam of the Jade Disk and the Magic Tree of the World. Under the bondage, the remnant soul of the Lord of Desolate God could not break free. Come. Qin Chen urged the universe good fortune jade disk and the ten thousand realms demon tree, and with his endless power, the remnant soul of the lord of the desolate god was instantly included in the universe good fortune jade disk. What? In the jade disk of good fortune in the universe, the remnant soul of the lord of desolation was even more unable to make waves. Amid the screams, dying, only a little remnant soul remained. However, this remnant soul is the most difficult to extinguish. Qin Chen is not in a hurry, urging the power of the years in the Jade Disk of Good Fortune of the Universe, together with the Devil Tree of the World and the Jade Disk of Good Fortune of the Universe. A trace of remnant soul, completely suppressed. In the endless years, together with the remnant soul of the Lord Yama, was imprisoned in the depths of the Jade Plate of Good Fortune in the Universe. Hum. Outside. Losing the control of the Lord of Desolate God, the heaven-swallowing jar and the altar instantly calmed down. This. Not far away, the Eternal Sword Master and Kyungzian looked at this scene, completely stunned. Before, they were still desperate and didn't know what to do, but in the blink of an eye, the crisis was resolved, Qin Chen relied on one person to suppress the Lord of the Desolate God, this kind of strong contrast made them crazy. This is the Lord of the Desolate God, the Holy Lord of the Peak, the top powerhouse of the heavens who has already spied a trace of the realm of the Venerable. Even if there is only a remnant soul left, it is still extremely terrifying. One thought will destroy the world and easily annihilate a heavenly sage. Soul. But now. Eternal Sword Master and Kyungxian almost thought they were dazzled. The two seniors, now that the crisis is resolved. They are all right now, and the two seniors don't have to burn the remnants of their souls. Qin Chen exhaled. This time, it was more dangerous than the time when the demon tree of ten thousand worlds was conquered in Yama's secret realm. At the critical moment, it was the ancient book that frightened and frightened the consciousness impact of the Lord of Desolate God. 
otherwise, it was just that blow, and Qin Chen's soul would be shattered. So ten thousand. The world magic tree has no chance to display it. But in the end, Qin Chen won the bet. Oh, oh. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyanxian were still a little dazed, and it took a long time to come back to their senses. They were a little shocked, what are the countless tentacles you just displayed? It seems something like the power of a demon. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyangzian both felt stunned in their hearts. If Qin Chen is a demon clan, then... The two seniors, that is indeed a treasure of the demon race, but that demon treasure has been sacrificed by the juniors, and the juniors are of pure human blood. Please don't worry about the two seniors. Qin Chen knew what they were worried about and explained immediately. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyangzian just breathed out a long sigh. In fact, they could also see that Qin Chen was a real human race, but Chen Sisi was a bit weird, obviously of human blood, but seemed to have mastered some terrifying rules of magic. But before. In that case, they have no choice at all. It seems that the waves behind the Tianhe River are pushing the waves forward. The two of us are indeed old. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyangzian looked at each other, both showing bitter smiles, but this also made them extremely gratified, at least, the crisis was resolved, and the two of them could also leave safely. The two looked at each other, hugged each other, smiled at each other, and the remnant souls on their bodies radiated a faint light, and they were obviously about to enter the state of transmutation, blending with the rules of the heavens. Since then, completely disappeared in this world. But there was no resentment in the two of them, only the comfort of being together. Two seniors, maybe the younger ones have a way to keep the two remnants of souls alive. Qin Chen said suddenly. Do you have a way? The Eternal Sword Master and Kyung Xian were stunned. Qin Chen nodded. In his opinion, the universe Jade Plate can retain the remnants of the Lord of the Desolate God and the Lord of Yama, and naturally also the remnants of the Eternal Sword Lord and Kyangzian. Under the power of time, it can be guaranteed the remnant soul power of the two no longer dies, but... It's just a preservation. If you want to heal this remnant soul, with Qin Chen's current strength, it is impossible to do it. You mean... What you trapped the Lord of the Desolate God just now turned out to be a small world treasure. In that treasure, there is a strong power of time that can keep our remnant souls sleeping without falling. He Kyungzian was shocked, and was completely shocked by Qin Chen's words. After a long time, the two men recovered, and after looking at each other, they both smiled bitterly, it is not necessary. Instead of lingering on like this and falling into a deep sleep, I and Kyung I'm not as good as. We went to death together, and now that the two of us have fulfilled our wish, nothing else cares about. The Eternal Sword Master looked very openly. Eternal Sword Master, Senior Kyungzian, although you can only sleep in the treasures of the younger generation's space, maybe one day, when the younger generation has enough strength, they will inevitably find new bodies for the two seniors and let the two seniors resurrect it again. This. The Eternal Sword Master and Kyung Xian looked at each other, and they were both silent. Even if they are the pinnacle holy masters, they will see through life and death in their entire lives, and they may live beyond things. Who wants to die? In the end, the Eternal Sword Master and Kyung Xian made a decision, accepted Qin Chen's kindness, entered the universe fortune jade plate and fell asleep under the seal of the Devil Tree of Ten Thousand Worlds and the Power of Time. Before they fell asleep, the two had only one request, that was to make Qin Chen destroy the desolate altar, and let this great array of sacrifices to the creatures of the world be destroyed. Without reminding them, Qin Chen would do the same. Such an evil altar would naturally not be allowed to continue to be destroyed. If you want to break through this altar, you must first control this clay pot. Qin Chen urged the demon tree of the Ten Thousand Realms and entangled the earthen pot. Although the Lord of the Desolate God had been suppressed by him, he still carefully baptized the earthen pot with the demon tree of the Thousand Realms before he began to sacrifice the earth. Tank. Hum. 
a trace of soul power poured into the earthen jar. This time, what Qin Chen felt was no longer the phantom of the altar, but a series of terrible prohibitions. It was the prohibition on this earthen jar. This earthen jar was the top treasure, even with Qin Chen's restricted cultivation base, can't be refined in a short period of time, and can only be slowly dissolved with Saint Yuan and soul power. Since this is the case, I will slowly refine this clay pot, as well as Sisi. Judging from the transformation in Sisi's body, it is impossible to break through the realm of Heavenly Sage in a short time. The transformation of the body, it takes a long time. Although Sisi is marching towards the realm of Heavenly Sage, after all, Sisi is not like Qin Chen. It is because of the power instilled by Qianxian, the nine-tailed fairy fox, that Sisi has entered the realm of Heavenly Sage in one fell swoop. She needs a lot of time to change. Originally, the nine-tailed fairy fox's idea was to use the method of pulling out seedlings to promote Sisi, so that Sisi could complete the Heavenly Sage breakthrough in a very short time, and get rid of the conspiracy of the Lord of the Wild Gods. But now that the crisis has been eliminated, Sisi naturally does not need to do so, so the transformation in Sisi's body has become stable, and everything is only for a better future in the future. Thinking of this, Qin Chen directly brought Sisi into the universe good fortune jade plate, and, surging with the breath of the Saint Master class ancient holy vein, Sisi's body was transformed. But Qin Chen himself urged the time to speed up and sacrificed the clay pot at a speed of 50 times the flow rate. With a spit of Saint Yuan directly on the earthen jar, Qin Chen shot out hundreds of hand tactics in an instant. All of a sudden, the earthen jar began to turn into an unusually strong light. Qin Chen practiced a little bit. What a formidable restriction, it is endless. It is worthy of being the top treasure of the Lord of the Desolate God. Moreover, in this sky-swallowing jar, the Lord of Desolate contains all the ancient auras of the Lord of Desolation. You can quickly restore the cultivation base to the peak by relying on the sky-swallowing pot, and now it's all cheaper for me. The endless ancient aura lingered, and Qin Chen's physical body was rapidly improving at the same time. When I sacrifice and refine this sky-swallowing pot, I will incorporate this treasure into my spleen. In the Five Secrets, the spleen belongs to the earth, and the attributes of this earthen pot are perfectly integrated. All, my five secrets are great, you can step into the realm of heavenly sage in one fell swoop. Furthermore, with the transformation of this wild ancient aura, my physical body will become a wild ancient sacrament, and my defense power will be increased tenfold. The only trouble is the ancient sacred veins. When I break through the heavenly sage, the ancient holy energy that needs to be consumed is definitely huge. If I swallow the sacred master class ancient sacred veins in the jade plate of the universe fortune, it will definitely consume its stock and even affect it. The growth of the devil tree of the ten thousand worlds and the stability of the jade disc of good fortune in the universe. Qin Chen's biggest headache now is that the ancient holy veins are not enough. Although he has a saint master level ancient sacred vein, Qin Chen consumes too many resources every time he breaks through. This saint master level ancient sacred vein is inherently incomplete and can only be used to provide the growth of the 10,000 realm demon tree. And the metamorphosis of the jade disc of good fortune in the universe, once it is absorbed by him, it will be bad. Forget it, let's talk about refining this clay pot. Qin Chen felt the strength of his physical body, rising steadily, and the infinite ancient aura was baptizing his flesh. His cultivation had never broken through, but the strength of his physical body had long surpassed many heavenly sage masters. Now that he is fighting against Zhu Xingqian, he must be more confident. The magical powers of origin were operating, endless runes flickered, and forbidden sweeping, Qin Chen urged the energy to refine this sky-swallowing pot over and over. The restrictions in the sky-swallowing pot were refined by Qin Chen one by one, and there was a trace of connection between Qin Chen and the sky-swallowing pot. Click. Qin Chen's body was also constantly changing in the process. Time passed, at 50 times the flow rate of time, after a full half a year, 
Qin Chen finally made enough contact with the Tunchen Kin. Hum. The sky swallowing pot that resembled a black hole was suspended above Qin Chen's head, swallowing and flickering, endless chaotic aura surging, setting off Qin Chen like a and demon. It's too strong, this is the sky swallowing pot? I have a feeling that if I push it with all my strength, I am afraid that all the holy Yuan in my body will be exhausted, and I will not be able to completely activate the sky swallowing pot, but even if it is only a touch, it is enough to destroy the world. Qin Chen shocked, this sky swallowing pot was suspended above Qin Chen's head, giving Qin Chen a feeling of heaven and earth. After all, he is not even a heavenly saint, how could he urge such a powerful peak saint master to treasure? Didn't you see that the other treasures of the Holy Lord have been asleep after entering Qin Chen's five secrets, haven't they been urged? As long as he could spur any Holy Lord treasure, how could he be chased and killed so embarrassed by Zhu Xing Tian? However, although Qin Chen was unable to urge the sky swallowing pot, nor entered the heavenly sage, his cultivation level was more than doubled compared to before. How could he be a body that had been transformed by the aura of the ancients? It seemed to have become the body of a and demon, exuding an aura of endless heart palpitations. After a short breath, the terrifying power in the void faintly came, filling the whole body. If there is enough ancient holy energy now, Qin Chen can directly integrate the sky swallowing pot into his spleen and advance to become the heavenly sage of the world. Does it really want to devour the ancient saint master level saint veins? Qin Chen was silent. Heavenly Sage, the realm he has been pursuing, as long as he makes up his mind to swallow this ancient holy vein of the holy master level, he will definitely succeed. But in the end, Qin Chen shook his head. No, the ancient holy veins of the holy master level are too scarce to be wasted here. It is a pity that the Lord of the Desolate God not only sacrificed the entire tribe, but also sacrificed all the ancient sacred veins in the tribe and even sacrificed countless treasures, otherwise it would be so troublesome. However, although I can't absorb this saint master level ancient saint vein, isn't there any other saint vein? That Ju Sing Tian is a strong man in the dead soul realm, a strong man who has half-footed into the middle of the heavenly sage, this once you come to the deserted ancient ruins, will you not have any holy vein reserves on your body? Suddenly, Qin Chen smiled coldly. With my current cultivation base, even if I haven't broken through the heavenly sage, I don't need to be afraid of this Ju Sing Tian. Go out and look for the Ju Sing Tian. While speaking, Qin Chen didn't hesitate anymore. He came out of the universe jade plate, shuttled out at once, and came to the cave outside the altar. Then, he saw an incredible scene, this Ju Sing Tian was actually outside the cave. Boom! Outside the cave, horrible ancient auras lingered, and Zhu Xing Tian hovered in this ancient aura, the shining bright light on his body, the aura on his body became more and more powerful, and it was even more terrifying than before. Did he break through the middle stage of Heavenly Sage? No, it's a little bit close. Qin Chen felt the breath of Zhu Xing Tian, which was almost exactly the same as in the middle stage of Heavenly Sage but his cultivation level had not completely broken through. Okay, 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 if he really breaks through, then it will be in trouble again. Qin Chen was completely relieved. And the moment Qin Chen saw Zhu Xing Tian, this Zhu Xing Tian also saw Qin Chen. Ha ha ha! Zhu Xing Tian's heart was filled with surprises, his body suddenly stood up, infinite power erupted from his body, his eyes opened, and the rainbow sword, as if a volcano was erupting in his body. The baptism of the ancient power has made his strength crazy progress. Smelly boy, I'm about to break through the middle stage of the heavenly sage, and I am going to find you. I didn't expect you to run out, eh? Why is your aura stronger? Could it be that you got some adventures in it, ha ha ha, it's a pity that in front of me, Ju Sing Tian, you are a half-step heavenly sage boy. No adventure is enough. Everything about you will eventually become the harvest of this seat. Zhu Xing Tian roared wildly, directly incarnate Xingtai executioner, 
and seeing Axe Phantom appeared before him, slashing violently towards Qin Chen. He wanted to slay Qin Chen with one blow and seize his chance. Want to kill me, too naive, Zhu Xing Tian, I am afraid you still don't know what situation you are facing. The nameless sword suddenly appeared in Qin Chen's hand, and the killing sword intention had already been cut out. The two martial arts collisions caused a series of spatial explosions, and the resulting power shook the entire cave rumblingly. Under a single blow, the two sides were evenly matched, and they did not distinguish between superiors. What? You are several times tyrannical than before. What did you get behind that door? Zhu Xing Tian showed a shocked face. He was cultivating here, and his strength has been amazingly improved. According to the truth, Qin Chen will not be his opponent even if he makes a breakthrough, but now, under a single blow, how can he make Zhu Xing Tian not be surprised? It must be known that his current cultivation base is sufficient to resist the real mid-level sage powerhouse. With the inheritance of the predecessor of the Eternal Sword Master, my killing mood has really improved. Qin Chen insisted on Xing Tian's move, and immediately knew his current strength, compared with how much he didn't know before. Come again. Taking advantage of the shocking moment of Zhu Xing Tian, Qin Chen waved the nameless sword in his hand and used a destructive mood. As soon as this trick was released, it immediately turned into good fortune, dominating the world and exterminating the world. Qin Chen's destructive mood is just a beginning, but it has already demonstrated the aura of eternal power. Boom! The Saint Yuan shield of Zhu Xing Tian's body exploded, and the endless ancient aura boiled, and he suddenly blasted him out. He snorted, and a blood burst out from his chest, already injured. Damn it, boy, do you think that if you get some inheritance, you can win me? Xing Tian's technique, I am God's punishment. Zhu Xing Tian roared, his lifespan burned in his body, he once again played his own Xing Tian Zhu Shui, the punishment was all destroyed, and he fought hard against Qin Chen. Hey, why are you punishing the heavens? In front of the young master, the heavens will lower their noble heads, let alone you are such an ant-like executioner. Qin Chen sneered, his body was still motionless under the endless heavenly punishment. He was like a and devil, with the ancient aura surging through his body, and he didn't evade and walk straight into the endless heavenly punishment. Boom boom boom. The terrible power of heavenly punishment fell on him, and Qin Chen's body suddenly surged with endless absurd ancient power. Under the strangulation of the power of heavenly punishment, the terrifying body of god and demon only appeared cracks, but soon, it recovered. Come over. The luster is round and unscathed. After Qin Chen's body was baptized by the gas of the sky swallowing pot, he stepped into an unprecedented level. Boom! The whole cave roared, and the world seemed to collapse. Qin Chen appeared cracks, but it was quickly repaired with the supplement of the ancient aura. Zhu Xing Tian's eyes went straight, and he was extremely shocked how can your defense be so terrible? Even if you are a strong mid-term heavenly sage, you will be severely injured by my blow, but you are unscathed. After that portal, what adventure did you get? Zhu Xing Tian is going crazy. With his desperate blow, he didn't even have the qualifications to injure Qin Chen, how could he fight? Zhu Xing Tian didn't know that Qin Chen's physical defense was invincible in this cave filled with endless ridiculous atmosphere. Hey, Zhu Xing Tian. This is your assassin? Even my physical defense can't be broken. It's too weak. What necromantic giant, I think it's a three-year-old kid. Qin Chen walked out of the explosion like a OR devil, quietly erecting the nameless sword in his hand. Next, it's my turn. Eternal Sword Intent Qin Chen displayed his eternal sword intent at the last moment. Suddenly, a sword light that seemed to penetrate the endless darkness and slashed out of the eternal existence from the moment the world opened up, like a blow from the sky, instantly smashed into the sky body. What? Zhu Xing Tian let out a scream, a deep sword mark appeared on his chest, and the blood surged. If it were not for Qin Chen's hand at the last moment, 
this Ju Xin Tian would definitely be split in half under one sword. No, let's go. Ju Xin Tian was terrified, turned around and was about to flee, going to leave through the sky, and at the same time sent a message to ask for help. But Qin Chen didn't give him a chance to escape at all. A magnificent hand, like a chicken, instantly grabbed Ju Xin Tian in his hand, and when a town was empty, he was included in the universe good fortune jade plate. Ha ha ha, so many ancient holy veins, not bad, not bad. Qin Chen nodded in satisfaction. In fact, one and a half sky level ancient sacred veins are not enough for Qin Chen to fully enter the realm of heavenly saints, but as long as there are so many ancient sacred veins to base, then Qin Chen will consume less holy master level ancient sacred veins. A lot, in this way, it won't. How much impact did it have on the jade disk of good fortune in the universe? This Ju Xin Tian is really his own lucky star. You, brat, I played with you. Ju Xin Tian saw that Qin Chen had taken out all his ancient saint veins, his face turned green, and he was struggling frantically. These ancient sacred veins were all reserved by him in order to break through the midterm of the heavenly sage. He had consumed half of them in his previous cultivation in the barren ancient cave, so only this one and a half remained, and the remaining half-day level ancient sacred vein was enough for his cultivation to enter the middle of the heavenly sage. Even to the peak. Realm advances. But now, all of this was snatched by Qin Chen. Ah! Ju Xin Tian is going crazy. It is important to know that the necrosphere is extremely chaotic and the strong will target it. Any heavenly ancient saint vein is extremely rare, very rare, and hard to come by. Think about it, even the Yundong light of the Yunzhou governor has only one heavenly ancient sacred vein, and that one is still located under the Yunzhou state city and used to stimulate the Yunzhou state city formation. It's impossible to take all of it for refining. The rarity of the holy vein. But now, the ancient sacred veins he finally collected have been looted like this, and he is going crazy. Boy, I'm fighting with you. Ju Xin Tian's rage could not be increased, but even if his strength was increased tenfold in the universe jade plate, he could only be suppressed to death, unable to move. Humph, don't do unnecessary resistance. In Ben Shao's world, no matter how hard you struggle, you can't escape. In this world, Ben Shao is God. Qin Chen snorted coldly, reached out with his big hand, and grabbed Ju Xin Tian's head as if he was carrying a chicken. Don't worry, this young man will not kill you for the time being. The heavenly sage rules in your body are already despised, but the power of your punishment that day, the mystery of incarnation of Xingtai, is somewhat interesting, let him take a closer look. Look. Qin Chen sneered and the heavenly soul forbidden art was used. Suddenly, the whole body of judgment heaven became transparent. The heavenly sage rules and roots in the body appeared, like chains, bursting out with dazzling light, and in this heavenly sage rules, he the profound meaning of cultivation is also gone. Entering Qin Chen's eyes, Qin Chen quickly analyzed it. Qin Chen could spy on the power and magical powers in his body without refining Ju Xin Tian. This method was simply magical. You, you are not a human. Ju Xin Tian was horrified. Everything that Qin Chen did completely exceeded his expectations. Nothing else, just a half-step heavenly sacred cultivation as a way to capture him has already entered. The techniques of the mid Tian sage masters are magical, and now they are far weaker than. His cultivation base is investigating his soul and mastering his magical powers. Is that human being? It's a monster, it's a monster. Bang! After some snooping, Qin Chen had already clearly understood the rules of heavenly sage and many magical powers in Ju Xin Tian's body. With a flick of his hand, he threw Ju Xin Tian away, and then countless ten thousand world demons. The tree tentacles have already wrapped the Ju Xin Tian Tuan Tuan. Live! It's interesting to evolve the execution ground and become a celestial execution ground executioner. You actually got the inheritance of an ancient celestial executioner. It's kind of interesting. 
Combining this thing with my sword intent of destruction and the power of thunder may be able to evolve even more terrifying. Supernatural powers come. Qin Chen nodded in satisfaction, this power of Xing Tian still had a lot of benefits to him, and even gave him a vague touch of how the ancient heavens punish criminals. This is, the breath of the demon race, are you, from the demon race? The ten thousand realms demon tree surrounded Zhu Xing Tian Tuan Tuan, and there was a sound of horror. Then, the power of the ten thousand demon trees began to slowly enter Zhu Xing Tian's body. This Zhu Xing Tian is a powerful mid Tian sage, and it's still a bit useful, and this dead soul realm is a chaotic area, and the surrounding palaces can't be controlled, but it is a place that can be occupied, and it has become a secret of my Chindi pavilion. Station, and this final punishment. Heaven, has been developing in the realm of the dead, but can make good use of it. Qin Chen smiled secretly, he now wants to use the power of the Ten Thousand Realms Demon Tree to let the Zhu Xing Tian body integrate into the Ten Thousand Realms Demon Source and be controlled by himself. With the Ten Thousand Realms Demon Tree, Qin Chen no longer needs to seal every strong man's soul, but it saves him a lot of trouble, and the breath of the Ten Thousand Realms Demon Source can also greatly transform Zhu Xing Tian's aptitude, so he has a stronger future. And development. Next it is to break through the heavenly saint. Qin Chen's figure flickered, and he went directly to the depths of the universe good fortune jade plate, urging time to accelerate. Immediately afterwards, Qin Chen began to integrate the sky-swallowing pot into himself, and entered the practice of the last secret of the five secrets. Boom! The sky-swallowing pot contained the ultimate violent ancient energy, which had swallowed the entire altar where the Lord of the Wild God had smelted hundreds of millions of years of power. As soon as he entered Qin Chen's body, an endless ancient power swept over. Humph! Qin Chen snorted in pain, his eyes turned blood red, Kaka, his powerful body, because he couldn't bear the power of the sky-swallowing pot, cracks began to appear, endless ancient aura. Jet from his body. Sweeping across the universe, the world is boundless. That kind of pain is simply more terrifying than being shattered. Buzzing. In Qin Chen's body, the powerful Eucharistic force constantly repaired his body, but every time his body was repaired, the terrifying atmosphere of ancient times would tear Qin Chen's body. There seems to be a puzzle. The human body is full of cracks, and every crack sprays terrible power. Ben Shao doesn't believe it anymore, give me suppression. Qin Chen roared, under this kind of pain, roaring angrily, with firm will, slowly blending the sky-swallowing pot into his body. This speed is extremely slow, Qin Chen's body will be torn apart ten or a hundred times with every single cent of pressure. How can ordinary people tolerate this kind of pain? But Qin Chen held back. The universe is boundless. I am strong. Any strong person will experience endless pain when he grows up. What am I suffering now? Qin Chen's will was crystal clear and turned into sacred light, not being crushed by any pain. Qin Chen understood this truth long ago in the Tianyu continent. In his previous life, he was a dead vein, but he could become the top bloodline master, tool refiner and alchemist on the Tianyu continent. What did he rely on? It is this spirit of not admitting defeat. On the road of life, any person will encounter many ups and downs and difficulties, and more than 99% of them will shrink in the face of difficulties, and the remaining 1% will meet difficulties come up. And among this 1%, more than 90% will fail, and only the last handful of people can rise to the top and become a highly anticipated existence. But no matter how many people can reach the top in the end, if you surrender and give in at the first level of difficulty, then you will never succeed in the end. Suppress me. Boom boom boom. Inside Qin Chen, the endless roar resounded, there were great thunder sounds, the rules of heaven and earth, the birth and death of the universe, the origin of all things, the simple small sword at the heart, the sky-filling hammer in the lungs, the palace of life and death in the kidneys, and the namelessness in the liver sword classic 
the four great treasures tremble at the same time, erupting endless power. Hum. In particular, the Sky Patching Hammer is a secret treasure of the Sky Patching Palace, capable of refining all the most treasures in the heavens. Under the suppression of the Sky Patching Hammer's breath, even the sky swallowing pot that incorporates all the power of the Lord of Desolation can only be suppressed a little bit. All the treasures began to resonate in Qin Chen's body and regrouped. The heavenly sage principles that were originally condensed in Qin Chen's body burst into bursts under this breath, and then condensed again, forming a purer, larger, and vast brand new. The chain of Tian Sheng rules represents the order of all things. Each kind of treasure represents a kind of attribute showing the aura against the sky, the endless chaotic aura surging, passing down from the endless void, baptizing Qin Chen's physical body, making Qin Chen's power more powerful, the heavenly law of the whole body reveals the principle of the universe's operation. Qin Chen's body, under this force, began to skyrocket wildly and stepped into a brand new realm. Moreover, this sky-swallowing jar also contains the astonishing insight of the Lord of the Desolate God, among which the strongest is his supreme boxing technique Desolate Ancient Divine Dao. This punch. Qin Chen was shocked. Countless phantoms surging in Qin Chen's mind. This is the supreme fist of the Lord of the Desolate God. It is led by his body of the Desolate God. This type of fist cannot be used by anyone except the top physical powerhouse with the ancient aura because the most important thing is the physical body. This is also the strongest move of the Lord of the Desolate God. He combines the supernatural powers of the Desolate Body, which is enough to open the sky and the earth, and even the Eternal Sword intent of the Eternal Sword Lord cannot easily break. Why is the Lord of Desolate God so strong? It is because of the special abilities of his wild ancient race, the ancient body, this kind of body is cultivated to the end. When fighting against other strong people, the strong people of the same level can't tear his defenses, how can he fight? And what weapons does such a terrifying body need? The flesh is their weapon, and the fist is their weapon. Even some holy master weapons are not as powerful as their physical bodies. Boom! Finally, thanks to Qin Chen's efforts, the sky-swallowing pot was smelted into the spleen representing the attributes of the earth. Among the five secrets, the five most treasures resonated at the same time and competed to reflect each other. At this moment, Qin Chen's body resonated with the great Dao, his physical strength, soul and will all surged, and he truly reached a peak. As long as he had enough ancient holy energy, he could raise his realm and truly step into the realm of heavenly sage. Exquisite heavenly pill, give me out, all the ancient holy veins will be decomposed for me all melted, and I will create a new divine body, the origin of good fortune, all kinds of things, eternal immortality, immortal and free. At this time, Qin Chen got the few bottles of exquisite heavenly pills in Yama's secret realm and finally had his works. Countless exquisite heavenly pills flew away like a fish, puff, puff, Qin Chen clicked out with both hands, and suddenly, countless peculiar heaven pills exploded one by one and the breath of the vast pill that represented heavenly sage burst into the sky. The Magnificent Picture Scroll There are countless ancient sacred veins, many pinnacle sacred veins of land, and the one and a half sky level ancient sacred veins, all exploded together, and the ancient holy energy that resembled a real dragon roared and roared in the void. Qin Chen sucked into his mouth frantically like a whale sucking water. Qin Chen's body has reached the peak of strength again, and every cell is close to perfection, like crystals, stained with golden light. The heavenly sage law in Qin Chen's body also began to condense. Based on the core heavenly sage law, the heavenly sage chains that directly connected to the heavens and the earth continued to form. Many sacred auras of heaven and earth are automatically combined, evolved, condensed, intertwined, and condensed into an extremely magnificent law of heaven and earth. Bang 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 these heavenly sacred laws, each of them is extremely thick, and even larger than the heavenly sage laws in the mid Tian sage powerhouses like Ju Sing Tian, like a pillar of heaven, and like an angry dragon, making a fierce roar. This is simply terrifying. 
if the heavenly saints from outside see the scene, they will be shocked and shocked. It should be understood that Qin Chen has only entered the early stage of the heavenly sage, and his one heavenly sage law is as terrifying as the hundreds of ordinary heavenly sages. This is so terrifying. The chains of the heavenly holy laws were formed, and a large amount of heaven and earth holy energy was consumed madly. However, Qin Chen was obviously not satisfied with this. The countless power of the peerless heavenly pill was integrated into his physical body, and every pebble heavenly pill contained astonishing power. I want to be the first person of the heavenly sage, and I want to gain stronger strength, from heaven to earth, respect me, heaven and earth, I am the strongest. Qin Chen suddenly swallowed all the ancient sacred veins and the peerless heavenly pills into his body, and countless ancient sacred veins evaporated and burned, serving as the source of strength for the transformation of the heavenly sacred law. The medicinal power of that unique heavenly pill, countless ancient holy veins, instantly burns and consumes violently, and is directly refined by him and integrated into his body. Even all of these powers are being consumed quickly, and they are not enough. I had expected it a long time ago, not enough, not enough, Saint Master level ancient Saint Vane, burn. Qin Chen roared urging the ancient holy vein of the saint master class in the jade disc of good fortune in the universe. Suddenly, the huge holy vein dragon with a length of hundreds of millions of miles suddenly erupted and gave Qin Chen a steady stream of breakthroughs. Saint, the power to transform the heavenly saint law does not need Qin Chen to worry about the slightest sacred spirit being exhausted. The warrior's impact on the heavenly sage is actually a very dangerous process. Once the heavenly sage law is transformed, the heaven and earth's holy energy is not enough. If something goes wrong, it will trigger a chain reaction, ranging from incomplete breakthrough, damage to the repair base, and serious to heavenly sage. The law is ruined, and the whole body is turned into ashes, even if it can save his life by chance, he will become a waste. Boom! And at the last moment when Qin Chen hit the heavenly sage, not far away, Chen Sisi, who was transforming physically and also breaking through the realm of Heavenly Sage, was also drawn. On her body, the colorful light bloomed, and the sacred breath lingered and combined. The aura of the Deep Demon Way of the Deep Demon Clan formed a black and white yin and yang picture, and it resonated with Qin Chen's breakthrough power. Boom! Two breaths, one left and the other right, one yin and the other yang. The power of Qin Chen and Chen Sisi had merged, and the two quickly became entangled. This is. Qin Chen felt the breath change and was shocked, because he could feel that Sisi's power and his own power were partly entangled. Although it was only a small part, there was an unprecedented resonance between the two. Less dust. In the dark, Qin Chen seemed to hear a low whisper. Sisi. Qin Chen opened his mouth in surprise. He couldn't think of it, because his breakthrough Heavenly Sage actually resonated with Sisi's breakthrough, speeding up Sisi's breakthrough, so that at the same time, they both stepped into the realm of Heavenly Sage. Okay, Sisi, you and I let go of the barrier, let my power help you, and you let your power me. Qin Chen roared. Crackling. In Qin Chen's body, all the law powers, all combined turned into the heavenly sage law, the power in the body was empty, but the medicinal power of the peerless heavenly pill and the holy energy of the ancient holy veins continuously supplemented in. Roar! 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 Qin Chen's whole person is full of clouds, and Chen Sisi in the distance is charming, evolving with multicolored divine light, and with the yin and yang diagram rotating, slowly approaching Qin Chen, the two are almost parallel and close to each other. In the boundless light, Qin Chen saw Sisi, and Sisi also saw him. Boom! The power of horror was violent, and the power of the two clashed wildly, with terrible lethality, causing all the robes on his body to shatter. Qin Chen saw Sisi's perfect body, and Sisi also saw Qin Chen's supremacy. Body! The faces of both of them were red especially Sisi, very shy and blush at the base of their necks. No, 
here we are in conflict with each other's power. Think about it, don't resist, and merge our souls. Only in this way can our powers be perfectly integrated and there will be no conflict. Qin Chen urged the heavenly soul forbidden technique and built a soul bridge between the two. The next moment, the soul power of the two touched together, as if being electrocuted. Little dust, I finally waited for you. The souls of Sisi and Qin Chen were entangled together, crying with ecstasy. I'm not dreaming, am I? I'm really not dreaming. Sisi hugged Qin Chen hard, as if once released, the two would be separated forever, unwilling to let go for even a second. No, it's not a dream, I'm sorry Sisi, I'm late and make you suffer. Qin Chen stroked Sisi's face and said softly. He lowered his head and kissed Sisi's mouth. Sisi's whole body seemed to be electrocuted. Although it was at the soul level, it still seemed to provoke an electric current, and his whole body trembled. Boom boom boom. The terrifying heavenly sage breath was violent, Qin Chen let go of Sisi's soft lips, raised his head, and looked at the sky with his eyes. Sisi, we are together. Qin Chen roared fiercely. At this moment, it was the final moment of breakthrough. The endless years of power in the jade disk of good fortune of heaven and earth was shocked. Above the two of them, countless tributaries of destiny were spinning, the breath of the long river of years. Surging, exuding immense power, unexpectedly showed the path of their future destiny. At this moment, Qin Chen is a key point. He wants to grasp the strongest one in the long river of years and become the strongest himself. Over the years, I have seen my countless auras of destiny. The past is irreversible, and the future is unpredictable. There are thousands of possibilities for my future. This is the phantom of countless years, representing my future years and destiny. Countless possibilities. In front of Qin Chen, he saw countless destinies. However, these destinies are not what I want. My destiny should be in my own hands, without the need for evolvement by the way of heaven. I will be immortal and grow in the origin, to achieve the supreme sovereign. I don't want these destinies. Since there is no destiny I want, then I will use my own hands to carve out a destiny that is my own in the infinitely possible future. Beyond the long river of years, eternal immortality. Qin Chen saw his countless destiny and countless future from the long river of years, but he was not satisfied with these. His will, roaring wildly, and the power of terror tore through the void above his head, to open up a destiny that truly belongs to him and controlled by him in countless impossible futures. I control my own life. The martial artist was going against the sky, but Qin Chen is now against the sky. Boom! The boundless destiny and boundless years suddenly burst into pieces. In the endless future, there seems to be a vast figure, a world-class figure, who has jumped out of the long river of years and wants to dominate his own life, death and destiny. At this moment, in the depths of the heavens, some big figures who have been sleeping for so many years opened their eyes. They all felt the extraordinary changes in the years. Who is it? who is changing the future of the long river of years, who is this worldly figure who is changing his fate against the sky, who wants to open up his own way and open up his own future. These big figures were shocked, their eyes bursting with rainbows, and they looked at the river of time abruptly. At the end of the vast river of years, they seemed to see a supreme figure, wanting to get out of trouble, to jump out of the river of years, not in the heaven. However, this figure is extremely vague, obscured by the power of time, and it is impossible to see the origin. It's tyrannical, it's too tyrannical. It's too daring to change your fate against the sky. In the history of the heavens, for hundreds of millions of years, there have been some top figures who wanted to detach themselves from the years. Unfortunately, none of them succeeded and died. All perish, who is this? How dare to risk such a big deal? If you change your fate against the sky, it is so easy to surpass the fate of the years, how can we still struggle under the rules of this heaven? A great figure is shouting, trying to see the figure clearly, but can't see it clearly. 
the years are mysterious and vast, the past can be checked, and the future can't be spied at all. In a trance, at a certain moment, these big people seem to see the shadow of a young man flash past. What? Young man. They were all shocked and thought they were wrong. Boom. At this time, the years Chang He felt the breath of countless big people, suddenly violent, the endless river escaped into the depths of time and space, disappeared, leaving only the shock and amazement of countless big people. Cut. Break fate. My destiny is in my own hands. Qin Chen stood upright, his hands intertwined with runes that no one could understand, and his many destinies appeared above his head. In the end, all these destinies were shattered, his destiny was blurred, and there was no future. Well, the first thing to change your fate against the sky is not to admit your fate. Qin Chen knew that this did not mean that he succeeded in changing his life. In the future, there are countless possibilities, and any one of them may happen. Now, he just blurs his future from the long river of years and no longer follows the rule of heaven. But in the end, what will he become? No one can predict that it may become the supreme master, or it may burst into death in the next moment. The only constant is Qin Chen's belief in becoming the strongest. The strong will not listen to fate, they will break fate, give the strongest note, and open up their own path. At this moment, Qin Chen's mind has become the strongest to some extent. Boom! In the body, countless Saint Yuan was circulating, and all the heavenly Saint Laws were condensed. In Qin Chen's body, there was a pure golden flame, without any impurities. The boundless and mighty breath fell, and Qin Chen finally broke through to heavenly sage. Hum! Above his body, the terrifying heavenly sage rules haunted, like gods and demons. His eyes pierced the sky and saw through the future. His fist is unstoppable, and the gods and demons are free. His body is standing upright and immortal. His will is eternal and indestructible. At this moment, become a god. Invincible god. Moreover, Qin Chen's cultivation level did not stop, leaping forward wildly, almost touching the peak of the early days of Heavenly Sage. However, Qin Chen did not force a breakthrough because the ancient holy veins were not enough. Holy master level ancient sacred veins are extremely rare. If I forcefully break through the initial peak, it will not be difficult, but it will consume a lot of holy master level ancient sacred veins. Just for Qin Chen to break through the heavenly sage, this broken saint master level ancient sacred vein has consumed a full one-fifth. Fortunately, Qin Chen did not use all the saint master level ancient sacred veins to break through, otherwise this time, at least one-third of the power will be consumed, which may directly cause the collapse of the saint master class ancient saint veins. Hum. The boundless power was restrained, and it suddenly entered Qin Chen's body. Qin Chen's body was round and jade, like a and demon, unmatched in strength. His achievement in this world is no small matter. One and a half sky level ancient sacred veins, nearly twenty peerless peak ancient sacred veins, one fifth of the broken saint master level ancient sacred veins, and a large number of exquisite heavenly pill, various powers, laws, all refining, melting into oneself. How powerful is this? Coupled with the refining of the ancient qi, Qin Chen's physical body is already unparalleled. Qin Chen had a feeling that he could break the sky and destroy the earth with a punch now. Kaka Kaka! Qin Chen squeezed his fist, and all the cell crystals in his body rubbed against each other, transmitted power, the rules of heavenly sage, and roared and roared. He felt that a state governor like Yundong Guangzhou Lord was strong in the early days of heavenly sage. He can kill with one move. Even strong men like Zhu Xing Tian couldn't withstand his punch an ordinary Tian Sage mid-level martial artist could be seriously injured with one punch. At this moment, the strength has increased more than a hundred times. Half-step Heavenly Sage and True Heavenly Sage, the realm is too different, one step to the sky is not enough to describe. This is simply shocking and horrifying. It's a pity that Qin Chen's consumption is extremely huge. 
just breaking through the heavenly sage has already consumed so much. In the future, it will consume so much to break through the middle and late stages of the heavenly sage, or even the realm of the holy master. The ancient holy veins are not enough. It seems that I have become a poor man again, and the ancient sacred veins on my body are bare, and there is nothing left, even a peerless saint. Qin Chen was silent. Less dust. At this moment, an excited cowardly voice sounded. Qin Chen's figure froze suddenly, and at the moment he broke through the heavenly sage, Sisi also broke through the heavenly sage, and that voice was extremely familiar and lingering, it was the thought that Qin Chen had missed for a long time. Qin Chen slowly turned around and saw a beautiful woman with tears on her cheeks, walking slowly step by step, and finally rushed into Qin Chen's suspicion. Wu, little dust, I thought I would never see you again. Sisi was crying. After countless powerful people in the dead spirit realm chased and killed her, she did not cry, but at this moment she was crying like a child. Silly girl. Qin Chen wiped away the tears from the corner of Sisi's eyes, and felt a pain in his heart, no matter the mountains and rivers, the sea of knives, the sea of fire, and the Huangchuan purgatory, you don't have to be afraid. Qin Chen hugged Sisi vigorously, smelling the familiar smell on Sisi, hurting his beloved woman so much, Qin Chen felt pain in his heart. He lowered his head and kissed Sisi hard. Well. The two of them responded crazily. Time seemed to stop at this moment. After a long time, the two people separated. All the lofty ambitions and ambitions have disappeared. Qin Chen and Sisi just cuddled together like this. If there were no killings in the world, it would be such a beautiful thing to be together so happily. By the way, where are Kyungsu and Ruya's sister? Suddenly, Sisi seemed to think of something and looked up at Qin Chen. Qin Chen shook his head slightly, I haven't found them yet, but I already have news of them. Qin Chen told Sisi what he had experienced after entering the heavens. Although Sisi knew that Qin Chen was safe and sound in front of him, he was still nervous when he heard the dangers. And Sisi also told Qin Chen what she had experienced. After they separated, Sisi entered the dead spirit realm. Knowing the danger of the dead spirit realm, she did not dare to go to Qin Chen and the others, so she stayed in the dead spirit realm. Develop silently. Relying on the magic spell, Sisi has been like a fish in the dead zone, always hiding her appearance and identity, relying on various resources to break through to the realm of the holy, but in the end, she was exposed in an accident and was chased to death. The deserted ancient ruins, thanks to the call of the nine-tailed fairy fox, entered that altar, Otherwise, with Sisi's cultivation base, it is very likely that they would have fallen into the deserted ancient ruins. By the way, there are few dust, now in this barren ancient ruins, many people are chasing me, and they are all strong in the dead soul realm, and even some strong in the middle of the heavenly sage, you must be careful. Sisi said nervously. Sisi, don't worry, from now on, no one can hurt you. As for the strong man who chased you, this Ju Xin Tian should be one of them. Qin Chen raised his hand. Suddenly, Ju Xin Tian appeared in front of the two of them, respectfully saluting, Little Chen. Ju Xin Tian, who had the source of the devil of the world in his body, had his own thinking, but he had already become a servant of Qin Chen, following Qin Chen's orders. A look of surprise appeared on Chen Sisi's face. But thinking of Qin Chen's strength, Sisi was surprised again. Let's go, next, there are still many things to deal with, first go to meet those two guys. Qin Chen sneered, and took Chen Sisi out of the universe fortune jade dish, arrogant. Boom. Qin Chen and Sisi walked out of the universe and the jade disc, their auras were restrained, as if they had become ordinary people. Sisi, the breath on your body, you can hide it so thoroughly. Qin Chen looked at Chen Sisi in surprise. The aura on Chen Sisi's body was extremely restrained, leaving only a trace, like an ordinary person. I would also like to thank Senior Kyungzian for teaching me the method to reduce my charm. Sisi smiled softly. 
Kyanzian, a nine-tailed fairy fox of the demon clan, also has a natural fox fairy body, and naturally has the means to conceal the charm of his body. Little dust, we have all broken through the heavenly sage now. As far as I know, the heavenly sage is already a big man in the heavens. If we go directly to the Guangan mansion and find sisters Kyungsu and Ryu, will the people in Guangan mansion agree? We. That can't work. Although Tian Sheng is considered a big man in the heavens, he is still far behind Guangan mansion. The head of Guangan mansion, who is in charge of a mansion, is a master of the holy master. We are the real big people. We are now in the early days of heavenly sages. In the eyes of the Holy Lord, it is nothing at all. Only those peak heavenly sages may have some qualifications. Qin Chen shook his head, however, the peak heavenly sages are in the heavens. Those are all princes and legends. Let's not talk about the masters of the saints now. Even if we arrive at Guanggan Mansion, if we want to see those legendary peak heavenly sages. Difficult. Fortunately, I have already joined Tianzuo. When you look back, you can go to Guanggan Mansion City to be in charge of Chindi Pavilion, and you can even join the Tianzui Martial Arts Department. During the work that day, we can obtain more resources, even a stronger ancient holy vein. Also, it's been almost two years since we arrived in the heavens. After we find Kyungsu and Ryu, we must find a passage to the Tianyu continent as soon as possible, otherwise the top powerhouse of the Yeami mansion will come to the Tianyu continent. It's dangerous. Sisi's heart shuddered. It was only more than a year since the crisis of Tianyu continent, and she was also worried. The heavens are so big, how can we find that passage? SISI had no idea at all. This is the purpose of my joining Tianjiao. Qin Chen said solemnly, it is impossible for us to travel to the heavens, but Tian Jiao is a top power in the heavens. As long as you show enough in the heavens. Potential, definitely able to use the help of Tian Jiao to go to any place in the heavens. The key thing now is, I don't know what happened to the cats. According to the truth, it has been almost two years, and the cats should have also come to the heavens. Could it be that the passage did not lead to the heavens? Possibly, after all, the strong man back then was indeed a master of the celestial realm, and there was nothing wrong with accidentally breaking into the Tianyu continent. After we return to work in heaven, I will check the information carefully to see if we can find out some clues. But with our current strength, it is far from enough. It is best to break through the mid-stage or even late stage of the heavenly sage. Only then can we be sure enough to resolve the crisis in Tianyu continent. Little Dust, I believe you can do it. Chen Sisi said firmly, when I become stronger and resolve the crisis in the Tianyu continent, I will also go to the land of the demons to find Master. Master was taken to save me. Entering the land of the demons, I believe she is still alive, and one day, I will rescue her. Wonder. Qin Chen murmured. His eyes bursting into the rainbow, he naturally did not forget the woman who was in desperation in order to save Sisi, that in order to avenge herself, willing to be a demon and ruin the face of the world, and Shang Guan's yet anti purpose woman. Sooner or later, I will go to the land of the demons and ask for justice. Qin Chen said coldly. Hey! As the two of them were talking, they had already entered the endless space underground. Boom! As soon as Qin Chen's body shook, he entered deep underground, in that mysterious cave, and then felt that the terrifying heavenly sage aura in the entire cave was like a vast ocean, sweeping crazily. Boom boom boom. In the cave, the ancient atmosphere lingers, and in the center of the ancient atmosphere, two powerful figures stand proudly inside, with endless and terrifying holy origins surging from their bodies and the rich ancient holy veins aura dissipates, it is Jing real person and emptiness old man. At this moment, the aura on the two of them was more than ten times stronger than when Qin Chen first saw it. The terrifying aura in the middle of the heavenly sage surged, and their cultivation bases completely entered the middle of the heavenly sage, becoming true powerhouses. 
and the moment Qin Chen and Chen Sisi came to the cave, the two of them also saw Qin Chen, and they suddenly shook their heads. The two figures appeared like phantoms, swiftly appearing in front of Qin Chen and Sisi. Chen and Sisi surrounded. Boy, didn't you think you weren't killed by Zhu Xing Tian? These two figures converged their breath, and the violent power in their bodies was like a volcano about to erupt, containing shocking power. The two looked at Qin Chen as if they were looking at weird people. They really couldn't figure out why Qin Chen was still alive, Zhu Xing Tian where did you go? Hey? This woman? Could it be that charming woman pursued by Zhu Xing Tian? Suddenly, the empty old man saw Sisi, and a faint green light suddenly appeared in his eyes, like a cat smelling a fishy smell. Although the enchanting aura on Sisi's body has been restrained by her, her world-renowned appearance can already sink many men. Peerless posture, really peerless posture, no wonder Zhu Xing Tian will chase this woman into the deserted ancient ruins. Tisk tisk, it seems that this time I am empty and lucky. The empty old man said excitedly. Empty, be careful, don't be careless, I always think this kid is a bit weird. Madam Jinghe frowned, his expression a little serious, we had clearly received a signal from Zhu Xing Tian, but we never saw him, maybe what accident has happened to Zhu Xing Tian, it is better to be careful. What are you afraid of? The empty old man was very disdainful, chuckled, and revealed a mouthful of yellow teeth, now that the two of us have broken through the middle of the heavenly sage, you don't know the strength of this kid, I am afraid you can win it in minutes, as for Zhu Xing Tian, maybe some treasure was discovered, and he didn't have time to care for us. Everything is possible, it's better to be more cautious. Madam Jinghu took a step forward and his eyes were cold, boy, come on, where is Zhu Xing Tian? He should have been chasing you just now, why is he missing? Jun Xing Tian Qin Chen smiled faintly, he has been captured by Ben Shao and has become Ben Shao's slave, and you two, don't even want to escape today, you will all become my slaves. The real person in Jinghu and the empty old man actually broke through the middle stage of the heavenly sage. That's good, but it saves myself extra trouble. With their three powerhouses, they can secretly develop in the dead spirit realm, and slowly control the dead spirit realm. Hands. What? Zhu Xing Tian has become your servant, you won't be chased down and lost heart, your mind is not good, right? After listening to the empty old man, he almost didn't laugh out loud, just you, can you also enslave Zhu Xing Tian? You don't believe it. Qin Chen laughed, waved, and suddenly, a figure appeared, it was Zhu Xing Tian, standing beside Qin Chen respectfully. When the two big powers saw the Zhu Xing Tian appear, each was shocked and shivered. They were really Zhu Xing Tian? What? Zhu Xing Tian, why would you follow this kid? Come here soon. Zhu Xing Tian, are you deaf? What's wrong with you? The real man in Jinghu and the empty old man kept yelling at Zhu Xing Tian and even transmitted various voices, but Zhu Xing Tian turned a deaf ear to nothing. Don't shout, Zhu Xing Tian knows his sins are serious, so he decided to change his mind and follow Ben Shao to forgive sins. The same is true for the two of you. Surrender obediently and obey Ben Shao's orders. Perhaps one day in the future, he can become a great figure in the heavens. It's not the same. Qin Chen smiled slightly and did not pay attention to the real person Jinghu and the empty old man at all. No, Zhu Xing Tian is determined. How could he obey your orders? You must have used some sorcery to confuse Zhu Xing Tian. The two powerhouses are hideous, startled and angry. No matter what, if you take this kid, you'll know what's going on. He must have used some kind of witchcraft to control Zhu Xing Tian, and as long as you kill him, you can break this witchcraft. Catch! Mr. Jinghu, you seal the void, and you can't let this kid escape anymore. There is no need for the empty old man to speak. The real Jinghu roared and displayed the King Yuan too. Suddenly, a terrifying sky swept across the world, 
and the boundless black cloud swept across, enveloping Qin Chen and the others. In the space of Kang Yuan too, for a moment, clouds rolled, and everywhere was the atmosphere of a terrifying space cage, covering everything. The emptiness old man roared, and directly displayed his mastery, the emptiness of all souls, the infinite holy Yuan came out in the air, intertwined into a giant palm, volleyed to capture the photo, ascended, up to the sky and the earth, and down. Nine ghosts true spirits. Run? Do I need to run? Qin Chen was not afraid, even letting the other party display the King Yuan too to trap himself and stay still. Qin Chen really didn't need to run. After he was promoted to Heavenly Sage, his strength was invincible, let alone the two mid-term Heavenly Sages who had just broken through. Even if it came to ten, he was not afraid, there was no reason to escape. Boom! In his body, the terrifying Saint Yuan erupted and he released his heavenly saint law, and a straight and thick golden light approached the sky, as if to directly penetrate the heavens. There was a loud noise. The King Yuan map arranged by the real Jinghu shook violently, and the terrifying space force broke every inch, and it couldn't block any space at all. And the emptiness of all the spirits played by the old man of emptiness, he simply ignored it, the ancient body surged, and the terrible ancient power in his body turned into an invisible armor, and he shook the huge palm formed by the terrifying emptiness force. The explosion on the spot caused the empty old man to retreat again and again. He has been promoted to the realm of Heavenly Sage. What a tyrannical power! The Heavenly Sage law on his body is thick and big, like a pillar of heaven. How could it be possible? He is a guy who has just broken through the Heavenly Sage. How can the heavenly sage law be better than ours? Even more terrible in the midterm? Is this guy a man or a ghost? The empty old man roared again and again, unable to believe his eyes. They finally understood from the bottom of their hearts that Zhu Xing Tian might really have been enslaved by Qin Chen. But how did he do it? He was almost killed by us before, how did his cultivation level rise so much, and his body has such a terrifying ancient aura? We absorb a little more of this aura. He is about to explode and die. This kid's body seems to be completely haunted by this terrifying and ancient aura. How to do it? Real man Jinghyo couldn't believe it, because Qin Chen completely violated the common sense of cultivation. Even if he is fierce, he is only an early sage. I am not familiar with the application of the rules of the sage. I don't believe that a little kid in the early stage of the sage will be the opponent of our two great mid-stage masters. Killing him will save Zhu Xing Tian and get his secret. Yes, if we get his secret, we will develop. A battle of life and death, in this one move, I have a hunch that the secrets in this child are shocking to the world, and I am afraid that it will be an incomparable gain even greater than the ancient ruins. Kill. The real person Jinghu and the empty old man, the two great mid-term powerhouses of the sage, exchanged their eyes in an instant, and suddenly became violent. The lifespan on the body began to burn, and the golden textures were intertwined, terrifying. The heavenly sage's power was intertwined and violently killed Qin Chen. At the same time, the sky-shattering space bound by Kang Yu and Tu descended from the sky, blocking all the space of Qin Chen's body. The real person Jinghu urged the power of the Saint Yuan in his body to the extreme, the essence and blood burned, turned into a long rainbow, and merged into the Kang Yuan map. Suddenly, the power of the breath on the Kang Yuan map was several times stronger than the first one. That strong spatial power seemed to imprison this void into an eternal cage. And the empty old man was calling desperately, as if he was performing an ancient supreme magic technique requiring the supreme and powerful force of the ancients to come to help out across time and space. The attacks of the two were fierce and vigorous, cold and ruthless, and at the same time full of heroism and irreversibility. No matter how powerful the heavenly sage is, facing the attack of the two, he will be in a hurry and be killed in an instant. If the seven deputy leaders of the Shengu League were here at this time, they would definitely be defeated and killed one after another. The combination of the two masters of the midterm heavenly sage, 
combined with the heavenly rank supreme treasure King Yuan II, formed the power that even reached the peak of the midterm heavenly sage, invincible. But Qin Chen was not afraid, smiled coldly, with a burly figure, standing like a king, with a strong breath, he wanted to make a move. Little dust, leave these two guys to me. At this moment, Chen Sisi suddenly said, whoosh, she flew up, and above her head, a emptiness figure suddenly appeared. This is a godly woman, her eyes opened, and a breath of stunning charm suddenly burst out. Nine-tailed Mai Shu. Okay? When Qin Chen looked over in shock, he felt a supreme charm of power, swept out, and immediately enveloped the real man Jinghu and the empty old man. This charm technique is so powerful. Qin Chen took a breath of air, he could feel the horror of this charm technique, even Qin Chen swayed a little, not to mention the real person Jinghu and the empty old man. The two violent bodies seemed to have a pause, and their eyes suddenly became hazy, as if they were in some kind of illusion. Kill. Chen Sisi quickly flew out. However, the real person Jinghu and the empty old man were only bewildered for a moment, and in an instant they recovered and hurriedly shot. Boom! The terrifying explosion swept through, and Chen Sisi was blown away, but the real person Jinghu and the empty old man also backed back again and again, and their faces flushed. The two sides are evenly matched. Awesome! Qin Chen was pleasantly surprised, and he could not think that Sisi was so strong. But it is also true. Sisi itself is the top Tianjiao in Tianyu continent, and has been baptized by the Long River of Years, and has been inherited from the Abyssal Demon Clan, has mastered the Abyssal Demon Dao, and now has the inheritance of the Nine-Tailed Fairy Fox. Is to have a natural body. Any one of these is a horrifying heritage. Now thinking and thinking together, except Qin Chen Wuxian, which powerhouse of the same level can fight against Sisi? Among other things, just the inheritance of the charm of the nine-tailed fairy fox can confuse any master of the same level, and be beheaded by Sisi. If it weren't for both the real person in Jinghu and the empty old man who were slaughtered in the dead soul realm, and possessed the heavenly grade supreme treasure King Yuan II, I am afraid it would be even more unbearable. What? We can't even match this woman. The real person Jinghu and the empty old man went crazy, booming, and the two shot wildly, killing Xiang Sisi. But Sisi is not afraid, her whole body, lingering black magic light, terrible power blooms from her body, with the cultivation base of the early days of the sage, it is not inferior to the two people in the middle of the sage. After all, the Yuanmo clan is also the top power among the demons. Sisi has mastered the way of the abyss. It is really not easy for ordinary martial artists to kill her. You can escape the chasing and killing of the heavenly sage of Zhu Xing Tian. Qin Chen put his mind down completely, Sisi's strength made him not need to worry too much. Boom boom boom. When the two sides fought, Qin Chen watched quietly. He also knew that Sisi was preparing to temper himself. Anyway, even if Sisi was invincible, there was no danger. Sisi became more and more intrepid under the siege of the midterm powerhouses of the two great heavenly sages. The whole person was like a witch and goddess, giving people a strong illusion. Ah! The real person Jinghu and the empty old man were almost crazy. The two roared repeatedly, but they could only parry frequently. Seeing Qin Chen staring at the side, they no longer have any courage to fight. The real Jinghu, retreat quickly, it. Go. The two were so furious that they turned around to run away. Boom. Kang Yuan Tu carried a terrifying aura, wrapped the two of them, and was about to escape into the void and leave here. Although Sisi is capable of rivaling two people, but the other party possesses the heavenly rank supreme treasure Kang Yuan Tu, it is difficult to track even if he wants to escape. Want to go, have you gone? Qin Chen, who had been watching this scene, suddenly sneered. The universe good fortune jade disc was quickly displayed by him, buzzing, in the sky, the universe good fortune jade disc bloomed with an endless and terrifying aura, sealing the entire void. 
the real person in Jinghu and the empty old man surrounded by Kang Yuantu and the empty old man were shrouded in the void shrouded in jade discs of good fortune. They couldn't escape at all. What? What kind of treasure is this? It can block Kang Yuan too. Could it be that the treasure of the Holy Master failed? The real person in Jinghu and the empty old man were so furious, they couldn't help sweating and startled. Humph, it's all suppressed for me. Qin Chen ignored it, snorted coldly, and reached out with his big hands. With a punch and a bang, he immediately blasted the real man in Jinghu and the empty old man out of the Kang Yuan map. The bodies of the two shook wildly, and the blood surged in their bodies. Magic Tree of Ten Thousand Worlds At the next moment, Qin Chen urged the Demon Tree of the Ten Thousand Worlds, whoosh, black tentacles protruding from the Jade Disk of Good Fortune in the universe, and instantly wrapped the real man in Jinghu and the empty old man, and with a swish, he pulled in. In the Jade Disk of Good Fortune in the universe, disappeared. The combination of the magic tree of the world and the jade disc of good fortune from the universe is a good means of combat. Qin Chen smiled slightly, he raised his hand, and suddenly, Kang Yuanta was converged in his hand by him, like a bird, he wanted to flutter and flee from here, but when Qin Chen covered his hand, he was obedient. Do not move, also thrown into the jade disc of good fortune in the universe. Little dust, I finally let you take a shot. Sissi said helplessly. Ha ha. Qin Chen laughed, this is because the other party has the treasure of Kang Yuan too, otherwise, if you use the charm technique, the ordinary heavenly sage may directly fall into the sinking of the illusion technique, and it will be killed by others. After this Kang Yuan map is refined, I will give you a gift. With this treasure, your ability to sign up in the future will be stronger. With the Jade Disc of Good Fortune from the universe, Qin Chen didn't have much interest in the sacred treasure of space like Kang Yuan too. Go. He rolled his body, put away Ju Xing Tian, and Chen Sisi rushed out of the endless underground in an instant, and then swiftly flew toward the barren ancient ruins. Little Dust, are we going back to Guanggan Mansion now? Sisi asked. Don't worry, I have to go to the Shengu League first. The few guys from the Shengu League before, directly put aside Ben Shao, Ben Shao hasn't found them to settle the accounts. Qin Chen said coldly, this ancient god's alliance is also the top power in the dead spirit realm. If you don't include this ancient god's alliance in your bag, then I am too sorry for me to come to the dead spirit realm. Qin Chen's figure swiftly flew across the desolate ancient ruins, and, urging the universe to make the jade disk. The terrifying space power permeated out, and soon he found a space transfer point of the ancient gods. This should be a node of the space teleportation array of the gods and ancient alliances. Now the masters of the gods and ancient alliances should be in a secret stronghold. Through this teleportation array, they can find their headquarters as quickly as possible and save a lot of money. Flight time, but I still have to go to Yuda City to take a look. Qin Chen stepped into it, and immediately the teleportation formation was activated, and Qin Chen quickly disappeared. The teleportation array of the gods and ancients alliance was originally very secretive, but with Qin Chen's cultivation base, combined with Qunkin's jade disk, and his formation, it was not difficult to find the teleportation array and activate it. Whoosh whoosh! Qin Chen's body flew across the teleportation array, and every time she teleported, it swept through countless thousands of miles of void, very freely. Through the teleportation array, Qin Chen quickly arrived at Yudu City. Qin, Qin Chen, didn't the deputy leader of Qiashui say that you are already dead in the deserted ancient ruins? Didn't you die? As soon as he entered the branch of the Shengu League, one of them had received Qin Chen before and the master of the Shengu League who was staying in the Yuduchen branch was startled. His face was pale, and he was almost speechless in shock, his eyes rolled. Woke up. The senior leaders of the Shengu League were very angry, thinking that the real people Sifeng and Chu Shui were too naive. Yes, you should stop begging for that kid named Qin Chen. He died here, it can only be regarded as unlucky, 
condensing soul light, let alone that kid, even if you die, even me if you die, you won't be able to enjoy such treatment. There is no need to mention this matter. Another high-level senior said coldly, the top priority now is how to solve the joint problem of Zhu Xingtian, Jing Hu Zhenren, and the empty old man. These three giants joining forces are a huge threat to our god and ancient alliance. Matters are the most important matter of our Shengu League now. But then Qin Chen saved us after all. Real person Chu Shui wanted to say something, but was interrupted by Boundless Feng, impatiently saying, Real person Chu Shui, why did Qin Chen save us? Self-help? Where did the breaking talisman come from? It was not given by the Alliance. And I waited to survive, which was not burned for life, and the strength in the body was greatly damaged. The credit should be attributed to that kid, too much. You. Chu Shui's voice choked, but he couldn't say a word. Now that Qin Chen is dead, he can't fall out with the whole alliance for a dead person, right? Ugh. Real person Kia Shui and real person Su Feng can only sigh and shake their heads. Well, real person Su Feng and real person Chu Shui, you two should stop fighting, even if this matter is over. Another heavenly sage master shook his head and said, that Qin Chen, after all, is an outsider, we cannot possibly it costs too much, and this time our Shengu League itself is also facing a crisis. If it weren't for the leader who broke through the middle of the heavenly sage, I'm afraid we would just part ways and flee for each other, but even if the leader broke through, the crisis of our god and ancient alliance has not yet been resolved, and the leader of the alliance still needs to strategize and think of a safe method. Don't worry, you guys, after knowing the news, this leader has already sent a few friends the first time and called on them to come together and join forces against the Ju Sing Tian trio. You can rest assured. The of ancient alliance Tian Yi said lightly, what everyone has to do now is to investigate the intelligence carefully, and as soon as there is news about the number of people in the final sentence, it must be sent to the leader of the leader as soon as possible. Let's go away. Many high-level officials waved their hands, when we have news of Judgment Day, we will lay a net of heaven and earth and kill them secretly. We must not let them have any chance to take action. Now you all sit in your place. Is it gone? It turns out that my Qin Chen's life is so worthless, just casually, just like this. Boom. The Shengu League headquarters trembled suddenly, Qin Chen's body appeared in the void, and with a flick of his sleeve, he had already placed the steward leading the way on the ground. Qin Chen. Are you still alive? How could it be possible? You escaped the pursuit of Judgment Day. Impossible, absolutely impossible, how could you still be alive? Under the palms of the three masters, none of the heavenly saints can survive, let alone you are a half-step heavenly saint. The seven great heavenly sages were all taken aback, and almost jumped up, shocked beyond words, and their eyes were about to burst. But they had to believe it, because Qin Chen truly appeared in front of them. How did you come in? Why didn't we receive a notification? Who gave you the way to enter the headquarters of our gods and ancient alliance? A great master suddenly became serious, and Qin Chen, an outsider, could enter quietly. The Shengu League headquarters, they didn't know at all, this was nothing trivial. Presumptuous, dare to sneak into the headquarters of our gods and ancient alliances. Take him. How can he survive a half-step Tian Sheng from Zhu Xing Tian, it must be fake, even if it is true, there is only one possibility, that is, this child has already taken refuge in Zhu Xing Tian. No, is it Zhu Xing Tian sent this son? Many cold shouts sounded, and the Shengu League headquarters was in turmoil. Everyone, this son must have been enslaved by Zhu Xing Tian, let me arrest him and torture him. Among the seven great heavenly sages, boundless wind's gaze froze, and suddenly a trace of cold murderous intent was outlined. When the voice fell, his figure had already turned into a long rainbow and swept over, booming, a black wind and cloud black hole swept over and aimed at Qin Chen crushed down strongly. He originally saw Qin Chen not pleasing to his eyes, 
but now that he saw that Qin Chen was still alive and his murderous aura surged, he wanted to capture Qin Chen forcefully. Blessed wind, you have targeted Ben Xiao over and over again, and Xiao Ben hasn't bothered you yet. I didn't expect that Xiao dared to take action against Xiao Ben. No matter what the Xiao said, I have saved you before. You are so awkward and treat your savior. With cold eyes, Qin Chen stood upright like a big mountain in the heavens, took a step forward, and boomed, the glory of the heavens emerged from his body, and he used his body to directly give the Fenjiun black hole that boundless wind displayed. The child shook away. Boom! Boundless Saint Yuan Explosion Scroll Before Qin Chen broke through, Boundless Wind was not Qin Chen's opponent. Now it is far worse than Qin Chen. Qin Chen only shook, Boundless Wind fluttered like a broken kite. Going out, puff puff puff, blood spurted out of his mouth, and later, black blood was spurted out, obviously the origin of the body was damaged, and the foundation was bombarded. Kneel me down. Qin Chen flipped his hand over and snapped it with a bang. Boundless Feng couldn't resist. He knelt at the headquarters of the ancient alliance with a click. No matter how the laws of his body changed, he couldn't move, like a dead dog, he could only roar again and again. Presumptuous, dare to run wild at the headquarters of our god and ancient league. Naughty animal, let me go. A series of frightened voices came from all directions. In the endless void, a high ranking from the ancient alliance suddenly turned into a black palm. His voice was rumbling. It was exactly the high ranking one who said Qin Chen was an outsider. Shi Galing obviously wanted to capture Qin Chen on the spot. Especially Qin Chen quietly broke into the Shengu League headquarters, which is related to the safety and confidentiality of their Shengu League, so you must not be sloppy. When the hand enveloped Qin Chen, it even enveloped the guardian of the ancient alliance, thinking that this person brought Qin Chen in, but these high-level managers also wondered that this steward himself did not have such great authority. How did he bring Qin Chen in with the qualifications to enter the headquarters? That's how your gods and ancient alliances treat lifesavers? If you don't send a glance, you have to capture it. It's so powerful. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, his body exploded and a mighty and domineering aura burst out, a punch in the air, a fist the size of a grinding plate, flashing the rules of heaven and earth, and the heavenly king began to walk on the ground. Boom! Without any suspense, the hand was blown apart by Qin Chen, and the terrifying phantom in the depths of the ancient alliance also moved, making an angry voice. Don't hide, come out and face me! Qin Chen yelled, Get out! His palm turned into a claw shape, facing the endless void, just like that. Boom! The void in front of him was suddenly caught and burst into a huge hole. The countless restrictions on the hole were destroyed. From the black hole, a towering figure was captured and photographed by him, and he held it in his hand abruptly. Stop struggling, this is a strong man who is not weaker than the real person of Su Feng in the early days of the Heavenly Sage and has an extraordinary position in the ancient alliance. But now, like a chicken, Qin Chen grabbed him in his hand, losing his majesty and embarrassed him. You wanna die? This high ranking of ancient alliance is still struggling fiercely, but no matter how hard he struggles, he can't escape Qin Chen's grasp and is pinched to death. Master Bainan. Many masters yelled, especially Chu Shui and others, who were shocked. They knew deeply that the great figure Qin Chen was holding in his hands was so powerful that he was called Baron, whose cultivation level had reached at the peak of the early days of Heavenly Sage, he was a former deputy leader. Later, he retired and retreats for self-cultivation. He is the top master of the ancient alliance second only to the leader of the gods, and is even more powerful than the real person Su Feng. In the Shengu League the retired deputy leaders who can live in seclusion at the headquarters are basically retiring from the cultivation base of the early days of the Heavenly Sage, and they are devoted to cultivating, and the purpose is to attack the middle-term realm of the Sage. Because in the Necrosphere, 
only the mid-level heavenly sage masters can make the forces of the ancient alliance of gods advance by leaps and bounds. But now, this reclusive master, the real baron, was pinched by Qin Chen in his hand, like a dead dog. Lay down. Naughty animal, you are looking for death. Dare to come to my gods and ancient leagues to go wild, and don't see where this is. Mr. Chu Shui, this is the kid you've been talking to before? It's too presumptuous. Even the kecking of the Wangulu can't be so wild in our god and ancient league. In an instant, Qin Chen's actions angered all the experts of the ancient alliance, and many experts of the ancient alliance in the presence shot one after another, one after another, the spirits that can penetrate the heaven and the earth, the endless rules, the thousands of magic rainbows. They were all killed and aimed at Qin Chen, all of them were critical. That's how the gods and ancient alliances treat saviors. Qin Chen raised his head and looked at the top figure, who was the leader of the gods and ancient alliances, the real person of God's will. He kept coldly drinking and wanted to see how the real person of God would deal with it. However, this real man of God's will was motionless, motionless like a mountain, and surrounded by the vast midterm aura of the heavenly sage. He just watched the changes and didn't say a word, letting the masters of the ancient God Alliance take the initiative. Obviously, he also had doubts about Qin Chen's quietly breaking into the headquarters of the ancient alliance, and wanted the master of the ancient alliance to test Qin Chen's reality. Ha ha ha, good, very good, your gods and ancient alliances face the savior, not only not welcome, but also kill, if this is the case then all kneel down for me. Qin Chen's eyes burst, angered, and he pressed his hands hard and clicked, the real baron also knelt in front of him like a dead dog, and Feng Wu Yang, and then, the holy Yuan in Qin Chen's body and the ancient aura it swept, rubbed against each other, exploded, forming a monstrous roar. In the explosion of the Saint Yuan, Qin Chen's hands repeatedly grasped, photographed, and used his hands, as if tearing the sky away. Pieces of void were abruptly caught and exploded by him, and then a number of great figures were all caught and photographed by him. Below, all are the heavenly saints in the ancient alliance. Bang bang bang! These heavenly sages were in Qin Chen's hands, really like the little chickens, sealed with one hand and pressed on the ground with the other, kneeling together on the ground in a row, very spectacular. Stop, little friend Qin Chen, stop quickly! Real person Chu Shui felt that he was about to faint, and shouted again and again, no matter who was injured, he felt unbearable and hurried to relieve. At the same time, real person Su Feng, Fairy Rugu, Beauty Siet, Reality Ziu, Reality Gu, etc. all changed their colors and wanted to step forward. Hey? Why? You are also against me? Don't forget. The reason why you are still alive and standing here is all because of Ben Shao's credit. Do you still want to do something with Ben Shao? Qin Chen's eyes were cold, and he looked coldly, the ugly words are in front of you. If any one of you does something, don't blame Ben Shaoxin for being cruel and beheading you directly here. A heavenly sage, as if he was really ungrateful, Qin Chen would really blast them to death, anyway, for Qin Chen now. A heavenly sage was nothing. A frightening aura surged from Qin Chen, and the aura of the ancients swept away. At this time, Qin Chen was like the same demon god, stunning the entire headquarters of the ancient alliance, causing the real Chu Shui and others to retreat again and again, just like grass in a storm. Weakness. Not only him, but the rest of the gods and ancient league masters present felt that they were going crazy. Many of the top masters in the gods and ancient leagues were all captured by Qin Chen abruptly, unable to move, kneeling on the ground, and standing in a row. This kind of scene is too spectacular. These masters, every one of them went out, is the supreme supreme who has been in the necrosphere for many years, but now Qin Chen has almost all defeated and is on the verge of destruction. Heavenly Sage, he has cultivated to become the Heavenly Sage. Su Feng said in astonishment. How did he break through to the heavenly sage? Under the chasing of the three masters of Zhu Xingtian, 
not only did he not die, but he cultivated into the heavenly sage. Where did the ancient sacred veins in the deserted ancient ruins allow him to break through? No, even if he has cultivated to become a heavenly saint, there is no such a cruel truth. Masters such as Baron Genren were captured by him in one move. This is comparable to the top masters in the midterm of the heavenly saint. Strong, it's really too strong, you feel the breath of him, it is the aura of the ancient ruins, did he get any adventure in the ancient ruins? Hey, if that is the case, it might be able to explain. What adventures can make him improve so much? I can feel the aura on him. It's too tough. If you do it, you can kill me, you will never survive. If this kind of adventure is obtained by me, what will be the result? Real person Su Feng and others were shocked again and again, among them, real person Chu Shui was the first to calm down and immediately said, Qin Chen, stop, we have something to discuss, and don't hurt the adults of our God and Ancient League. Then, he faced the Lord of Heaven's will, who was sitting on his head with a gloomy gaze, said, Leader, there must be a misunderstanding in this. Please don't get angry and discuss with you. Misunderstanding The leader of the Shengu League, who had not moved before, suddenly stood up at this moment, with endless cold light in his eyes, now this sun is killing at the headquarters of my God and Ancient League, and suppressing the strong men of our God and Ancient League. Here, you dare to say that it is a misunderstanding, real person Chu Shui, are you from the ancient alliance of my gods or this kid? The real man of heavens will stepped out and walked towards Qin Chen in an instant. With every step out, the void rippled and ripples, as if he was in charge of the rotation of the world, the birth and death of all things. A trace of greed flashed past his eyes. The terrible breath rose to the sky, representing the majesty of the midterm heavenly sage. Moreover, the power in the real gods will combine with the endless void of the headquarters of the ancient alliance of gods forming the king of this world, controlling everything. In the void, countless prohibitions surged. This is the treasure of the gods and ancients alliance. The breath aroused by the teleportation treasure blocked all spaces and all passages, trapping Qin Chen in this square of heaven and earth. Mr. Su Feng and Mr. Chu Shui, you all obey the orders. Keep the emptiness around you. Don't let this kid run away. The leader of this lord has to see, where does this kid have the courage to run wild in our ancient alliance, even if he is neither can the keking of the Wang Gu Tower. Our an ancient alliance cannot tolerate anyone in the wild. The reel of heaven drank coldly, his eyes were cold, like the emperor's anger, the world collapsed. Ugh! Qin Chen shook his head and sighed. This god and ancient alliance really disappointed him. Originally, he came here only to seek justice, of course, to cooperate with the ancient alliance, that is for sure, because if you want to control the necrosphere, you must rely on the teleportation formation of the ancient alliance. The reason why Qin Chen didn't directly subdue the Shengu League as soon as he came up was just because he looked at the face of the Wang Gu Tower and gave the Shengu League a chance. If the other party was sensible, it was not that he couldn't cooperate. But now, this ancient alliance has disappointed Qin Chen. He treats his lifesaver with this attitude, and this ancient alliance leader is superficially sounding, but in fact he is just coveting the adventures he has obtained and wants to capture himself. Just get what you want. Well, if that's the case, then I'm not welcome, this is the gods and ancient alliances who have to seek death by themselves, and I can't blame me. Qin Chen shook his head, very sorry. Boy, do you think that if you capture the masters of my gods and ancient alliances, you will be lawless and invincible? It's ridiculous, you are wrong. You shouldn't break into the headquarters of my gods and ancient alliances. Here, no matter how strong you are the person is not my opponent, all worlds are unified, the world is a cage. The true man of God's will, like an emperor, patrolled the world, waved his hand, and suddenly, the emptiness of endless space lingered, one after another of restraints, rising from the sky, with infinite restraining power, to imprison Qin Chen. Naive, too naive. 
Qin Chen's body stood up suddenly, as if the glory of the heavens burst out from his body, and the divine rainbow in his pupils seemed to penetrate the sky. Lord Chengu, your vision is too small. You can only see the adventures of this young man, but you can't see the future. Even Zhu Xingtian, the real person of Jing Hu, and the empty old man can suppress and subdue him. How can he care about you? A martial artist who just broke through in the middle of the heavenly sage. Qin Chen said with a sneer, the endless wild ancient aura erupted from his body, and that terrible restraining power flickered on his body surface, and he couldn't restrain him. What? You suppressed the Zhu Xingtian, the real person in Jing Hu, and the empty old man? Or even subdued? True person Chu Shui couldn't help but lose his voice in amazement. Otherwise what do you think? Qin Chen looked at Chu Shui and the others, Originally, I came here to resolve your grievances with each other, and then join hands to develop together in the necrosphere, annex all major forces, and finally control the necrosphere, but now it seems that Xiao Ben is thinking too much, and your gods and ancient alliances have become a branch of Xiao Ben. Come out, Zhu Xingtian, the real person in Jing Hu, and the empty old man, I will leave it to you here. Qin Chen waved his hand. Boom boom boom. In the void, three figures suddenly appeared in front of Qin Chen. It was the Zhu Xingtian three who respectfully saluted Qin Chen, Master. Okay. Qin Chen nodded and boomed. His body shook, his hands stretched out, and a violent pull, tearing apart the void imprisonment in front of him. His body is now like a king. Trap him. Sissi, come. We can just watch a good show. Qin Chen said lightly, Sisi appeared next to him, and a great teacher's chair appeared behind them at the same time. Qin Chen put his arms around Sisi and sat down on the great teacher's chair, very comfortable. This, this, this. Seeing the Ju Xing Tian three suddenly appeared, Chu Shui Zhenren and others had scalp numb, almost going crazy. The suppressed knelt on the ground such as Baron Zhenren and Feng Wu Yang, all the masters of the ancient alliance, who were also panicking, almost went crazy. The three tycoons of the Deadly Realm are so horribly famous that they call this kid their master, crazy, the world is really crazy. The most shocked was the of heaven, the of ancient alliance lord, his eyes were almost straight when he saw Zhu Xing Tian's old opponent. True God, you dare to disobey the master's will. Give us obedient submission. Boom. The three of Ju Xing Tian sneered, and all the bodies burst out with shocking auras, a series of thick heavenly laws, like chains, rose to the sky, and the three powerhouses all killed God's will. In the middle of the sage, you have all broken through to the middle of the sage, this is impossible. The real God's will roared, and his heart was full of fear. At this moment, he didn't even have the courage to resist, and he urged the teleportation formation to leave here. Hey, Kang Yuantu, leave it to me. The real person Jing Hu urged Kang Yuantu, and immediately, the terrifying space power confined everything and prevented the real person of God's will from leaving. Then, the three top masters surrounded the real person of God's will and kept making moves. Puff puff. No matter how strong the cultivation base of the true God's will is, how can he stop the attack of the three great masters of Zhu Xing Tian, and continue to retreat, vomiting blood and embarrassed? In fact, Qin Chen could easily suppress the real man Tianyi with his own actions, but he had to let the real man Tianyi suffer and dare to covet himself, which was almost death. Qin. Xiao Chen, I don't think Xiao Chen is such a hero. I am waiting to admire it. This is the soul essence fruit that his subordinates finally collected. It can wash the flesh and purify the sacred essence. Please also enjoy Xiao Chen and Mrs. Xiao. Fairy Rugu's complexion changed extremely quickly, and he hurried forward, holding a pot of Ling Yuan fruit the size of a grape-like thumb, and respectfully serving the two. Little dust, young lady, the two have traveled here. They should be tired. Let the subordinates knock them on the back. The scorpion beauty also changed a face, stepped forward cautiously, 
and said flatly. This quick change of expression made Qin Chen a little speechless. Shameless, it's shameless. However, it is quite cool. Okay. Qin Chen nodded, put his arms around Sisi, letting the scorpion beauty massage them, and at the same time, eating the spirit essence fruit peeled by Fairy Ragu in his mouth, it was as pleasant as it was. On the side, the real person Su Feng, the real person Chu Shui, and others have been stunned, while the real person Baron and the senior leaders of the ancient gods are angry. This Fairy Ragu, Siem Iron, and others are too shameless. Qin Chen was not afraid of any deceit between the two, as long as he was willing, Qin Chen could squeeze the two of them with one thought, and even if the two of them shot with all their strength, it was impossible to hurt one of his own hairs. Boom boom boom. After Ban Zuxiang, Zhu Xing Tian and the three people fell down with a god's will. Master, the task is complete, this man of god's will, please let the master decide. Zhu Xing Tian knelt on one knee and said respectfully. Ah, ah, Zhu Xing Tian, you are also the ancestor of Xing Tian Dao King anyway, you actually recognize such a young man as the master, I, Taoist Tianyi, look down on you. Taoist Tianyi roared again and again. Dare to run wild. Qin Chen snorted coldly and raised his right hand. Immediately, Taoist Tianyi was captured and photographed in his hand. With Qin Chen backhanded, a source of ten thousand realms had already penetrated Taoist Tianyi's body. What? Taoist Tianyi roared in pain, and in his pupils, a ray of light flashed, and then, after being invaded by the magic source of the ten thousand worlds, there was a kind of power of the origin of the great surging in his body, and the whole person seemed to become deeper. This looks at the eyes of Chu Shui and the others. You too. Then, Qin Chen looked at the real person Su Feng and the real person Chu Shui again, banging, he shot, and two groups of ten thousand realm demon sources were infiltrated by him at the same time. What? The two roared, the power in their bodies was baptized by the demon source of the ten thousand realms, and there was an urge to step into the middle of the heavenly sage on the spot. The source of the ten thousand worlds of demon is the origin of the terrifying demon race formed by the demon tree of the ten thousand worlds. It tells the supreme truth of the heavens and the earth. Although it is only a trace to control them, for ordinary heavenly saints like Su Feng and Qia Shui, it is undoubtedly a huge benefit and improvement. At least, they who have been baptized by the magic source of the ten thousand worlds will have the hope to enter a higher realm. As for the others, Qin Chen was not so kind. The rest, Zhu Xing Tian, you guys accept it. Qin Chen said lightly. The demon source of the ten thousand worlds is extremely precious. With Qin Chen's eyes, he didn't bother to cultivate a few early days of the heavenly sage, but he could indirectly let Zhu Xing Tian and the others subdue it. Yes, master. They naturally had some means of subjugation in Zhu Xing Tian. Various contracts and soul secret techniques emerged one after another. Within a moment, the many heavenly sage masters in the entire Shengu League headquarters had all been enslaved and subdued. The host. This group of people respectfully knelt before Qin Chen. Qin Chen, this. Chen Sisi looked at Qin Chen and was shocked. Even if her magical body wanted to control these people, it was not so simple, but Qin Chen did it easily. However, with Qin Chen's current strength, he doesn't need to care about these people at all. What is the purpose of subduing these people? Sisi, our foundation in the heavens is still too weak. Since this necrosphere is so chaotic, even the big mans cannot intervene in it, but it is a good opportunity for us to develop. If we can control in the necrosphere a group of people can use this to inquire about Yao Mi Mansion. Qin Chen solemnly told Chen to see the reason. Although Qin Chen has the Chindi Pavilion in Guanggan Mansion, Chindi Pavilion is a force on the bright side after all. Some things are not easy to do. For example, if you explore Yeami Mansion, you can't let Chindi Pavilion do it with integrity. Otherwise, after Yaomi Mansion knew the news, it would be easy to find Qin Chen and possibly his true face. 
Qin Chen now can still take this risk. But they are different with Zhu Xing Tian. They are the forces of the dead spirit realm. In the dead spirit realm, they are very chaotic, and the news is also very mixed. If you let Zhu Xing Tian inquire and pass it to themselves, they will not anyone will discover their purpose. Moreover, Zhu Xing Tian has its own Xing Tian Taoist, Jing Hu real person has Jing Hu Taoist, and the empty old man has empty mountain, each has its own power, combined with the gods and ancient alliances, several major forces unite, maybe the future can give Qin Chen a lot of help. At least, various resources can provide a lot. After conquering the ancient alliance of gods, Qin Chen did not idle, and began to allocate the resources of this great power. Together with the cultivation base of Zhu Xing Tian, they could soon expand in the dead soul realm. On the contrary, it was in Guangan Mansion. Chindi Pavilion lacks resources. A few days later, Zhu Xing Tian and others have gathered the various resources of their respective forces together. In addition, during this process, the Taoist Heavenly Yi of the Ancient God Alliance also summoned a few friends. Those friends were also some of the top powers in the Dead Soul Realm. Each cultivation base was approaching the middle stage of the Heavenly Sage. Once they arrived, Qin Chen all captured and surrendered. Before Qin Chen left the Dead Spirit Realm, his power skyrocketed again. Boom! In the end, Qin Chen collected dozens of superb sacred veins under the collection of these many forces, and at the same time, he also obtained two heavenly ancient sacred veins. Yes, yes. In this way, I already have a part of the resources for breaking through the initial peak of heavenly sage, but for the time being, I am not in a hurry to swallow them. With my current status, as long as I join heavenly work, there will be resources to provide. I'll talk about it back to work. In the end, Qin Chen took Chen Sisi and used the teleportation array of the ancient alliance to leave the necrosphere after sweeping away the major forces in the dead spirit realm. Then, after passing through the teleportation array of the major states in Guanggan Mansion, began to think about the advancement of Guanggan Mansion. Qin Chen had wasted a lot of time in the necrosphere, and he had to report to heaven as soon as possible, otherwise even Master Kanaha would not be able to suppress it. Of course, the most important thing is that Qin Chen must go to Fukin for the first time to find out about Kyungsu and Ryu, and figure out a way to rescue them. Qin Chen and Sisi practiced as they rushed. Their lives were very comfortable. Moreover, with the Jade Disc of Good Fortune in the world, and the breakthrough of Qin Chen's cultivation base, the speed of the journey was extremely fast, shuttled in the void, thousands of miles a day. Finally, after about half a month, Qin Chen came to the palace city of Guanggan Mansion through the teleportation formation. Boom! As soon as Qin Chen entered the Guanggan Mansion city, he was shocked by the vastness of the Guanggan Mansion city. This was not a city at all, but a nebula a vast continent, surging with the glory that shocked Qin Chen. This is Guanggan Mansion. Qin Chen and Sisi walked out of the teleportation formation and were deeply shocked when they saw Guanggan Mansion. In front of me, there is an endless divine kingdom, vast and endless, layered on top of each other, endless spaces are folded together, in these spaces, there are magnificent buildings, and countless strong breaths fill the eyes. What shocked Qin Chen even more was that the vastness of Guanggan Mansion could hardly be seen from the outside. If Qin Chen could figure out the vastness of Yunzhou Prefecture, then the vastness of Guanggan Mansion, Qin Chen can't see through it all, countless empty. Fold in between and spread to the depths. This is no longer a city, but a vast continent with countless folding spaces. And in the deepest part of the city, there is also a world like the Kingdom of God and the shock in the heart cannot be described in words. In the heaven-like world, not to mention the towering buildings everywhere, the rays of sunshine, the aura of aura, and the ground is almost padded with the most precious sky stones. The most important thing is that the entire Guanggan mansion is not flat, but three-dimensional. When you stand in it, there are also pieces of space above your head. In the space, there are countless buildings, 
many of which are constructed from sacred objects and manifest. Out. Obviously, it was a powerful super martial arts building used to shock the scene. Qin Chen even saw that in Guanggan Mansion, there are some particularly tall buildings that penetrate into infinite time and space, emitting the same aura as Kang Yuan Tu and Wan Pirate Cave, which are the heavenly treasures. There are some sacred artifacts. The breath made Qin Chen palpitations. This is the highest treasure of the heavenly grade, which can suppress everything. In addition, the streets of the ancient city of Guanggan Mansion are each ten times wider than that of Yunzhou Prefecture. At a glance, they are all tall buildings with people coming and going, and there are the most common mortal and earth sages. Walk on the ground and do business honestly. Serve others. There are also superior heavenly saints flying around in the air. If you say that in Yunzhou City, strong earth sages can be seen everywhere, then here, the most are the peerless earth sages, half-step heaven sages, people come and go, it is everywhere. Even ordinary heavenly sage masters have many, and each body exudes amazing heavenly sage laws. However, masters above the mid-term of heavenly sage are still rare. After all, at the mid-level of heavenly sage, they are all giants, even in Guanggan Mansion, they are very rare and powerful. However, Qin Chen felt slightly with his spiritual thoughts and found that among the tall buildings in the city, there was still the aura of a master in the middle of the heavenly sage, and there were even some powers that made Qin Chen feel terrifying, located in the center of Guanggan Mansion. God. The core of the country, this is obviously the top powerhouse who surpassed the midterm of heavenly sage. It's magnificent, Qin Chen. Is this the Guanggan Mansion? The holy energy is much richer than the necrosphere, and, you see, there are so many masters here, and there are not a few masters of heavenly sages. As for the peerless earth sage, half a step god, it's too common. If we want. Wandering around in it, it may not be clear after a few years of shopping. Guanggan Mansion is really prosperous. Wearing the veil, Chen Sisi also shocked and said that after she came to the heavens, she had been in the dead soul realm and had never seen such a huge scene. In the necrosphere, although there are many strong people, they are far less than the Guanggan Mansion. After all, in the necrosphere, any heavenly sage master is a great figure and can become a member of such forces as the gods and ancients. The leader, sit on the side. But in this Guanggan Mansion, you can see a heavenly saint walking by from time to time, just like ordinary people on the road, which is too exaggerated. It's natural. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, although he was surprised, but he soon recovered. This city, after all, is the center of the entire Guanggan Mansion. Here is where all the powerhouses, all the treasures, and all the resources of the entire Guanggan Mansion are gathered. As long as there is a chance, anyone will want to come to this Guanggan Mansion and capture good luck, looking for opportunities. It's more promising than staying in your own small place. Qin Chen led Chen Sisi into this street. Have you seen those peerless heavenly saints and half-step heavenly saints? If they stay in their own place, such as Yunzhou and other places, and want to become the heavenly saints, it will be as difficult as reaching the sky, but they come here. Guanggan Mansion, even if it is some top. The servants and slaves of the great forces, the chance of becoming a world-famous saint, will also be increased tenfold and a hundredfold. Who doesn't want to come here? Qin Chen gave pointers at will. Yes. Chen Sisi nodded, a small place is equivalent to the countryside, just like doing business in the Tianyu continent, in a small village, even if you become the richest man, you will have a fortune. But if you go to the imperial capital of an empire, although you cannot become the richest man in the empire, as long as you work hard, you can easily earn tens of thousands of fortunes, and once it becomes successful, billions of fortunes are not impossible. This is the charm of a big place. But now, Guanggan Mansion City is such a big place. All states in Guanggan Mansion, as long as they have the opportunity to come to this city, whoever doesn't want to join here, fights their heads, 
must come to the city. Local. Walking on the bustling street, Qin Chen and Chen Sisi both felt their insignificance. Are Kyungsu and Ruyu in the core of the Kingdom of God? Are they now the closed disciples of Palace Master Guanggan Mansion? Qin Chen raised his head and looked into the depths of the infinite space, the bright Kingdom of God that bloomed with vast glory. The mighty breath made Qin Chen deeply feel the insignificance. Although he has broken through the heavenly sage, if he rushes into it, I'm afraid it will happen immediately. We'll be torn apart. Qin Chen, are we looking for Sister Kyungsu and Ruyu now? Chen Sisi asked. Don't worry, let's go directly to Guanggan Mansion now. That's death. I will return to work first. But before I enter the work day, I need to settle you down. I don't know what will happen after I enter the work day. Wanna top master? I am afraid that the jade disc of good fortune of the universe cannot be easily displayed. It is safer for you to stay outside of heavenly work. Waiting for me to find a chance, then bring you in. Qin Chen's eyes flickered, flashed in his mind for thousands of years, and quickly made a decision. Chen Sisi nodded. She listened to Qin Chen. Although she was very reluctant to be separated from Qin Chen, she also knew that if the abyssal demon Dao she controlled was discovered, it would definitely cause great trouble. I don't know if the branch of my Chindi pavilion has been opened in Guanggan Mansion. I will first find out about the situation in Wanggu Tower. Qin Chen took Chen Sisi towards the depths of Guanggan Mansion. When he was in Yunso, he was seen Zhenren gave him a map. After he came to Guanggan Mansion, he could follow the map to find a branch of Wanggu building if he needed it. The branch belonged to his line and would give him definitely help. Because Guanggan Mansion is too vast, there are many sub-buildings of Wanggu building in Guanggan Mansion, and Wanggu building itself is divided into many factions, and there are conflicts and competitions between them. Of course, Qin Chen still believes in Tian Xin Zhenren. This vein. Qin Chen and Sisi were walking in the Guanggan Mansion. While walking along the map and perceiving the holy energy in Guanggan Mansion, they discovered that the underground of Guanggan Mansion contained countless ancient sacred veins, and many of them were heavenly ancient. Holy vein, exudes surging. Breath. However, these ancient sacred veins under the ground were laid down by many forces in Guanggan Mansion, and they were all blocked by powerful restrictions. Like Yunzo City, the paddy fields were intertwined with each other, forming a huge network of ancient sacred veins. Even the Wanggu Tower does not know how many ancient sacred veins are contained in the entire Guanggan Mansion. Because there are too many powers in Guanggan Mansion, power is annihilated every day, and power is born every day, and every power is do not grasp. Few ancient holy veins. Guanggan Mansion is very vast. Although the distance between the Wanggu building sub-buildings on the map is not far, it has to penetrate thousands of stacked spaces. Fortunately, there are small teleportation formations everywhere in Guanggan Mansion, which can be transmitted quickly. To various places, otherwise just rely on. I don't know how long it takes to fly and walk. After about a stick of incense, Qin Chen saw a magnificent building towering in a space in the distance. Its appearance was exactly the same as the Wanggu building in Yunso. It seemed to be of a unified standard, emitting a bright light. Go. As soon as Qin Chen moved, he led Chen Sisi to the door of this Wanggu building. He has the Keking token of the Wanggu building and can enter at will. As soon as Qin Chen entered the Wanggu building, a disciple came up to ask questions. Qin Chen didn't talk nonsense and directly showed the Kei Ching Ling and saw that the disciple's eyes suddenly showed surprise. Light. Senior is Master Qin Chen. This disciple lost his voice and sent a message for the first time, his attitude immediately became extremely polite and respectful, and his waist couldn't help but bent down. You know me. Qin Chen was astonished. It seemed that this was the first time he came to Guanggan Mansion, right? Master Qin Chen, please come with me. In our Wanggu building, every piece of the guest order has a number to verify the identity of the other party. 
Master Qin Chen, you are in our Wang building. You have a good reputation. The younger one has also heard the famous name of the predecessor. Our supervisor. As I said, once the senior comes over, we must ask us to notify as soon as possible, and ask senior to go to the VIP room, our supervisor will be there soon. This disciple is also a peerless earth saint, but like a servant, his attitude is too respectful. Oh? Are you in charge? Qin Chen thoughtfully, could it be that real person Tian Xing had told him? He didn't mind, entering the VIP room, and just sitting down with Sisi, he saw a graceful figure walking in excitedly. Little dust, meet again, don't come here unharmed. A soft voice sounded, with joy, excitement, and maturity, like a blooming peony, noble and elegant. It turned out to be Miss Ruyui, why did you come here? Qin Chen stood up in surprise, the person here turned out to be Ruri. At this moment Ruyui, with the breath of heavenly sage lingering for half a step on her body, exuding an astonishing breath of heavenly sage, she has broken through to the peak of half-step heavenly sage, and only one step away from the realm of heavenly sage, Qin Chen has a feeling. The other party will not be out long. Can truly break through to the realm of heavenly sage. All this thanks to you. Xiao Chen, because of the outstanding contribution made by our Yunzo Wang building, we discovered Xiao Chen Yu, the top refiner Tian Jiao, and Tian Xin Zhenren and I have been promoted by the headquarters and have been inserted in in this branch of Guanggan Mansion. Not only was I transferred to Guanggan Mansion, but I was also rewarded for entering the secret field of the headquarters, successfully breaking through the half-step Heavenly Sage and now I am working hard to advance to the heavenly sage. Ruo Rui said with a smile, and then glanced at Chen Sisi, showing a stunning expression, this should be the confidant who is dreaming of Xiao Chen and wants to go to the dead soul realm to rescue. Ruo Rui has seen a girl. Although Sisi wore a veil, Ruo Rui was still amazed by the agile and clear eyes. Moreover, in those pair of eyes, as deep as the starry sky, clear but vast, gave Ruri a strong impact. This is definitely a top master, let Ruriui feel the endless mystery. Good girl Ruri. Sisi gave a bow and said with a smile. Xiao Chen, you just came back from the necrosphere? I will go back to ask the Tian Xing host. If you know that Chen Xiao is coming, the Tian Xing host will be very happy. Oh? The real person Tian Xing is here. Qin Chen was surprised. Where is it? I just met. Ruo Rui smiled, the original Tian Xing was also transferred to this eternal building because of you. As the sub-host, but the Tian Xing host is now receiving a distinguished guest. Of course, you are also a distinguished guest, but that person is a heavenly saint. The strong man in the mid-term, and his temper is very bad, so the original poster of Tian Xing is hosting, I don't know what you need. You can talk to me and I will arrange it right away. Then give me some heaven level saint veins first. This time I went to the dead soul realm and gained some gains. I want to redeem the heaven level saint veins cultivation. I don't know how many of your eternal vessels. Qin Chen raised his hand, and immediately, dozens of ancient sacred veins at the pinnacle of the land, as well as countless treasures from the necrosphere appeared in the void of the VIP room. Boom. These treasures exploded with countless astonishing auras, and they were all converged in one space. It was the Kang Yuan map, which evolved into their respective appearances. This Kang Yuan map has been refined by Sisi, but it contains many things that Qin Chen wants to exchange. Treasure, so temporarily. Still in Qin Chen's hands. These pinnacle sacred veins are not very useful for Qin Chen and Sisi now. There are also many ancient treasures obtained from the major forces in the necrosphere and the ancient ruins. These Qin Chen they don't use it at all. It is the ancient holy veins that are ready to be obtained in the eternal building, all exchanged into heavenly levels. This is. Ruyui saw countless treasures, many ancient holy veins, and couldn't help but breathe in the air. There are too many treasures in it, there are many sacred artifacts of many places, and even many heavens. 
The key to the quality of holy artifacts is that some of them are unique holy soldiers in the necrosphere. Especially the treasures from the deserted ancient ruins. Little Dust, are you not some of the top forces that destroyed the necrosphere? And these treasures, with the aura of ancient times, according to the information of my eternal building, should be treasures in the mysterious land and ancient ruins in the necrosphere. You actually got so much. Did you wipe out the entire barren ruins? Are you Rui was dumbfounded. Yes, this time I went to the dead spirit realm, and I killed a few forces in the necro realm, and then scoured the barren ancient ruins. How about? How many heavenly ancient saint veins can be exchanged for so many treasures? Chin the dust said lightly. Ordinary holy soldiers, we don't care about the eternal spiritual tower, but these wild ancient treasures are very special. They are unique to the necrotic realm. They are useful to many powerful people who practice ancient mysteries. Cooperation with the Shengu League It is for these treasures that are not available in Guangan Mansion. If these treasures are brought to the market in Guangan Mansion, they will definitely cause a sensation and be favored by some big people. The cold sweat on Ruo Rui's excited forehead came out, Qin Chen's hand was simply too big, and he took it out, and it was a treasure against the sky. Together, these treasures can create several days level martial arts. The entire Guanggan mansion, that is, a top power such as the Wang Gu Tower, can eat it. There is little dust, these treasures are too many and they are of infinite value. I can't be the master. I must report it to the Tianxin poster. Moreover, the share of our branch of the heavenly ancient saint vein is limited. If we really want to exchange it, we need to go to the headquarters. To pass the Tianxin poster. To decide, I will report to the host. Ruo Rui's heart was surging and left in a hurry. This is a big deal and it has a bearing on her future. In fact, Ruo Rui and Tianxin Zhenren were transferred from Yunzhou back to Guanggan Mansion, which has offended many people and caused the unhappiness of some factions in the headquarters. How many states are there in Guanggan Prefecture? Which of these states does not want to return to Guanggan Mansion? But those who can really come back are very rare and must be done. Ruo Rui and Zhenren Tianxing were transferred back to their headquarters only because they had a good relationship with Qin Chen, but Qin Chen was only a disciple of Tian Jiao after all and he had not really joined Tian Jiao and had no real power. Can't let. The establishment of effective cooperation between Wang Gyulu and Tian Gong has also made Ruo Rui, a faction, a lot of targets in Wang Gyulu. But now, Qin Chen has brought so many treasures, especially some of the unique treasures in the Necro Realm. If we can cooperate with this list, then it will be huge for her and the Tian Xin poster based in Guanggan Mansion. The benefit of the faction. The pressure will be much smaller. The depths of the Wang Gu Tower. The original poster of Tian Xing, as well as some high-level people who originally belonged to this Wang Gu building, are now respectfully receiving an old man. This old man has sharp eyes, grey beard and his hands are very thick and big with five fingers. He is holding two stars and meteorite iron. Cheng's Rai Maru. Turning back and forth exuding a vast breath. Senior to Renchen, you want three heavenly ancient sacred veins at once. This is a big deal. We are just a small sub-building of the Wang Gu Tower in Guanggan Mansion. I am afraid it will be difficult to get together at a time. The original poster of Tian Xing looked at the rough mine old man embarrassedly, with a smile on his face. The business of your Wang Gu building in Guanggan Mansion is so big that you can't get the three heavenly ancient holy veins? This Wang Gu building is only a small sub-building, but it is also in Guanggan Mansion. A stronghold in, why, there are no three ancient sacred veins? And, the price I gave is not low, 50 earth-grade ancient sacred veins exchanged for one sky-level ancient sacred vein, a total of 150, this price it's already pretty good. If you can't be the master, go to the headquarters. Let the people above decide. This old man, known as the God of Slaughter, snorted coldly, his eyes were fierce, 
his whole body expanded in the midst of heavenly sage, and shook again and again, as if to give the Tian Xin poster a smashing power. Senior Turin God knows something. The Tian Xin poster said with a smile, in our stronghold, there is not much inventory of the heavenly ancient sacred veins, plus the heavenly ancient sacred veins, which are strategic items. Anyone can be established. A heavenly power can be regarded as the treasure of the town. If you buy all of the predecessors of the Tureng God, I'm afraid we won't be able to do business in this premises. Moreover, the Tureng God's predecessor, although our Wang Tower has a price tag of 50 exchange of land grade holy veins for a heaven grade holy vein, but you should also know that this is just a list price. If you really want to redeem it, our Wangulu is too disadvantaged. Or, senior to Renchen, you go to the higher level Wang building and ask. The earth level saint veins are exchanged for the sky level saint veins, and the price is lower, but in general, it is rarely used. The price is exchanged. If two Renchen only exchanges one item, it's fine, but now he wants to exchange 150 items for three. Article, then absolutely nothing. The strategic positions of the heaven level saint veins and the earth level saint veins are far different. Just like in Guangan Mansion, can you exchange 50 heaven level saint veins for one saint master level saint vein? Not to mention 50, 500 will not work, the status of the two is completely different, a world of difference. Hey, this seat has always been doing business with your Wanggu building sub buildings. The world Wanggu building is one family. Why do you want to go to other Wang buildings? This is your business. This seat only needs to exchange for the heavenly saint veins, remember to go when the host Feng Ye was there, he was much more refreshing than you. Tu Renchen's face was cold, why, now you are here, so you don't recognize people? You are a little early sage, dare to be with me am I talking like that? If you can't be the master, call your superiors over. I won't go to other places. This. The landlord Tian Xing had an ugly face. If this little thing would alarm his superiors and spread it to the headquarters, it would be a great dereliction of duty, indicating that his ability is not good, and even his faction would be overwhelmed. Moreover, the original poster of Tian Xing also knows that this Turin god dared to be arrogant here, but also because of the connection with another faction in the Wanggu Tower. Maybe, this person suddenly came to exchange for the heavenly saint veins, maybe there is another Wang Gu tower behind it. The shadow of factions, no. Then he is a strong man in the middle of the heavenly sage, even if he is tyrannical, how dare he run wild in the Wangulu? Didn't you see some of the high levels of the original Wang Gu building around you, all sneered at them, saying nothing? This is obviously to give myself this new landlord off the beaten track, watching my own jokes, and even if I don't handle it well, I'll go to the headquarters and report myself. I told you. The original poster of Tian Xing suddenly felt very troublesome and burnt. Senior to Renchen, we really can't be the master here. Why don't we go to a higher level branch as our seniors? Here, it's just a waste of your own time, senior. When a confidant brought by a Tian Xin poster saw it, he couldn't help but distinguish. Snapped. The god Tu Ren stood up abruptly, slapped the half-step heavenly saint flying out with a slap, slammed on the restraint inside the Wanggu building, and then fell to the ground, groaning in pain. Bold, what do you dare to talk to me like this? If I come to do business in your Wanggulu, you dare to perfuse me like this? Believe it or not. I will go to your Wangulo headquarters and participate in your fortune. The temper is too good, what? What a cat and a dog dare to come up and talk to me. Before the shot, the Turin god would beat and scold this half-step heavenly sage at will. If it weren't the identity of the other side's Wanggu tower, it could not be too violent, this half-step heavenly sage might have been directly exploded. This is Guangan Mansion, this is the strong man in the middle of the heavenly sage, the strong is respected, and the half-step Tian Sheng here can only be used for wanton bullying. Senior to Renchen, you. 
Zhen Xin Tianxing's expression changed. What am I? Tu Renchen coldly snorted, his fierce eyes staring at real man Tian Xin, I am here to do business. If you are open for business in the Wang building, you have to do business. Otherwise, what is the use of you as the host? If you don't do business with this seat, then this seat will only. I'm able to go to your headquarters and participate in your fortune. Zhen Xin Zhenren's face is ugly. This is a double difficulty. If the Tu Ren is really allowed to go to the Wangulo headquarters, no matter what the result is, his new subhost will definitely make the headquarters very dissatisfied, and even be impeached. Senior Tu Renchen calms down. Tian Xing's face changed a bit, and finally reluctantly changed his words, since Senior needs three heaven-level ancient sacred veins, then I promised it, only 150 earth-level ancient sacred veins. No matter how much, there is no forgiveness. Can do anything. That's it. Tu Renchen smiled, his eyes gloomy. True person Tian Xing knows that this is also an expedient measure. If this Turin god is really coming from another faction in the building, this is just the beginning, and there must be a later move. Moreover, as soon as the three heavenly ancient sacred veins went out, his share of the sub-building was not much left, and business would be difficult for the next period of time. However, it can only be blocked by soldiers and covered by water. Tian Xing Lu Zhu At this moment, Ru Yui walked in, Little Chen is here. It's in the VIP room. To exchange for the heavenly ancient saint veins, he is going to use. Get out. When Zhen Xin Zhenren heard that, a Ji Ling wanted to drive Ruo Rui out. Wait. Tu Renchen suddenly smiled coldly, and stopped Rui, his eyes surging with fierce light, why, this seat is exchanging the heavenly holy veins, and others will also exchange for the heavenly holy veins. What a coincidence. What little dust, dare to say in front of this seat. Young, bring him in and let me take a good look at him. This Turin god was called out by other factions in the Wang building, that he wanted to make trouble for the Tian Xin poster. There is no chance for Zhen Su. Now there is a chance, where is not excited. Senior Tu Renchen. Zhen Xin Tian hurriedly said, that one is a disciple of Tian's work, Senior. You still don't have any insights with others. What? A disciple of Tianzuo. Tu Renchen was taken aback. Don't look at his majesty, he is a mid-stage tycoon of Tiancheng, but he still has to lie down when he encounters Tianzuo. No, Tian Gong has just recruited disciples, but these disciples are all in the Guanggan Mansion branch of Tian Gong, where they are undergoing special training. How can they appear here? The original poster of Tian Xin, do you dare to lie to me? Tu Renchen suddenly coldly snorted. Tao. Tian Jiao did recruit disciples in Guanggan Mansion, but Tian Jiao's management is strict, and the newly recruited disciples have all been trained in Tian Jiao, so where will they appear here? Senior Tu Renchen, I didn't lie to you, Chen Xiao is indeed a disciple of Tian Zuo, and a disciple of the Division of the Refining Equipment Division. The reason why he does not work is Tianzuo's special approval. Tian Xin Zhenren heard Li explanation. Hey, the original poster of Tian Xin, are you a three-year-old child? Tian Xin has strict rules, so how could it be possible to approve such a thing? Tu Renchen sneered again and again, seeing the attitude of the real Tian Xin, he immediately guessed. Tian Xin Zhenren, this is to protect. Fang that's why I said so, my heart was overjoyed. He was instigated by other factions in the Wang building to make trouble here. As long as he can make the bigger mistakes made by the original poster of Tian Xin, the greater his reward will be. Now the real person of Tian Xin dares to pretend to be Tian Xin to protect others. Working disciple, this. If something is told to the headquarters of the Wangulu, it will definitely be furious, and the Tian Xin poster will be removed directly, no one can save him. Okay, the original poster of Tian Xin, you are so bold that you dare to make people pretend to be a Tianzuo disciple. Lawlessness is really lawless. 
I have to see who is so bold and even a Tianzuo disciple dared to impersonate. With a cold snort, Tu Renchen left here and went directly to the VIP room. In the VIP room, Qin Chen was talking with Sisi. Suddenly. Boom. The restriction of the VIP room burst suddenly, and an infinite and terrifying breath surged in, like a vast ocean, instantly appeared in the VIP room. Senior Tu Renchen, stop. Behind, Tian Xin Zhenren was frightened and furious, and hurriedly brought many powerful people in the Wang Gu Tower, his face pale. The many high-level buildings of the Wang Gu building sub-buildings all sneered at the scene, knowing that the real person Tian Xin was going to be unlucky this time. If it doesn't work, the location of the landlord must be gone. Maybe he will be severely punished by the Wang Gu building. Boy. You're the guy who claims to be a disciple of Tian Jiao, so young. Seeing Qin Chen, Tu Renchen suddenly sneered again and again, his eyes were fierce and murderous. Who is your excellency? Qin Chen stood up, his expression a little ugly, I rushed into this young master's VIP room, too much, right? Little dust, calm down, calm down, this one is senior to Ren Shen. Guang Han the midterm fusion saint is a strong man in Guanggan Mansion. The true man Tian Xing knew Qin Chen's temper. He was afraid that Qin Chen would make a move, so he hurried up to explain, and then confronted Tu. Ren Chen Dao, senior to Ren Chen, Chen Shao is indeed a disciple of Tianzuo, and a master of the division of Tianzuo's refining division. Grand Master. The god of Tu Ren laughed loudly and the original poster of Tian Xing went over it. Lord Tian Xing, I think your old eyes are dim. You believe what the other party says? You dare to say even the master of the refining division? Tu Renchen sneered again and again, his eyes scanned Qin Chen, his mouth showed a smirk, this seat is here to redeem the heavenly saint. My, boy, you have to redeem it too. It was deliberately arranged by the original poster of Tian Xing. You are so brave. You can even dare to play with this seat. Suddenly, Tu Renchen saw Chen Sisi next to Qin Chen, his eyes lit up, and there was a hint of and greed in his eyes. Unexpectedly, I met a woman with such a temperament in this Wang Gu building. It is a pity, with a veil, why, in front of this seat, still hiding her face? Come on, take off the veil and let this seat see you. What's the matter? Tu Renchen laughed sullenly, put his big hand out, and immediately grabbed the veil on Sisi's face, rudely. Senior Tu Ren God, stop. The real Tian Xing on the side rushed up in a rush. He roared, rumbling, and his cultivation was full of blooms. He madly stopped in front of God Tu Ren, blocking the claw of God Tu Ren. Boom. The Saint Yuan on Zhen Xing Zhen Ren's body burst layer upon layer. His face was pale, he stepped back to Qin Chen, and then stabilized his figure, wow, a mouth full of blood spurted out, his face pale as gold paper, and he was already seriously injured. Tian Xing poster. Ruo Rui and many other confidants shouted in anger. Dust. Sisi also looked at Qin Chen. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, his wisdom flashed, and his arms around Sisi. He was not arrogant or impetuous. He sat down again, his eyes flashing with cold killing intent, and said, Look at the situation first. Majestic Tian Xing tried his best to stabilize. Body shape, hurriedly saluted to Turenchen, Senior Turenchen, please listen to me, no matter who Chen is, he is also a guest of my Wangulu. Please also Turenchen Senior to give me the face of Wangulu. Don't get angry. Ha ha ha, is he a guest of your Wangulu? Tu Renchen looked at Qin Chen, his eyes shot, and a grinning smile appeared at the corner of his mouth, Okay, I heard that this kid will also exchange for the ancient saint veins. I am going to exchange three of them. I don't know if this junior wants to exchange it. How many? The landlord Tian Xing actually dared to lie to himself. From his point of view, this kid was clearly sent by the landlord Tian Xing to deliberately disturb his business. Little Chen, this is Senior Turen God, a tycoon in the middle of the Heavenly Sage, 
hurry up and salute. Tian Xin Zhenren hurriedly said. This god Tu Ren has a violent temper, Yang Chen, don't have general knowledge with him first, let him know. At the same time, the real person Tian Xin secretly transmitted the sound, and simply explained the cause of the matter, cautiously, for fear that Qin Chen would suffer. Although he knows that Qin Chen has extraordinary strength, slays Yun Dong Guang, breaks into the dead spirit realm alone, and is a disciple of heaven's work, he does not need to be afraid of the Turin in terms of identity, but the Turin does not believe it at all now, if he starts mad, he insisted. Unstoppable, Qin Chen would also be beheaded here. At that time, even if Tian Jiao was furious, but Qin Chen had been killed, could it be possible to survive? Can only endure the humiliation first. After coming and going, Qin Chen probably already knew the reason. Oh. This one turned out to be a tycoon in the middle of the Heavenly Sage, Senior to Renchen? A famous powerhouse in Guanggan Mansion? The dignified tycoon of the middle term Heavenly Sage exchanges three ancient sacred veins? So poor. Qin Chen laughed haha although this young man has no money. Fortune, but I also want to exchange five or six for fun. Boom. As soon as Qin Chen said this, everyone was stunned and the high levels in the Wanggu building were frightened stupid, and they couldn't believe Qin Chen would say such a thing. He, a young man, dare to say such a thing to a giant in the middle of the heavenly saint? I don't know how to write the word dead. What? What did you say? The two Ren didn't seem to hear clearly, you say it again. I want me to exchange five and six heaven-level holy veins, and all they take are rare treasures, Earth level holy veins, that's an addition, unlike some people. Prides itself on being a giant, senior, but they all use goods like earth level holy veins to exchange for heaven level holy veins. People are cheap, and they are ready to buy and sell, which is a joke. Qin Chen sat steadily on the chair in the VIP room with his arms around Chen Sisi. Above the audience, he and Chen Sisi were sitting, and the others were standing like the most noble characters. Dust, this old man is probably also a Zibay Goods, what a giant, I think it's almost a poor ghost. Sissi also covered her mouth and chuckled. She knew that Qin Chen was going to cheat people, and she sang and made peace without putting two Ren God in her eyes at all. Little Chen, you, you. Tian Xing and Ruo Rui and others have now thoroughly heard what Qin Chen said. They only felt dizzy and almost fell to the ground with their voices trembling and startled. Angrily said, Little Dust, you, rebellious, how can you be so? Senior man and God speak. He kept winking at Qin Chen, very anxious, and his courage was almost shocked. Ruo Rui and the others also shivered and hurriedly explained for Qin Chen, senior to Renchen, although Chen Shao joined Tian Jiao. He just came to Guanggan Mansion and didn't know the prestige of seniors, so I asked seniors to have a lot of them. Forgive him this time. They are heartbroken. If Turin God goes crazy here, who can stop it? Lord Tian Xing, what kind of guest did you bring? It angered senior to Renchen, you really don't know how high the sky is. Several of the original high level people of the branch here sneered, and yelled at Qin Chen coldly. Boy, I think you don't know the heights of the sky, the mouth is poor, and you don't even look at who is in front of you. Wrong, kowtow to beg for mercy, otherwise the Turin God Senior will get angry and kill you, our Wangula will not stand out for you, we will take the blame. They seem to be speaking for Qin Chen, but they are actually hiding their evil intentions. GG, GG. Two Renchen suddenly exploded with energy, you all get out of me. Boom. The original poster of Tian Xing and the others backed up again and again, and they were suddenly sent out. Lord Tian Xing, I think you have eaten the courage of the bear heart and leopard, dare to treat me like this, find such an arrogant kid, and yell at me, looking for death, it is almost looking for death. Two Renchen walked towards Qin Chen step by step, surging with endless terrifying midterm laws of the heavenly sage, booming, one after another like chains, 
pierced through the world, sweeping across all directions. Tian Xing Lu Zhu and others were shaken away by the god of Tu Ren, and they didn't have the ability to resist at all. They showed horrified expressions on their faces, as if they were about to see Qin Chen's miserable end. But Qin Chen didn't change his expression. He just sat there quietly, his eyes squinting, looking at the Turin god coming, just like looking at a majestic ant. Tu Renchen, the midterm tycoon of the heavenly sage, bursts of fire from his eyes, burning with anger. He originally thought that when he got angry, Qin Chen would kneel on the ground and beg for mercy, but he didn't expect Qin Chen to be so calm. His eyes are even more intense. Accurate. Just like an emperor, how can he not be angry when he sees his courtier not fearing his gaze? The rules of the heavens are respected by the strong. He is a giant in the middle of the heavenly sage, let alone this kid, even if the heavenly sages such as the heavenly landlord, they must be trembling and respectful when they encounter themselves. Qin Chen's attitude is right. It's a shame for him. Disgrace. Boy, you're called Qin Chen? What a courage. Originally, as long as you kneel down and beg for mercy, beg this cedar to spare you a dog's life, and give the woman next to you, let this cedar play with it, this cedar may still it will spare you a dog's life. But now, no matter who you are or what you have to do with the original poster of Tian Xing, I will divide your bones and muscles, extract your soul, and use the Yuan Huo to burn it a little bit. You endure the torture of eternal life, and then turn into ashes a little bit. As for the woman next to you, this seat will also capture her and take her as a forbidden. After playing with it countless times, she will be sent to the Shuangzia building of Guanggan Mansion to pick up the guests and die. Tu Renchen laughed grinningly. Hearing that, in Qin Chen's eyes, there was a sudden burst of endless fierce light, and in an instant it was like a human being, like a fierce beast, walking out of the predicament, and exploding with a terrifying murderous look, his eyes were cold as cold. Bing said murderously, God Turin, it seems that you have to die. Haha, <laughs> you are the one looking for death, die for this seat. Tu Renchen roared, too lazy to talk nonsense, rumbling, the infinite heavenly sage intermediate law rushed out, and the Tian Xing Lu Zhu and others could not get close at all. His big hand turned into a giant hand, facing Qin Chen He Chen Sisi is just catching and shooting, just like an eagle catching a chicken. In his eyes, Qin Chen and Chen Sisi are little chickens, even little chickens. Everyone, you have all seen it, it was this Tu Renchen who first shot Ben Shao. As a Tianzuo disciple and a guest of the Wang Gu Tower, Ben Shao was forced to fight back because of helplessness. Even if this lawsuit hits Ben Shao in Guanggan Mansion. Not afraid. Qin Chen finally stood up. He had wanted to do it a long time ago and he finally managed to endure it now. Finally, he couldn't bear it. Boom! In Qin Chen's body, the infinite ancient aura surging, turned into a powerful rune aura, surging between the heavens and the earth, and suddenly blasted on the claws of the Turin's grasping and shooting, and suddenly, Turin God felt like he had caught a terrifying crystal that was extremely hard and indestructible. No matter how he caught it, he couldn't continue downward. Hey? Desolate Ancient Qi? Could it be the special magical secret technique in the desolate ancient ruins in the special secret realm of the Necrosphere? The Tu Ren was taken aback, and a cruel smile appeared on his face immediately, ha 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 ha, boy, it's no wonder that you are so arrogant, you have mastered a little special magical power in the Necrosphere, you dare to be arrogant to me, but your cultivation is too weak. It's broken for me. He stepped forward and completely let go of his mind. The necrosphere is not within the scope of Tian Jiao's recruitment. No matter how powerful Qin Chen is, he can't be recruited into Tian Jiao. The real man Tian Xing dare to deceive himself. Boom! The infinite holy Yuan came out rolling out, behind the god of Tu Ren, countless magnificent figures appeared, like the same demon god, each of them burst out with a terrifying murderous aura. He is known as the god of murder, who slaughtered all things in the world, and mastered the strongest way of killing. 
the way of Tushin. Boy, you are proud to be able to die under my magical power to slaughter the devil and kill the gods. The stronger your resistance, the stronger the power of my slaying and kill the gods. In the end, the gods, and gods pii, blood reign in the world. In one move, the entire void, in the eternal building, is like a battlefield transformed into gods and demons. The dusk of the gods and endless rain of blood are sprinkled, and Qin Chen is like the spirit of the gods and demons to be sacrificed. Annihilated, the blood turns into energy between heaven and earth, returning to nothingness. Oh 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 oh! Tian Xing Lu Zhu and others can't get close at all, because as soon as they get close, their souls seem to be drawn away, involved in this battlefield of gods and demons, and their heads are different and turned into dust. Boom! The endless terrifying killing method fell on Qin Chen fiercely. Less dust! The landlord Tian Xing and Ru Yui roared in anger, their eyes were desperate, as if they could see the miserable appearance that was torn apart in an instant. But the next moment, everyone was shocked. The endless battlefield of gods and demons grandly settled in Qin Chen, but Qin Chen, like a in the battlefield, breathed through the sky, bursting out the glory of the heavens, like a towering giant standing on top of the sky, rising into the sky. God slaughter, this is your god slaughter power? Too weak? The small midterm heavenly sage giant is also mad in front of this young man, not knowing how high the world is. Now. It is Ben Young's turn to take action. Qin Chen's body was shaken, and the whole figure was stretched infinitely, turning into a towering pillar, standing upright. The heaven and the earth trembled under his feet, and the avenue sang beside him. He seemed to be the only of the heaven and the earth, and the chapters of all things sang all around him. Bang bang bang! Qin Chen's body moved, and under the terrifying aura, the battlefield of the gods and demons displayed by the two Ren suddenly burst. The ancient battlefield was suddenly severely suppressed, murderous agitation, and frantic collapse. The entire battlefield of gods and demons was shattered by the momentum of Qin Chen's steps. After that, Qin Chen came to the front of god two Ren with one step and punched out. Desolate ancient gods. Hum. What kind of punch is this? Unspeakable, the world was in between this punch, and they were all bombed. The entire eternal building was trembling with the frequency of this punch. Above that fist, the glory of the heavens surged, showing the sacredness. Extremely bright light. This is no longer an ordinary punch, but a punch that contains the rules of the supreme world. Two Renchen's face changed abruptly. He never thought that Qin Chen could perform such a terrifying punch. Under the endless coercion, it was only the blow of the fist, and the Saint Yuan on his body protected the turtles. Crack, there was a harsh cracking sound. Bang bang bang. In his body, the source of the tyrannical heavenly sage midterm law was blasting and shattering, Tu Renchen's face was horrified, and instinctively retreated. He wanted to escape from here and escape this devastating punch. However, no matter how flashy he was, he was still in this space, as if a fly that was imprisoned here couldn't fly out no matter what. What? In the end, Qin Chen's fist crashed down. Boom. Ah 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 ah. The body of God Tu Ren split, countless blood splashed, the chains of the midterm law of heavenly sage in his body broke and the breath of the whole person suddenly declined. He felt the boundless pain, his whole body seemed to be torn, the meridians, muscles, and clothes all over his body were exploded by Qin Chen's punch, and blood spurted out of the countless acupuncture points all over his body. What? I don't believe it, but I am invincible. Tu Renchen roared, his life was burned, his essence and blood were invigorated, and a dormant force in his body was resurrecting like a horned dragon. His eyes were angrily open, like a sleepy dragon fighting for his life, about to burst out and fight Qin Chen desperately. However, to no avail, Qin Chen smiled coldly, between his eyebrows, as if a vertical eye was opened, the heavenly soul forbidden technique quietly used, an astonishing soul power suddenly poured into the body of Tu Ren Shen, 
and Qin Chen took another step. Stepping out, a big hand pressed, like an ancient holy lord, the palm of the hand turned into a mountain, and it was heavily pressed down. King Deng. Before, he was still flaunting his might, such as the slaughter of the mighty god, was severely oppressed on the ground, his nose and tears flowed down, his skull cracked, his seven orifices were bleeding, he was struggling the ground, unable to move. This is. The real man Tian Xin kicked back, his eyes were hysterical, and he roared like crazy, what the is going on? How can you be so strong in the dust? Tian Sage, Chen Shao, he has broken through the world heavenly sage. Ryu Rui also yelled, Senior Tu Ren Shen was suppressed by Chen Shao, incredible, strong, too strong, abnormal, too abnormal. Can't believe it, what did I see? Suppression of Tian Chen's midterm giants. Am I dazzled? Or is the rule system of the heavens broken? I'm crazy, I'm already crazy. The countless high levels of the Wangula roared, shaking all over, there was no way to believe their eyes. Especially the high levels of the Wanggu building that had previously targeted the Tianxin poster and Qin Chen, their bodies were trembling like sieve chaff, and they fell to the ground by Qin Chen's domineering aura, and the feces and urine were scared. Senior Tu Ren God, right? Weak, too weak, just this strength is rampant in front of this young man. I don't know where you are courageous. I don't know how to live or die. Qin Chen slapped the two Ren God. Pressed the ground, the other side desperately. Struggling, roaring again and again, but unable to move at all. Qin Chen received the inheritance of the two great pinnacle holy masters, and his body became holy, and the ordinary midterm heavenly sage giants were not in his eyes and could easily be killed. This two Ren God was arrogant in front of him, it was a wrong calculation. Tu Renchen was shivering all over, endless shame and anger, bursting out of him, he was vomiting blood with anger, and suffered a shame that he had never suffered in his life. Let Ben Shao come and see, what are you on? Qin Chen stepped on Tu Renchen's head fiercely, grabbed it with a big hand, and snatched a hand from Tu Renchen's body. In the storage space of, there are nearly 200 earth level sacred veins flying up and every ancient sacred vein is like a giant dragon. Generally, flying and surging in space. 183 earth-level ancient sacred veins are very good, and this can be treated as compensation for offending Ben Shao, um, what is this? Qin Chen once again claws, suddenly two magnificent ancient sacred veins surging, the breath of this ancient holy vein is magnificent, the above. The breath is particularly condensed, it seems to be uniformly produced, and there are even various textures. It's the standard sky-level ancient sacred vein of our Wangulu. The Lord of the Skyline roared. He saw these two systems of ancient sacred veins. He was already certain that this Turin god was definitely sent by the rival faction in their eternal building, and this heavenly ancient sacred vein was very likely. Is the reward given to him? There was a deep chill in the heart of the original poster of Tian Xing. Oh! Qin Chen swept his eyes, smiled slightly, and put it away directly, and then captured all the treasures in Turin God's body again. The countless treasures, densely packed, were all restrained by Qin Chen, and there were a few of them. A heavenly holy soldier with extraordinary breath. Qin Chen is all cheaper. Then Qin Chen banged and sat directly on the body of Tu Renchen, and said lightly, Wang Gu host, we can come to discuss the business between you and me. We want the heavenly ancient saint veins at least, and the more is better. Want. You. The original poster of Tian Xing walked over in disbelief, and said tremblingly, Are you really Qin Chen? I'm not Qin Chen, who is it? Qin Chen asked back. Then you, why are you so powerful? The Tianxin poster was almost crazy. Although Qin Chen was powerful when he was in Yunso, he killed Yun Dong Guang with a half-step heavenly sage, but at least he could bear it, but now, Qin at the fingertips of the dust bomb, suppression can kill him. The man and giant, the shock in his heart, for a while, 
could not calm down. It's okay. I'm in the dead soul realm. Using my identity as a work of heaven, I got some special adventures and inheritance, broke through the realm of heavenly sage, and cultivated the supreme magic and supernatural powers. Qin Chen fabricated it at will. Heavenly Saint Midterm Giant. Head, in my eyes, is no different from ants. You got an adventure in the dead soul realm. The original poster of Tian Xin got numb scalp. The place like the dead soul realm was very strange. Although the big mans could not occupy the dead soul realm, there were many masters in each government coveting the dead soul realm. I went to explore the treasures in the world. As a result, many people fell, unexpected. As soon as Qin Chen left, he received the inheritance of adventures, worthy of being the heavenly arrogant who won the top job evaluation. However, this Turin god is a strong man in Guangan Mansion after all, and there are some connections behind it, so you still don't act rashly. The Tian Xing Luzu said again, he knew that Turin god might be another faction of his eternal building. For fear of Qin Chen being led. Pull among them. Boy, let me go, do you know who this seat is? Dare to be so against this seat, the forces behind this seat are invincible, you dare to move a hair of this seat, believe it or not, this seat will break you into pieces, and the woman next to you, humiliated severely. 2. People and gods roared again and again. At this time, they were still resisting and didn't bow their heads. Oh! The power behind it is so strong and invincible. Qin Chen smiled and looked at the Tian Xing poster, then tell me, is the relationship behind this Turin god strong in work? This. The original poster of Tian Xing was stunned, this is not true. Even if it is the Holy Lord's mansion of Guanggan Mansion, he dare not say that he offends Tian's work. That's not enough. This slaughter insults Ben Shao and may have a life, but if he dares to insult Ben Shao's woman, Ben Shayin can let him live? Isn't he self-proclaimed a giant? Ben Shao deprived him first. All his power makes him a waste. Things. Qin Chen's eyes were cold and fierce, he grabbed it with one claw and pressed it on the top of Tu Renchen's head. Qin Chen had already sentenced him to death from the moment Tu Renchen dared to show his lustful light to Sisi. Qin Chen also vaguely guessed the cause of the conflict between the Turin and the original poster of Tian Xing, but he was not afraid at all. He was a disciple of the division of Tian Gong's refining equipment, and Tian Gong was extremely protective of talented disciples. Strict, extremely short-term protection. Otherwise, Master Kanaha wouldn't let him break the rules of the sky, and the report was postponed. He didn't believe it, and killed the god of slaughter. Given all the truth, the forces behind the god of slaughter dared to make trouble for himself. What's more, even if there is no backing, anyone who dares to covet it, he is absolutely unrelenting. Dead. Qin Chen clasped Tu Renchen's head with one claw, and directly extracted the origin of the midterm rule of Heavenly Sage in his body. Ah! Tu Renchen screamed. Boom! In the top of his head, the thick origin lore resembles an angry dragon, which Qin Chen violently pulls out. The terrifying origin law dances wildly in this space, exuding a terrifying aura, and will bring the Tian Xing Lu Zhu and others crazy retreat. The art of patching the sky, sentiment. Qin Chen urged the sky patching technique, exhaling a strong breath, countless runes flickering, and crazily comprehending the power and magical powers in it and then he instantly penetrated most of the midterm laws of the heavenly sage into the universe. In. Hum. The universe good fortune jade plate was nourished by this force, and it immediately grew a lot, and the outer cover became more profound. This is the art of patching the sky, which can refine anything in the world and turn it into its own power. There is also the Tian Xing poster, Ruo Rui, these remaining Tian Sheng midterm rules, even if it is the meeting ceremony for this meeting. Qin Chen raised his hand casually, and immediately, the remaining few raging dragon-like midterm laws of the heavenly sage were suddenly penetrated by Qin Chen into the bodies of Ru Yui and the original poster of Tian Xing. 
Ho ho ho. Aruo Rui suddenly heard endless explosions in her body, and the terrifying Heavenly Saint's midterm law seemed to burst her body, causing her body to swell suddenly, as if to burst on the spot. The art of patching the sky, refining. At the critical moment, Qin Chen squeezed his hand, and the runes continued to penetrate Ruyui's body. Roar! Ruyui's seven orifices spit out a divine rainbow, and under the refining of the sky patching technique, he absorbed many of the powers of the Turin god. The boom, the breath of the body, suddenly swelled, and broke into the realm of heavenly sage in an instant. The boundless and magnificent heavenly sacred aura came down, and Ruyui roared again and again, becoming extremely sacred, noble, changed face, and breathtaking. A heavenly saint was born. This is actually not all Qin Chen's credit, because Ruyui herself is only one step away from the heavenly sage realm in the forbidden area of Tian's work. Even without Qin Chen, it would be as short as two or three months, and as long as ten years. We'll also break through to the realm of heavenly sage. But now, Qin Chen has shortened the entire time infinitely, allowing her to directly enter the realm of heavenly sage at this instant. This shocking scene made everyone present stunned. Roar! On the side, Zhen Xin Zhenren's body also burst out with endless power, and countless midterm laws of the heavenly sage were absorbed by him, and the whole person seemed to have spied a road, step by step to reach a higher realm. Even above his body, there was even a trace of the Mid-Tian Sage aura lingering, as if half of his foot had entered the Mid-Tian Sage. Of course, the real person of Tian Xing is just an illusion. In the middle stage of the Sage, it is not so easy to break through. If you casually swallow a master of the middle stage of the Celestial Sage, you can make people break through the middle stage of the Sage. Would be so. Not enough. But even if he didn't touch the threshold of the middle stage of the heavenly sage, the strength in the body of the Tian Xing true person was at least several times higher than before, and the incomparably condensed sacred essence circulating in his body had reached the peak of the initial stage of the sage. The ultimate. This at least saved Tian Xingjin's thousands of years of hard work, allowing him more time to explore and break through the mid-Tian sage realm. Little dust, I. Both Tian Xin Zhenren and Ruyui felt the power in this body in amazement, Qin Chen saved countless years of hard work and made their future brighter and more promising. Everyone is a friend, you don't have to be polite, just raise your hand. Qin Chen waved his hand, not at ease at all. I hate it, why? God Turin shouted sternly, the midterm rule of the heavenly sage in his body was extracted, and he has become an ordinary person even without the power of the Earth Sage, becoming the most humble one. Fans hung, and it is fans hung. Ants in the... I am not reconciled. Why is this happening? I am a legend in my life, surpassing the heavens, being born as a genius, becoming a sage, and then getting many adventures, becoming a midterm giant, and now everything is reduced to ashes. I am not reconciled. Tu Renchen jumped up suddenly, his life was burning, and he wanted to change his life against the sky. In the heavens, any heavenly sage is a legend, with extraordinary experiences. Every life of a heavenly sage is a legendary history, and everyone is the protagonist. But now, the glorious path of God Turin has come to an end. Do you still want to change your fate against the sky? Qin Chen sneered and blasted a punch. Suddenly, a terrifying fist swept the past and the future, and instantly landed on God Tu Ren. Pang! The blood flew horizontally, and then, the blood chi was steaming, and the whole person of Tu Ren Shen was bombarded with a punch and turned into nothingness. Even the blood chi was not left, as if he had never appeared in this world. Petal! On the field, countless high levels of Wang Gu building were pale and ashen. Cruel! too cruel, this guy is simply a demon, lawless. Okay, this slaughter god has been killed by Ben Shao, and no one will destroy our business anymore. Qin Chen said lightly to the Tian Xin poster, if the people behind this slaughter god want to be investigated, then let them come to work for me, but then. 
Ben Shaok is not so good at talking. Qin Chen looked at the upper floors of the eternal buildings, shining through everything, and said coldly, as a disciple of Tianzuo, who came to your eternal building to do business, he was met by you and the god of slaughter. Intimidation, threats, if things go wrong. Ben Shao doesn't know what will be done, let the people behind you weigh it clearly, well, you guys go away. Qin Chen said coldly, without giving any face. The high levels of those eternal buildings only dared not say a word, left in embarrassment and fled in panic. Well, Tian Xing, sit down, let's talk about business. Qin Chen sat down, put his arms around Sisi, and said with a smile. The landlord Tian Xing is still hooded now, and shook his head and said, Little dust, what you said, just say, what do you need, do you want the heavenly holy veins? I will mobilize for you immediately. This sub-building has five permissions at a time. No matter how much it is, you just need to speak up, and I will report to my branch immediately. They know what happened today, and they will never refuse. The original poster of Tian Xing is not an idiot either, he can see at a glance that Qin Chen is cleaning up the trouble for him, otherwise he wouldn't say this to those high-level officials, and he couldn't help being grateful. As long as today's events are reported, the other factions of the Wang Gu Tower may no longer dare to easily target him. A disciple of Tian Gong Tian Jiao who is so majestic, they have to weigh the consequences, and the highest level of the Wang Gu Tower is not an idiot, he can. The Tian Jiao disciple who is enough to replace the Wang Yilu and Tian Jiao to cooperate, and if it is too late to fawn, how can he punish him? He knew that his position in the Guanggan Mansion sub-building was completely stable, and he might even accept a more important position. And all this was brought by Qin Chen. Five items, too few. Qin Chen shook his head, I took out all the treasures from the Necrosphere and the Turin God. You see, how much can be exchanged, based on normal business, and, is your Wang Gu Tower farther away? Ancient Saint Veins, such as, Saint Lord level transaction. Holy Master level. The original poster of Tian Xing was taken aback and shook his head repeatedly, don't think about it, little dust, the ancient holy veins of the Saint Master class are all strategic treasures for us in the eternal building, and they won't be traded at all. Let me tell you. The voice of the original poster of Tian Xing was lowered, and he said carefully, our biggest ancestor in the Eternal Building is rumored to be a half-step Saint Master. If there is a Saint Master class treasure, the ancestor himself is not enough to cultivate, how can he trade it out? So, Qin Chen nodded, and he asked, any of the ancient holy veins of the Saint Master level are heaven-defying treasures, and the Saint Master level masters will fight for it. How could it be easily sold? In the voice, Qin Chen I have taken all the treasures of Kang Yu and Tu and Tu Ren God. Come out. At a time, more than 200 earth level holy veins flew across, and countless holy soldiers lingered, forming a kingdom of treasures. This is, the ancient sage soldiers, these are all good treasures, I'll calculate. The landlord Tian Xing pinched his fingers, and got the result, little dust, your treasures are worth about 10 days in total. Level Ancient Holy Veins, if you are in a hurry, I can give you five first, and the remaining five will come back to you. If you don't in a hurry, I can try to apply for a middle grade Heavenly Ancient Sacred Vein from above to reach these ten Heavenly Ancient Sacred Veins. However, if you can, I suggest that you exchange for an Ancient Sacred Vein of mid-level Heavenly Rank. Although I don't have this authority, I am sure that I can make the vein behind me pay this price. Tao. A heavenly middle grade ancient sacred vein. Qin Chen's eyes brightened. The ancient sacred veins are not only divided into the earth level and the sky level, but the same level is also divided into three middle and upper ranks, and a middle rank of the sky is roughly equal to ten lower ranks. The key is that the sacred energy of the middle rank of the sky, more condensed, more vigorous, absorbed. It is also more convenient, especially for Qin Chen, it is more effective than the ten low-grade heavenly veins. 
Besides, after Qin Chen killed the god Turin, he already had four ordinary heavenly ancient sacred veins. He didn't need much for the time being, and he would have resources to grant him after he entered heavenly work. Well, I'm not in a hurry for the time being, so I will exchange for an ancient sacred vein of heavenly grade middle grade. Qin Chen made a decision. With so many treasures, all traded, only one ancient holy vein, Qin Chen was not unhappy, but rather happy. He already has four ordinary heavenly ancient sacred veins, plus an intermediate celestial ancient sacred vein, maybe he will be able to step into the early stage peak realm as soon as possible. What he needs most now is his cultivation base. Whether it is to rescue Kyungsu and Ruyu or to relieve the crisis in Yeami Mansion, he needs him to upgrade his cultivation base as soon as possible. Okay, little dust, wait for my good news, so, you put these treasures away first, and wait for me to apply for the middle grade ancient sacred veins, and then inform you. Tian Xing said. That doesn't have to be the case. Ben Shao can trust you to do business with your Tian Xing landlord, and besides, Ben Shao believes that you are not greedy for Mo Ben Shao's things in Wang Gulu. Qin Chen said indifferently. Okay, you should deal with the aftermath first, this slaughter matter, everything can be pushed to Ben Shao, are you Rui stays, I have to ask some things about Chindi Pavilion. Qin Chen settled his mind and began to inquire about Chen Dij. Originally, Qin Chen planned to keep Sisi in the Wang Gu building, but now it seems that Wang Gu building is not safe because the factions inside are very complicated, so this plan was cancelled. From Ru Yui's mouth, Qin Chen also understood what happened during his absence. Ao Qingling and Qin Tingting have joined Tian Jiao and are receiving special training to attack the realm of Heavenly Sage. Tian Jiao's resources are only stronger than their Wang Gu building. Since Ru Yui can survive in the forbidden area of Wang Gu building. Saint to heaven, so Ao. Qingling and Qin Tingting will obviously not slow down much. In addition, Tiangong's refining division has also completed the assessment. A group of top refining divisions have entered the division, received training, and received training. Qin Chen is already much late. It is said that Master Kanaha has Qin Chen left without permission. Tian Jiao has been questioned internally. In addition, Chindi Pavilion also has an office in Guangan Mansion, but it is only a small office to communicate the connection between Guangan Mansion and Yunso. Currently, Chindi Pavilion is not enough. The strength of developing business in Guangan Prefecture. Think about it, even the sub-buildings of the Wang Gu Tower will be bullied by the mid-term giants of the Heavenly Sage like Turin God. Chindi Pavilion has no backstage, and opening a shop rashly will surely be troublesome. It seems that I am not in a hurry for the time being. Qin Chen thought, the Chindi Pavilion will be opened sooner or later in Guangan Mansion, but I have to wait for me to establish a firm foothold in heaven. Then, Ju Xing Tian, they will also stabilize the dead spirit realm, and they can get from the dead spirit realm. A steady stream of resources are being delivered. Okay, I have already understood everything. I will go to Tian Jiao to report now. If there is news about the heavenly middle grade ancient sacred veins of the Tian Xing poster, remember to notify me as soon as possible. Qin Chen flew out of the eternal building, booming, he tore through the restrictions of the eternal building, left forcefully, and walked extremely fast. When everyone in the eternal building reacted, Qin Chen was completely gone. SHH. After Qin Chen left, many high-level and powerful people in this Wang Gu building all breathed a sigh of relief at the same time, and then one of the half-step heavenly sages, with a puff, actually sat on the ground, as if collapsed. How can there be such a terrifying evildoer in this heaven, scary, scared to death? The original poster of Tian Xing and Miss Ruri are actually related to such a fierce man. It seems that our attitude will need to be changed in the future. Otherwise, we will become cannon fodder if we are caught between the two in the future. Hey, what are you afraid of? This time Qin Chen killed Senior Turin God, and the news reached the headquarters, so I don't know how to deal with it. Headquarters? 
You think too much. Didn't you hear that? Then Qin Chen is a disciple of the Tiangong's refining division. In addition, it is Turenchen who did it first. The headquarters does not dare to challenge Tianzuo. A disciple of the division of the refining artifact division of Tian work? Do you really believe it? What's wrong with this, don't you know that this time, the real person Xing Zhen suddenly transferred from the state below to Guanggan Mansion as the sub-host, because of Hishan work? I got a relationship, I was a little skeptical before, but now I completely believe it. Let's not mix things up with things like this in the future. Yes, don't know how to die. These high-level faces looked at each other and looked at each other, completely frightened and afraid to confront the original poster of Tian Xing. Qin Chen flew out of the Wanggu building and felt happy. After the host of Tian Xing and the others transferred to Guanggan Mansion, it would be more convenient in the future. And I got a lot of treasures, and soon there was even a middle-ranked treasure of the Heavenly Sage. If it is absorbed by myself and breaks through the peak of the early days of the Heavenly Sage, how tyrannical will it be? Dust, didn't you say that you let me stay in the Wanggu building? Why did you suddenly change your mind again? Chen Sisi asked in confusion. Wanggu Tower is still in chaos. I don't worry about leaving you alone. In this way, you urge King Yuan to, to enter my universe and fortune jade disc, and then I will use the magic of heaven and earth, let the power of time cover my destiny. Even if you and me enter the sky. Work, it should not be discovered. Qin Chen thought for a while and finally decided. Whoosh! Immediately, Chen Sisi took the Kang Yuan map and quickly entered the depths of the Jade Disk of Good Fortune in the universe, and Qin Chen directly took out a heavenly sacred vein to stimulate the power of the years and let Sisi in the depths of the Jade Disk of Good Fortune in the universe practice, and he himself flew away from the place where he was working. From Ruyui's mouth, Qin Chen already knew the location of Guanggan Fusion's work branch. He entered the teleportation formation inside Guanggan Mansion, teleported all the way, swish, and shuttled through the void of Guanggan Mansion's 10,000 realms. After about an hour, he stopped. What appeared before his eyes was a vast and boundless building, suspended in the depths of the endless void, magnificent and majestic. This is the work of heaven. Qin Chen was shocked. Unlike other forces on Guanghanfu Street, the work branch of this day is located in a void, surrounded by the sky and the earth, empty, shrouded by terrifying prohibition, in the entire void. Only on this day is a power rising. The majestic atmosphere. In front of this void, there is a huge archway. The archway goes directly into the clouds and condenses in the sky into the three big characters Tianzhou. Behind the archway is a step leading to the sky. The open space in front of the archway was empty, there was no one, and no one dared to walk in. Qin Chen's figure shook, and he was about to go up the steps. Hum. Just as Qin Chen just stepped up the steps, suddenly, boundless rays of light bloomed, one after another restraints, like the chains of heaven, sealing all the void, and wrapping Qin Chen, these chains carried the atmosphere of destroying the world, Qin Dust has a feeling. Even his body, as long as he dared to break through, he would definitely be injured by this forbidden breath, no suspense. Who? I trespass my job. A rumbling roar resounded, and then, from the steps, two figures flew down. They turned out to be two young people wearing disciple costumes, with sword eyebrows, stars, and demeanor. Pian Pian, between gestures, exuding a breathtaking atmosphere turned out to be two tops. Grade Tian Jiao. The two looked at Qin Chen, hum, Qin Chen felt a strong gaze, trying to penetrate and see through. But Qin Chen shuddered slightly, and then dispelled these two eyes. The ancient qi in his body surged, like a demon like a god, not moving like a mountain. It is naturally impossible for the two strong men of the early days of Heavenly Sage to see through him. Repair 4 Two of you, my name is Qin Chen. I am the champion of the appraisal at Yunzhou by the Tianzhu Refining Division. Because of personal affairs, 
it was a little late, so I am here to report. Qin Chen took out the token given by Master Muye and said calmly. But I was secretly surprised. This day's work was so big, the two Tianjiao from the early days were actually arranged to watch the door here. Of course, the two looked young, but they should be a little old in fact, but no matter what, they are also a heaven. Saint. What? You are Qin Chen. The two disciples were shocked, their eyes flickered, and they kept looking at Qin Chen, as if they had heard of Qin Chen's name, as if they were looking at a rare figure with endless curiosity. Haha, <laughs> it turned out to be Master Qin Chen. We are disciples of the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department. Today it happens to be us on duty, guarding the portal. Since the Master passed the assessment of the Refining Division, please come with us. The two suddenly laughed, urged the Jade Pendant on their bodies to release Qin Chen's restraint, and then leaned forward to lead Qin Chen forward. Unexpectedly, this Qin Chen is so young. Looking at the aura on his body, it shouldn't be too big. It's really amazing to win the Yunzhou appraisal of the Tiangong Crafts Division, but unfortunately, he violated Tiangong's rules. Actually did not follow the team back to work in the first time for training. It has caused a lot of unhappiness at the top. I heard that even Master Kanaha has been trained, think about it, this Qin Chen hasn't joined Tianzuo, so he is so free and unrestrained, after he joins, it will be fine. Maybe he is proud of himself? The talent is different. Indeed, everyone who can win the appraisal champion of the refining division is a world-class figure, but our work is different from ordinary forces. Who can come in, which one is not Tian Jiao? If everyone has to open the back door. Is that okay? SHHH, let's just say a few words, it doesn't matter to us anyway, we are only from the warrior department so we can lead the way with peace of mind, but then there will be good shows. I heard that many Tianjiao who joined the refining division this time are all very unconvinced. The two people led the way, communicating with each other's spirits, very secretive, but they were caught by Qin Chen's sky repairing technique and heavenly soul forbidden technique, and they all heard it. It seems that working this day is not a place for nothing. Qin Chen shook his head. However, he didn't take it to heart. Soldiers came to cover the water. At this moment, in a certain space of the tall tower in the core building of Tian Work, a group of extraordinary old men are sitting here, and the leader is an old man exuding a magnificent body, with a withered face and extremely long eyebrows, as if sitting down. Under him, there are a group of masters wearing the robes of the master craftsmen, all of them are extraordinary, and Master Kanaha is in the crowd. Kanaha, when will the disciple named Qin Chen you recruited in Yunzhou come to report? A lot of time has passed now. The basic training for our newly recruited refiner has ended. You the disciple recruited hasn't arrived yet. Come on, is it too much? Hey, lawlessness, what do you think of my day job? For personal matters, I even gave up joining my day job for the first time. Does this kind of guy think of my day job? Kanaha, please tell me, when will that kid be able to report? I think he is a yellow-mouthed kid. Many masters snorted and asked Kanaha. Kanaha was accused by everyone, but his expression remained unchanged, saying, everyone, that Qin Chen, is indeed the most talented craftsman I have ever seen. Not to mention, everyone knows his achievements. I personally think this kind of arrogant is worth staying in my day to work, even if it's lawless, it's okay? Now that the demons are ready to move, my day job has suffered heavy losses on the front line, and this has increased the recruitment. Is it because of some so-called onerous stereotypes? Will such a goddess give up? Everyone, this is too much, right? An old man frowned and said, Kanaha. I admit that the Qin Chen you submitted has a good test result, but that doesn't mean anything. This time, the refiner Tian Jiao we brought back from other states is also no small thing, such as Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun both have great talents in refining craftsmanship. It didn't take long for them to enter the heavenly work, 
and they had already broken through the heavenly holy realm. With good guidance, the refining of heavenly holy soldiers is just around the corner, and even for them, there is no complaint, obediently obey the call, come to train, what Chin Chen of yours, but only a half-step heavenly saint, even if your talent is amazing, what qualifications do you have to be so presumptuous? Yes, my daily work is based in the heavens. The most important thing is the rules. If the rules are broken, how can I develop? Some masters even drank coldly. Really? Master Kanaha sneered, then how did I hear that in the process of becoming elders, you have more or less violated the rules of some day's work? Not to mention, even our Guangan the head of the fusion work branch, when? When he was at the headquarters in 2010, he even disturbed the headquarters. He was still sent to sit in Guangan mansion, and he was not expelled. Bold. Kanaha, we are discussing the question of Qin Chen, you dare to slander Lord Tribe. Presumptuous. Several master refiners were furious. Am I wrong? The reason why you conquered the old man is just to get a place to enter that place. Master Kanaha sneered, even if Qin Chen doesn't come, the Bai Yutang that the old man brought back is also a top refiner. Tian Jiao, and you. The Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun that we brought back broke through the realm of Heavenly Sage. Even if you target the old man, Bai Yutang can also compete with your disciples. Master Kanaha sneered. You. Other master craftsmen were furious again and again. All right. At this moment, the old man who had not spoken suddenly opened his eyes, buzzing, in the void, as if two lightning bolts flashed. Since that Qin Chen has passed the assessment, he is a disciple of my daily work. Kanaha is right. My daily work is not a disciplined disciple, but a real Tian Jiao. Now the demons are ready to move, and the human race is in danger. What rules are there? Cannot violate. Auntie? As long as there are talents, I give him the position of the great elder, and the same is true for you. As long as we break through, it is not impossible for me to retire and give way. Great elder. The other masters said in surprise. I'm talking about the facts, so there is no need to discuss Qin Chen. When Qin Chen arrives, the old man will test it personally. If there is indeed talent, then it will be fine. Just like your disciples in this assessment, what are you fighting for? The name of the chief disciple, right? So what Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun and Bai Yutang are all competing with each other? It seems that there have been several conflicts. Making a big noise? What I want in my job is this kind of atmosphere. As long as I don't kill people, let them compete. The real Tiger King can only be born through competition not just training. The old man with long eyebrows said lightly. Yes. The other masters bowed their heads. Okay. At this moment, the great elder raised his head, showing a look of surprise. It seems that someone has come to work for us, he <laughs> he, what a coincidence, it is Qin Chen. The great elder said with a smile. What? Qin Chen is here. The corners of the mouths of the master refiners present were all surprised. At this moment, Qin Chen followed the two young men to the end of the steps. What appeared before Qin Chen was a vast square. Around the square, there were buildings, and the most magnificent one was the one in front of Qin Chen. Tower. Standing into the sky, boundless and mighty. On the square, a famous master passed by, all exuding a terrifying aura and each was extraordinary. Among them, there were as many as the peerless earth saints, half-step heaven saints, and some heaven saint masters, each with extraordinary aura. In addition, many people have a smell of material and fire, which is contaminated by the refining masters who sacrifice the refining fire and refining materials all the year round. Everyone flew by while talking with each other, and suddenly saw Qin Chen being led up and they all showed surprise. Hey, who is this kid? I haven't seen it before. Why did the guard bring in outsiders? So young, 
is it one of the warriors I recruited this time? That's not right, the martial arts recruited by our day job are now training and practicing in the secret area. Only the recruited refiner can move freely. Is it a newly recruited refiner disciple? It's even more impossible. I have heard of all the newly promoted refiners this time, but this kid is not among them. Who is that? Many disciples were surprised. Master Qin Chen, this is the core location of our Tianzuo, but although you have Tianzuo's disciple token, you have not formally joined Tianzuo. Master Qin Chen, please wait here again, let's go and report. The two young men were surrounded by the crowd, their expressions were a little unnatural, and after speaking to Qin Chen, they immediately went up to report and left Qin Chen in the square. Qin Chen Hearing what the two guards said to Qin Chen, everyone on the court shook, and all the fiery eyes fell on Qin Chen, as if looking at a monster. This is the first disciple who passed the appraisal of the refining division in the history of Tianzuo and did not join Tianzuo for the first time, but instead was going to deal with private affairs. His reputation has long been spread in Tianzuo. If Qin Chen's name is a little smaller, it's nothing. The key is that Qin Chen is the first in the Yunzo assessment this time, and he broke into the ninth floor of the ancient sacred tower, using half-step Tian Sheng cultivation as the training. Made a heavenly sage soldier, these various legends. It made everyone very curious about Qin Chen. Originally, everyone was skeptical of these rumors, but this time the Yunzo assessment and the anomaly of Bai Yutang. After joining Tian Jiao, Bai Yutang showed amazing talent and has become Tian Jiao this time. Wide Han Mansion recruited disciples of refiners, one of the top three refiners. He Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun are also known as one of the three outstanding talents recruited by the Tiangong Refining Division this time, and all three of them, in a very short time, under the cultivation of Tiangong, made a breakthrough in the early days of Tian Sheng and achieved success. Heavenly Saint As long as the three people refining the Celestial Saint weapon, they will be able to break away from the status of ordinary disciples and become the top talents of the core personnel as soon as they join the celestial work. What a majesty this is! Working in heaven, as long as the refiner becomes a master refiner of the celestial rank, he can get rid of the status of ordinary disciple and become the core personnel. This process is extremely long, and many people need to spend thousands of years to do it. Therefore, the three of Bai Yutang can become legends. And in order to compete for the position of the chief disciple of the refining division, Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun have competed several times and fought. Originally, Bai Yutang did not participate in it. But after hearing that the two competed for the title, they were also strong. Intervene. Just because he openly stated, in the work of heaven, the chief disciple, he only recognizes one person, that is, Qin Chen, the champion of Yunzo assessment. It is precisely because of Bai Yutang's words that Tian Jiao pays such attention to Qin Chen. What kind of character is it that can violate Tian's rules and make such a powerful Bai Yutang worship so much? Qin Chen has become a mystery in everyone's hearts. Now that Qin Chen appeared, the Tian Gong disciple level immediately caused a sensation. Elder, since Qin Chen has arrived, I will bring Qin Chen over now. Among the high towers, Master Muye also felt the breath of Qin Chen arriving at the square at this moment, and stood up for the first time to bring Qin Chen in. Elder Kanaha, wait a minute. But the elder stopped him, his eyes flashed, and said lightly, summon Qin Chen in no hurry and see how he performs. Master Kanaha's face suddenly changed, Elder, this, isn't it great? Who is the disciple who can join Tian Jiao, who is not a worldly figure, a lawless person, Qin Chen's previous movement in Tian Jiao is really true. It's too big. If many disciples were to know the news that Qin Chen came to report, something might happen. The matter is coming. Haha, <laughs> Elder Kanaha, didn't you say that the Qin Chen you recruited is unparalleled in the world? Why, are you still afraid that he will suffer a loss in the square? Don't worry, our daily work is not a dragon, 
a sea of swords, and there will be no problems. The elder whom Master Kanaha targeted before suddenly sneered. Master Kanaha sighed and had to give up. He also knew that the purpose of the great elder was to observe Qin Chen comprehensively. To blame, Qin Chen had to be peculiar. Now that the great elder speaks, he has no choice. Can only watch the changes. At the moment on the square, countless disciples had received news that they had gathered around. These disciples, ups and downs, there are earth saints and heaven saints, among them, there are more earth saints and half-step saints. Obviously they are all newly joined Tiangong craftsmen, but even the weakest earth saints are exuding a tyrannical aura, obviously all generation. The proud son of heaven, a prominent figure in Guanggan Mansion. They have now become introductory disciples of the great power in the heavens, Tian Gong, and they have been trained to be more promising than those like the Yunzhou governor. Working in heaven, breaking through the heavenly sage, that is the most basic requirement. If any refiner cannot break through to become the heavenly sage within 10,000 years, and refining the heavenly rank holy soldiers, it will be delegated by heavenly work and become the most common peripheral staff, working day after day. No disciple's name can be used. After all, heavenly work is a great power that crosses the entire celestial realm. In the ancient heavenly realm, it has a vast reputation. Although it belongs to the reconstruction, it is still astonishing in the realm like today. Compared with many sects in Guanggan Mansion, heavenly work is God. Dragon, they are ants. Oh? This is Qin Chen, doesn't it seem like it's so good? Hey, it's him. He broke the rules of our daily work. After the assessment, he didn't come to report, but went to do private affairs. Arrogant, presumptuous, I have been working in Tianzhou for so long, and this is the first time I have heard of this happening. Do you feel this son's cultivation base? Why can't I feel his cultivation base? Hey, you can't feel it. There seems to be a mist lingering on this child, which isolates my divine consciousness from the outside, and cannot see the true face. It is really not simple. What's not simple? Who doesn't know that Qin Chen is only half a statue? Buletin Tian Cheng, I'm afraid he has practiced some special secret technique to cover his own breath. If before, this kid could be regarded as a human being, but now Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun. The three masters of Bai Yutang have broken through the realm of the heavenly sage and achieved the best heavenly sage, this kid is a fart. He he, indeed, he has lost the training time he can best improve his cultivation level after joining Tian Jiao. He has lost too much. Many disciples watched Qin Chen, all talking, some looked playful, some sneered, and some seemed to see a plaything. Faced with so many top disciples onlookers, an ordinary person might have been frightened and weakened, and my heart was overwhelmed and anxious. But Qin Chen was indifferent. Under the eyes of everyone, he sat cross-legged like this, and the Saint Yuan in his body slowly flowed, closing his eyes to calm his mind. This heart is too big, right? Qin Chen's performance immediately made many people feel dissatisfied. Oh? This Qin Chen is so arrogant. It looks like he clearly doesn't pay attention to me. Even if he won the championship of Yunzhou assessment, but he came so late, how can he be arrogant? Don't worry, he won't be arrogant for long. We have secretly passed the news of Qin Chen's arrival to Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun. Wait for the two seniors to come and see how arrogant Qin Chen is. Breaking the rules and still being so minded, I don't know whether to say that he is confident or arrogant. He he, his good days are over. Brother Nan Tianyi has broken through the realm of heavenly sage not long ago, and he has cultivated into Nan Tian desperate heavenly art. Once this technique is performed, the vast sky will be enveloped, and it will last forever. Become the puppet of Brother Nan Tianyi. Yes, senior brother Nan Tianyi is the eldest son of our Nan family in Guanggan Mansion. He was originally the top martial artist in Guanggan Mansion and he also showed his amazing cultivation skills on the refining tool. There are rumors, Guanggan Mansion. 
all intend to recruit him, but he joined. It took us days to work. He he, with the strength of Nan Tianyi's senior apprenticeship, it is more than enough to join any force. I am afraid that he will be the first person among the crafting masters that we joined this time. Now after the breakthrough, even if he is right. Those old. The master refiner is not inferior at all. It is rumored that Nan's family is very satisfied with Nan Tianyi's brother, and even intends to pass on the position of patriarch to Nan Tianyi's brother, so that Nan Tianyi can lead the Nan's family to flourish in Guanggan Mansion, with the support of Nan's family. I'm afraid the Nantian First Division. Brother will work in heaven in the future, so he can easily become an elder. He will definitely become the chief disciple among us. You can't say that, senior brother Nan Tianyi is amazing, isn't senior brother Feng Liuyun so good? Senior brother Feng Liuyun also cultivated to the realm of heavenly sage, and it is said that senior brother Feng Liuyun has experienced wind and fire disaster since he was a child. Cut. Moreover, he is also the young pavilion master of the Fengjiun Pavilion of Guanggan Mansion, and Fengjiun Pavilion is not unknown to you. It is the top power of our Guanggan Mansion, not weaker than the Nan family. It is rumored that the pavilion master of Fengjiun Pavilion has been in retreat for thousands of years. It is said that once he has passed through the most mysterious state of the Holy Master, he will surely shake the world. Brother Bai Yutang is also not bad, the young master of Bao Kitang, Bao Kitang is our Guanggan mansion, in addition to the Tiangong branch and the Kuj, the top crafting force, with the craftsmanship, Brother Bai Yutang is extremely talented, and this time he also made breakthroughs. Arrived at the realm of Gashishanchen. Bai Yutang, he is also worthy of being a senior brother? He just lost to this Qin Chen once in the assessment. He actually said openly that he only recognized this Qin Chen as the chief disciple. This kind of person without courage, even if I am a small person. I don't like it. All kinds of discussions are endless and flow in secret. At this moment, a terrifying breath suddenly fell. It's brother Nan Tianyi who came out, look at it quickly. Suddenly, an endless gust of wind swept across the heavens and the earth and a thick blue sky was spreading out from the distant buildings, vast and mighty. In this endless sky, a vigorous figure appeared, like a king who controls the world. It is Nan Tianyi. Boom! The southern sky appeared one by one, and the entire square was full of tragic auras, and the mighty heavenly power was brewing on his body. The azure blue robe he was wearing was forged from starry sky silk, sparkling various runes, just like the sky. Cut down and condense. As soon as he appeared, countless disciples on the square stepped aside, as if courtiers were welcoming their emperor, and no one dared to fight against Nan Tianyi's breath. Brother Nan Tianyi. I have seen Brother Nan Tianyi. Many disciples salute respectfully. Although they are all disciples who have joined Heaven's work, once they enter, they are already divided into ranks. Your Excellency is Qin Chen. As soon as the southern sky fell, his gaze fell on Qin Chen. Suddenly, a terrifying gaze fell on Qin Chen like a divine light, sweeping around, as if to see Qin Chen clearly from the inside out. Hey! Nan Tianyi's gaze actually cuts everything and penetrates the soul. As soon as Qin Chen was stared at by this gaze, the Saint Yuan in his body immediately reacted. Nan Tianyi's gaze was not only a gaze, but also with a special power of prying, it actually wanted to penetrate his body. Stealing the sky and changing the moon. But Qin Chen just smiled coldly, the Saint Yuan in his body twirled gently, and an invisible force immediately enveloped his whole body. No matter how Nan Tianyi scanned Qin Chen's body, he could never penetrate Qin Chen's body, hazy. Can't see clearly at all. Hey? Interesting. Nan Tianyi sneered, my son's piercing technique can't see through your cultivation level. This concealment technique is really powerful, yes, yes, I heard that you won the first place in Yunzo assessment, and even killed Yunzo. The lord of the state? Even the boy Bai Yutang admires you so much, 
you must be elected as the chief disciple. This world has always wanted to see and know, but unfortunately you did not enter the sky work in the first time. Now it is just right for you to come. Let Ben Chiza try my Nantian despair desperate power to see if your excellency is as powerful as the rumors said. Nantian Yi said indifferently, walking forward slowly, he stepped out step by step, the terrible light of the sky surged over his body, as if he went wherever he went, and became his kingdom. He is the incarnation of the sky, the ruler of the heavens and the earth. Under his breath, the other disciples felt a deep suffocation. Even the educated and masters of Yunzo have long been the existence of the heavenly sage. Under his breath, there was also an impulse to kneel down on the spot and bow down. This Nantianyi is too strong. Nantianyi, don't grab the business of the young pavilion master, this Qin Chen is my prey. Suddenly, there was a loud shout in the square. Boom! A group of terrifying wind and cloud aura, like chaos opening up engulfed in an endless magnificent aura, suddenly descended from the sky. This is a figure, the whole body is enveloped by the aura of annihilation, as soon as it falls, it bursts out with a power that destroys the sky and the earth. The terrifying light blasts faintly against the power of Nan Tianyi's sky, and it is another heavenly sage. It is the romantic one of the three outstanding. This is a young man with a majestic figure and an ancient complexion, with a large skeleton and a dragon and a tiger's step. No matter where he goes, wherever the wind and clouds swept, everyone on the square couldn't bear his strength and backed up. Feng Liuyun looked at Qin Chen, and his pupils appeared in two colors. The left eye was wind and the right eye was clouds. The wind and clouds swept across, forming an aura of annihilation. This kid is Qin Chen? Does it look ordinary? However, Bai Yu Tang's kid can admire him and think of some tricks, but unfortunately, your daring to defy the rules of work is too rampant. Today, this young pavilion owner I want you to know that some things cannot be violated. Feng Liuyun walked out slowly, his breath rushing into the sky. Qin Chen, I have nothing to celebrate with you. On the contrary, I admire you for daring to act, to openly slay the lord of Yunzhou and occupy the land of Yunzhou but your limelight is too high, even Bai Yutang said that you are the one our day job recruited all the big disciples among the refiners this time. This makes me very upset. I must press you down. This romantic cloud said coldly, sonorously, as if gold and iron crossed. Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun, don't bother you too. Boom. At this moment, another terrifying aura came. This was a fat boy who was Bai Yutang. Ha ha ha, Qin Chen, you are finally here. As soon as this Bai Yutang fell, the terrifying heavenly sage aura surged on his body, so round and extremely terrifying, he came along with a big laugh. Don't worry, with my little master, no one can touch you today. Bai Yutang smiled at Qin Chen, and then looked at Nantianyi and Fengliuyun, Nantianyi, Fengliuyun. This is Tian Gong Square. Why are you two going crazy here? Why are you so wild? Don't let go. Bai Yutang, I'm afraid you can't take this place today. Nan Tian felt a green finger on his hand, and said coldly, This Qin Chen, ruining the rules of the sky, the two of us are just going to teach him how to behave, if you insist on intervening, don't blame us for teaching it with you. Bai Yutang, there's nothing to do with you here, so go ahead. Feng Liuyun also said coldly. Humph, I am here today, none of you can deal with Qin Chen. Bai Yutang's body of heavenly sacred principles circulated all the way, bursting out a horrible breath, and said to Qin Chen, Qin Chen, if they want to deal with you, they have to step over from my little master first. Oh? Why are you helping me? Qin Chen? who had always been sitting cross-legged and calmly, finally opened his eyes at this moment and said lightly. This. Bai Yutang was stunned, of course it's because both of us came from Yunzhou. Besides, you tested in Yunzhou, defeated me and won the championship. If you let them both defeat you, 
is not my Bai Yutang's face that I lost. Besides, don't think too much, thinking that Bai Yutang admires you, so I stand up for you. I just hope that you will be promoted to the Heavenly Saint as soon as possible. In this day's work, we will divide the victory and defeat again. The road is still long. Today I will take this Liangzi for you. I hope you can compete with me again after you break through the Heavenly Sage. By that time, I will definitely not lose to you. I belong to the champion of Xiao. Lord, I will definitely take it back myself. Bai Yutang said proudly. Ha ha ha. Hearing this, Qin Chen laughed loudly. At this moment, the body he had been sitting on suddenly stood up. Ha ha ha, this is the capital you rely on. Whatever the desperate heavenly powers from the south, you dare to take out the stuff like a house. Qin Chen's original ordinary body suddenly became extremely tall, and his whole body burst into chaos. A mighty wild ancient atmosphere burst out all of a sudden, and the whole figure turned into a god, stepping out, facing the vastness that had descended. Looking at the sky, a cruel smile appeared on his face. When the power of the desperate Madra touched his body, it collapsed every inch, like ice and snow. Nan Tianyi, if you joined Tian Zhou and broke through the heavenly sage, you think you are a real genius? It's ridiculous, you think that I didn't enter Tian Zhou in the first time, just a half-step sage? In fact, I also broke through to Tian Sheng. The realm is just hiding the strength, suppressing your scum, between the three breaths, the young master is too long, and he will die for me. Qin Chen's spirit is like a storm of the last days, sweeping crazily, with supreme will. Then, his figure moved. Fast, incredibly fast. Qin Chen jumped up and swept across with a fist. His fist was faster than his divine consciousness, just like the primordial god king, appearing in the air, showing an overwhelming aura, and his whole body was violent and endless. Power is gathered in his palm. Boom! Qin Chen blasted out with a punch, and Nan Tian suddenly shook his whole body. The infinite desperate power of the sky broke and collapsed. At the same time, the bodyguard Saint Yuan on his body collapsed completely without even a breath. Heavenly Sage! There is a feeling that the laws are not working. He has experienced countless battles in his life, but he has never encountered such a terrifying breath, like a king and he can't breathe. What is this? Even if you also break through to Heavenly Sage, how can you have such a tyrannical power? Nan Tianyi roared wildly, and countless palm prints changed from both palms. The vast desperate hand prints were vast and crazily punched out. After a tragic storm, like a demon god, destroying the sky and destroying the earth, piercing the void of the heavens, and pouring countless powers. It fell down. But Qin Chen's palm shook. Under the cover of the ancient aura, the Saint Yuan in his body suddenly swelled, and the terrifying Saint Yuan's power exploded in his fist, instantly rising. In a flash. No one reacted, Qin Chen gave another punch. Boom. This punch was even more violent, and the entire Tian work square shook violently, and countless prohibitions flickered, as if the sky had collapsed and all the palm prints of Nan Tianyi were shattered. Puff! Then everyone saw Nan Tianyi, who was still invincible before, was hit by the volley, and a mouthful of blood spurted out of his mouth. Their big brother Nan Tianyi, with the punch, was extremely embarrassed, no longer the sheik before. What is going on? Why, why are you so powerful? Nan Tian rushed with blood in a mouthful, and almost collapsed all over his body. His fierce heart was aroused, and an azure blue Saint Yuan armor appeared on his body, and the blood in his body was burning, and he wanted to shoot again. Kneel down. But Qin Chen didn't give him a chance to fight back at all. A thunderous roar sounded on a sunny day, and Qin Chen strolled in the courtyard. In an instant, he appeared in front of Nan Tianyi and the ancient atmosphere swept into the universe and directly overwhelmed it. Come down! Immediately, Nan Tianyi's armor broke and his clothes burst. 
There were cracks everywhere on his body. Blood was sprayed from it. He couldn't help roaring again and again. However, under this terrifying force, he was unable to resist and his knees were all of a sudden. The pressure was bent, and he kneeled before Qin Chen in full view. What? Nan Tianyi went crazy, his canthus was cracked, and he roared frantically, but it was useless. Under Qin Chen's power, he was like an ant, kneeling on the square alive, unable to move. Senior brother Nan Tianyi was beaten to his knees. My God, am I dazzled? Or hallucinations? God, I must have had a stroke, I actually had a stroke. Many disciples screamed like crazy, and couldn't believe everything in front of them. Who is brother Nan Tianyi? The eldest son of the Nan family, the future patriarch of the Nan family, the invincible Tianjiao of Guanggan Mansion, one of the three masters of the Tiangong Refining Division, an invincible figure, he was also domineering and powerful before. Just a few breaths. Kneeling down to Qin Chen in full view, this kind of strong contrast made any normal person think that he had a stroke. No one would have imagined that Qin Chen would be so strong. If everything in front of him was true, Qin Chen would not be a joke, but a myth. Ah, beast, I am the world's arrogant, the oldest son of the Nan clan, how can I kneel down? Nan Tianyi also felt that he knelt down, and the boundless shame poured out from deep in his heart. His face turned blood red and then turned to purple. In his body, the breath of lifespan surged. This is burning life. Desperately. Indeed, in his capacity, letting him kneel is even more uncomfortable than killing him. He would rather stand to die than kneel to live. Want to resist. However, Qin Chen didn't give him a chance to desperately. In a sneer, the ancient energy surged again, and the power condensed in Nan Tianyi's body was instantly crushed, booming, a terrible ancient energy. Turn it into a ban and seal Nan Tianyi firmly. Imprint, keep his kneeling position. Say you are allowed to kneel, just let you kneel. Qin Chen drank coldly, then when he turned his head, his eyes fell on Feng Liuyun, kneel down for me as well as you. You. Feng Liuyun was frightened and shocked at this moment. He never expected that Qin Chen would defeat Nan Tianyi like this, with almost no effort, just a few breaths at his fingertips. Nan Tian Yuju. Sheng Sheng knelt down. This is ten times more difficult than killing Nan Tianyi. In an instant, fear emerged in Feng Liuyun's heart. He and Nan Tianyi had not only fought once or twice, and he knew the horror of the other party, and he was between him. But now, once Nan Tian was defeated by Qin Chen so easily, he knelt on the spot, what about himself? At this moment, Feng Liuyun's retreat has already emerged in his heart, and he said in a deep voice, Qin Chen, don't go too far. I am the young master of Fenjiun Pavilion. If you do this today, you will not only offend me Fenjiun Pavilion, but also offended all the new promotion we are present. No matter how strong you are and offend everyone, you will definitely be unable to work in heaven in the future. Offend all refiners. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, he glanced at the disciples of Tianzui who had been talking about it before, and sneered again and again, it's just some rubbish, if there is something to be offended, I dare to say half a word, let them kneel down together today. Stop talking nonsense, kneel down for me. Qin Chen smiled coldly, stepped forward and pressed his palm to Feng Liuyun. His expression was like swatting a fly, and he didn't care about it. Feng Jiun got I. Feng Liuyun saw an endless storm of annihilation burst out of his eyes. The black storm swept in like a violent wind. At the same time, his body hurriedly jumped upwards, he was about to break away from control and escape here. But Qin Chen's wild ancient aura swept out, covering the entire square, and the annihilating storm displayed by Feng Liuyun hit the wild ancient sky, as if flies hit the wall, bursting one after another and continuously falling apart. Boom! Feng Liuyun's body was blocked by the qi of the ancients and fell all of a sudden. Qin Chen flipped it over with his hand, 
and Feng Liuyun was suddenly suppressed, and fell on the ground with a clatter, his body exploded, and large swaths of Saint Yuan exploded. Damn it, the wind and remnants of the cloud, all things returned to the ruins. Feng Liuyun was frightened and angry. He couldn't possibly kneel down. His whole body actually started to burn, the essence of blood and the breath of life surging, especially a pair of eyes, turned into black and white, woo-woo, howling ghosts, terrible murderous, facing. Qin Chen counterattacked. Rage. A country of wind and clouds appeared all around, and everything turned into wind and wind. In that wind and wind, soldiers of gods and demons with hideous faces and armors appeared. Wielding a saber. Carry out a frantic attack around Qin Chen. And Feng Liayun herself, like a Fenjiun god demon, wanted to break through the shackles of Qin Chen and kill him. Ha ha ha, in the hands of the young master, still want to resist. Qin Chen sneered with disdain, and immediately displayed a trace of killing aura in the ancient aura. Suddenly, the murderous aura boiled between the heaven and the earth, and the wind and cloud aura displayed by Feng Liuyun suddenly became riddled with holes. In the next moment, Qin Chen's big hand was already covered. What? Feng Liuyun screamed and fell abruptly, his coat robes burst, and he knelt down with a bang, kneeling in a row with Nan Tian one by one. Oh oh oh! The countless ancient qi was suppressed, like a billowing torrent, Feng Liuyun's breath burst suddenly, and the balloon that was pierced by the needle vented away in an instant. When many people saw this scene, they almost passed out in shock. Kneel down, senior brother Feng Liuyun also kneeled down. So strong. Countless disciples broke out in a cold sweat, strong as Nan Tianyi and senior brother Feng Liuyun were instantly defeated by this Qin Chen, kneel here and change I'm afraid we can't stop them with a finger, and we'll all kneel down in no time. This world. How could there be such a scary person? Yunzo champion, isn't it so strong? Why is there such a strong person in this world? It's no wonder that senior brother Bai Yutang only recognizes Qin Chen, and he really has his reason. Fortunately, senior brother Bai Yutang didn't target Qin Chen, otherwise, I'm afraid it would be three senior brothers kneeling here. Many disciples looked horrified and looked at Qin Chen as if they saw a devil. From the depths of their hearts, endless awe and fear emerged. In the Tianyu continent, the strong is respected. Although Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun, and Bai Yutang entered the work of the sky first, they have left a strong majesty in the hearts of other disciples of this year, but at this moment, all the majesty is the smoke disappears. In the eyes of everyone, only Qin Chen remained, turning into an invincible figure. If someone now asks who is the chief disciple that Tianjia recruited this time, there is no doubt that everyone will say it is Qin Chen, and there will be no second possibility. The shadow of Qin Chen's invincibility has planted a deep mark in the hearts of everyone, and status and authority have begun to be established. You guys, who else would like to ask about Ben Shao's methods? It doesn't matter, even if he takes the shot, Ben Shao happens to be active. Qin Chen said indifferently to the remaining Tianzuo disciples. Wow! All the disciples present were like hell, retreating crazily, and who would dare to come up and die? Master Qin Chen is mighty. Strong, this is the real Tian Jiao. Compared with senior brother Qin Chen, Nan Tianyi and senior brother Feng Liuyun are nothing at all. Have you seen that even if senior brother Qin Chen is so powerful, after coming to work in heaven, he will behave in a proper manner, motionless, not showing off his power at all. This is the real arrogance. Many people complimented. In the heavens, everyone worships the strong. Qin Chen broke the rules of Tian's work at the beginning and provokes the anger of the people. He can't wait for people and gods to be angry, but Qin Chen defeated Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun, everyone immediately. Changing his tone and honoring him as big brother, as for Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun, they have long been forgotten. Naked, nothing fancy. What? Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun knelt there, only feeling that their complexions were flushed, 
and their hearts were greatly humiliated. They knelt on the square, accepting pointers from many disciples, and watching. This kind of shame and shame enveloped the hearts of the two of them, making them unable to lift their heads. They knew that the power of their management was finally destroyed and became Qin Chen's stepping stone. They can't wait to find a place to drill down on the spot, but they can't even commit suicide now. Qin Chen's power completely imprisoned and sealed them, and they can only maintain the kneeling posture, as well as the movement of their minds. Other than that, no power can be used, and of course they cannot get up and move. Seeing that no one came up, Qin Chen didn't make a sound, but continued to sit cross-legged, closing his eyes and resting. He knew that if he made such a movement, he would naturally be known by the senior management of Tian Gong, and then sent someone to come. In fact, as Qin Chen expected, among the towers at this moment, the elders who have worked for countless days are going crazy, especially those strong men who support Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun, their eyes are red, and they can't wait to rush to Qin Chen. Severely suppressed. They finally recruited and cultivated the world's arrogant talents, so they were defeated by Qin Chen, faceless. If it hadn't been for the great elder to stop them, they would have been furious. Elder, Qin Chen is too much. As a disciple, he let his companion kneel on this square, lawless. I propose that he should be severely taught and punished severely. An elder roared. Ha ha ha, Elder Yunqi, it's too much. When Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun targeted Qin Chen before, I didn't say anything. Why do you have to punish others now that your people are dysfunctional? Tang Tang Elder, a little measure nothing at all, just fine. Laugh. Master Kanaha laughed, and he was so happy, he didn't expect that after Qin Chen had left, his strength improved so much. This time he worked the whole day, and his face was greatly changed. Master Kanaha, you are presumptuous. This is your disciple. You have recruited such a character, lawless, and you will surely do harm to my work in the future. Elder, please let me take action and teach him a lesson. Do you think that your Feng Liuyun is not lawless? Relying on the identity of the young pavilion master of Feng Liuyun, it hasn't been long since your Feng Liuyun entered the sky, but you have already taught many disciples, and I still listen said that he also robbed some people's treasures, and he was also a disciple of heavenly work, and even grabbed the treasures. Isn't it more excessive than Qin Chen? Groups of elders are arguing. All right. The elder squinted his eyes and spoke coldly. When he made a sound, no one was talking anymore. Kanaha, go and bring in that Qin Chen, as well as Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun, who are also my disciples of Tian's work. It's a bit too much to kneel there, but this time, it's a lesson for them. Temper and temper their zingxing, let them know what is outside and there are people outside, there are heaven outside the sky. The elder's voice fell and he waved his hand gently. Suddenly. Boom. On the square, an invisible force descended on Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun. The ancient aura on the bodies of Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun wanted to break the restriction, but when this force just came, OM, Nan Tianyi and Feng Lu the prohibition on the cloud suddenly burst out with a shocking atmosphere of ancient times, and he wanted to resist this force. What? In the emptiness, there was a startled voice immediately, and the next moment, that force fell. Boom! The endless ancient aura was immediately shattered, and the restraints on the bodies of Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun immediately made creaking sounds, and then exploded with a bang. What a strong force! When Qin Chen raised his head, he felt the mighty force, with the supreme strength, even his own ridiculous aura could not be resisted completely. This is a peerless master. Qin Chen knew very well that with his current strength, even a heavenly sage giant at the midterm peak of the heavenly sage, would never easily break the restriction set by him, but this powerful one just used it after a short time. The prohibition and tearing under the aura of the ancients, this method has surpassed the imagination of normal people. Lei Tian Cheng. Even stronger. 
Qin Chen knew immediately that this was the top expert in the day's work. Of course, if Qin Chen was willing, the other party would definitely not be able to break his prohibition so easily with just a holy energy, but since he is a master of heavenly work, Qin Chen's goal has been achieved, and naturally he will not regenerate branches. You guys, in this fight, you should also know what it means to be someone outside of a person. There is a person outside of the sky. Don't think that if you join Tian Jiao, you can be arrogant. You are only slightly talented. In the future, where you can go, everything depends yourselves. Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun, you two, go back and reflect on it. The rumbling roar resounded over the square, losing their restraints. Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun's complexion flushed, and they didn't dare to stay any more. They didn't even have the courage to stare at Qin Chen but they quickly turned into escape light and disappeared. Qin Chen, ha ha ha, you are good. At the same time, a figure flew out from the high tower in front, and it was Elder Kanaha, with a smile on his face, and fell suddenly in front of Qin Chen. Elder Kanaha. Qin Chen immediately got up and saluted. He knew that Elder Kanaha had done a lot for him, and Bai Yutang was also saluting. Elder Kanaha was the one who led them into the work of heaven, and he could be regarded as their guide. Haha, <laughs> good, good, come with me. Elder Kanaha led the way for Qin Chen, and at the same time said in a voice transmission, The great elder wants to see you. Elder. Qin Chen moved in his heart, but quietly followed behind Elder Kanaha. Seeing Qin Chen leave, all the disciples in the square breathed a sigh of relief. Following Elder Kanaha, Qin Chen flew directly into the high tower in front of him without any emotional fluctuations. As soon as he entered the tower, Qin Chen knew the vastness of the tower in front of him. Each layer of the tower was like a kingdom, vast and mighty, luckily it was carried by the Elder Kanaha, otherwise he would let him come in alone. And even get lost. Moreover, there are countless prohibitions in this high tower which is extremely terrifying. Qin Chen, the great elder was holding an elders meeting before. After a while, you will see a lot of elders and the great elders I work for. You must be respectful. Elder Kanaha reminded as he flew by. Don't worry, Elder Kanaha, I know what to do. Qin Chen nodded. The next moment, hum. The two shuttled through a void, and came to a magnificent hall. In the hall, there are many strong men wearing apothecary robes, and each body exudes an astonishing aura. The weakest among them are all the strong men at the peak of the midterm heavenly sage, and there are many others. It was so strong that Qin Chen couldn't see through it at a glance. These people are all elders with real power and work just like Master Kanaha. It is impossible for elders without real power to participate in this kind of elder meeting. And at the very front of the hall, sits an old man wearing a large robe with a withered face and extremely long eyebrows. On the old man, the heavenly sacred breath has turned into a heavy kingdom. In the kingdom, there seems to be a respectable person. Gods and demons are practicing, expounding the profound meaning of heaven. This is terrifying. The first glance this old man gave Qin Chen was that it was powerful and unmatched. Moreover, the aura on the opponent's body also made Qin Chen react. This person was the great elder who rescued Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun before. If it were the first time to come to the heavens, Qin Chen would definitely be trembling when he saw such a strong man, and would even be too scared to stand up. But now Qin Chen has seen the Lord Yama, the Lord of the Eternal Sword, the Lord of the Desolate God, and the Nine-Tailed Heavenly Fox, and even felt the breath of the demon tree of ten thousand realms, but the breath that this great elder exudes is unrelenting. Do not move, do not move. Although this old man is strong and faint, in his breath, there is a kind of extraordinary good fortune, as if it can come through the air. The unmatched power that blasted him. But it was still the cultivation base of the heavenly sage, unable to make Qin Chen fear from the depths of his soul. Awesome. Is this the big man of Tianzuo? Lei Tiancheng? No, it may even be the peak of Tianchen's later stage. 
I didn't think that it was just a branch of Tianzuo in Guanggan Palace. There were such strong people, and it was just a supervisor. The chief elder of affairs is not the real minister of the Guanggan Fusion Work branch, so how strong will this minister of Guanggan Fusion work? Even, for such a large institution, there must be elders, or worship in seclusion, etc. This is only a branch of Guanggan Mansion. No wonder Tian Jiao has such a momentum in the entire celestial realm. Qin Chen felt that he had opened his eyes. He thought that he was already invincible. He could suppress the midterm Heavenly Sage powerhouse and defeat the midterm Heavenly Sage peak. But after seeing the many elders and great elders present, Qin Chen understood, I am in Guangzhou. In the Han Mansion, he can't be regarded as a real powerhouse. Therefore, he immediately converged his mind, became humble, and aroused the desire to practice. Moreover, from the body of the great elder, he felt a lot of things worth learning from, combined with the experience of the eternal sword master, vaguely saw a path that belonged to him. Great elder, Qin Chen brought it. Master Muye took Qin Chen to salute in a hurry. In the heavenly work, the position of the elder was much higher than that of him, and his strength was in the sky and the underground. You are Qin Chen? As expected, the hero was born a teenager. The elder opened his eyes, as if there was a divine light, his voice came faintly. Meet the great elder. Qin Chen saluted. For the great elder, he still maintained enough etiquette. Well, very good, you are fine. I heard that you broke into the ninth floor of the ancient sacred tower. Originally, the old man didn't believe it. When I see it now, it is really extraordinary. The elder said, I have seen you in on the square, Nan Tian and Feng Liu Yu kneel down. Things, do you know why we don't stop you from doing it? Because you elders hope to compete. Only through competition can we cultivate strong people. Our daily job is an organization that fights against the demons. Naturally, we hope to cultivate more strong people. Qin Chen straightened his body. Furthermore, I did this to kill their anger, which is beneficial and harmless. Otherwise, with their arrogant personality, after going out, they will definitely conflict with other forces, die unfavorably, and even give. Our daily work brings disasters, and the disciples let them kneel down, but also to dissipate their arrogance, let them know what it means to be outsiders, there are heavens outside the world, it is a good thing. Qin Chen said neither overbearing nor overbearing. Bye. All the elders in the audience were dizzy. This Qin Chen still had the face to say that Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun were arrogant. Compared with your personality, you simply didn't know much. Qin Chen, you are the one who is really arrogant. An elder angered and couldn't help but sipped coldly, what a humiliation and how arrogant and overbearing this is to let Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun kneel on the ground. Personality, if you go to the outside world, it also means how much trouble it will cause Tian Jiao, let us use Tian Jiao to save you, don't you know it wrong? Yes, lawless, breaking the rules, having no respect, and dare to argue. The other elder also roared. It was the two elders who recruited Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun. I will cause trouble for Tian's job? Let you help me? Ha ha ha. Unexpectedly, Qin Chen laughed suddenly. Why are you laughing? The other elders didn't know why Qin Chen was laughing, and the two elders couldn't help being angry. I laughed that the two elders were questioning my arrogant and overbearing character. It seemed that the two elders didn't even know who I was. What are you like? Didn't the two elders ask me why Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun's arrogant and overbearing dominance would bring disasters to Tian Jiao and need to kill my arrogance, but I can't? Qin Chen smiled coldly, because in this world, there is no arrogance stronger than me, I just. It is the person who is outside the human being, and the sky is outside the sky, even if there is a conflict in the outside world, it will not cause trouble to the work of heaven, but will only bring glory. Hit out with one word. The audience was shocked. Mad. Too arrogant. 
in the face of the great elders and the many elders of Tian Gong, Qin Chen is not weak at all, strong and tit for tat, showing endless arrogance and arrogance. Presumptuous, too presumptuous, Qin Chen, do you know what you are talking about? It will only bring glory to the work of heaven? It is ridiculous, I have heard such a funny thing for the first time in tens of thousands of years. I am arrogant. Elder Marble bowed his hand to the elder, and said angrily, Elder, this kid is too rampant and lawless. If such a person joins my daily work, it will only be a curse. The old man proposed to expel him. Work, such a lunatic, to me. Day work is just a disaster. Elder Marble, you are too much. Master Kanaha stood up immediately and said angrily. What is too much, listen to what this kid is saying, lawless, it's lawless. Elder Marble roared again and again. Chin Chen, what do you think? The elder remained silent, just looking at Chin Chen. What do I think? Chin Chen sneered, great elder, I don't blame this elder Marble. After all, Elder Marble has been practicing for tens of thousands of years, and he is just a giant at the peak of the mid-term heavenly sage. He probably will always won't understand me like this. How strong Tian Jiao is, what will I bring to Tian Jiao? After all, how can the ant think about the dragon, and how can the frog know the vastness of the sky, so I don't blame him, just pity him. Pity him? All the elders fainted, their eyes rounded. Is this Qin Chen's brain abnormal? He is a newly promoted disciple who works every day, and he is pitying an elder who works every day and has real power. Doesn't he know what the elders ask for? To become a powerful elder, the middle stage of the heavenly sage is the most basic cultivation level. Secondly, you must be able to refine the holy soldiers above the middle stage of the celestial rank and make great contributions to the heavenly work and accumulate countless mission points before they can be given to the elders. Possible. Although Elder Marble is one of the weakest elders with real power in the work of the sky, he is the elder with real power after all, and he was even despised by a disciple. This face is a shame. Arrogant. Arrogant. I don't know how high the sky is. All the elders aroused the heart of the same enemy. Boy, what are you talking about? Elder Marble rumbling, rose up, his body erupted with endless majesty, and the terrifying breath of the midterm peak law of Heavenly Sage suddenly swept towards Qin Chen, as if the end is coming. Do you think that if you suppress Nantianyi and Fengliuyun, you can be indifferent and slander the old man? An ant like you can kill you with one move. Elder Marble roared, his anger burning like never before. Kill Ben Shao with one move? Well, it's a well frog, I don't know how big the sky is. Don't say a move to kill me, Ben Shao is standing here today, you can do it, within one move, if you can hurt Ben Shao, then Ben Shao will quit Tian Gong directly. Do, leave it to your disposal, would you dare to give it a try? Qin Chen said proudly, standing upright all of a sudden. You, you. All the elders looked at Qin Chen in disbelief, only thinking that Qin Chen was mad and he was actually challenging a real power elder. Good boy, you are looking for death. Elder Marble roared and rushed violently. The master Kanaha on the side was about to stop him, but was transmitted by the great elder to persuade him to retreat. The great elder's eyes flickered, and he looked at Qin Chen again and again, calmly, as if watch the fire on the other side. This Qin Chen. Master Muye's heart was about to collapse. Elder Marble was not Nan Tianyi and Feng Liuyun, Qin Chen was too supportive. He could only stare at him, as long as Qin Chen was in danger, he would take action immediately to rescue Qin Chen. Boom! Everyone saw that the Elder Marble made a move. As soon as this elder with real power made a move, the situation changed, and the magical powers shook and exploded strangling them into the shape of a giant dragon, and roaring at Qin Chen. Boom! Almost everyone backed off under this breath. Fortunately, those present were all elder masters. If they were replaced by ordinary disciples, in the aftermath, 
countless disciples would be shocked and violent on the spot. Shoot! In order to defeat Qin Chen with a single move, Elder Yunqi didn't keep a little bit of his hand at all, unfolding his true strength. Strong! Incredibly strong! His Saint Yuan, centered on itself, presents concentric circles one by one, spreading outward like ripples. This is the terrifying power at the peak of the celestial mid-term. At this moment, Elder Marble was like an undefeated demon god, standing on the spot, the magical powers of Taoism with both hands filled the whole hall, a vast, rumbling roar. However, Qin Chen didn't move. His body stood upright, and waves of the ancient aura agitated in his body. His body seemed to have become the body of a and a demon and the countless laws and ancient rules flowed in power. Rock-like, formed. After a layer of terrifying defense, he abruptly carried the attack of Elder Marble. Boom! Qin Chen's body is like a rock under a waterfall. It hasn't moved for hundreds of millions of years. Elder Marble's terror attack impacted on him and disappeared without a trace. Instead, his body began to swell and his body surface the gloss on it becomes deeper and deeper. Mighty, invincible. However, Elder Marble's attack was too strong, and Qin Chen's luster flickered, and he was constantly being consumed, finally. Boom! He was shocked and flew out, but when his body was flying upside down, he was constantly killing off the attacks of the elders of meteorites. In the end, when Qin Chen's body was completely wiped out, the elders of marbles attacked. Finally disappeared. Yun San. What? This Qin Chen actually blocked it. What kind of exercise is this? Impossible. The many elders were all shocked, all stunned, even worse than the disciples in the square before. This kind of wild ancient aura, seems to be the power in the wild ancient ruins of the dead spirit realm. It has never been absorbed by anyone so why does it appear in him? Too strong, what defense is this? It's only a little bit. If Elder Marble's strength is stronger, he will be hurt, but unfortunately, it is still blocked. Many elders roared again and again. Elder Marble, I said, your power is impossible to even hurt me, so you can't understand me, because I'm a real pride, and you, just an ordinary person, have ordinary opportunities. I got here fortunately. One step, you never understand, what I will bring to Tian Jiao. Qin Chen said, standing in the void. In fact, he can completely withstand the attacks of Elder Marble, but, in order to be too prominent, he deliberately pretended to exhaust the last trace of strength. I don't believe it, my marble will not defeat you. Elder Marble roared, your defense is strong, but it's just imaginary. I am the peak giant in the mid-sage sage. As long as you destroy your will, I can defeat you. A terrifying sharp light burst out of the Elder Marble's eyes, and countless laws of power soared into the sky, surrounding Qin Chen, condensing into a large formation, and strangling inward. He was angry and didn't want to believe that he was inferior to Qin Chen. Origin Magical Power Faced with another attack from Elder Marble, Qin Chen sneered, turned from defense to offense, and suddenly used a punch. It was his most terrifying source of magic. Suddenly, the origin of one world after another appeared. The civilization of the heavens, the grand epic, seemed to come out of the endless void, flickering one by one. The Tiangong elders present seemed to have seen the origin of the heavens and the reincarnation of all things, and they wanted to be immersed in it and follow the reincarnation of the origin. This is the terrible origin of Qin Chen's supernatural powers. Not good. Elder Marble's expression changed. Suddenly, a grey-brown armor appeared on his body, covering himself and protecting himself from being violated. He did not expect that Qin Chen's punch would be so fierce. In between, let his soul sink. Caught in endless reincarnation. With just one punch, what is powerful is not Sheng Yuan not strength, but a punch. Elder Marble felt as if he was isolated between the heavens and the earth, becoming a trivial thing in the origin of all things, 
disappearing with the reincarnation of the heavens and the earth, in this mood, he deeply felt his own insignificance, and his mind began. A crack appeared. Invincible fist. Origin supernatural power. Qin Chen's punch brought his strongest artistic conception, especially the experience taught to him by the Eternal Sword Master, and it was much stronger than when he first created the Origin Supernatural Power. Boom! Two terrifying forces collided, endless explosions swept across, the void oscillated, the sun and the moon shattered, and the earth was reborn. The entire tower will collapse under this blow. Of course, this is just an illusion. The two masters fought each other in this hall, and the power spread out. If it weren't intercepted by the hall prohibition, they didn't know how much space would be destroyed and how much existed. Fortunately, those present are all top masters. Otherwise, if you are here as an Antian first class disciple, I am afraid that they can be killed and wiped out by the aftermath. Bang bang bang! With all eyes in sight, Qin Chen took seven steps backwards and finally stabilized his figure, but Elder Marble was not well, and he stepped backwards five steps in a row before finally stopping. The two were evenly matched. Hateful. Elder Marble is crazy and wants to take another shot. Enough. Suddenly, a cold drink sounded. It's the Great Elder. Boom. He waved his hand, and suddenly an endless horrible force fell. Qin Chen only felt that an unrivaled force swept through and suppressed him. He immediately restrained his breath and stepped aside. Anyway, he was just proving himself, even when he was playing against Elder Marble, he deliberately kept a hand. The Elder Marble was also firmly suppressed, unable to move. Elder, you let me dispose of this kid. This kid has a weird background. He has only broken through the Heavenly Sage, but his strength is so strong. I now suspect that he may be the spy of the demon race. Elder Marble roared frantically, turning anger into anger, and his face flushed. This is a dirty method. Elder Marble, enough. The icy voice of the great elder came, and the elder marble paled, and all of his spirits suddenly vented, and he was depressed. All of you retreat, Kanaha, Chin Chen, you two stay. The elder said coldly. When the other elders didn't dare to disobey the great elder, they immediately left, and before leaving, the elder marble gave Qin Chen a fierce look. His face was lost. Elder. After the others left, Master Kanaha hurriedly said, Qin Chen is arrogant, but because he is too young, the young man should be a bit aggressive. Please don't take it seriously. He was pleading with Qin Chen. Hey. The elder nodded and looked at Qin Chen with a smile. Amidst the darkness, a powerful force lingered, his eyes fixed on Qin Chen. The art of patching the sky, evolving the sky, stealing the sky. Qin Chen had mentioned all the sacred origins long ago, covered his body aura, and tried his best to condense the origin of everyone's heavenly sacred laws, hiding the treasures in the five secrets, and substituting them into the role of an overbearing and arrogant disciple. The elder's gaze didn't have the slightest temptation, he was just observing Qin Chen's power, but there was a terrifying power to see through anyone's heart. Okay, very good. In the early days of Heavenly Sage, even the initial peak is still a little bit short. I heard Kanaha say that when you participated in my daily work assessment, you were just a half-step Heavenly Sage peak martial artist. The cultivation of daily work, since... He has been promoted to Heavenly Sage, which has been rare in the past. Especially you, Qin Chen, I have already seen your suppression of Nan Tianyi, Feng Liuyun, and the fight against Elder Marble. Originally, I heard Kanaha report that when you were in Yunzhou, you used to half step Tian Sheng. The peak cultivation base can actually kill Yunzhou. The master of Yundong Guangzhou originally shocked me. I never thought that after you break through the realm of Heavenly Sage, you will be able to fight against Elder Marble. I want to come to you and have another adventure during this time. The Great Elder watched for a long time, then retracted his gaze, and exclaimed, If I'm not mistaken, 
the aura on you should be the strength of the barren ancients in the barren ancient ruins in the necrosphere, and it is very condensed, even condensing a legend. The ancient body. Did you go to the deserted ruins for a while? This elder had a very vicious look, and he could see how powerful Qin Chen was, especially since Qin Chen was able to withstand the attacks of Elder Marble before. That powerful body was very similar to the legendary Elder Body. This is a rumored physique. Back to the Great Elder, the disciple did indeed go to the Dead Soul Realm, and entered the deserted ancient ruins, and got some adventures. Qin Chen said. No wonder you went to the desolate ancient ruins, and you also got the adventure in the desolate ancient ruins. There are also some records in the historical materials of my work in the desolate ancient ruins. It is rumored that it is a forbidden place left by a special race among the ten thousand races in the ancient heaven. There are many dangers in it. For countless years, many strong people have broken into it, all of them have been defeated, even severely injured, and some sky-reaching strong people have entered it, and they are unable to find the root of the desolate ancient ruins. Unexpectedly, you actually got it in it. Odd. Encounter. The elder sighed and said. Hush. Qin Chen breathed a sigh of relief. Although he relies a lot now, he is also a little wary in front of the master elder. If the other party spies out the abnormal changes in his body, it will bring him a lot trouble, at least it will expose. Many things. Hey! The great elder sighed again, the desolate ancient race was considered a powerful race in the ancient times, but it eventually exterminated the clan and died. Moreover, the desolate ancient ruins are full of dangers, and this desolate ancient aura cannot be absorbed by the warrior. Absorbed into the body, even. Even if the body explodes and die, what's more? There are many forces and masters in the deserted ancient ruins, and they can't find the adventures in them. How can you get the adventures when you were a half-step heavenly saint? The Grand Elder is still asking. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, many thoughts came out, and he suddenly said, The Great Elder doesn't know anything. I have practiced a bodybuilding exercise, which is quite similar to this ancient aura. At that time, I entered the ancient aura. Later, I discovered that my physical exercises could be inspired by this wild ancient aura. Therefore, although there were many masters chasing me in the wild ancient ruins at that time, the disciple relied on this practice to break into the wild ancient ruins. The desolate ancient city in the depths, and I feel the ground. There is a special summoning power at the bottom. The disciple entered it carefully, but came to a mysterious space. There was the legacy of a strong man from the ancient desolate tribe. The strong man washed my flesh, trained the body of the desolate ancient body, and taught the ancient supernatural powers, so the disciple to be safe. Unharmed, eventually breaking through, physical invincibility. Qin Chen explained the half-truth. He knows that his own strength performance has been a little too much, but if he wants to save Yu Qingxiu and the others, he must hurry up and get the attention of Tian work. If he wants to get attention, he can only show the talent that shocks the world. Wait. Need. A Tian Jiao who has just broken through the realm of Heavenly Sage and can fight against the midterm peak of Heavenly Sage will make the entire Heavenly Work Division pay attention to it. Oh? Special exercises. The Elder frowned. Great Elder, this is this technique. Qin Chen kept his expressions, and took out the Immortal Eucharist. Anyway, the Immortal Eucharist is a body-refining method of the lower than the mortal sage, even if it is spread in the heaven, I'm not afraid of anything, and, as the elder, I would never do this kind of things to talk about. The great elder just looked at it, and he was surprised, hey, this exercise is really interesting. It seems to have something in common with the wild ancient spirit of the wild ancient clan. However, it is essentially the practice of our human race. Is it a certain body refiner? Can it be created? No wonder. The great elder suddenly, with his vision, naturally can see the extraordinary of the immortal Eucharist. It's a pity that the immortal Eucharist is just a small mortal technique, 
and it has little effect on people like him. The disciple only discovered the special of this technique after entering the deserted ancient ruins. Qin Chen smiled bitterly. In this way, it seems that it is indeed your chance. The elder sighed and said, if I guessed correctly, what you got should be the inheritance of a certain heaven-defying heavenly sage of the wild ancient race. After you broke through, did you continue to go deeper? Investigate. No, after I got the inheritance, I drove out of the deserted ancient ruins, because the disciple had to come to work and report. As for going to the dead spirit realm, it was just to complete a private matter. Qin Chen said. Fortunately, you did not go deeper. The deserted ancient ruins are the relics of the deserted ancient tribe. Among the deserted ancient tribe, there have been top saints who have appeared. If you continue to go deeper, you may break into the prohibitions and traps of those characters. In. Otherwise, you think that the masters in the big mansions near the Necro Realm, why no one enters the deserted ancient ruins to grab treasure? It is because the place is too dangerous, even if the old man goes, I will die. Qin Chen was still wearing ordinary clothes, fell down all of a sudden, walked straight into the hall, and reported. Hey, who is this person? I haven't seen it before, is it a newcomer to our daily work? If you are a newcomer, you should all be receiving training? Look at his clothes, he doesn't look like a refiner, is it a member of the warrior department, but the warrior department is receiving training in the forbidden area, it is impossible to come out. That's a newcomer to the refining division, but the newcomers to the refining division have just finished training and are now ready to come over to take up the task. Isn't it too arrogant? Hey, I want to work in heaven to earn contribution points, but not so easy, the best way is. It's really refining the saint soldiers and selling them to Tianjiao in exchange for contribution points. Everything else is dangerous. I've heard that among the new recruits this time, there are a few awesome characters, Nan Tianyi, the elder son of the Nan clan, Feng Liuyun, the young master of Fenjiun Pavilion, and Bai Yu, the young master of Treasure Hall. Tang, have already broken through the realm of Heavenly Sage, so. The character, can come to take the task, is this one of the three? Hey? I can't see through the cultivation base of this child. It's kind of interesting. Is it really one of these three arrogances? The people who worked for many days saw Qin Chen and immediately cast their eyes on him and talked a lot but everyone was busy, just guessing, and they were all busy with their own affairs. In the hall, there are counters, and people are busy at each counter. Tian Jiao is a huge organization. There are Warriors Department, Refining Division, Alchemy Refining Department, Materials Department, etc., but apart from Refining Division, which is the most important, all others are subsidiary forces, but each is incomparable busy. This is like a huge machine, in operation. Qin Chen didn't look too much, and went straight to a counter, preparing to take out the token and report. Hey, kid, step aside for me and let the old man come first to hand in the task. Suddenly, a cold drink sounded, and an old man with a starry eyebrow, who was behind Qin Chen before, appeared in front of Qin Chen in a flash, holding a bag in his hand and threw it with a snap. On the counter. In the bag, a round human head rolled out. The head was messed up. His eyes were round and his face was distorted. It exudes the aura of the heavenly sage. It turned out to be a heavenly sage master with a cloud of yin and yang flames on the center of his eyebrows. Under. He removed his head and threw it directly on the counter. This is. According to the rumors, the demon in the sea of yin and yang near Guanggan Mansion, the lord of yin and yang. The sea of yin and yang is a strange place, in which yin and yang are reversed, and when the sun and the moon are reversed, energy will be converted. Unpredictable majesty, which is vast and boundless, there are many bandits, and the devil is prosperous. This yin and yang prince is a famous one in the sea of yin and yang. The head of the demon, arranging one side, endangering the nearby state, has now been decapitated. 
its senior brother Chime. Brother Chime was a member of the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department who joined 5,000 years ago. He is now a peak master in the middle of the Heavenly Sage. It is rumored that senior brother Chime has a fiery pupil in his cultivation, which can break the yin and yang energy. No wonder he can kill. Kill the yin and yang prince and bring it back directly. Lost his head. Awesome, because many bandits and demon heads in the yin yang sea united with each other to form an alliance. One person was killed and the others had to avenge him. So few people were willing to go to yin yang sea to perform tasks. We used to have martial arts disciples. Entered the yin yang sea to perform the task, and was killed by the yin and yang lang jun. If I remember correctly, the task of killing Yin and Yang Lang Jun has been in our work for thousands of years, right? This task has a full 30,000 points and can be exchanged for one. A good celestial saint. Yet, yeah, I used to have many masters who have taken this task in my daily work, but they have not succeeded. This time Brother Chime took the task half a year ago, and finally killed the dog. For many days, the masters who were present at the scene exclaimed, showing surprise. The old man with red eyebrows seemed very satisfied with what others thought of him, very proud. What? Chime, you killed the yin and yang lang jun. This is his head? Very good. Very good. You have made a huge contribution to our daily work. The manager on the counter saw this and was surprised. Wrong, carefully looked at this head and found that it was indeed the lord of yin and yang and immediately began to record, wait a moment, I will immediately report the news of you killing the Lord of Yin and Yang to the upper level, as long as the verification is passed. After that, your points will be credited, a total of 30,000 points. In addition, you can still get rewards from Guangan Mansion. You know, this person is also a wanted criminal in the nearby provinces. There should be a lot of rewards on the wanted list. Don't worry, the workday will do it for you. Processing will not miss any point. This manager is very enthusiastic. Thank you for the stewardship, then. The red-browed old man smiled. The stewardship in the Holy Island is actually only in the middle of the Heavenly Sage, or the peak of the middle stage, and there is no room for improvement. To the Elder, and he. There is a future, there is hope. Hey. This time Brother Red Eyebrow is a big prophet. I remember that the strongest yin and yang lord is the yin and yang soul fire he practiced in the soul sea. A soul fire mark is formed on the center of his eyebrows, which can smelt the soul, senior Brother Red Eyebrow. Killed the opponent, yin yang lang jun sacrificed. Tens of thousands of years of yin and yang soul fire must have been obtained by senior Brother Chime plus the rewards of heaven's work and the rewards of various houses, this is a big deal. Awesome, with one shot, you can earn treasures that ordinary people can't earn for a lifetime. Only Brother Chime can do it, we can only be jealous. Many people are saying. Amidst everyone's amazement, the red-browed old man was calm and a little self-satisfied, while the steward on the counter began to send information, and verified the head of Yin Yang Lang Jun, and reported the news in an orderly manner. But Qin Chen frowned. I said, this manager, isn't there one here that comes first and then arrives? Shouldn't I deal with Ben Shao first? Qin Chen said coldly. What Qin Chen lacks most now is time. To rescue Kyungsu and Ruyu and rush back to Tianyu continent, there are too many things for him to do. After the other party's verification is completed, who knows how long it will take. He can't wait for a moment. As soon as Qin Chen said this, the whole audience was silent. Everyone looked at Qin Chen in astonishment. What's wrong with this young man? How dare to speak like this? The manager was also stunned. Okay. The old man with red eyebrows darkened even more, turning his head to look. Shit. Qin Chen felt bursts of invisible flames and he felt like he was in a peerless pill furnace, suffering in the furnace of heaven and earth. He is strong with red eyebrows, and in the future even hopes to break through the late heavenly sage, 
and even become the elder of the warrior department and a figure in power. But no matter how strong he is, he is only a member of the military department. But how about the sun? Any saint child in the heavenly work is a refiner and needs to have an amazing talent in the way of refining, so that it is possible to inherit the mantle of the heavenly work. He was a member of the warrior department, and he didn't dare to offend a future refiner master even if he was killed. Go away. Yes. Chime stood aside respectfully when he heard Qin Chen's words, no longer the rampant he had before. Hurry up and report for me. Qin Chen said to the manager again. Yes yes. This manager did not dare to neglect, and even began to go through the formalities for Qin Chen. What? This Qin Chen is the champion who was assessed when the job was enrolled in Yunzhou this time. Because of his personal affairs, he just came to report today. At this moment, there was an exclamation in the hall. This is the news that someone has inquired about Qin Chen and couldn't help but lose his voice in shock. The work of the day is big and big and small and small. Many people are busy practicing, refining tools, taking tasks, and so on. Few people pay attention to the newcomer's affairs, but as long as you inquire with your heart, you can get news in minutes. So in a moment, many people got the information, almost all of them were shocked. This son actually broke the rules of the Tianjia Refining Division. After passing the assessment, he did not sign up for the first time, but went to handle his personal affairs first. On the square before, this Qin Chen raised his hand to suppress Nan Tianyi, the son of the Nan family, and Feng Liuyun, the young master of Fenjiun Pavilion, one of the three outstanding disciples of the refining master this time, causing the two to kneel in public. This person was summoned by the great elder, and it is said that he had a conflict with the elder marble at the presbytery. The great elder personally granted this person the status of saint's son, and he appointed this person to recruit the chief disciple among the disciples of the refiner for this day's work. One by one news came, and the horror in everyone's hearts became stronger and stronger, and the gaze that looked at Qin Chen also became jealous and solemn. Suppressing fellow disciples is normal. Those who can work in heaven are Tian Jiao. Who doesn't have a solo temperament? It would be terrifying to let the two Tian Sheng disciples kneel down on the spot. Moreover, a newly promoted disciple of Qin Chen even dared to confront the real power elder of Tian Zhou, and he was an extremely arrogant demon. The most important thing is the status of Qin Chen's chief disciple, which is related to a quota for Tian Jiao. Yes. Everyone's gazes at Qin Chen changed. As for the old man with bare eyebrows, his heart was almost out of breath. Offending such a world-famous figure, can he be a warrior in the warrior department in the future? Must find a way. He gritted his teeth and walked up, Master Qin Chen, I have been offended before. To express my apology, this is the yin-yang soul fire obtained by killing the lord of yin and yang before going down. Please also Master Shenzi to laugh. As soon as he raised his hand, a group of yin and yang flames floated out. As soon as the flame came out, the temperature in the hall suddenly became slightly cold, as if changing between cold and hot. When this flame came out, it naturally caused many disciples present to exclaim. Yin and Yang soul fire, the treasure of the lord of yin and yang, this red-browed old man is so willing willing to take out the yin and yang soul fire to apologize? This is a treasure that cannot be found, and the red eyebrow old man himself cultivates the blazing fire mysterious eye, this yin and yang soul fire pair. For him, it will definitely be of great benefit. But now the red eyebrows are taken out directly. Oh! Qin Chen faintly glanced at the old man with red eyebrows, this guy was somewhat decisive. However, this yin and yang soul fire is somewhat interesting. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, raised his hand, and condensed the flame into his hand, and said lightly, Since you are so sincere, let's forget about the previous things. Yuxi, his gaze flashed, and without hesitation, he took out a storage ring again, Holy son, this is an ancient heavenly vein that I got from his cave when I killed Yuniang Lang Jun. Is the ancient sage of the middle rank. 
The veins were originally intended to be used for his own cultivation, but after seeing Master Shenzi, he only felt that the treasure should be worthy of a hero, so Zixia was willing to give this ancient saint vein to Master Shenzi for his cultivation. Yes. Everyone looked at Chime in disbelief. Qin Chen had obviously decided to let this matter go before. Why did Chime take out an ancient sacred vein of the middle grade of heaven? This is the ancient sacred vein of the middle rank of the sky. If they guessed correctly, this ancient sacred vein and the yin yang soul fire are the biggest gains after slaying the yin yang lang jun with the red eyebrows. Now they are all given to Qin Chen. Oh! Qin Chen glanced at his red eyebrows with a faint smile, you should not ask for anything. There is a middle grade ancient sacred vein of heaven which he has exchanged for all the treasures in the Wang Gu Tower, and this is only one, which is definitely a huge amount for a giant at the peak of the mid-stage sage. This. Chai Mei smiled awkwardly, Master Shenzi, there is indeed a request from Zixia. I heard that Master Shenzi is a newcomer who just joined Tian Jiao. He just made an exception today. He wants to come and know something about Tian Jiao. And join the sky under. I have been working for 5,000 years, and apart from other things, I am quite familiar with some things that work in the sky, so I think if Master Shenzi has any needs in the future, I can call it out. The old man with red eyebrows took out a piece of jade slip, this is the jade slip for the next transmission, Master Shenzi can send it to the next if necessary in the future. The old man with red eyebrows said expectantly. Qin Chen realized in an instant that the other party was ready to take refuge. Qin Chen's heart moved. He really didn't know much about his work this day. It would be great if someone could call it. Ha ha ha. Qin Chen laughed, raised his hand and put away the jade slip and storage ring, very well, since that's the case, then Ben Shao will accept it. Thank you, Lord Sun. The old man with red eyebrows was overjoyed. In fact, he was also a man of arrogance before, so he has never taken refuge in any holy sons or elders in his heavenly work, and he wants to explore the higher realm of martial arts. But in recent years, he has also begun to feel a little weak. In fact, he has long planned to find someone to seek refuge. It is just that the many holy children in the daily work have been in business for many years and have his own team. Although he has some strength, he may not be able to take it after entering. How much attention? Until he met Qin Chen. In an instant, I felt that this was an opportunity. Qin Chen became the saint son and chief disciple as soon as he joined Tianzuo, proving his strength. In addition to the fact that the other party had just arrived, there must be no familiar people. If he could take refuge in the other party for the first time, will certainly be taken seriously. This is gambling. But Chai Mei himself is a gambler, otherwise he would not continue the task of killing Yuniang Langjun and Yuniang Hai. There are some powerful people and Tianzuo disciples who have died in Yuniang Hai over the years. He took this task, but also took a lot of risk. In the end he succeeded. But now, it is another gamble. If he loses the bet, his future at work in the sky will be dimmed and he can only be a steward and a deacon in the future. But the bet is won, the future is limitless. As for Chai Mei's show-stopping operation, many people on the scene will also be stunned by the show. Master Shenzi, your procedures are complete. At this time, the steward carefully returned the token to Qin Chen, and respectfully said, here are some precautions for Tian's work, as well as the location of your cave, Master Shenzi. Your Dongfu, I arranged it at Qingtian Peak, this is the rest of our work. One of the best. Qin Chen's perception penetrated into the token, and he felt that there was a towering mountain in the distance, with jewels rushing into the sky, like a giant pillar, majestic and majestic. Nice place. Qin Chen took the token, flashed his body, and left the hall to the place where the disciples lived. And as soon as Qin Chen left, there was an uproar and sensation in the entire hall, which drew the exclamation and shock of countless people, and there was a lot of discussion and noisy. 
even the eyes of many people looking at their red eyebrows became unusual. Some looked like an idiot, while others were very envious. With the token of the Son of God, Qin Chen arrived at his own mountain not long after. The whole mountain is very magnificent, towering high and condescending, like a giant pillar, standing still. Under the mountain peak, the breath of the holy vein was constantly flowing. Around it, there are also mountain peaks, either high or short, large or small, majestic and rugged. In the work of heaven, ordinary disciples live in courtyards, and even deacons and stewards live in mansions. They are located together. Only at the level of the saint son and the real power elder can there be a cave, and each person has a mountain. In addition, every courtyard, mansion and mountain peak are connected by the ancient sacred veins. According to different levels, the level of the ancient sacred veins is also different. Qin Chen felt the breath of the sacred veins flowing under the mountain. Up to the sky. The breath of the coming of God, compared with the ordinary ancient holy veins, has an indescribable mystery, it is vast and powerful. This is the ancient sacred vein aura of the peak of the sky. Qin Chen sucked in air, and his work this day was really rich. The holy veins cultivated for the holy child turned out to be the peak of the sky, but Qin Chen guessed that the ancient holy veins of the peak of the sky were not arbitrarily absorbed. Sure enough, Qin Chen felt it carefully and discovered that the ancient sacred vein aura at the peak of the sky level was only a trace, used to refresh and condense the true essence when practicing, while most of the other ones were ordinary sky level ancient sacred veins. Among the mountain peaks, there is a cave mansion, and the cave mansion is empty, with training rooms, living rooms, refining rooms, and so on. Since you have arrived at the cave and you have obtained a middle grade heavenly ancient sacred vein, you should practice it first. Qin Chen closed the cave and went directly to the training room, sat cross legs, opened his mouth and inhaled, suddenly all the ancient holy energy on the entire Qingtian peak was condensed into a set of laws, integrated into his body's cells and flesh. Among the ancient sacred veins at the peak of the heavenly ranks are different. Once inhaled, the power of the laws mixed in the holy energy of the day is like a raging fire, calcining Qin Chen's body and cells, making it a thousand times, so that Qin Chen's whole body is sprayed out. Light. So strong. Qin Chen immediately felt that there was a transformation in his body. Unfortunately, this transformation is very slow. Unfortunately, there is only one trace of the ancient holy veins at the peak of the heavenly ranks. It should have been deliberately assigned by the senior management of Tian Gong. There is only one in each cave, and it flows slowly. Otherwise, let the elders and the holy children absorb, no matter how much heavenly peak. Holy veins are not enough to absorb. Qin Chen shook his head. The ancient sacred veins at the peak of the heavenly rank are strategic treasures. He has a feeling that as long as he can absorb it unscrupulously, he may be able to step into the realm of the initial peak of the heavenly sage in a moment. Even if it breaks through to the midterm of heavenly sage, it won't take too much time. It's a pity that he only has a trace of absorption every moment, which is too scarce. Fortunately, I just got an ancient sacred vein of mid-level heavenly rank. Qin Chen stretched out his big hand, and immediately took out the heavenly grade middle grade ancient sacred vein that was offered on his bare eyebrows and began to absorb it. Rumble. Qin Chen immediately felt that the heavenly sage law in his body was blazing. Although the ancient sacred veins of this mid-tier celestial rank were far inferior to the ancient sacred veins of the celestial peak, they were much more condensed than ordinary ancient sacred veins. The billowing force enters Qin Chen's body. Inside, the law aura in Qin Chen's body continued to rise. The origin of the law, condensed. Qin Chen condensed the heavenly sage law of his whole body, with more than a hundred thousand ways, ran at full force, combined with each other again, condensed, clicked. Every three heavenly sacred laws eventually condense into one, and the number is reduced again, changing into thirty thousand. But the sacred laws of the heavens are a lot thicker, each one is thicker than the thigh, and the golden rune chains are intertwined. Strong and powerful. 
Although the heavenly sage law has been reduced, the power has increased. Yes, that's right. The number of the heavenly sage laws is one thing, but you can't blindly pursue too many. I also want to pursue thick and strong. My current heavenly sage laws, everyone is stronger than the giants in the middle of the heavenly sage. Dot have been practicing like this. Go, when I restore the number of laws at the beginning, my strength can be increased several times. Qin Chen nodded in satisfaction. There are many masters in the sky work, and there are also strong people in Guangan Mansion. Qin Chen wants to stand firm in the Saint Child and rescue Jian Shui and the others, only to constantly improve his strength. Absorb, absorb, absorb again. Now Qin Chen seized the opportunity to use the power of the ancient sacred veins of the middle rank of the sky to re-refine the laws of the sacred sky, just to increase his strength and reach a higher cultivation base. Originally, Qin Chen's own heavenly sage laws were very scattered, some were derived from heavenly grade pills, some were absorbed by some peerless experts, and some were formed by absorbing many holy veins. Each is different. Now Qin Chen has integrated this entire ancient sacred vein of the middle rank of the sky. Boom! Along with Qin Chen's devouring, the ancient sacred vein of this middle-ranked heavenly vein sharply reduced, the moment the entire sacred vein was completely swallowed by Qin Chen. Hum! A stronger aura lingered in Qin Chen's body. He finally reached the peak of Tian Chen's initial stage. Tian Chen's initial peak, it succeeded. Qin Chen stood up, his whole body, the power of the heavenly sacred laws lingered around, like a chain, surrounding the sky and the earth, in his eyes, the stars of the universe flashed out, bursting with an astonishing breath. Between the gestures, there was a burst of ancient aura permeating him, setting off his whole person like an ancient demon god. An unprecedented surging power flowed in Qin Chen's body. Although there is only a slight difference between the peaks of the early days of the Heavenly Sage and the early days of the Heavenly Sages, in terms of strength, there has been an amazing improvement. If he meets the Elder Marble again, Qin Chen will be more comfortable. I originally thought that if I wanted to break through the initial peak of the Heavenly Sage, I must first obtain the Saint Veins of the Eternal Building. I didn't expect to break through so soon. Qin Chen shook his head but didn't take it seriously. At the peak of the sacred stage, there is no need to consume too much energy. It is enough to continuously absorb the holy veins. The key is how to break through to the middle stage of the sage. This can. It can't be done by absorbing two ancient sacred veins of middle rank of heaven. If I want to break through the middle stage of the heavenly sage, I must first raise the chain of the heavenly sage law in my body. Now I only have more than 30,000 law chains in my body, and there are too few, far from the initial peak. Although more than 100,000 laws were turned into more than 30,000, which was three or four times more concentrated, Qin Chen's strength did not decrease but increased, and his physical strength became stronger and stronger. Qin Chen almost felt that with a random shock, he could turn the entire cave into ashes and sweep the army. When I raise the heavenly sage law in my body to more than 100,000 times, I can try to hit the middle of the heavenly sage. All of Qin Chen's previous holy veins and powers had condensed into more than 30,000 dao, and it was not a matter of wanting to return to more than 100,000 dao. If I only practice slowly by myself and absorb the holy energy of the heavens, I am afraid that it will take thousands of years to break through but if there is a holy vein of the peak of the heavens for me to unscrupulously absorb, this process can be ten times, a hundred times faster reduce, most. The important thing is resources. Qin Chen now has a deep understanding of the importance of resources. This is also the reason why many ordinary martial artists in the heavens are not as good as some disciples of the big forces. For the same cultivation level, Ordinary martial artists need to cultivate for thousands of years, but one has paying. A disciple with a big family background can save ten or even a hundred times the time. How can this compare? However, in the days of work, there are resources, and I can obtain resources by constantly doing tasks, hunting down the strong, 
and the development of Chindi Pavilion. Qin Chen calculated, and these must be carried forward at the same time, his current demand for heaven and earth holy energy is dozens of times that of ordinary heavenly holy spirits. Let's go to the hidden treasure temple first. Qin Chen's thoughts flashed, and the one that attracted him the most in his daily work was undoubtedly the treasure treasure temple. After a while, Qin Chen had already arrived at the door of the treasure treasure temple. The treasure treasure temple is the core place of Tian Yu. It contains countless treasures. It is also the largest library of Tian Yu. It stores countless classics and is guarded. The entrance is a huge stone gate, and there is a huge. The word Bao is vigorous and simple, and contains infinite power. Just looking at it makes people seem to see the infinite vastness of heaven. Moreover, there are countless restrictions on Shimon, exuding a tyrannical aura. This is the restriction of the heavenly sage peak, and even stronger. Even with Qin Chen's current cultivation base, it is difficult to break, and it is impossible to detect the real lines of the restriction. If it is broken forcibly, the restriction will be killed on the spot. And at this stone gate, sitting cross-legged is an old man guarding the palace. Seeing Qin Chen coming, the old man opened his eyes, and there seemed to be a starry sky spinning in his pupils. Young man, are you the newly promoted son Qin Chen? The old man said lightly. This old man is unfathomable, and he has a profound feeling like a great elder, and he is definitely the top powerhouse among the heavenly sages. As soon as he opened his mouth, the rules of heaven and earth vibrated, and there was a strong sense of oppression. Senior, it's a disciple. Qin Chen said. Well, you go in. The son is eligible to enter the treasure temple to read the classics but remember, you can only read it, not bring out any of them. In addition, there are countless treasures of my daily work, you you can also observe and even exchange. Change, however, any piece of treasure requires massive contribution points. You shouldn't have one yet, but you can observe it. Go ahead. While speaking, the old man opened the door. As soon as the door was opened, a breath of treasure suddenly rushed toward his face, and at the same time, there was also a breath of scrolls that swept out. Qin Chen felt the vastness of knowledge like the sea in an instant, arching his hand and flying in. The door closed slowly again. Well, this sun is full of breath and extremely long. Compared to some mid-tian sage peak giants, it is not weak. Unexpectedly, it turned out to be just a Tian Jiao in the early peak of Tian Sage. Did I really find a treasure this time? But the breath on his body is very mysterious. I guessed his fate, but I couldn't figure out his origin. It's weird. The old man at the door seemed to have the gears of destiny turning in his eyes, calculating something, but in the end he shook his head, revealing a look of doubt. A lot of classics. As soon as Qin Chen entered the inside of the heavenly work, he saw the boundless classics. Bundles of classics fell on the tall bookshelves, towering into the clouds, containing countless refining classics from before the heavens were broken to the present. These classics, anyone, if taken out, can cause a sensation, but they are very common in this day's work. However, the classics here are not originals, but photocopies. The real originals may have been lost, or it may be impossible for them to appear here in the treasure hall of the Tian Gong headquarters. Except for the bookshelves, there are classics everywhere between heaven and earth. From a distance, dimly and carefully, there are countless classics piled together to form mountains and even rivers. These classics include jade slips, paper, stone, gold, etc., and there are even masses of light, conveying consciousness. Qin Chen touched a beam of light, and immediately, a flood of information poured into his mind. Sanskrit sounds sang loudly. This is a classic that tells the history of the heavens. It contains many things that Qin Chen does not know. Qin Chen thought. In addition to the classics of refining tools, there are many collections that tell the human history of the heavens. Awesome, the technique of patching the sky, absorb, transform. 
Qin Chen watched the books and books, and suddenly, information flooded into his mind and appeared in his mind. With so many books, reading alone is definitely not enough. It takes countless hours. Qin Chen is preparing to use the technique of patching the sky to reproduce the content, and use the source of time to understand the content, but at this moment. Hum. In Qin Chen's mind, a mysterious ancient book suddenly appeared. Wow! It was the first time that Qin Chen saw a mysterious ancient book appear when he was not in danger. The ancient book appeared, suddenly bursting with mysterious light. Suddenly, all the books in the entire treasure holy temple radiated a little light. Any Qin Chen touched the past books will have an inexplicable power absorbed by the mysterious ancient books and disappear. What's happening here? Qin Chen was shocked. Could it be said that this mysterious ancient book is absorbing the power of the classics in this hidden treasure temple? But in any book, isn't the knowledge in it the most powerful force? Qin Chen could feel that after absorbing the power of classics, this mysterious ancient book actually began to show the appearance of a book, which showed various rules and knowledge, giving Qin Chen a sense of vastness. Could it be that the book formed is something similar to the legendary Book of All Saints? Qin Chen is no longer a lower realm warrior who knows nothing. It is said that in the ancient world, there is a Book of All Saints, which is a sacred book that records all the avenues, martial arts and knowledge of the entire world, including all the worlds. Knowledge This Book of All Saints is not only a classic, but also a supreme treasure, surpassing the existence of the treasure of the Holy Lord. This classic is said to have almost supreme strength in itself. It is the common imprint of countless venerables in ancient times. It sits in the 10,000 seconds book world of the heavens and controls all the knowledge and martial arts in the heavens. Now, the book phantom formed by this mysterious ancient book has turned into an embryonic form similar to the All Saints Book of Heaven, condensing all the knowledge. Any book Qin Chen has touched and the knowledge recorded in it will be absorbed and become its own knowledge. Moreover, when the knowledge of these books was formed, Qin Chen felt a sense of thorough understanding in his mind. This is awesome. Qin Chen wanted to finish reading these books, at least tens of thousands of years, or even tens of thousands of years, even if he used the sky patching technique, it would take countless years to master it. But now, Qin Chen has only touched a book, then the knowledge in this book will be merged into that book under the mysterious ancient book, and appear in Qin Chen's mind. This method is simply against the sky. Great, the formation of the prototype of the All Saints represents the origin of knowledge, and my origin supernatural power represents the origin of all things. If this knowledge origin is incorporated into my origin supernatural power, it can give the origin supernatural power stronger power. With a sudden movement in Qin Chen's mind, origin supernatural power seemed to have a new understanding. Before, Qin Chen's original magical powers were just his perception of the universe, the heavens, and the rules. But now, Qin Chen has incorporated the origin of knowledge into it, because everything in this world has an origin. Life has its origin, matter has its origin and knowledge naturally has its origin. Origin supernatural power is a supernatural power created by Qin Chen. It is still at a very naive stage. Although it is the strongest supernatural power that Qin Chen has comprehended, in the eyes of many top experts, it is actually very crude and ridiculous, but it has rich potential. Now that Qin Chen has incorporated a lot of knowledge, as he understands the ways of heaven and all things, the origin magic power will naturally become stronger. A lot of knowledge, merge into the origin, form the origin of knowledge. Qin Chen quickly touched the books. Suddenly, the rays of light were absorbed by the mysterious ancient books. A large amount of knowledge was engraved in Qin Chen's mind. Qin Chen didn't need to read it. The knowledge in this classic book had already been absorbed. He took control. How terrible is this? No, this can no longer be described as terrible, but a pervert. Not only knowledge, such as a classic of refining techniques, it may take several hours for Qin Chen Guang to read it with the naked eye, but that is only after reading it. 
it may take several months to fully understand it. Time can truly be mastered. Even if he used the technique of patching the sky and the power of the soul to understand, and under the acceleration of the origin of time, it would take at least several hours for Qin Chen to master a book of refining techniques. However, under the mysterious ancient book, Qin Chen mastered a classic at a single thought. What a perversion is this! Ha <laughs> ha! In the pleasant surprise, Qin Chen quickly schemed through the books, and immediately, countless knowledge merged into Qin Chen's mind, making the phantom of the book brighter and brighter. At the same time, the content in it also jumped and turned into many patterns. It will not be repeated, and like the years, it will always flow, innovative, and represent new knowledge. Every page of this book represents a civilization. There are records of the history of the heavens. There are records of celestial materials. There are records of refining techniques. There are records of the information of the 10,000 ethnic groups. Also make various martial arts classics, alchemy techniques, formations, etc. Whether strong or weak, they were all engraved in this book, forming Qin Chen's unique knowledge and becoming a part of his soul. If ordinary people were filled with so much knowledge in their minds, they would have become lunatics in an instant, but Qin Chen didn't have any difficulty. That mysterious ancient book exudes misty light, combined with the heavenly soul forbidden technique, and the circulation of time. Each piece of knowledge merged into Qin Chen's mind and became part of the original knowledge book, making Qin Chen's mind like a library. In Qin Chen's mind, countless knowledge formed. He swiftly schemed through the books, without having to read it at all, countless knowledge became his knowledge. What Qin Chen didn't know was that his soul power was slowly growing while he was scouring the books, and the fusion of his soul and the origin of time became closer and closer. The origin of time is the most difficult to recognize the origin of the Lord. Although it entered Qin Chen's mind at the beginning, Qin Chen could not completely control it. But now, with the formation of terrible knowledge in Qin Chen's mind, the origin of this time has become more and more closely integrated with Qin Chen, and a kind of time rule and power flowed out of Qin Chen. In this treasure holy temple, I don't know how many books there are. Bookshelves like mountains stand here, and some books are piled up into mountains, some become rivers, and Qin Chen strays in this sea of books. Especially under the blessing of time origin, Qin Chen's speed is extremely fast. Boom! I don't know how long it has passed. When Qin Chen finished storing the last book, Qin Chen's mind immediately shone brightly. A mysterious book was formed. Okay, it's finished, the book of origin, condensed into a rudimentary form. Qin Chen stood up and observed the book of origin in his body. This book is not thick, only more than ten copies, but every page blooms. The soft mask, the epic atmosphere, and the words flow on it, making people feel the knowledge. The profoundness of wisdom, the profoundness of wisdom, the vastness of origin. The wisdom of all things. This book contains the knowledge of countless ancient books in the entire treasure holy temple, representing the origin of my supernatural powers. Qin Chen's heart was clear and clear. When his book of origin was formed, he felt when I reach an inexplicable power, I even see through the future. The endless void of the future, in the dark, seems to have become the future of the heavens. The origin. However, the book of origins is still very weak. Although the ancient books in the treasure temple are gone, they are only equivalent to Guangan Mansion, equivalent to the working branch of this day, the true heaven-defying ancient books. The quantity is still too small. In the future, Qin Chen will need to continue to accumulate knowledge, write more knowledge and civilization, and continue to grow the power of this book of origins. If he could write the knowledge of the entire celestial realm, Qin Chen didn't even know how far this book of origin would grow, and whether it would become the treasure of heaven guarding knowledge like the book of all saints in the ancient celestial realm. What is the origin of this mysterious ancient book? Qin Chen was shocked. At this moment, he was more curious about the origins of the mysterious ancient books, and even more shocked. 
No matter what the origin of the mysterious ancient book is, I always feel that my book of origin is very important, because every civilization history is written by countless sages who have exhausted their endless power and wisdom, and even their lives. One of the human race. It is the obligation to pass on this responsibility. Qin Chen felt the great responsibility deeply, and his mind broadened extremely. What he has to do in the future is to continue to accumulate knowledge and civilization to make the Book of Origins more perfect, not to let it die out, and not to be sealed in the long river of history. In the dark, in Qin Chen's original domineering and vigorous body, there was a sense of bookishness. Every inch of his skin had textures and epic knowledge was flowing. This has gone beyond the scope of power and entered a realm of mysterious and mysterious saints. This time condensing the Book of Origins is a huge transformation for me. I practiced too fast before and my foundation was unstable. Although my strength was very solid, my realm and sentiment were actually much worse. Now, my hidden danger is eliminated. Now it will be much easier for me to advance to a higher realm in the future and to understand the highest way. I will increase my cultivation base at an astonishing speed, which will shock the world. Qin Chen had an insight into his realm. He looked at the countless classics in front of him and wandered in the treasure storage temple. These books have now entered his mind, and will never forget them, and become part of his knowledge. The vast knowledge gave Qin Chen a sense of perceptiveness, observing the autumn leaves, distinguishing the past and the present. Then, Qin Chen left the classics and entered the treasure area inside. Suddenly, the colorful treasures bloomed with light, giving Qin Chen a strong shocking feeling. Boom! The strong treasures in the treasure area swept down, and even formed a terrifying storm. If there is no passable life card, the treasures of these treasures alone can instantly kill a strong celestial sage. This is, too much. Looking around, the treasures that can be placed here are all treasures above the heavenly rank, and it is impossible for non-celestial treasures to be placed here. And there are many varieties of these treasures. There are all kinds of them, suspended in the air, shrouded in an invisible light cover, and can only be viewed, not captured. If you want to redeem the treasures here, you must have corresponding contribution points. But now Qin Chen has no contribution points at all, so naturally he cannot exchange them. In addition, there are integral displays on each mask. Qin Chen casually looked at a treasure in front of his left. It was priced at 10,000 points, but it was a broad knife the size of a door. This broad knife is very weird and extremely huge, but it is very rough, exploding with a shocking aura, and there are even savage god-like figures flashing. This is a low-grade war sword of the Sage of Heaven, but it is a fine piece of the low grade. It should have been refined for more than 300 years. It seems to have penetrated the atmosphere of the ancient barbarians. Swordsmen get it, depending on the repair level. Can definitely improve one's own strength a lot, for example, a warrior at the peak of the Celestial Sage can improve by 50% in the contemporary era and even a swordsman giant in the Celestial Sage can be increased by more than 10%. Qin Chen's gaze shifted slightly, his gaze shone on the sword, and he immediately showed the refining time and various effects of the sword, the engraved formation method and the materials, all in his head. This shocked Qin Chen. In fact, although Qin Chen had acquired the sky repairing technique before, and possessed heaven-defying accomplishments on the refining device, he would not be able to see all the information of a holy soldier at a glance. At least he must use the sky repairing technique. Technique, secretly analyze it to get. Draw certain conclusions. But now, just looking at it, he can judge something, and it is very detailed, which is simply against the sky. It's the book of origin. Qin Chen knew in his heart. He had watched all the classics in the Treasure Holy Temple before and merged into the Book of Origin, turning this knowledge into the knowledge in his own mind, countless celestial materials and so on, as long as there are records in the classics here. He can draw conclusions in the first place. This allowed him to see everything about this sword in just one or two breaths. Awesome, I'm afraid, 
this is the true purpose of the Book of Origins, not only to stabilize my realm, and to make the future more smooth, but also to give me a comprehensive understanding of all things in the heaven. Qin Chen before the most lacking is the knowledge about the heavens, but now, after absorbing all the classics of the entire treasure treasure temple, Qin Chen's knowledge is profound and vast, and can be called the first in Guanggan Mansion, even Guanggan Palace Lord and the ministers of Tian Gong Division may not be like him. Because these people did not read all the classics in the entire treasure temple. Of course, what Qin Chen is stronger than them is only the amount of knowledge, and there is still a lack of overall quality. Because the classics here only record the history of some characters in the heavens, material techniques, secret skills, and supernatural powers, but although these classics are very powerful, they are only equivalent to some heavenly sages. Books like the Holy Lord's supernatural powers that are truly against the sky will not appear here, so Qin Chen still lacks some of the top-level exercises, secrets, and techniques. Set his mind, Qin Chen's eyes fell on the price of the sword. 10,000 contribution points. 10,000? Qin Chen frowned. He remembered that the red eyebrows killed the yin and yang prince, and he got 30,000 contribution points. So, if he killed a yin and yang prince, he could only exchange three such saint soldiers? Some are missing, right? You know, yin yang lang jun is a giant of the mid tian sage mid level, even approaching the mid tian sage mid level peak and in the Yin Yang Si, it is extremely difficult to kill him, even the strong man at the mid Tian Sage Peak has the probability of falling. Chai Mei also beheaded the opponent because the flames and profound pupil restrained him, and after beheaded, could he actually exchange for three such saint soldiers? Although this holy soldier is strong, it is equivalent to the sky-opening axe of the Lord of Yundong Guangzhou, but after all, it is only the best among the heavenly low-grade holy soldiers. For a giant at the peak of the mid-term heavenly holy, the role of improvement is still somewhat small. But the price in exchange is so great. No, you can't count that. Suddenly, Qin Chen shook his head. He had forgotten that after the red eyebrows killed the yin and yang prince, he also got a lot of treasures from the yin and yang prince. These treasures are not collected by the day's work. They have other means of making money, and these 30,000 contribution points it's just an extra give. Among other things, the yin and yang soul fire that Qin Chen hadn't smelted, and the ancient sacred vein of the middle rank sky, were far more valuable than this battle axe. Moreover, Chai Mei can also get rewards from various big houses, and the information and rewards of Lord Yin and Yang do not need to be done by Chai Mei himself, and the day's work can be completed for him. The value of these things is extraordinary. The most important thing is that Qin Chen discovered that the treasures here don't seem to need a lot of contribution points. The best sacred soldiers of the lower grade that day had 10,000 contribution points. The other treasures were basically at this level, the lowest, 10,000, and the higher ones, 134, 156. At the 20,000 level, it has already reached the mid-level heavenly rank. In other words, Crimson Eyebrow's 30,000 contribution points can be exchanged for a saint weapon of the heavenly mid-rank peak, corresponding to the identity of the Yin Yang Lang Jun. This calculation is not too small. Qin Chen looked at the treasures here, all kinds of weapons, defenses, and auxiliary types. There are holy soldiers, armors, shields, flying treasures such as Noah's Ark, escape treasures, and even treasures such as air-breaking talisman, all of which are expensive. In addition, there are all kinds of sky-defying flames, as well as the exchange of refining tools and alchemy materials. Of course, the most sacred soldiers, because the work of heaven is rich in sacred soldiers. Whenever someone refines top weapons, they will be placed here for internal exchange. Some ordinary sacred soldiers are sold through their channels and supplied. The front line of the demon battlefield. Qin Chen has no interest in other treasures for the time being. When it comes to attacks, he has mysterious rust swords and other things, and when it comes to hiding, he also has jade discs, etc. 
what he needs is at most some powerful spatial treasures, which can be used to fill the sky. The technique is integrated into the Jade Disc of Good Fortune from the universe, and strengthens the effect of the Jade Disc. However, space treasures are extremely expensive. In contrast, combat saints are the cheapest, followed by armor, and then various auxiliary treasures. Space generally belongs to the auxiliary category, and the price is the most expensive. A top-tier Heavenly Saint's low-grade saint weapon only needs 10,000 contribution points, but a space-type low-grade treasure requires 16, or even more, with a huge price difference. Don't underestimate the price of 6,000 to 7,000. Working in Tian, the contribution point is very difficult to get. You can see the clue from the only 30,000 yuan that can be used to kill Yin Yang Lang Jun. Let's first see what treasures suit me. Qin Chen walked in, all kinds of treasures dazzled him, and he kept watching, especially some sword-like treasures, which still made Qin Chen quite concerned, and his consciousness kept sweeping. After a while, Qin Chen had already entered a higher level. This scanning process is too slow, why not stimulate it? Qin Chen's heart moved, exuding a sword intent, motivating the swordsman treasure here. Suddenly, countless swordsmanship treasures trembled and were inspired by Qin Chen's sword intent, emitting light. But none of these swordsman magic weapons made Qin Chen particularly satisfied. All the way in. Whoosh! Suddenly, Qin Chen seemed to have touched a powerful saint soldier. In the sky. A sharp sword light with a strong aura flew over, slashed the void, and slashed towards him. A river of sword energy appeared, vast and mighty. When Qin Chen raised his hand, and this sword aura was immediately pinched in his hand, swaying, like a spirit snake, almost cutting Qin Chen's barren ancient body. Awesome! Qin Chen retreated slightly under the sword aura, almost injured by his cultivation base. If a general Tian Sheng midterm giant came in, he might be seriously injured by a blow. He looked at it and saw that it was a sacred soldier at the peak of the middle rank of heaven. It was mighty, with many sword marks on it. It seemed like a peerless master who was practicing swordsmanship and engraving his martial arts on it. A sense of decisiveness. Moreover, there is a vicissitudes of history on it. This is not a new refinement made by heavenly work refiner, but an ancient sage soldier. Looking at the price, Qin Chen was speechless. 40,000 contribution points. This is simply robbery. Qin Chen urged a trace of mysterious rust sword aura, and suddenly, the old sage soldier who was still radiant and murderous suddenly trembled, like a frightened cat, and did not dare to move. Ugh. Qin Chen was speechless. After having the mysterious rust sword, the other holy soldiers did not attract him much, unless they were truly against the heavens. It's a pity that no matter how big the treasure is in the temple, it is impossible for the holy master weapon to appear. The ordinary sage soldier Qin Chen could refine it by himself, processing it on the basis of the nameless sword, and Qin Chen was completely confident to refine it to a level not inferior to the ancient sage soldier in front of him. The most important thing is cheapness. Qin Chen has no contribution at all right now. It's better to choose some defensive treasures for Sisi, Ao Qingling, and Qin Ting Ting. Qin Chen's heart moved. Sisi is okay, already has the Kang Yuan map, and has the inheritance of the nine-tailed fairy fox. He is born with a charming technique, and the ordinary strong can't hurt at all. The strong can really hurt her and the ordinary treasure can't defend it. But you can buy some escape treasures like the Breaking Talisman. But Ao Qingling and Qin Tingting are not as talented as Sisi. To survive in Tianjiao and Guanggan Mansion, they still need some defensive treasures, at least they cannot be easily crushed by some giants. This is critical. Qin Chen went all the way in, looking at the various defense treasures, and after a while, he was a little dumbfounded. 30,002. 35. 40,000. 41. The more you go in, the more expensive the treasure. The key is cheap, which Qin Chen doesn't like, 
because the protection effect is not so good, but the better ones are too expensive. Hey, this treasure is good. Qin Chen's gaze suddenly fell on a cyan silk garment. The silk garment was as smooth as satin, shimmering like a starry sky, and it was astonishingly bright. The starry sky cicada clothing is made from the wings of the starry sky cicada, a mid-tier heavenly treasure, which can withstand the attacks of the peak powers in the middle of the sky for a certain period of time. The starry sky cicada is a space attribute monster with space attributes. The starry sky cicadas made of its wings make the wearer more comfortable in the control of the void when he travels through the void. Value, 50,000 contribution points. This defensive armor is good. Qin Chen's heart moved, this starry sky Chan Yi suits Ao Qing Ling. Unfortunately, the price is too expensive. You can just remember to contribute 50,000 points. Qin Chen continued to move forward. Soon, he saw another defensive holy soldier that satisfied him. The void shield is made of void spar. Once activated, it can withstand the attacks of the peak giants in the middle of the heavenly sage, and has a hidden effect. It is a top defensive treasure. Value, 50,000 contribution points. This one is suitable for Qin Ting Ting, and the price is exactly the same as Xin Kong Chan Yi, not cheap. What? Suddenly, Qin Chen saw a treasure again and couldn't help but let out a surprise. This is a whole body of snow white gauze. On top of the soft gauze, it is shining with brilliance, like it is made of the feathers of the gods. It is soft and phantom, giving people a beautiful feeling. In these many treasures in, as dazzling as a queen. The phoenix feather robe is made from the feathers of the ancient monster Nine Phoenix Phoenix. It has amazing defensive power and is gentle and comfortable. It can be integrated into the holy Yuan, fit on the surface of the body, and even filter the impurities in the holy energy of heaven and earth. So that the wearer's efficiency in absorbing the holy energy of the heavens and the earth is increased by 30%, stimulating to the extreme, and able to withstand the short-term attack of the strong man in the late stage of the holy. Value, 88,000 contribution points. Yes. Qin Chen took a breath of air, and could withstand a blow from the late heavenly sage powerhouse. This treasure was almost comparable to a heavenly high-rank saint soldier treasure. The price is also the most amazing, 88,000. This gauze suit is very suitable for Sisi. It is enough to increase Sisi's defensive ability by a whole level. Unfortunately, the price is not cheap. 88,000 contribution points are equivalent to killing three yin and yang lords. I it's not impossible, but it will take too much time. It would take a lot of time to kill three powerful men like yin yang lang jun, even if Qin Chen slashed the chaos with a quick knife, one of them would take a lot of time, and three of them did not know how long it would take. What's more, even if you kill three of them, you only have 90,000 contribution points, and you can only buy one defensive treasure. In the future, it is more than 100,000 level. Qin Chen has seen it for so long. 10,000 to 20,000 contribution points are the holy soldiers of the peak of the low-grade heavenly ranks, and between 20,000 and 100,000 are the middle-ranked heavenly soldiers. The sage soldiers who reached the peak of the mid-rank of the heavenly ranks, more than 100,000 were the sage soldiers of the top-ranked heavenly rank, that was the realm level of the strong man in the late stage of the sage. Although this level of saint weapon is powerful, for Qin Chen now, it is still a bit too wasteful. If a treasure can't exert its true power, it's better to buy a saint weapon from the heavenly middle grade peak. Comfortable. Okay. As Qin Chen was thinking, suddenly, the origin of time in Qin Chen's mind moved slightly, as if there was something in front of him attracting him. This is. Following the change of the origin of time, Qin Chen saw a colorless spar, exuding the aura of time, suspended in the sky, around, and other treasures, even those of top grade heaven. They were all overshadowed by the brilliance of the spar at this moment. The origin of time. No, it's a time spar. Qin Chen took a breath and there was a time spar in this treasure holy temple. 
Time Spar, a treasure with special power of time, rumors, is a kind of time crystallization born during the continuous flow of years, which contains the profound meaning and power of time. Rumor has it that once a warrior completely absorbs the time spar, he will be able to comprehend a hint of time. This kind of treasure is extremely against the sky, how could it just appear in the treasure temple? Qin Chen hurriedly looked at the price. At this glance, he almost vomited blood. 0.88 million contribution points. Damn, is this a robbery? No wonder no one exchanges. In just an instant, Qin Chen understood the reason for coming. According to a book he had seen before, the time spar was actually not a special treasure in the ancient heavens. Although it is rare, the time spar has appeared many times because of the long history of the years. Many big men and strong men, knowing that it is precious, have spent a lot of money to buy, trying to grasp the profound meaning of that little time. However, for so many years, almost no one has truly understood it and mastered that trace of time. In many cases, it was just a touch of time rules, and it did not have much to improve the cultivation of martial artists and combat power. Effect Over time, the time spar has become a legendary treasure with amazing value, but few people are willing to spend a lot of money to buy it. Just like this time spar, it is priced at 880,000 contribution points. With the strength of the refiners of the Guangdong Fusion Working Branch, it is almost impossible to spend so many contribution points, and it is impossible to exchange one. Master the time spar. But at this time, the spar did not have much effect on other warriors, but it was full of attraction for Qin Chen. The other warriors of the time spar cannot understand and master it, but I am different. I have the origin of time and can easily grasp the profound meaning of time in this time spar. At that time, Qin Chen's breathing suddenly rose. He has been unable to control the origin of time, because he has been unable to comprehend the profound meaning of time, but if he had this time spar, everything would be different. Moreover, he openly exchanged the time spar, if unexpected after displaying the profound meaning of time, other people will not guess about the origin of time, but think that he has mastered the profound meaning of time in the time spar. This is a win-win result. At this time spar, I must redeem it. Qin Chen vowed secretly, but when he saw the 880,000 contribution points, he got a headache again. This price can no longer be described as expensive, but a sky-high price. For the entire Tiangong Guangdong Mansion branch, there are so many contribution points that can be used, almost no more than one hand. He is a disciple who has just joined Tiangong. Where can he find so many contribution points? Notice. General refiners can only exchange contribution points through refiners. But this process is very slow and difficult. For example, for a holy child, Tian Jiao will provide about three materials every three months, while the holy children need to hand in a heavenly low-grade holy weapon, a normal early-stage refining weapon. The division can produce one and a half saints for every three materials. That is to say, there can only be half of the saint soldier balance, and the price of an ordinary heaven rank low rank saint soldier sold to Tian Zhou is 1000 contribution points, and half is 500 points. Every three months, only 500 points can be earned, 2000 points a year, and 10,000 contribution points, it takes five years. This is still a saint son who does not eat or drink, does not spend any contribution points, and only spends a day's work to refine free materials. Under normal circumstances, the saint son's cultivation requires a lot of resources, which is absolutely impossible to waste time. Continuously refining saint soldiers and earning this contribution point difference. And this is still on the premise that the saint's disciples have three free supplies of materials every month. As for ordinary disciples and refiners, they are not so comfortable. If you want to contribute, you can only complete some small tasks of Tian's work and work for Tian's work. The refining system Saint Soldier is earning a fixed small amount of contribution points. Too difficult. 
it will take 500 years for 1 million contribution points to accumulate 5 million without eating or drinking. Only after 500 years will Qin Chen be able to buy the time spar. Qin Chen doesn't have this time to waste at all. I still need contribution points. The ancient saint veins for cultivation requires contribution points. The purchase of various materials requires contribution points. The exchange of time spar also requires contribution points. Now I can only go to the day work task, except for the contribution point tasks in the day work. There must be many other tasks besides killing the strong. However, there are not too many contribution points for ordinary missions. Even the killing of Yin Yang Lang Jun has only 30,000 contribution points. If I want to collect all the contribution points to buy time spar, I need to kill 30 Yin Yang Lang. Jun, this is impossible to do, so I have to take on some extremely difficult and extremely abnormal tasks. Go to the mission hall first. I believe that heavenly work has stood for so many years, and there must be many extremely difficult perverted tasks. Only by completing such tasks can I get more rewards. Whoosh! Doing what he thought, Qin Chen didn't hesitate anymore turned around and walked out of the treasure treasure temple. Creek. Shimin was pushed open, and the old man guarding the door opened his eyes and saw Qin Chen walking out of it. He just nodded at first, but the more he looked at it, the more he was surprised, because he found that Qin Chen walking out of it had a profound and vast aura, and when I first entered, there was a shocking change. Qin Chen, who had not been in front of the book collection temple before, had a strong aura and amazing talent, but still had a feeling of inexperience in the world. But now Qin Chen seems to have gone through countless vicissitudes of history, the heavens have changed, and there is a transparent feeling of seeing through everything. This feeling made the old man even watching a strong man with more experience than him, an endless shock suddenly emerged from the depths of his heart. You! The old man said hesitantly, this, you just spent three days and three nights in this treasure haven temple. Why did your breath become completely different and completely reborn? What happened to you? You have raised your realm? No, you are still a warrior at the peak of the early days of Heavenly Sage, but this breath, mood, and feeling. In Qin Chen, the old man seemed to have seen an eternal figure who understood eternity and had a clear wisdom. This kind of feeling was only felt by the Minister of Heavenly Work. At this time, Qin Chen's breath of wisdom is equivalent to a top powerhouse who has lived for many years, making people feel inexplicably afraid. It's nothing, the disciple just realized something in the treasure storage temple, looked through some celestial history, comprehended some refining techniques, and at the same time reorganized his own magical powers, formed a system, with new just comprehend. Qin Chen smiled and said, the disciples have benefited a lot from the three-day retreat. Thank you seniors for opening the door to convenience. In the future, the disciples will repay and leave. The voice fell. Whoosh! Qin Chen's body disappeared directly outside the treasure hiding temple, silently. Then Qin Chen relied on his saint son token to pass the prohibition on work for countless days and once again came to the hall on the holy island. In the main hall, people came and went, still a lively appearance, Qin Chen was familiar with the road, and soon came into the temple and walked to the task counter. It's Qin Chen. This time the newly promoted son Qin Chen. Hi, the breath on my body is really strong, and it makes me feel jealous. It hasn't been long since he was assigned to the cave mansion, what did he come to the hall to do without practicing in the cave mansion? Is it because you want to take up the mission? Or exchange materials, or sell the holy veins in exchange for cultivation resources? Many disciples began to guess, their eyes flickering. Qin Chen ignored the discussion around him and went straight to a counter. Master Saint's son. That was the job that Qin Chen handled the cave before, and when he saw Qin Chen coming straight, he couldn't help feeling a little frightened. I don't know, Lord Saint Sun, what are your needs for coming this time? He didn't dare to neglect, he hurried forward, and said respectfully, 
feeling nervous. I want to take the task, do you have any higher contribution tasks here, take a look. Qin Chen said directly. The manager breathed a sigh of relief and hurriedly said, it turns out that Lord Sun is going to take on tasks. It just so happens. Recently, there are more tasks for work, and many contributions are good. I don't know what kind of tasks Lord Sun wants to take. It doesn't matter what task, as long as the contribution point is high, I can take it. Qin Chen said lightly. Master Saint Sun, there are many tasks for our daily work, among which there are four main tasks. One is the task of collecting materials, which is to purchase extremely rare materials on the market. Including holy soldiers, any holy soldiers, and materials, as long as they are handed over to heaven. Work can be converted into contribution points. Depending on the value, the number of contribution points is different. This is the fastest way to earn contribution points. The second is the task of making sacred soldiers. After receiving them, Tian Jiao will allocate the materials for refining sacred soldiers. After you successfully refining, Lord Sun, different ranks of sacred soldiers can be exchanged for different numbers of contribution points. However, there is a problem with this kind of task, that is, if the refining fails, it needs to compensate for the loss of the heavenly work materials. You also know that the refining master has a chance of success in refining the holy soldiers. The third kind is the beheading mission. In Guangan Mansion, and even outside Guangan Mansion, there are countless bandits, evil strong men, criminals on the wanted list, as well as demons, demons, and other races that destroy the peace of the heavens. After killing them, different powerhouses have different levels, and they get different contribution points. One month. Qin Chen frowned, it was too long, he didn't have so much time to waste. Can you shorten the verification time? Qin Chen asked. Of course it can. Actually, one month is due to the fact that many disciples are busy with their own affairs, and may not be able to verify it in the first time. But in fact, many questioners have been asking questions for many years. For decades, even hundreds, or thousands of years, if someone is willing to answer for them, they are even willing to let go of everything and verify it on the same day, but this needs to be communicated with the questioner in advance, Lord Sun, do you think which question to answer? I can help ask the questioner and get a reply soon. So? Qin Chen thoughtfully. If my answer is correct, but the other party insists on saying it is not correct, why not contribute? Qin Chen asked again. Holy Sun, you don't have to worry about this question at all. The manager smiled, if you are sure to be bold and correct, but the other party does not admit it, you can directly submit it to the elders for reconsideration. Once the elders verify that the answer is correct, the questioner will severe punishment, ranging from ten times the points to the answerer, or directly expelled from work. Of course, the answerer can't answer some solutions that the questioner can't do at all, as well as ambiguity, feasible or not, so the elders will not approve it. Basically, in the history of my work, there has not been a case where the answerer has the correct answer, and the questioner does not admit that something happened. Qin Chen nodded, take me to the solution area. After hearing this, he nodded, thinking that Qin Chen knew which question had a solution, and immediately brought Qin Chen to the solution area. You come and send me a message. As soon as he sat down, Qin Chen said to the steward. I don't know which question you want to answer, Lord Saint Sun. The steward smiled. As long as it is less than 10,000 contribution points and more than 3,000 contribution points, you will send a message to the questioner. My requirement is that the other party must have time to verify within one day, otherwise, the task will be taken from me. Removed from the list, if the other party's feedback can be done, then submit it to me. Qin Chen said. You, sure. The manager was stunned for a moment, with less than 10,000 contribution points and more than 3,000 contribution points. 
is this enough to have thousands of problematic tasks? Hurry up! Qin Chen said lightly, I don't need me to remind you a second time, right? Yes. The manager was taken aback and didn't dare to neglect, and immediately started sending group messages. Of course, he changed the wording for Qin Chen during the group sending, saying that if the other party agreed to verify within one day, he would start to try to answer. In this way, even if Qin Chen couldn't solve it, there wouldn't be any particularly big problems. Di 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 di. Almost instantly, all the questioners of these thousands of questions received news. A certain mansion. An elder who was refining was prompted by the message, picked up the token, frowned, which elder is this to answer the question? It must be verified within a day before attempting to answer it. This is to the mission department. Looking for inspiration. The old man sneered and didn't bother to pay attention to the news. He was in the process of refining. Although the questions he raised had puzzled him for hundreds of years, he couldn't stop refining to verify the answer to this question, right? And the other party may not really be able to answer. Put down the token directly, ignore it and continue refining. Another mansion. A refiner opened his eyes while practicing, and revealed the same doubts, but he hesitated for a while, and still agreed. Anyway, it's only a day. This time I practiced for a long time. The question has puzzled me for thousands of years. It is unlikely to answer it, but it is better to try than not to try. At this moment, many refiners who worked in the sky had received messages, some were disdainful, some sneered, some were interrupted in refining and unhappy in cultivation, and so on. Most of them chose to ignore it, because this kind of thing hadn't happened before. It was because some elders felt doubts and problems during the refining process and wanted to come to the mission area to find inspiration. But like this time, it is the first time to directly ask to verify the answer within a day. Who? It's so arrogant that they are asked to answer the question within a day before the question has started. Isn't this funny? If they ask questions that are so easy to answer, will they put a hundred or thousand years of time in the work task department? Of course, although the vast majority of people are unwilling, there are still a small number of refiners who are not busy, holding the attitude of giving it a try, and submitting for approval. Beeb. At this moment, Qin Chen, who was in the answering area of the Tian Gongshan Island Hall, finally began to have the first question before his eyes, and more and more questions began to appear in the answering area. These were the questioners who accepted the conditions. Okay, let's start. Qin Chen lowered his heart, held his breath, looked at the series of question messages above, and at the same time picked up the Sheng Yuan sensor pen on the side, and started to browse the first question. The title of the whole question is very short, and Qin Chen finished reading it in a blink of an eye. When this question appeared in his mind, all the knowledge Qin Chen saw in the Treasure Treasure Temple surged voluntarily, and it repaired the sky. The technique also began to combine and deduct together, giving the answer instantly. In that watchful gaze, Qin Chen seemed to have just pondered for a while, and then he started writing quickly. This begins to answer. It was a little dazed to deal with things, because he knew very well that the question Qin Chen answered was not something he had prepared early. It was only when the other party responded to the request first that it would be the first one to present it. Unable to think of the first question, Qin Chen just can answer. But to make things dumbfounded, Qin Chen only took a few minutes to answer the first question, and then his eyes fell on the second question. Qin Chen hardly paused, and continued to write on the screen in the solution area. The first question, the second question, the third question, the fourth question. Qin Chen almost didn't pause. According to the order on the task list, he started to answer the questions directly without any time for thinking. Isn't this Qin Chen answering indiscriminately? The manager's expression changed suddenly, and he hurriedly said, Master Shenzi, if you really want to answer these questions, you'd better answer with full confidence. At least, there is also an 80% certainty, 
because if you answer maliciously, once it is confirmed, you will be deducted from the corresponding contribution points, and if it is serious, you will be expelled from work. This is urgent, if Qin Chen really answers maliciously, let alone Qin Chen will be expelled, he, the reception manager, will also be punished or even expelled. However, Qin Chen, who was in the Fenbijisha book, seemed to have not heard him at all, and continued to write the answers quickly. It's over. The steward's face suddenly turned pale. He didn't believe that Qin Chen could answer so many questions so easily. If these questions were so easy to answer, he wouldn't stay at their work for so long. Because for countless years, the questions in the task list have been refurbished many times. Many refiners were unable to answer the questions when they were young. Later, as their strength improved, they gradually solved some of them. There are also questions about the answers that many elders have come to watch after they are looking for inspiration. Of course, there are some top crafting master Tianjiao who specialize in quests and earn contribution points. They will come to the quest hall for a certain period of time, soak in them, spy and understand, and constantly answer questions. Over time, the simpler tasks in all the tasks have almost been processed. The remaining ones are all truly top-level tasks. These tasks are extremely difficult, even if the core elders of the late stage of the sky come, short. It may not be able to answer within time, it needs to go through many trials and analysis. But now, Qin Chen almost finished reading the question, and after a little thought, he wrote the answer, which made the manager think that Qin Chen was definitely writing indiscriminately. It's over. This time is completely over. He was desperate and had no hope at all. Ha <laughs> ha. Qin Chen wrote quickly, his mind was completely turned at this moment, and various thoughts appeared in an endless stream. Every time he saw a topic, countless knowledge points appeared in his mind. This knowledge was originally stored in his book of origin. In. He has control, but this control is not yet complete. But now, in the rapid thinking, all kinds of knowledge in Qin Chen's mind are integrated, especially Qin Chen's sky patching technique. When he sees any problem, he can form a corresponding refining process in his mind. Perform deduction. This is terrifying. If a normal refiner wants to confirm an operation, he must actually refining, but Qin Chen can use the sky patching technique to perform the same effect which is equivalent to carrying out various difficult refining all the time. Countless knowledge points surging, Qin Chen is also quickly mastering various refining knowledge in the process of answering questions, and integrating this refining knowledge to form his own knowledge points. 10 questions 20 questions 30 questions In just two hours of work, Qin Chen has solved more than 30 questions. At this speed, there is absolutely no one who has come before. If Qin Chen, who formed the Book of Origins before, had memorized all the knowledge in the Treasure Treasure Temple, now Qin Chen, in the process of answering other people's questions, his own refining skills are also fast promote. All the refining techniques have become his real knowledge. What is Qin Chen doing? And Qin Chen's actions in the solution area quickly attracted the attention of many disciples in the hall. When Qin Chen kept answering questions left on the task book, many people suddenly showed a trace of disdain. What is the problem in the question answering area? That is the problem encountered by many refiners during the refining of the whole day's work. Many of the questions are directed to the origin of the refiner. They are extremely profound, and many of them are even natural. The elder of the refiner who is the disciple instructing the middle may not be able to answer, otherwise he would not stay here. But what about Qin Chen? A refiner who has just joined Tian Jiao, although his strength is amazing and his talent is extraordinary, he was promoted to a holy child as soon as he entered Tian Jiao, but after all, he had just joined Tian Jiao not long ago. I heard that he just refined it not long ago. Saint soldiers of the world's inferior grade. But the questions in the task area, but many of them are mid-level questions, can you answer them? Especially when Qin Chen was answering questions quickly, 
almost without stopping, everyone was going crazy. This Qin Chen is not here to make trouble, right? He is a disciple who has just joined Tian Jiao, even if he becomes a holy son, he is also the most ordinary holy son, dare to go to the solution area to answer crazy questions. It's not necessarily. The so-called art industry has specialization. Maybe this Qin Chen, in some refining aspects, and unique attainments, it is not impossible. It can't be a shit, the art industry does have specialization. The methods used by the refiner are not all the same, but in general, they are roughly the same, but when you look at Qin Chen, you are actually answering the questions indiscriminately. You dare to say that he answers all the questions. Know everything well? Look, Qin Chen has already answered more than 30 questions, right? At this moment, many of the disciples and refiners were as crazy as they looked at Qin Chen speechlessly. They were indeed Qin Chen's. The behavior is so crazy, even if it is the great elder who works in the sky, or even the minister, he dare not say that he can be like Qin Chen. Answer the questions crazy, right? This Qin Chen thinks he is a holy son, it is terrible. Doesn't he know that if he answers questions in the solution area randomly, will this cause severe punishment? Many people shook their heads speechlessly. At first, they felt that Qin Chen was a person, but now they doubt whether Qin Chen is an idiot with a problematic brain. He answered the questions indiscriminately, and he would surely shock the senior executives, and he wouldn't even know how he died by then. What happened? Sure enough, not long after, an old man in charge of the mission area came over and sneered coldly. This is a Taishang elder named Hong Yu, who is specifically responsible for the release of the task of Tianzu. Normally, no one can be seen, but the abnormality in the hall shocked him, and he came to the hall instantly. Elder Hui Hong Yu, Qin Chen is answering questions in the answering area. A disciple said carefully. Solve the problem in the solution area. Elder Hong Yu frowned, what's all the fuss about? But Hong Yu Supreme Elder, then Qin Chen has already answered more than 30 questions. The disciple was speechless. More than 30 questions. Hong Yu was taken aback, who is this Qin Chen? Why have I never heard of it? I answered more than 30 questions in the answering area. How long has he been here, are you sure? Answering more than 30 questions, no wonder it attracts so many people's attention. Even if he is immersed in doubts, Ding Tian can only answer a dozen questions. Who is this Qin Chen? So awesome? Qin Chen is our newly promoted saint son of Tianzuo. It hasn't been long since joining Tianzuo, so you don't know the elder Hong Yu. The key is that Qin Chen solved more than 30 questions in only two hours. Two hours? Impossible. Hong Yu nodded in front, but at this time, he jumped up directly. Answering more than 30 questions in two hours, what's the joke? This is simply impossible. What is the problem? Hong Yu's face was difficult to look. I, we don't know, but Qin Chen who was received by manager Lu Yu before, is still in the answering area. He must know. The disciple hesitated for a while and said. Lu Yu? Call Lu Yu over. Hong Yu's face was pale, and he gave an order, and the disciple who had something good suddenly called Lu Yu over excitedly. The answering area is very sacred. When the disciples answer the questions in the answering area, even if he is the supreme elder, he can't directly destroy it. This is the most basic rule of heaven's work, so they can only call Lu Yu. Lu Yu was in the answering area, also anxiously turning around. At this time, when he heard the elder Hong Yu summoning himself, he walked over in tears, feeling despair in his heart. Say, what is going on with Qin Chen? Hong Yu was not angry. Going back to the elder Tai's Hang, that Qin Chen is the newly promoted saint son of Tianzuo. He found his subordinates before and said that he would do a mission to earn contribution points. After choosing a few times, he chose to answer the mission. 
get more contribution points and let your subordinates directly send messages to all refiners who have posted tasks, asking them to verify the answers within a day. Many people refused, but some refiners agreed. Now Qin Chen is answering the tasks of these people. Manager Liu Yu shuddered, said. Just to earn contribution points. Hong Yu looked dazed, he is a newly promoted saint's son, where does he have the ability to answer so many questions? This, the subordinates don't know either. Liu Yu said with trepidation. Hong Yu frowned, I remember it's not time to select the saint's son, who specially approved Qin Chen's saint's son status. It's the great elder. Great elder? Does this Qin Chen really have a super heaven-defying talent for refining tools, able to answer all doubts? Or is he a late-stage Tian-level refining master? Impossible. Hong Yu couldn't help saying, frowning, thinking carefully. It is almost impossible to have an idiot who can join the work of heaven, and that Qin Chen is also the saint son specially approved by the great elder himself, and he still believes in the eyes of the great elder. Could it be said that Qin Chen was a craftsman at the late stage of the heavenly rank, so as soon as he joined the great elder, he was specially approved as a holy son? But even a late-day refiner can't solve more than 30 questions in two hours, right? Late heavenly stage. Liu Yu's eyes turned black, returned to the supreme elder, this Qin Chen joined through our heavenly work assessment. He only broke through the early stage of heavenly sage not long ago and he is not a crafting master in the late heavenly stage. I just broke through the early days of heavenly sage not long ago. Hong Yu put a black line on his head and said, it's a nonsense. He originally thought that Qin Chen was the top crafting master with special tricks, so he came to answer, who knows, he was just a disciple who had just broken through the heavenly sage. Although he was a holy child, he didn't even reach the middle of the heavenly grade in terms of craftsmanship. Isn't this fooling around? Elder Hong Yu, this Qin Chen is clearly making trouble, it is better to let the disciple pull him out. Some disciples were eager to try, their eyes glowing. It is a rare thing to be able to show your face in front of the elder Tais Hang. Normally, they would not dare to do anything to a saint's son, but as long as the elder Hong Yu ordered, they were fearless inappropriate. Hong Yu frowned, but waved his hand. Although Qin Chen was answering questions indiscriminately, he did not violate any rules after all. So far, there is no evidence that Qin Chen is making trouble. He sits in the task hall and maintains the majesty and order of the heavenly work, so he naturally has to abide by the rules more and not betray the law privately. Who of you responded to Qin Chen's message? Elder Hong Yu turned his head. As soon as these words were said, everyone instantly understood the purpose of the Elder Hong Yu. As long as it proves that Qin Chen is answering the question indiscriminately, then the Elder Hong Yu is qualified to intervene in Qin Chen's answer. Elder Hong Yu, I. A refiner carefully raised his hand. This is a mid level heavenly sage powerhouse. It has been thousands of years since joining heavenly work but his refining attainments have remained at the lowest rank of heavenly grade, and he has not broken through for many years. If in the next thousand years, he still cannot break through, when the time comes, he will become a steward and deacon of Tian Jiao to do basic work. Then Qin Chen answered your question. Hong Yu Supreme Elder asked. Not yet. The refiner spoke, before the voice fell off, he saw his disciple token light up and immediately said, it's answered, Qin Chen answered my question, just now. Well, you can verify your question. Hong Yu said solemnly, hurry up, many people have heard the news now. If Qin Chen is really fooling around, we must stop him as soon as possible, otherwise I will lose all the face of my work. A holy son, in order to contribute points, randomly answer questions in the mission area and pass them out. No matter what. Yes. The refiner did not dare to neglect. The question he asked was a problem he encountered many times during refining, and it was the key to his breakthrough in the middle grade middle grade refiner. Over the years, he has been looking for it. 
The answer, it's a pity that he couldn't solve it after countless refining and research, so he placed it in the mission area, trying to find the answer. At the beginning, he only priced 2,000 contribution points, but over the years, no one can answer. His price has also increased from 2,000 contribution points to 8,000. But for thousands of years, he has been hanging on where there is no answer. Today, Qin Chen gave the answer. And in such a short time, it is impossible to think about it. Therefore, he didn't believe that Qin Chen had resolved it at all, but the elder Hong Ye was watching, he did not dare to neglect, and immediately followed Qin Chen's answer, but proceeded. Hey, in the process of refining, the conflict of materials is fierce, causing the mental power to not be fully integrated into it, and it will form a fragmented state, making the refined holy soldiers uneven and unable to guarantee a fixed quality. Your problem is a problem that many refiners will encounter. Seeing this disciple's problem, the elder Hong Yu couldn't help but sigh, this problem is level. This is something that almost every refining master will encounter, but each refining master will use his own unique methods to overcome this difficulty according to his own cultivation methods and different levels of mastery of refining tools. This is a question with no fixed answer. It may take a lot of energy for him to answer it, and then it is possible to come up with a method, which may not be completely suitable for the other party. For such a difficult problem, Qin Chen gave the answer in minutes. Elder Hong Yu's expression immediately became even more ugly. At this moment, the Elder Hong Yu had completely regarded Qin Chen as a fool. Too presumptuous, this Qin Chen, brave, just promoted to the Holy Son, he did such things, after he comes out, the old man will go to the great elder and say, our daily work will never tolerate anyone. Challenge the bottom line of the refiner. Elder Hong Yu's face became more and more ugly. If Qin Chen caused something else, he could still see the great elder's face on the internet, what is the answerable area? That is one of the most sacred places in the work of heaven. As a refiner, you must first have a sense of reverence for refiners. And what is stored in the answer area is the doubts of countless refiners for many years. How can they allow others to answer slanders so freely? Have you finished the verification? Senior Elder Hong Yu looked at the disciple. The more he thought about it, the more angry he was, and he couldn't wait to Qin Chen out of the solution area. Quickly, to Elder, the disciple will verify that process soon. Being stared at by countless refiners and Hong Yu, who is the Supreme Elder, the disciple of the verification made a slight sweat on his forehead, and his heart was tense. Hum. His hands flicked and he was fusing two materials, both of which were mid-level materials. During the previous fusion process, he could not grasp the degree of the fusion of the two, which made him unable to successfully refine the saint soldier of the middle rank of heavenly rank, and his question is about how to solve the material fusion. It's red moon crystal and black yeotai. Mu Hong's question turned out to be these two materials. If I remember correctly, the red moon crystal is a fire attribute material, while the black yao iron is slightly overcast. The smelting of the two is very difficult. You remember correctly, the red moon crystal is indeed a fire attribute and has a violent characteristic, while the black flares have a hint of yin attribute and are soft. It is extremely difficult to merge the two especially the structure of the two materials is complete. It is not the same, it is difficult to combine them completely, but once combined, the red moon crystal can completely release the characteristics of the black flares, forming an effect of 1 plus 1 greater than 2. If it can be merged, the crude embryos produced will already have the effect of a middle grade heavenly grade. It seems that Mu Hong wants to use this method to break through the realm of a middle grade heavenly refiner. However, the fusion of these two materials is very difficult, and many midday refiners may not be able to succeed. Mu Hong chose to refine these two materials because he cultivated the magical powers of the scorching sun and the red moon crystal. It has similar characteristics to the black lightning iron, so it is the easiest to do. Unfortunately, the conflict between the two material structures has troubled him for countless years, 
making him still unable to enter the heavenly grade middle grade mixer. A master craftsman was watching and couldn't help but say again and again. If Qin Chen solves Mu Hong's problem, can we see it? There were also some refiners who were not as strong as Mu Hong, and couldn't help but ask. Yet. A master refiner in the crowd nodded. In fact, I want to see whether the fusion between the red moon crystal and the black flares is good or not. It is still very simple. The attributes of the two are different. The red moon crystal is red and the black flares are black. Iron has the upper hand, the color of the material will quickly become black, and if the red moon crystal has the upper hand, it will become red. Once these two situations occur, the fusion fails, and only the characteristics of each other are combined. When the material emits yellow light, it is considered that the real integration is successful. A and D. Success is also divided into levels. Level. According to the success rate of the two materials being completely integrated, the level is also different, and the final effect is also very different. According to the effect, it can be divided into three levels, qualified, good and excellent. The material fusion degree reaches 60. Even if it is qualified, the material is dark yellow, with a degree of integration of 70, which is good, showing a dark orange, and a degree of integration of more than 85, it is considered excellent, and it will appear bright orange. I remember that there was a great elder in our daily work. In a class where the refining method was taught, the bright orange-black brilliance was directly refined, which will be unforgettable for a lifetime. Thinking of the scene at the time, the man's face flushed with excitement. The ability to refine the bright orange-black brilliance crystal is a level that can only be reached by the level of the Supreme Elder who has anti-natural attainments on the refining device. Elder 2? Hey, these are the top refiners of our day's work, how can they refine bright orange? It's no wonder that Mu Hong couldn't even pass the test. This is indeed a bit difficult. So. Mu Hong's problem can be regarded as the most common intractable disease encountered in refining tools. Although Qin Chen is a holy son, he wants to solve it. It's ridiculous. Look at it, everyone, Mu Hong's refining has reached a critical moment. It is estimated that the integration of the two will fail immediately. It will either become black or red. There will be no third possibility. Everyone talked a lot. Hum. Before he finished his words, the two materials in front of Mu Hong had already been combined, and a strong breath of material surged out. It seems that Mu Hong has completed the fusion of the two materials, and the result appears. Once it fails, Qin Chen is probably in bad luck. After snorting, the master refiner sneered and looked at the material of Mu Hong's color. At this look, his eyes suddenly went round, his brain rang and he froze in place. The two materials that Muhong smelted suddenly shimmered, but it was not black or red, but, dark yellow. Why is it dark yellow? Did Muhong succeed in refining? This, how is it possible? Muhong has studied the fusion of red moon crystal and black yao iron for thousands of years and failed to succeed. Why did it suddenly succeed this time? The refiner rubbed his eyes vigorously unable to believe what he saw. Mu Hong seems to have really succeeded in smelting. Although it is only dark yellow, it is also qualified. No, it is not qualified. Someone in the crowd shouted. Accompanied by his voice, the light of the material in front of Mu Hong's eyes continued to bloom, from the dark yellow at the beginning, it turned slowly to dark orange. Good. Turns out to represent a good dark orange. At this moment, everyone on the court was stunned. Even Mu Hong, who was refined by himself, and the elder Hong Yu Tai Hang who watched from the side, had their eyes widened with a look of disbelief. Mu Hong, the integration was successful? Is it a coincidence? Still an accident? But when everyone was unbelievable, the dark orange material changed again, from dark orange to bright orange. Hum. The bright bright orange light blooms in the hall, magnificent, just like the bright starry sky. 
The dazzling orange light shone everywhere. Excellent, this is, excellent grade black Yejing. All the refiners were dumbfounded, their mouths could no longer close, and they were shaking and speechless. Isn't it that Mu Hong has been unable to merge the two materials? How come the refining was successful in a big court and the crowd was in full view, and it was the excellent black brilliance crystal? Is this, surely not dreaming? Mu Hong, what the is going on? The elder Hong Ye lost his voice. Hey Ye Jing, an excellent grade, may not be able to be refined at once. He looked at Mu Hong, didn't he mean that you couldn't refine black Ye Jing? Come and explain to me, what is going on? I. Mu Hong's body shook, and he was completely confused. The expression was both excited and seemed to cry. Elder too, I don't know what happened. He looked dumbfounded and murmured, Is it luck? Luck. Hong Yu's face turned black all of a sudden. If you only refine the qualified black Ye Jing, you can still be considered luck. Now it is an excellent black Ye Jing. Tell me it is luck? Why didn't you see your luck in the past few thousand years? At this time, Mu Hong also felt something was wrong. He looked at the identity token in his hand in shock, and muttered, Could it be, because of the answering method Qin Chen gave? Hong Yu's expression suffocated, his eyes lit up instantly, and he even anxiously said, Quickly, how did Qin Chen make you refine it? Mu Hong didn't dare to neglect and hurriedly informed Hong Yu of Qin Chen's answer. Hey, is it that simple? Use the most basic physical form to judge the process and degree of fusion. Upon hearing the method, Hong Yu was taken aback, you try again. Yes. Mu Hong did not dare to neglect, and refining again, and this time, Hong Yu watched his refining process carefully. The whole process is very simple, nothing special, but in the end, Hum. The bright orange light bloomed, and Mu Hong once again refined the excellent black brilliance crystal, which represented the crude embryo black brilliance crystal of the middle grade material. Kang. The Hei Yejing in Mu Hong's hand suddenly fell. I, I actually succeeded in refining it, and I also refined it twice, both of which were excellent grade black Yejing. Mu Hong himself was stupid. For thousands of years, he couldn't do it so easily. The feeling made him completely confused. Qin Chen, it's Qin Chen, that Qin Chen's method is correct. Finally, everyone thought of a possibility and looked at Qin Chen in amazement, revealing an extremely shocking color. Although it only verified Mu Hong's answer, the implications of this shocked everyone present. Quickly, Lu Yu, go and gather the questions that Qin Chen answered and verify immediately to see if the other disciples' questions he answered are correct. The elder Hong Yu jumped up and shouted anxiously. There was an incredible light flashing in his eyes, and he muttered, No. A possibility appeared in his mind, but he did not dare to imagine it at all. Yes. Lu Yu didn't dare to neglect, and hurriedly left, as a manager, to inquire about Qin Chen's answers and send messages to those disciples who gave the questions to verify. Holy Island Basilica This is the core hall of Tian Work, where Tian Work specializes in reporting, handing over tasks, allocating resources, redeeming contribution points and exchanging materials for Tian Work staff. As a craftsman in the work of heaven, most people usually work either on missions or practicing or refining in their own residences. They rarely hang out but because of the importance of the core hall, they still there will be some. The disciple wandered here. However, under normal circumstances, these disciples would wait and see in the mission area to see if there is a new mission that suits them, or exchange the materials they need in the material exchange area. As for other places, the number of disciples is very small. Especially in places like the solution area, the flow of personnel is pitifully small and often a day's work may not necessarily have a refiner enter. But today, the solution area at this time is noisy, like a tea house, everyone's faces are all showing excitement, from time to time someone is watching the identity token in their hands, 
as if waiting for something, full of anxious. This scene starts with Liu Yu going to verify. Because of Mu Hong's incident, the elder Hong Yu Taishang began to take Qin Chen's answer seriously, so he tried his best to get Liu Yu to find several disciples who had already received Qin Chen's answer. The disciples heard that their task was answered, and at first they didn't care, and they didn't even prepare to verify it on the spot, but because of the order of the elder Hong Yu, they started to verify it immediately. But the result stunned them. Those refining that they had been unable to complete before, after using Qin Chen's answering method, they were all solved magically, even in the process of solving it was perfect, almost no problem was encountered. This result shocked the elder Hong Yu and everyone present. Especially after everyone saw that a refiner put forward an answer to a basic puzzle that many refiners had encountered, everyone was shocked. Qin Chen's answer is in-depth and simple. It is interlinked. There is no need for these people to carry out refining and verification. In his mind, it is like a divine enlightenment. It suddenly confused this question. Moment. Enlightened. At this moment, the entire core hall burst instantly. Especially many disciples' problems have been solved one by one. By this time, if all the refiners present did not understand, they would not be worthy of becoming members of the heavenly work. Qin Chen, although he just became a holy son, Xiu for just the beginning. Pinnacle, but the attainments in the refining process are so enchanting, there is almost nothing he doesn't know. As a result, the entire day's work exploded in an instant, and all the refiners in the core hall were crazy. They came up one after another, temporarily submitted tasks, and wrote all the problems they encountered during the refinement process. And, moreover, both indicate that verification can be performed within one day. Numerous questions were submitted one after another, and they all wanted Qin Chen's answer. All the refiners who submitted the questions were extremely worried. Qin Chen in the answering area naturally didn't know that the outside world was so lively. Although he discovered that there were a lot of questions suddenly, but he came to earn contribution points, so naturally it would not be too troublesome, and in the process of answering these tasks, he himself the forge. Achievements will also be significantly improved, and naturally answer them one by one without any worries. At this moment, the entire core hall went crazy in an instant. I saw in the core hall, countless disciples crowded here, and even many elders received the news and surrounded the hall. Ah, my question has been answered, it has been answered. Suddenly, a refiner exclaimed, his face showed a trace of excitement, and his mental power quickly penetrated into his identity token. How? How? On the side, many refiners were waiting anxiously. That's it, that's it, haha, I understand, I understand, it turns out that such a combination is wrong in itself, it is not a question of timing, but a lack of a catalyst, as long as the addition of one can promote two materials. The catalyst of reflection, that. After a while, the face of the refiner quickly became flushed, and his mouth murmured, and the whole person became extremely excited, and his body couldn't help shaking. Although the refiner didn't say whether the answer was right or wrong, everyone knew the result. Hey, hey. Many people's expressions were nervous, and they kept trying to squeeze forward to see if Qin Chen had answered his question. At the same time, more refiners flocked to the few remaining task submission areas to submit tasks. In the past, for them, the task submission area was not at all painful. At this moment, they are all entangled and pained. There are too many people who want to apply for questions, and task review requires a process. To enter. Task submission is not enough for them. It's really because there are too many refiners who want to answer the questions, and even some elders secretly mingled in the crowd, submitting answers secretly, sneaking. And some refiners who have already posted questions are as anxious as thousands of claws are scratching, and they are very itchy. The long time of looking at it has already made them clear that the order of Qin Chen's answers is based on the reward. Contribution Points The few who come in the ranks, 
they can't wait to see, their own problem is ranked first. The previous one, are you ready? Hurry up. Hey, you guy has occupied a task submission area for a while. Isn't it okay? How many tasks are you going to submit? The entire answer area is extremely noisy, and many people are crowded and occupied a few. The refiner in the task submission area was dissatisfied. If it weren't for being in the core hall and the members were not allowed to fight against each other, I am afraid that many refiners present would not be able to bear it. It's going to be melee. Swish. Amidst the crowd, a refiner could no longer stand it, and the whole person turned into an afterimage, and quickly came to the front desk. Quickly, add 5,000 contribution points to my question, numbered 67329, hurry up. The refiner shouted to the steward of Tien's work with a flushed face. 8, 93, 1, my question plus 8,000 contribution points, a total of 18,000 contribution points. Another refiner also came to the service desk like lightning, and said anxiously. At the beginning, everyone saw that Qin Chen chose to answer between 3,000 and 8,000. When submitting the task, he also set the contribution point in this range. But now, as everyone submits more and more questions many, even a few high contribution points. After all the problems of the elders were solved, these refiners went crazy. This kind of opportunity is rare for thousands of years. Compared with the improvement of strength and cultivation base, what is the point of contribution? In particular, Mu Hong, who was trapped for thousands of years with a heaven-level lower-grade refiner, was even more likely to go directly from a heaven-level lower-grade refiner who had not broken through for many years to the mid-level realm because of Qin Chen's problems. Is to make the countless refiners present. You can't press Jina anymore. Although the contribution points are precious and scarce, they can still be earned by doing missions and refining sacred soldiers, but if the puzzles that have troubled oneself for many years cannot be solved today, it is very likely that they will continue to be puzzled for countless years. Therefore, after seeing the rapid increase in the number of mission areas, in order to allow Qin Chen to answer his own questions as soon as possible, Many refiners temporarily increased the number of contribution points obtained after answering the questions. The news in the mission area is updated in time, that is to say, once the contribution point of the question changes, it will be reflected on the mission screen in front of Qin Chen. Several stewards started to operate in a hurry. After listening to the urging of many refiners, they were completely overwhelmed. It was not a matter of a day or two for them to come here as stewards but today's scene is in their impressions. Also, this is the first time. For a time, the information on the questions released in the lobby increased at a crazy rate, and these questions all have the same characteristic, that is, the answer points are higher than each one. No one knows exactly when Qin Chen is going to answer, so naturally he took advantage of this rare opportunity to answer the doubts in his heart, otherwise Qin Chen suddenly didn't answer wouldn't it be regrettable? The refiners who were lucky enough to be able to solve the problem did not hesitate to pay their contribution points while admiring them. At the same time, they were full of admiration for Qin Chen, the newly promoted Saint Sun's accomplishments in refining. I heard that in the assessment of joining the heavenly work, this child used half-step heavenly sage's cultivation to produce a heavenly rank saint soldier. Everyone who had heard of this before had some doubts. At this moment, there was no doubt at all. Gaze Tian Jiao, this is the real Gaze Tian Jiao, as if born to live for refining tools. Even afterwards, many elders who received the news swarmed over. After seeing the madness of the hall, they were all dumbfounded. After understanding for a while, these elders also became fans of Qin Chen, and secretly began to submit questions. Of course, the difficulty of the questions submitted by these elders is much harder than that of ordinary disciples, but they do not expect Qin Chen to be able to answer them. They all set their contribution points to one point with the intention of giving it a try. Amazingly. Step. In the answering area, Qin Chen has been busy for most of the day. During this most of the day, 
he successfully answered nearly a hundred questions. His attention was highly concentrated, staring at the task screen intently, and the origin in his mind books and the sky patching madness. Frenzy Operation Every question here is not simple, and almost every question is above the heaven level. The reason why Qin Chen only chooses between 3,000 and 8,000 contribution points is because the difficulty of these questions is basically early peak. Qin Chen said he could answer. But later, as Qin Chen's understanding of refining tools became deeper and deeper, and the knowledge in the Book of Origins and the techniques of patching the sky were completely integrated and became Qin Chen's own knowledge, Qin Chen answered more and more. Profound even some questions about mid-celestial level and even the peak of mid-celestial level can be answered. This spread out, it was shocking. You know, although many questions are only in the middle of the sky level, in fact, even if a master crafting master in the latter stage of the sky level comes, they may not be able to answer them. After the refiner's rank reaches the heaven level, each refiner has its own set of theories and methods. Other refiners may not be able to understand, let alone give them answers in these aspects. This is also the solution to these problems. One of the important reasons why the answer zone has been hung up for a long time. But in front of Qin Chen, although some questions were troublesome, they were only troublesome, and they were not impossible to answer. However, there were still some questions that Qin Chen gave up. Because these issues involve the most core part of the refining tool, although Qin Chen possesses countless knowledge, after all, he is only the refining master at the peak of the early days of Heavenly Sage. Of course, relying on the technique of patching the sky, he can even refine the heavenly level. The holy soldiers of the product come. But it does not mean that he has no doubts. And there are some answers to some questions that need to use some of the contents of the sky patching technique, but it is impossible to answer them with the knowledge of books in the treasure temple. Naturally, Qin Chen wouldn't answer these questions. If he exposes his sky patching technique, it is very likely to cause a lot of trouble. Although Qin Chen didn't know what was happening outside, seeing the countless high score questions constantly appearing in the answering area, he naturally guessed something vaguely. In this way, Qin Chen was completely in the middle of answering the question. He did not deliberately pay attention to the contribution points, so he answered the questions tirelessly. At the beginning, he answered the questions for the contribution points, but later, he discovered that, here, the questions are all very representative, and there are many questions, which have given him a great inspiration for this newcomer to the Heavenly Crafting Master. From these questions, he was able to understand the ideas of many refiners. Each of these refiners was a master refiner above the heavenly level. Their ideas were precious wealth, and they were given to Qin. Incomparably great enlightenment. Qin Chen had a brand new understanding of the knowledge in the treasure treasure temple, and it became his own thing completely. When Qin Chen recovered from the state of enthusiasm, it was already a day and a night. Call. Qin Chen let out a long breath, and replied crazily day and night. Even with his soul strength, he couldn't bear it, and there were waves of weakness in his mind. Constantly answering all kinds of esoteric refining questions is a serious waste of energy and energy. After Qin Chen woke up, the first thing he did was to focus on the contribution point of the identity token. This look immediately made him startled. 2,899 million contribution points, this number made his mind a little confused, and for a moment he almost thought that he had read it wrong. He was stunned, only to realize that it was indeed 2.89 million. The answer day and night made him instantly from a pauper with the least contribution points to one of the people who contributed the most points in the entire day's work. You must know that a most basic late-stage sage soldier only needs 100,000 points, and the points Qin Chen earned in one day and one night is enough to buy nearly 30 late-stage sage soldiers. What is this concept? What Qin Chen didn't know was that in addition to the 2 million plus contribution points, he still had a considerable amount of contribution points, because the questioner hadn't confirmed it yet, so it didn't arrive. 
The huge number exceeded his expectations, and at the same time, it made Qin Chen exhale a big breath, and the concentration of answering one day and one night made his mind a little tired. Questions and thoughts turned in his mind. When he moved, his thinking was a little confused for a while. Hey, now I finally have contribution points to buy Time Spar, and they can also buy all the defensive treasures that Sisi and the others need. Qin Chen stood up, this was the first thought in his mind at that time. Why didn't he answer Qin Chen? What's the matter? My question is ranked third next, why didn't I answer it? Continue to answer. Seeing Qin Chen put down the message pen in his hand and stood up, many of the craftsmen present couldn't help but scream. At the same time, their hearts sank, Qin Chen didn't know how to answer it, right? In annoyance, everyone saw that Qin Chen did not continue to answer, but walked out of the answering area. Why so many people? As soon as Qin Chen walked out of the answering area, he saw countless pairs of fiery eyes, and he was almost startled. What's happening here? He just answered a question, as for so many people? After looking around, I found Manager Lu Yu, and immediately walked over, Manager Lu Yu, my answer is complete, I am a little tired, there should be no other procedures? Can I go? The contribution points are all in the account, there should be no problem, but Lu Yu is the task manager, Qin Chen still has to ask, if there is anything to deal with, he should deal with it in time. Oh, oh, no more, no more. Manager Lu Yu said hurriedly, and then said to the elder Hong Ya who was next to him, Master Saint, this is Master Hong Ya who is in charge of our mission hall. I have seen the elder Hong Yu. Qin Chen saluted, is there anything wrong with the elder Hong Yu? Qin Chen frowned. How could he answer the question by himself, so that he was shocked by a supreme elder? Could it be that the other party saw his own sky patching technique? Qin Chen's heart was stunned. After so many experiences, Qin Chen finally knew that the heavenly patching palace was once powerful in the celestial realm. It was the top one among the celestial refining powers, and even the birthplace of the ancient heavenly work. Carry. The inheritance of Mending Heaven Palace will definitely be coveted by countless refiners, and it is possible to kill people and make things worse. Therefore, when he answered before, he answered at the highest level to the middle of the heavenly rank. It was not because he couldn't answer higher, just to hide himself. Why, he still alarmed the Supreme Elder. It's okay, I just heard that Your Excellency answered many questions from the refiner here and I came here admiringly. The elder Hong Yu said, his tone was very gentle. The great elder laughed. The questions answered by the disciple are not worth mentioning. They are just some of the early and mid-stage problems of the heavenly rank. You will also earn contribution points. You will be able to solve it easily if you become the elder too. You praised it. Qin Chen. He shook his head and said. Elder Hong Yu's eyes twitched. If it weren't for Qin Chen's character, he would think Qin Chen was mocking him. Can it be solved easily? He couldn't answer this, and his old face was a little red. Since the elder Tai Hang has nothing to do, then the disciple retires first. Qin Chen didn't want to be watched by so many people, so he left. With a flash of Qin Chen's figure, he came to a street surrounded by buildings of all kinds. I don't know where Ching Ling and the others are. Qin Chen looked around, frowning slightly, but he was not impatient, walking on this street, looking around. This warrior department is really different from the refining division. The refining division is very classical. Although there are many buildings, most of them are functional buildings. They are places for work and training. But the warrior division is different. There are many shops. Qin Chen walked on this wide street. The street was paved with white jade. On both sides were shops and restaurants. There was a feeling of being in the world. The only difference was that these business people were all heaven. The staff at work have different levels of strength. These are all disciples of the martial arts department in Tianzuo. 
The martial arts department is much larger than the refining division, and has a lot of staff. It can be seen from the number of martial arts division and refining division disciples recruited in Yunso. The difference in the number of people between each other, even tens of times. Moreover, the martial arts department is also more open. Tian Jiao is so famous. Many top forces in Guanggan Mansion want to send their disciples to Tian Jiao to practice. However, the refining division is the core of Tian Jiao, and no one can enter. Go, but the warrior department is different, as long as they have enough connections, they can be sent to the warrior department to learn and practice. This has also led to the fact that there are still many related households in the military department. Compared with the refining division, the warrior division is more like a secular hodgepodge, and as a result, it has spawned many shops and businesses. People from all major powers will choose to open a shop in the day job as long as they have the conditions to make friends. Personal connections also earn a lot of holy crystals. And doing business here is different from the outside world, it's a bit more calm and less disputes. In the air, there was a wave of clear spirits, which was the most suitable for cultivation. The entire martial arts kingdom was running slowly, and the holy energy was filled with sacred air. It was a treasured place for cultivation. Qin Chen was unfamiliar with the place where he was born in the military department, so he could not go directly to Ao Qingling and Qin Ting Ting, but he had notified Chai Mei in advance. What Qin Chen has to do now is to wait for Chai Mei to arrive and work with Chai Mei in the sky. For many years, finding Ao Qingling and Qin Ting Ting shouldn't be difficult. Qin Chen walked into a restaurant at random and looked at the recipe. There were many weird delicacies on it, such as dragon velvet and phoenix liver, stir-fried demon heart, qingluan tongue, braised kirin brain, all kinds of dishes there are some fine wines that Yunzo can't eat at all, and they are all brewed with holy water that is rare between heaven and earth. Of course, the price of these drinks is not expensive. If you use the sacred crystal to settle, they are all worth the sky. There are some top dishes, and even worth a peculiar local vein. Of course, you can also use contribution points to settle, and the cheap ones only need a few contributions. Point, expensive is worth thousands of contribution points, most people simply cannot afford it. Qin Chen randomly ordered a plate of steamed arawana, a stir-fried kirin tendon, and a dish such as Tian Sheng tea marinated phoenix egg, and a small pot of Bai Xiujing's and dragon blood wine. Observe the context of the entire warrior department, and sense tyrannical characters. In this restaurant, there were also many warriors and disciples who talked and talked loudly, while Qin Chen was drinking a little wine, waiting for the arrival of Chai Mei, while also capturing the conversations of many guests in the restaurant. At a table not far to the left of Qin Chen, there were a few men and women with extraordinary auras, with terrifying aura of law surging in their bodies which turned out to be the cultivation base of the early days of Heavenly Sage. They are sitting in the seats by the window. There are various rare dishes on the table, which are of great value. Obviously they have a lot of background. Moreover, there are not many people close to them, so they are extraordinary. At the moment they are talking to each other. Have you heard that this time? The training of the newly promoted disciples of the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department is about to end. Soon, it will be the arrangement of the Dongfu. This is the most important arrangement for them in the future. Yes, I heard that among the disciples this time, there are a lot of disciples with good talents. It's a pity that in the Martial Arts Department, it's not that talents are high and can arrange a good Dongfu. It needs a relationship. I remember that Nine Suns Shenshen Mountain still has several caves. It is one of the best caves in our martial arts department. I don't know if any disciples are lucky enough to live this time. The cultivation environment of Nine Suns Shenshen Mountain, it is much better than the nearby Jufeng Mountain and Giant Mountain, and the cultivation speed is at least about 50% higher, but it is not ordinary difficult to get to such a cave. Don't even think about the newly promoted disciples of Nine Suns God Profound Mountain, why don't you have their turn, don't you know, there are not many cave houses in Nine Sun God Profound Mountain, 
they are all occupied. The youth sneered. Who? Who occupied it? With such a courage, how dare to occupy the cave house of Nine Sun God Profound Mountain? Another man among them was surprised, don't the elders care? It's Mirongdian, the last newly promoted saint son of our martial arts department, you must have heard of it. Although this son has only joined our day work for less than a thousand years, he can be regarded as a newcomer, but his cultivation is unfathomable. With the fastest record, he became the saint son of our martial arts department. I am afraid that he is already a strong man in the middle of the heavenly sage, right? The strength is so strong that some old brand powerhouses dare not make enemies. It turned out to be senior brother Murongdian. The two women at this table both showed nympho-like expressions, with light in their eyes. Hee hee, don't you two like Murongdian too? You are really not afraid of death. To tell you the truth, Murongdian is a very romantic person. I don't know how many girls have been harmed. Many female talents in our martial arts department have been with him. There has been Wushan Yunyu, the nine profound imperial daughter Dafa he has practiced, the more women he has played, the more beautiful the women, and the deeper his practice. I don't know how many female disciples of our daily work have been harmed. In my fancy, that is the sheep entering the tiger's lair. As far as I know, many of our female disciples who work in the day have you and yin, which was broken by him. What? Does the warrior ministry care about it? Why do you care? You also know that what the warrior department wants is the strong, and the disciples have conflicts in order to improve themselves, especially those who can become saints. Who is not an incomparable figure, plus Murongdian does not force others only use their looks and status to seduce those women. What's more, after practicing the nine profound imperial daughter Dafa, Murong Tian's cultivation level will improve, and the women around him will also have a lot of benefits. You are willing, as long as you don't make trouble. Things that are too big, I won't care about it. This time he occupied the nine sons god profound mountain, and it is said that it was just to settle his beauties, so the upper head also opened one eye and closed one eye. But even so, he, a newly promoted saint son of the martial arts department, who broke through only three hundred years ago in the middle of the heavenly saint, has openly occupied the cave for his beauty to live in. Whose courage depends on? Even if he is the saint's son, upper head wouldn't you tolerate him doing such a thing? One of the men was surprised. Humph, don't underestimate this Murongdian. This person has supreme fortune and possesses a supreme treasure of the Zixiao Daoshui Palace. It is not an ordinary heavenly treasure, and it is infinitely powerful. He has accomplished many tasks over the years. Got a lot of adventures, and has been promoted to become a high-ranking figure in the Saint Child of the Warrior Department. Not long ago, he and the old Saint Fu Zixi had a fight because of a few women. What? He and Fu Zixi are evenly matched. Many warriors in the restaurant who heard this were all taken aback. Fu Zixi is a veteran saint, with an amazing reputation in the warrior department. He has practiced the secret technique of the Western Emperor and is rumored to be the descendant of the ancient powerful Western Emperor. Extremely scary. What kind of luck does Murongdian have? How many adventures did you get? Can you even share with him? Qin Chen listened to the side, his eyes flickering, and he couldn't think that this warrior department was as strong as a cloud, but it was normal to think about it. Those who can be selected into the warrior department are all geniuses who are against the sky. Over the years, many strong people will naturally emerge. By the way, he and Fu Zixi fought because of several women, what happened? At this time, someone asked again. I don't know the details. It is rumored that this time the martial arts department recruited disciples and recruited many good women. Then Murong Tian had been cultivating the nine profound imperial daughter Dafa, and he had already focused on the most beautiful of them. The key was Fu Zixi. After seeing a few of them, I was shocked and decided to pursue them. Only then did both parties start their hands. Hey, what woman can make the two holy sons fight? 
I don't know the specifics, but I heard that the three most talented people are actually from the same state under Guanggan Mansion. They seem to be Yunso, right? These three were trained in the martial arts department. Having already touched the realm of Heavenly Sage, Murong Tian and Fu Zixi were interested in them at the same time before they started. Moreover, Murong Tian occupied the cave house of Zhuyang Shenqian Mountain, it is said that it was to raise these three women in it. What did you say? As soon as this person's voice fell, he heard an indifferent voice. The next moment, a young man was already standing beside a few people, booming, a terrifying will, like a huge ocean, swept in instantly. It was Qin Chen. Before Qin Chen heard something interesting, but the more he listened, the more things went wrong, until after hearing Yun Zhou, Qin Chen's face suddenly changed. The women these guys were talking about were Ao Qingling and Qin Ting Ting, right? As for three people, if you count Li Wangxiu, wouldn't it be exactly three? An invisible anger suddenly surged out of Qin Chen's body. What kind of saint child of the martial arts department dared to hit his people? The three women you mentioned are definitely from Yunzhou? What are their names? Qin Chen stared at the table of people and said coldly. Under Qin Chen's gaze, these men and women felt as if they were being stared at by a beast. A wave of fear surged from deep in their hearts, and their thinking was frozen. This senior, we are just hearsay, we don't know whether it is true or not. The man who was still talking before that suddenly tremblingly said that he could feel the terrifying strength of Qin Chen, and he could pinch himself to death with one finger. Before these characters, he had no courage to resist. However, he is also full of regret at this moment, hating himself for not talking nonsense, if he gets involved in the grievances between this person and the son of Murong Tian, there will be endless troubles. Okay. Qin Chen's eyes were cold, and a murderous intent suddenly appeared. Puff, Qin Chen's hand had already pinched the man's neck and lifted it all at once. What do you want to do? This is the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department. Regardless of your job status in Tian, you will violate the rules if you act on the martial arts department disciples. Everyone at this table stood up and said sharply, but their bodies were still a little trembling and their tone trembling. Humph, your friends are sincere, get out. Qin Chen gave a cold drink, and a terrifying aura suddenly surged in his body. With a bang, these Tian Sheng disciples were shocked and flew out. One by one, blood surged, almost spewing blood and the strength in his body solidified, almost unable to move. So strong. These disciples all looked at Qin Chen in horror. They were all masters in the early days of Heavenly Sage. Although they were not the top disciples in the martial arts department, they were also the outstanding ones in the previous session of joining the sky. In front of this young man, they didn't even have the courage to resist. What kind of strength is this? Where did Tian Jiao come from? Why have they never heard of it in the military department for thousands of years? Let's talk, tell me everything you know. If you can satisfy Ben Shao, Ben Shao can give you a great good fortune. But if you don't conceal the deception, you can no longer blame Ben Shao for being polite. Believe it or not, now Ben Shao if you don't waste you less there won't be anyone from the martial arts department who will stand up for you when you return. Qin Chen said coldly. For Ao Qingling and the others, he can only adopt this method. The young man was carried by Qin Chen, and he only felt that death was coming. He looked at Qin Chen's indifferent eyes and felt that this man absolutely did what he said. If he dares to deceive him, it will be an endless nightmare to meet him. This senior, the disciple is linen from the martial arts department of the heavenly work department, but the disciple does not know much. The disciple only knows that Saint Murong has taken a fancy to a few women in Yunzo and wants to place them in the Nine Sun Shenqian. In the mountains, as for the name, I really don't know. I just heard that one of the women's surname is Ao, and the other is Li, the third surname or something. The disciple really didn't hear it. Linen looked terrified. That's it. 
suddenly there was a terrifying rage erupting in Qin Chen's eyes, with murderous aura. He couldn't think of what Murongdian really liked Ao Qingling and the others, looking for death, this person is really looking for death. How can I find the three of them? Qin Chen Han said. Senior, I don't know. Now that the training of the martial arts department is over, everyone is divided into different things. The disciple doesn't know a few people in Yunso, how can I find it? Linen said tremblingly, he only dared to say so much. Going on, even if Qin Chen let him go, Murong Tian would not let him go, and he could not escape the disaster. Don't you know? Qin Chen sneered and looked at each other with a slight pressure on his palms. Suddenly, a breath that suffocated Linen, enveloped his whole body, giving him the despair of facing death. He didn't believe that the other party was the Tian Jiao of the military department, and would not know how to find Ao Qingling and the others. I said, I said. Linen said with horror, now the training of the martial arts department is over, the next step is to allocate the Dongfu. As long as you can find the steward for the Dongfu, you can know where the Yunzo disciples are assigned. As for more, I really don't understood. Senior, I have said everything I can say, and please let me down, Senior. Linen said in pain. Don't worry, as long as you haven't lied, I will naturally let you go, and I will give you a great good fortune, but now, you have to lead the way and take me to find the manager who assigns Dongfu to the newcomer of the warrior department. Qin Chen coldly, he put N.A. Linen down, but stared at Linen, as long as the other party had any changes, he would be captured. Facing Qin Chen's icy gaze, Linen was trembling, but helpless, so he smiled bitterly, Senior, the disciple promised to take you there, but there is only so much the disciple can do. I hope that seniors can keep their promises when they get there. He knew that he would not give up if he didn't lead Qin Chen, and immediately led the way. Qin Chen ignored him and said coldly to the waiter at the restaurant behind him, if someone comes to see Ben Shao in the future, you can tell him where Ben Shao is and let him follow him. When the voice fell, he had already followed Linen, out of the restaurant, and quickly swept into the void. The void of the martial arts department was very vast, and there was even a teleportation formation. Qin Chen allowed the opponent to take it and entered the teleportation formation to go deeper into the martial arts department. As soon as he entered the teleportation formation, Qin Chen felt the changes in space, but his soul knew everything about it and controlled everything at any time. Linen took a peek at Qin Chen and found that this person was calm and free, and he walked on the ground wherever he arrived. He couldn't help but secretly admired, this is the temperament of a big man. This person suppresses me with just a few fingers. I don't know where Tian Jiao is, why have I never heard of it in the martial arts department? And why is he so excited when he heard about the women in Yunso? Is it related to the women in Yunso? He was worried and worried, no matter what the origin of the other party, but he was clearly hostile to the son of Murong Tian. Once the two sides fought against each other, regardless of the outcome, he would be caught in the middle, extremely uncomfortable. Now I can only go one step at a time. I hope that a few of my friends can act by chance and save myself. When Qin Chen rushed to the depths of the warrior department, the restaurant was noisy. Such an amazing thing happened and everyone was not surprised. Many people are discussing and guessing, what is the origin of the young man who captured Linen before? I dare to be wild in the warrior department, so brave, even seemingly to find Murongdi in trouble. However, no matter what the other party's background is, they can't provoke them. Moreover, although Qin Chen is strong, he is facing Saint Murong Tian from the martial arts department. It is rumored that Saint Murong Tian could grow so fast, and there are big people behind him. If the young man rashly offended Murong Tian, the consequences would be very miserable. Hey! Just as everyone was talking about it, a golden red gleamed in the empty space on the distant street, like a flame of light coming from the heavens, piercing the sky and directly impacting here. Before the flames arrived, the whole restaurant began to tremble, 
and everyone felt that their minds were swaying and couldn't be alone. What is an expert? Come so strong? Boom! Like a meteor falling to the ground, the street outside the restaurant, the streamer fell, all the red light shot out in all directions, and bursts of flame runes were conveyed in the void, and the crimson light carried the aura of burning everything, terrifying. Then an old man appeared in the crimson light. The old man was wearing a crimson robe with red eyebrows. He was neat and tidy. He had an extraordinary breath. In his eyes, there seemed to be endless flames spinning, burning, and forging everything in the world. Exudes a breathtaking atmosphere. Gao Huo Xientong, red eyebrows and golden eyes, is senior brother red eyebrows. Seeing this old man with a terrifying breath, many people on the street were shocked, with respect and fear in their eyes. The person here is the famous red eyebrow in the warrior department. I heard that senior brother Chai Mei killed the Yuniang Langjun in Yuniang Hai not long ago and got a big gain. Why did he suddenly come here? The crowd was extremely shaken, and then under the eyes of everyone, he walked into the restaurant with red eyebrows, with an extremely respectful look, as if he was seeing someone, and went straight to the dining area on the second floor. Suddenly, the audience was silent. No one knew what Chai Mei was doing here. They didn't dare to speak. They were terrified. He just sent away a evil star. Unexpectedly, Brother Chai Mei came again and offended Chai Mei, all of them. It is definitely difficult for people to move in the warrior department. Okay. Chai Mei came to the second floor, his gaze swept away, and his respectful expression suddenly condensed, revealing a look of doubt. With red eyebrows, it is natural to see that this restaurant seems to have had a fight before. What's going on here? Has anyone fought against each other? Chai Mei grabbed and photographed a waiter in the restaurant, and immediately shouted coldly. According to the message he got, Xiao Chen was waiting for him in this restaurant. How could Xiao Chen not be there when he arrived, and there were even fights in the restaurant? His heart was immediately shocked. Senior brother Chai Mei, there was indeed someone fighting just now. The attendant was trembling, and immediately said the previous thing. What? Chai Mei was shocked, and in just a moment, he understood that the person who did it before was Qin Chen. According to his inquiries, Qin Chen seemed to be from Yunso, the head of Yunso. It's looking for death, what the son of Murong Tian dared to offend Xiao Chen, I don't know whether to live or die. A thick flame suddenly appeared on Chai Mei's body, and with a bang, he rose into the sky, and when he shook his figure, he had disappeared into the void and followed Qin Chen away. Young Chen? Did you hear that? What did Brother Chai Mei call that young man just now? Young Chen? What kind of person is that young man, even senior brother Red Eyebrow, should he call him respectfully? Yes. There were all kinds of air conditioning sounds in the audience, and everyone was dumbfounded with a dull expression. In the void, Qin Chen kept flying, and under the leadership of N.A. Linen, through the teleportation formation, he suddenly came to a space with beautiful scenery and amazing holy energy. This space is filled with flowing holy energy. Obviously, there are people with vast magical powers. The holy energy here is activated and dispersed into the air which also makes the disciples' cultivation base diligently improved. Senior, the main hall on the mountain in front is the main hall where our martial arts department allocates Dongfu, and the Dongfu distribution of new disciples is all controlled by the inside. Linen pointed to a mountain in front of him. Qin Chen had spotted the mountain long ago. There was a magnificent palace on top of the mountain. Qin Chen shook his figure and entered the palace directly. Xiang Guan, I am from Bai Yeozong, and my father is the deputy master of Bai Yeozong. This is the eternal Qing Tian tea that is unique to Bai Yeozong. Every piece of tea needs to be poured with evergreen holy water to grow. Each tea tree can grow a leaf in one year. I heard that you like to drink tea. After my father knew about it, he specifically asked his disciples to offer it to you. Such a good tea can only be a person like you. In order to taste the flavor. 
Guanxi, I am a member of the Su family of Pill King of Guangan Mansion. This is the nine resurrection pill refined by my father, and he smelted 99 and 81 resurrection plants. Once taken, the soul of the user can be baptized. According to different cultivation bases can grow up to 30%. My father told me to honor your old man. Xiang Guanxi, I am. In the palace, there are many warriors. These warriors, whose breath is in the realm of peerless earth saint and half-step heavenly saint, respectfully, standing in front of an old man in front of the counter, with flattery and respect in their eyes. And the old man, wearing a stewardship suit, with the heavenly sage aura surging from his body, and his cultivation base at the peak of the early days of heavenly sage, sitting carelessly at the forefront, it was obviously the steward of this hall. Senior, this one is the manager in charge of the allocation of the newcomer's Dongfu. Linen said tremblingly. Qin Chen glanced, and it was already clear. These disciples in front of them are obviously all disciples recruited by the martial arts department this time, and they present gifts to be able to allocate better Dongfu. The role of a cave mansion for a warrior is really crucial. Different cave houses have different holy auras between heaven and earth. If they can be assigned to a cave with abundant holy auras, the speed of cultivation will be at least higher than that of ordinary cave houses. It can even change the fate of a disciple in the future. Therefore, even if these disciples are bankrupt, they must offer gifts and strive to be assigned to a good Dongfu. However, among these disciples, Qin Chen did not see Ao Ching Ling. Qin Chen's figure shook, and he had already arrived in front of the old man. Hey? If you come to distribute the Dongfu, you just retreat to the back, don't you know the line? The old man played with the various treasures in his hands. Depending on the level of the treasure offered, the Dongfu allocated to others is naturally different. Do not lift. Who is your excellency? Don't go back soon. Humph, I'm running wild in front of the steward, don't you know the line? Go back quickly, or you won't blame me for waiting. Many disciples immediately yelled and wanted to show themselves in front of the manager in order to make a good impression. Roll. Qin Chen's tongue burst into spring thunder, and he let out a sound, rumbling, and suddenly, these peerless earth sage, half-step heavenly sage cultivation disciples, all seemed to have been struck by thunder, all trembled, and they were violently shocked. He lay down on the ground. What? An Xiang Guan Shilian raised his head and saw Qin Chen and Linen, and felt the aura of the two of them, and immediately became clear in their hearts, and immediately knew that these two were not new disciples. Who are you two? This is the martial arts department's Dongfu distribution hall. Who gave you the courage to be arrogant here? Xiang Guan suddenly stood up, yelled angrily, and exploded coldly and murderously. Do you want to be in charge? Don't be restless. Qin Chen squinted his eyes and teased his fingers. I'll inquire about one thing. In this general election of the martial arts disciples, several women came from Yunzhou, called Ao Qingling and Qin Ting Ting. Li Wangxiu, I don't know where I was assigned. I hope to tell. Qin Chen said lightly, not wanting to fight in front of the warrior department manager. Unexpectedly, as soon as Qin Chen said this, Xiang Guan's expression suddenly changed, his eyes flickered, and he sternly said, Who is it, Your Excellency? I will assign the hall and the disciples. What do you do with you, leave quickly, otherwise, don't blame the old man for being polite. Hey? This person has a problem. Qin Chen saw the other party's eyes flickering, and immediately knew that the other party was tricky and his heart sank. It seems that young Master Ben has to be rough. Qin Chen suddenly took a hand, hum, hum, and a huge whirlpool appeared in Qin Chen's palm, and suddenly the manager was unstable, unexpectedly was sucked by Qin Chen. Ah! Extinguish the innocent body, breaking Don Fist. Facing this, an ace Yang Guan's face changed wildly, and before a shock, a towering figure appeared behind him, and a light like a dawn, resisting the suction, 
to launch a counterattack. But Qin Chen flicked his finger, and a shadow of the sky shaking finger shot up into the sky, blasting out suddenly, shattering the light like dawn. This was a great supernatural power of the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department, but Qin Chen shattered between his fingers, showing that the two sides were not at the same level. What? Then, the old man was sucked into his hand by Qin Chen, and shouted, Who are you? I am in charge of the military department. You move me and cannot escape punishment. He struggled fiercely, but in Qin Chen's hands, it was like a sparrow being caught in a net and couldn't fly out no matter what. Linen on the side was already stunned. He only felt that his scalp was numb and his body was trembling. He thought Qin Chen had come, but just asked the other party. He didn't expect that he would just shoot like this. It was lawless and bold. It is a big crime to be cruel to the steward of the warrior ministry, and he, the leader, will also be implicated and severely punished. Let's talk about it, where did Ao Ching Ling and the others go? You must know their whereabouts, just say it. Qin Chen said in a cold voice, with murderous expression in his eyes. Ah, kid, you are dead, dare to do something to me, the elders will not let you go, elder, save me. Yelled at the steward. Boom. As the voice fell, a terrifying aura suddenly spread across the distribution hall. At the same time, a tyrannical force swept out from the depths of the hall, penetrated the layers of space, and instantly descended in front of Qin Chen. Young man, who on earth are you? I ran wild in my distribution hall, acted boldly, quickly put down Xiang Zun, and knelt down to admit his mistake. An old voice rumbled, motivating the rules of heaven and earth, and then in the depths of the void, a figure appeared vaguely. This was an old man with endless light shining on his body. He turned out to be a strong man in the middle of the heavenly sage, who guarded this distribution hall. One of the military ministers is old. Boom! He penetrated the void, stepped forward in an instant, appeared in the hall, swept across his palm, and the terrifying power instantly fell on Qin Chen, trying to suppress him with a punch. This is the elder guarding the distribution hall. With his cultivation base, a single move can kill a disciple in an instant. Qin Chen, the warrior at the peak of the early days of Heavenly Sage, is naturally no exception. It's over, alarmed the elders. Despair emerged in Lin An's eyes, Qin Chen would be defeated by the elder of the distribution hall, and he, as an accomplice, would also be suppressed here and subject to capital punishment. However, Qin Chen's eyes suddenly flickered with cold light, a breath of aura was slightly shaken, and a breath of eternal glory appeared behind him. The glory of the gods surged, and the power of the elder of the hall had just touched his body. They collapsed one after another. Allocation Hall Elder? Humph, accept bribes from disciples, control the cave, ask for benefits, corpse position vegetarian food, I think you are behind the scenes. The sin is unforgivable. Qin Chen's voice spread with his body, the next moment, appeared on. In front of the old man. Collapse. It seemed that the sacred mountain of the heavens had collapsed, and the sacred pillar supporting the heavens and the earth was smashed by Qin Chen. There was no suspense. The guard elder of the martial arts department was hit by Qin Chen and completely knocked out, with blood frenzied in his mouth. Spray breath away. The chaos, even the original law of Heavenly Sage, was bleak and smashed into pieces. Boom! The old man slammed against the wall of the distribution hall, and then stopped. The bones in his body blasted, and he turned over in the air, with his head disheveled. He opened his mouth and spit out dozens of blood. The blood was even with traces of blood. Destructive! The breath is obviously the root cause of the body is destroyed, the origin is greatly damaged. With one move, an elder of the military department actually vomited blood and was seriously injured. What? Linen, Xiang Zun, and the many other disciples present, they almost jumped with their eyes. I can't believe my eyes, one by one, just like seeing a ghost, 
especially N.A. Yang Zun, who used to yell before, but now, his eyes are white and he can't say a word, like leaving the water. Fish, only half left. Fate. Who is the guard elder? Although they are not the top elders in the military department, they are also strong in the middle of the heavenly sage. They can sit in a hall, which is extraordinary, famous, and famous, and the cultivation level is unpredictable and extraordinary. But now, they were hit by a single move, and it was impossible to even fight back. Qin Chen's strength made them incredible and could not believe it. Although it is said that seeing is believing, ears are fictitious, but now that they have seen this scene with their own eyes, they feel that what they see is fictitious, because this is beyond their ability to understand. Even the saint sons of the warrior department, even though they said that their cultivation bases are invincible and invincible, they have never said that they can shake the guard elder into flying. Naughty animal. Suddenly, the knocked up old man flew up, roaring and roaring, his hair flying, like a mad or devil, his blood was flowing, and the vast lifespan of his body was burning, the sky is shattered and the earth is destroyed. The void burned, and endless ashes fell, and they were sprinkled. In the ashes, there seemed to be a series of magical shadows, which fell down and formed a power against the sky, sweeping towards Qin Chen to kill the eternal age and destroy the heavens and the earth. Unexpectedly performing a taboo technique. When Xiang Zun looked at it, he couldn't help shaking. Elder Ziyuan, this supernatural power of ashes for all ages is a taboo technique of our military department. If you practice indiscriminately, you will be punished by heaven's work. Boom! His spiritual thoughts had just been sent out, and he saw an incredible scene again. Qin Chen's face was expressionless, his big hand grabbed into the air, a horrible killing aura surged out, and the horrible killing aura wiped out the eternal life and turned into thousands of palm shadows. Explosive volume, just grab. The supernatural powers of the eternal ashes were all shattered, and all of a sudden disappeared. Then, Qin Chen grabbed and photographed with a palm of his hand, no matter how Elder Ziyuan avoided it, he was caught and photographed by Qin Chen, pinched his neck suddenly, and lifted it up abruptly. Ah, <laughs> boy, I will break your body into pieces. This elder roared again and again, and constantly displayed his magical powers, trying to break free from Qin Chen's shackles, but no matter how he displayed his magical powers, he couldn't escape Qin Chen's palm like a dead fish. Humph, still struggling, give me stability. Qin Chen snorted coldly, a destructive force poured into the elder's body, and immediately, the elder's legs kept kicking in the air, his eyes turned white, and endless fear emerged in his eyes. Seeing this scene, N.A. Linen almost fainted, breathing heavily in his chest, feeling suffocated. God! The elder Ziyuan who guards the distribution hall was carried in his hands like a dead fish. What is the origin of this kid? How could it be possible that this is a giant in the middle of the heavenly sage, the outer door elder of the warrior department? Beat, too strong. Now, how could there be such a strong genius in this world? Linen yelled wildly in his heart, hysterical, he never thought that Qin Chen's strength was so high. He thought that Qin Chen's strength was better than Xiang Zhengwen's, but unexpectedly, he suppressed it with just a few fingers. An outside elder. After the shock, it was endless fear. This is the outer door elder, so arrogant, so fiercely slapped, the warrior ministry will never let them go. That kid is looking for death, seeking his own way. And the many disciples present were so scared that they shivered in the hall, and they didn't even dare to move, for fear that Qin Chen would trouble them and pinch them to death like ants. Elder Ziyuan? The guard elder of the allocation hall? Humph! Qin Chen held Elder Ziyuan in his hand and sneered, as the guard elder of the allocation hall, then you must know where Ao Qingling and the others have gone. Hurry up, give you three breaths. If you don't tell me the time, I don't care what you are in charge or the elder, and you will be cruel, this young master will directly kill you. You 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 you. This elder Ziyuan hesitated and was speechless. His life and death were between Qin Chen's thoughts, 
and the Saint Yuan in his body was blocked. At this time, he finally felt Qin Chen's horror, I also felt that in Qin Chen's body, it seemed like. He couldn't resist the vast power of the heavens. How could there be such a powerful Tian Jiao in the martial arts department? No, it is impossible. He has heard of the saint son of the martial arts department, but none of them is similar to the young man in front of him. Could it be that this son is the best talent in the art refining division? And only from the refining division. Gashi Tian Jiao has such a terrifying breath. Tian Jiao is heavily guarded, and it is extremely difficult for outsiders to break in. Qin Chen appears here. He is not a member of the martial arts department or the refining division. Moreover, these Tian Jiao are basically of the saint child level. Elders can mess with it. At the critical moment of life and death, Elder Ziyuan's mind was exceptionally clear. At this moment, he couldn't even think of hatred. In the face of such irresistible power, hatred was useless. Unexpectedly, the few women in Yunzo have such backgrounds. I knew that I shouldn't intervene in them. Now I'm asking for your trouble. Elder Ziyuan was horrified, and finally spoke, this young hero, the three Ao Qinglings, in Zhuyang Shenqian Mountain, the old man assigned them to Zhuyang Shenqian Mountain. Nine Sun God Xian Shan. Qin Chen felt a chill in his heart and said coldly, Isn't this the cave house occupied by Murong Tian? It was the son of Murong Tian who asked us to distribute this way. The son of Murong Tian has an extraordinary background and rises against the trend. Those few people, the old man is in the warrior department, do not have much background, Murong Tian Chenzi arranged like this, the old man just obeyed orders. Matter. Elder Ziyuan screamed again and again, the son of heaven Murong is himself a talented arrogant in the middle of the heavenly sage. His cultivation is stronger than that of the old man, and he is also a character of the son of God and has a background. I can't help it. Hey, there is no way. Let's just say, what benefit does Mirongtian give you? Qin Chen said coldly. No. Before he finished speaking, the elder Ziyuan screamed under Qin Chen's suppression, I said, that Mirongtian gave the old man ten heavenly low-grade saint veins. Just for the ten low-ranking saint veins of the heavenly rank, you actually let a few new female disciples of the martial arts department, the sheep enter the tiger's mouth, what kind of elder do you have the face? How to be a teacher? A terrifying murderous intent appeared on Qin Chen, as if death had descended. Senior. Linen, who was shocked and stunned, finally jumped up, seniors men are merciful and let elder Ziyuan and Xiong Zun take care of them. After all, they are the elders and stewards of our military department. You kill them, trouble. Not small, originally. We account for reason, but if you kill them, then we will lose reason, don't kill. Linen was so scared that his soul was almost gone. If Qin Chen really killed the elder Ziyuan, then everything would really be irreversible. No matter what Qin Chen's origin, he dared to kill an elder in the warrior department, no force could tolerate it. Such a thing. Well, what I meant was that I didn't want to kill in the warrior department, otherwise I wouldn't be so easy to talk. Qin Chen's eyes flashed, but he calmed down, however, these two guys can avoid the death penalty. Fleeing, Ben Shao took all the things on them, and it was some stolen money. And you too, go back to the warrior department and explain your crimes, otherwise, when Ben Sha returns from the Nine Sun God Profound Mountain, you will see it's not that simple if you didn't confess your guilt. You need to know. Dao, in the eyes of Ben Shao, the two of you are like dead dogs, and Ben Shao wants to kill you as if killing a chicken, effortlessly, go away. After throwing it away, Elder Ziyuan and Xiang Zunguan rolled out like a gourd, banging against the wall of the hall. The two lay on the ground in horror their throats gurgled, their eyes were full of fear, and they could not speak. You, take me to Jiang Shenqian Mountain. After that, Qin Chen took linen, swept away, and already flew high into the sky, rushing to the Nine Sun God Profound Mountain. 
whizzing. The two traveled quickly, and the Nine Suns God Profound Mountain was a well-known cave in the Warrior Department, and it was one of the top caves in the Warrior Department. Linen had naturally heard of it. He was led by Qin Chen, pointing the way, and his heart was depressed again and again. He is now involved in this battle. Now he can only pray that Qin Chen has a great status and a great position, and can defeat Murong Tian. Son, otherwise, then he. It's in trouble. He did so many things with him, and the blame came from the top. A little disciple of him couldn't resist at all, so he would be punished. Now Lin An's fate has all been tied to Qin Chen's body. Boom! Under Lin An's guidance, Qin Chen traveled through the void, and countless restraints felt the Saint Child token of the refining division on his body. They voluntarily gave up. This made Lin An feel more at ease. All signs indicate that Qin Chen is very likely. Is also one of the day's work. A great person, and has never seen it in the warrior department so it is very likely that it is from the refining division. After a while, in the distance, a magnificent mountain appeared. Senior, that is Nine Sun God Profound Mountain. Linen shouted. Very good. Qin Chen looked at the mountain peak with electricity, and saw that there were many cave houses within the mountain peaks. Outside of each cave house, there were dense restrictions, and he could not see the true situation. In the depths of the mountain, there is vague Taoism. The breath is surging, and the strong dormant. So many Dongfu, where are Ao Qingling and the others? Qin Chen furrowed his brows and shook his figure before he fell on the mountain peak. This mountain peak, as Linen and the others said, the heaven and earth's holy aura is indeed quite rich and thick, but compared to Qin Chen's own cave, it is at least twice as bad. That Murongdian saint's son's cave is in such a place. Qin Chen frowned. Compared with his own Qingtian peak, this nine sun god profound mountain is too far apart, right? Senior, although the nine suns Shen Qian mountain is famous, the cave mansion of the son of Murongtian is not here. The sun has a separate mountain, and each person is an independent one. More than twice as rich as Zhuyang Shengsuanshan. Above, the reason why this Nine Sun God Profound Mountain is famous is that it is the topmost among ordinary disciple Dongfu. After all, Shenzi Mountain is not something ordinary people can enjoy. Linen hurriedly said. That's it. Qin Chen nodded, it was almost the same. In this way, the sacred aura of heaven and earth of the Saint Child of the Martial Arts Department should be twice as much as the sacred aura of heaven and earth of the Saint Child of the Refining Division which is also in line with the identities of both. As Qin Chen said, his spiritual thoughts had already swept the gap, booming, Qin Chen's spiritual thoughts were as violent as the ocean, madly sweeping and spreading out, disturbing the sky. Click! The entire mountain's restraint was trembling, and Linen was tingling scalp as he watched. Hey! Found it! Suddenly, Qin Chen's gaze condensed, his face was ugly, and his figure shook, leading Linen and flew towards an area deep in the mountain. In that area, there are a few cave houses, and outside the cave houses, there are seven or eight disciples standing there, divided into two groups. Each of these disciples was the cultivation base of the peak of Tianchen's initial stage, and belonged to the core disciples of the Heavenly Work Martial Arts Department. Each core disciple was very powerful, arrogant, and extremely proud, staring coldly at the caves ahead. 3. Why are you so stubborn? In our martial arts department, the son of Murong is the real man of destiny. It is your blessing that you can be regarded by the Lord of the Sun. As long as you promise the son of Murong, you will be glorious. Rich, let alone. You enjoy it, isn't it better than your own hard work? A man with a big cloak and a feather crown, dragging two thunderballs in his hands, rolling back and forth, crackling, shining thunder and lightning, staring coldly at the cave in front, his face is dumbfounded. Sister Qingling, you and I have known each other for so long, can't you still trust me? I have done wrong things before, but as you said, my life was given by Qin Chen. 
I have been blinded once. I won't be blind for the second time. Don't worry. I will die, I will die before you. Li Wangxiu gritted his teeth, her eyes determined. Well, no one will die. If you have a little foundation, no one will die. Boom. At this moment, an indifferent voice sounded, and the prohibition in the cave was suddenly torn open a gap, and two figures came out of it. Dust, less dust. Seeing the people coming, Ao Qingling, Qin Ting Ting, and Li Wangxi were all stunned. They couldn't believe their eyes, little dust, you, why are you here? They rubbed their eyes frantically, thinking they were dazzled. Why can't I be here? Qin Chen looked at Ao Qingling and the three of them, and couldn't help but smile, showing distressed expressions, it's me, don't worry, it's okay, everything is okay, I have done everything about you I heard that there is a small amount of money, you don't. There will be nothing. Qin Chen said coldly, his eyes colder than ever. Little dust, it's really you. Ao Qingling cried with joy and could no longer hold Qin Chen's emotions anymore, and suddenly hugged Qin Chen, Little Chen, you have finally come to work, worry about us. Less dust. Qin Ting Ting also hugged Qin Chen abruptly. Li Wangxiu hesitated, her face flushed, and she gritted her teeth and hugged Qin Chen. Feeling the masculine aura on Qin Chen, the three of them were filled with happiness, and they felt more at ease than ever before. This. Qin Chen raised his hands in embarrassment, and then hugged him as he said. Lin An's nosebleeds are about to squirt out. Ao Qingling and the three are peerless beauties, each body is convex and backward, and the key is different. Some are shameless, some are embarrassed by the three. Just thinking about it, Lin An has some. Nai can't hold the blood in the body, and the nose has to be bloody. Dust. Is this the ordinary follower you are talking about? In the jade disk of good fortune in the universe, Chen Sisi's murderous voice came into Qin Chen's ears. Ahem, Sisi, let me explain. Qin Chen was immediately embarrassed and hurriedly explained through a voice transmission. Puff, well, I am teasing you, Chen, your followers are really good to you, you can't live up to their trust. Sisi said suddenly, with infinite emotion, she also heard the conversation between Zhu Qingling and the others. Once upon a time, didn't they also trust Qin Chen so much, would they always believe him? Qin Chen seemed to have a kind of magic power that could make anyone willing to entrust himself to him, even for his life. Little Chen, I'm sorry, we were too excited just now. Ao Qingling and the others felt the changes in Qin Chen, and they stepped back a few steps their faces flushed, and they were a little embarrassed, but thought that they had embraced them earlier Qin Chen, his heart is full of sweetness again, how much he wants time to remain still at that moment, forever. Does not pass. But they knew that all of this was an extravagant hope, and their eyes were much saddened. Okay, it's okay. Qin Chen smiled bitterly and shook his head. There are three women in a play, what can so many women sing like? Boom. When the atmosphere was very embarrassing, all of a sudden, the whole cave began to shake, and the cave seemed to be shaken. 3. Have you figured it out clearly, Master Murong Tianchenzi has no time to waste on you. An icy voice came from outside the cave. Less dust. Ao Qingling and others looked panicked. Let's go, go out and have a look. Qin Chen sketched a sneer at the corner of his mouth and a cold chill flashed across his eyes. Boom! He took Ao Qingling and the others, and flew out from the cave mansion. Outside the cave, the thunderball surged in the hands of the man who approved the great cloak, and a series of lightning flashes converged from his palm. It was obvious that he had sent the bombardment just now. His eyes were indifferent, and he was indifferent to the world, and his heart was cold. It seems that these women are toasting and not eating fine wine, and that is nothing. When he breaks the cave, he can directly seal and take it to the son of Murong Tian. Anymore. The woman who is fancy is impossible to escape from his palm. 
he sneered in his heart and was about to make another move. He saw a few figures flying out of the cave. He thought that Ao Qingling had figured it out, but before he could smile, he saw the cave. In, there are actually two men. His face suddenly changed. There was a man in the women's cave that Murong Tianchenzi liked. Linen, why are you? When were you in the cave mansion? You are so brave, you dare to covet the woman that Master Shenzi likes, I think you don't want to live anymore. Seeing Linen, the man's face suddenly changed, and a strong murderous aura swept out, obviously he knew Linen. Lin An's legs softened, but in front of Qin Chen, he had confidence and couldn't help but said, Xiao Chengping, I advise you to leave quickly. This adult is the sweetheart of the three girls. You should take someone away quickly. My sweetheart. Xiao Chengping, the man in the cloak, looked at Qin Chen and couldn't help laughing, his eyes were cold and impatient. I don't care why you are in Dongfu or what your purpose is, but you dare to move the woman Murong Tianchenzi likes. That is looking for death. It seems that I have to show you a little bit. Although in the sky work, we can't kill, but you. We have done unforgivable things, and I must let you know the fate of offending the Son of Heaven. Xiao Chengping, talk nonsense with them, beat them half to death, waited for a long time to work, and find a chance to kill them. Another core disciple barely threatened. Do it, suppress him, and drop the Nine Sun God Profound Mountain. The core disciple wearing a crown of feathers on his head and a large cloak suddenly roared and grabbed with his right hand. The void suddenly collapsed and cracks appeared everywhere. He unexpectedly displayed a unique skill to control the gods and demons. This is another ancient school of heavenly work, which is exactly the same as the great supernatural power of the ashes of all ages. It can destroy the ten directions, reverse the ten thousand ways, destroy the sky and destroy the earth and the gods and demons can change the world. This punch directly killed Xiang Qin Chen, and between the explosions, the aura of ancient destruction appeared everywhere, as if the gods and demons were roaring, and the sky and the sky were trembling. Brother Xiao's photo control gods and demons are more exquisite. It is rumored that this fist, controlling the way of gods and demons, shocks the world, is known for its explosive power, and is famous in the ancient world. It is one of the supernatural powers of our heavenly work martial arts department. Senior brother Xiao got the guidance of Master Murong Tianchenzi to teach skills. Of course, the tide will rise, and soon, he will be promoted to the upper class, and even break through the middle stage of the heavenly sage, and then he will be able to hold a high position in the heavenly work. Master Murong Tian, in order to take charge of the martial arts department in the future, we must establish a lot of masters as subordinates, and we are the subordinates of the adults. The future is infinitely bright. Many disciples present shouted in excitement. This brother Xiao is the best of these disciples, the peak figure in the early days of Heavenly Sage. Between this punch, the endless power enveloped, turned into three shadows in an instant, and each shadow exerted control. Gods and devils, rolling in hit a torrent of ghosts and gods, like gods and demons, blatantly killed. He was terrified. From the moment Qin Chen and Ao Qingling walked out, he knew that he had failed to complete the mission of Lord Murong Tianchenzi this time, so he displayed the most outstanding means as soon as he came up. Don't give Qin Chen half. A chance to fight back. Dead. The triple photo control god and demon Ju was shot out in a flash targeting Qin Chen's upper, middle and lower three roots, covering his entire body and giving no chance to escape. It is good. Many disciples roared. This blow from senior brother Xiao Chengping enveloped the void in all directions. It was amazingly powerful and would surely be able to capture and suppress that kid. At this moment, Qin Chen moved, he gave a sneer, squeezed his fist in his palm, lifted it up and the horrible killing aura surged with three punches. These three punches were silent, but every punch hit Xiao Chinping's body, booming. After three punches, Xiao Chinping's two avatars exploded in an instant, and at the same time, 
the body was also exploded with the holy energy, which was originally magnificent like a and demon. Suddenly burst open, just like being hit by a big mountain, torn apart abruptly. Ah! The screams screamed. The power that Xiao Chengping blasted was directly blasted into his body by Qin Chen's punch. In his body, countless bones shattered and blood flew across. The whole person flew out hysterically and fell heavily. Falling to the ground, he instantly became a blood man. Those disciples who were yelling with excitement before, watched Xiao Chenping's body explode, seeming to slow down the scene countless times. The horror, surprise and hysterical howling on Xiao Chenping's face were clearly visible. Come! With just three punches, Qin Chen defeated Xiao Chenping's violent shot. At the same time, he stepped forward, his claws were like a dragon, went deep into the air, and took Xiao Chengping into his hands like a dead dog. You, what kind of cultivation is this? How come you can defeat the photo control gods and demons without using any magical powers? Impossible! Xiao Chengping was carried by Qin Chen like a dead dog, hysterical and unbelievable, screaming. This is nothing because my strength is far above you. Today, you who are the running dogs of Saint Murong Tianzi, for the sake of you are disciples of the martial arts department, I will not kill you, but you have disturbed me. People must be punished. Punishment, in this way, I will extract ten thousand heavenly sacred laws from each of you to make up for your sins. Qin Chen lifted his palm and directly pressed it on Xiao Chenping's sky spirit cover. Ah! Xiao Chengping immediately let out a scream, his whole body trembled madly, and the heavenly sage laws with the thickness of thumbs were extracted, and then they were melted by Qin Chen and turned into the purest. The origin of the heavenly sage, dripping in the palm of your hand. Slippery rotation. A full ten thousand, ten thousand heavenly sage laws were forcibly extracted by Qin Chen. Xiao Chengping's whole person, like an overindulgent person, his face was pale and pale, his strength was gone, his whole body was like a deflated ball, and he shriveled in an instant and moved. Can't move. Extracting ten thousand heavenly sacred laws is equivalent to killing half of his life, and no matter how much he cultivates in the future, he can't make up for it. Most of the foundation is lost, even if the panacea is swallowed, it will not help. Even if the qualification is invalid. In the future, he will only be able to be an ordinary disciple in Tianjiao, and don't even think about it in the mid-term achievement of Heavenly Sage. Even when the time comes, he will be appointed by Tianjiao to be the most ordinary messenger, and the dust will fall from the clouds. Ten Thousand Heavenly Sacred Laws, the genius of Xiao Chenping's return to the martial arts department, who has only such a weak law power, is too disappointing. Qin Chen refined the extracted heavenly sage law in his hands, forming a gleaming orb, in which various auras surged, extremely powerful, but compared with the power of the law in Qin Chen's body, it was too far behind. Reasonable plan. Senior brother Xiao unexpectedly has taken the heavenly sage law in his body. Devil, this guy is the devil. When has such a freak appeared in our military department? Lawlessness too lawless. When the remaining disciples saw this scene, they were so shocked that their entire bodies stood up, and there was endless fear in their hearts. Qin Chen's shot was too harsh. They only wanted to suppress Qin Chen and teach him a lesson. Unexpectedly, the other party directly extracted ten thousand heavenly sage laws from Brother Xiao. Once these rules were gone, Brother Xiao almost become one. A waste. In panic, both Murong Tian's subordinates and Fu Zixi's subordinates looked in panic. They did not dare to confront Qin Chen, and turned around to flee here. You guys! Do you still want to run? Throwing Xiao Chengping on the mountain, Qin Chen looked at the other disciples with a sneer, a faint light burst into his eyes. Boom! He said that immediately, the entire space of the Nine Sun God Profound Mountain seemed to freeze in an instant, Everyone was imprisoned here, unable to move, the power of the Saint Yuan in the body seemed to be frozen, and could not be mobilized at all. Stand up! 
Why is this person so ferocious? It's too strong, what kind of spatial knowledge is this, why can't we move? No, is this a peerless evildoer? Brother Shao has now been abolished, and ten thousand heavenly sacred laws have been directly lost. If we are the same as Brother Shao, I am afraid that our status will not be preserved in the future. Sacred Sun Murong Tian, take action quickly and save us. Master Fu Zixi Shenzi, save us quickly. Ah, uh, why can't we move any more? The remaining disciples roared in horror and wanted to leave here, but found that no matter how they flew, they couldn't fly out of here. The void was imprisoned, and they were like flies imprisoned in this world. Want to run? It's impossible. People who dare to move me must have this consciousness, and let you run away like this. How will I stand in the future? Don't say it's you, even if it's Mirongdian behind you Shenzi, Fuzik Si Shenzi, also. It's hard to escape Ben Shao's accountability. Qin Chen stood on the Nine Suns God Profound Mountain with flying hair. He looked at a group of disciples who screamed in horror, as if watching a group of flies, die all to me. In the body, suddenly the peacock flew out of seven or eight Chonghong like a screen. Chong Hong swept across, flew to those disciples, and instantly fell on them. Suddenly, endless screams resounded. In the bodies of these disciples, the heavenly holy laws were extracted. Everyone is ten thousand, no more, no less, all were taken out in an instant. Ah! These disciples screamed sternly, but Qin Chen was indifferent. He now knew that the martial arts department was different from the refining division, and the refining division was relatively gentle. Allow too much fighting, you die. Live. But the martial arts department is different. In order to cultivate for himself, Murong Tian actually robbed Dongfu and even doubled the female disciples of other martial arts departments. However, the martial arts department did not punish them at all. The weak and the strong. As long as you are strong enough to occupy the truth, the warrior department will only open one eye and close one eye. Originally, the world of heaven is a world of strong men. The disciples of the Tian Gong martial arts department are also a world where strong men compete. If you can't bear it, you will only become a handyman who manages some things in Tian Gong in the future. Is the deacon in charge and stronger, you can become an elder. These are all fighting together. If you are strong, you can act unscrupulously. Holy Sun Murongdian, come quickly to rescue us. Shenzi Fu Zixi, save us. Ah, come and save us. These disciples who had been out of Ao Kingling's cave before screamed like a pig at this moment. They were imprisoned by Qin Chen's power and could not move at all. The holy law of the whole body is drawn like flowing water, vitality. Elapsed, dying all screaming frantically. Humph! Qin Chen snorted coldly. In the palm of his hand, he melted the heavenly sage laws of many disciples together, forming four groups of radiant light of the laws, exploding with a shocking aura. Ching Ling, Ting Ting, Wang Xiu, you three are only one step away from heavenly sage. Let me help you. Qin Chen urged the technique of patching the sky to refine these heavenly sacred laws, and then directly photographed them. Suddenly, these heavenly sacred laws were like an angry dragon, and Qin Chen was instantly beaten into the bodies of three women. And you, Linen, lead the way for Ben Shao, and there are hard work, and it will give you a little benefit. Qin Chen raised his hand and slammed the remaining little heavenly law into Lin An's body. He wants to be clear about grievances, grievances, grudges, and grudges. Ho ho ho! There was an endless explosion in the four people's bodies. The terrifying heavenly sage law seemed to explode their bodies, causing the four people's bodies to swell up suddenly, seeming to burst on the spot. Refining for me! At the critical moment, Qin Chen squeezed his hands and urged the sky repairing technique, and runes continuously penetrated into the bodies of the four. Roar! Ching Ling, Ting Ting! and Wang Xiu spit out divine rainbows from their seven orifices. Under the refining technique of patching the sky, 
they absorbed the many laws and powers of these core disciples. The rumbling, the breath of the body suddenly swelled, and it broke through in an instant. To the realm of heavenly sage. The boundless and magnificent heavenly sacred aura came down, and the three of them roared again and again, becoming extremely sacred, noble, changed appearances, and breathtaking. The three heavenly saints were thus born. Originally, Ao Ching Ling, Qin Ting Ting, and Li Wangxia were only one step away from the early days of Tian Sheng after undergoing the training of the martial arts department, but now, Qin Chen directly allowed the three of them to get a breakthrough, surpassing a lot of penance. As for Linen, the aura on his body also had a breakthrough, making him a point more diligent. Ah, <laughs> this is our law. Many core disciples roared in despair, their eyes cracked, and their eyes breathed fire. Originally, they still hoped to regain their law power, but now, everything is too late. Master Murong Tian Chenzi. Master Fu Zixi Shenzi. Help us. These disciples all roared madly. <laughs>